Hey everybody, it's Tim Heidecker here. We are about to begin something we've only done once before, and that is the Office Hours 9 to 5 Marathon. Unfortunately, I can't be there because I'm here at work, Paramount Pictures, making all sorts of incredible stuff that you're going to love and experience in the uh, next year, I'll tell you that much. This, I can tell you, we're going to be having tremendous success today. Today's marathon is very special. Doug and Vic are gonna be in the compound and they have been uh, given a pretty tough task. They are going to be uh, running the marathon and they're gonna have lots of special guests. You're not gonna believe the amount of wonderful people we have in store, but they are not gonna be able to leave the compound until they reach our goal of 6,000 patrons. So help them out, share with your friends, get everybody watching. It's gonna be an incredible marathon. We're gonna get past 6,000 just in time for the holidays and go beyond that, go well into the 6,000 range here on Patreon. I'll be checking in. I'm gonna be on set with a bunch of fun people and you're gonna see them later today, I hope. And I'll tell you something, we're gonna have lots of guests today and it's gonna be a lot of fun and a lot of people are gonna have a lot of good times watching the show and we're gonna have a lot of fun and Doug and Vic are going to do a great job. I'm wishing them all the best. Thank you, Tim. I like having fun. I like to laugh. I like to meet people who can make me laugh. I like having fun. Yes, I like to laugh. I like having fun. I like to to do my thing. Hello, everybody. Hello. Everybody. Good morning. Good morning. Hello, everybody. There it is. So this is a... Uh, we're doing it. We're just the doing it. The clock's running. Um, gonna... There's only seven hours and six minutes left. All right. So let's do a, a two-hour drop concert and I'm let's down. get started. Uh, Vic and I are running the show today and... Um, we got some guests, like Tim said. I'll tell you yes. what. Uh, I wanted to say, I was as I was watching that, I, could, I didn't hear what Tim was saying because I was just like noticing how thin he is. He's getting tiny. Oh, he's looking, he's looking great. good. He's looking wonderful. He looks tiny. He's a skinny. Tiny. He's like skinny, in fact. You know, he's a skinny little tiny little man. Yeah. So, I mean, I don't know what's going on there. What he's eating. What he's not eating. That's that's uh, pretty impressive, Tim. So. Thank you, Tim. I guess. What did he say? He, we have to get. We gotta kiss his ass. We gotta kiss his ass. Him. Yeah, that's that's the main thing. Um, because I don't know if we're gonna get to six thousand p- patrons. Is yeah, that where like, are we at right is that now, a thing? producer is that, Matt? Is that possible? Let's do a check in. We're at five thousand eight hundred twenty six. So yeah, we're not gonna get. There. I think we could do it. You think so? Yeah, I think we could do it. All right. That's at least we have Matt here who's positive. So I'm and then feeling, we can I'm go home that. once we hit that. Yeah. Then we're then it's quitting time. Then, then it's quitting time. Right. So if you want this over with. Join today, and uh, I guess I can turn off the Salt Peanuts song. Is that, or do you like that bed music? Can I get a water, <laughs> Johnny? We'll introduce you in well, a second. I just, I just didn't get offered Sit water. Well, you Hold showed up here. ten minutes yeah, late. Yeah, you showed you up. Really I mean, late. I didn't actually show up ten minutes late. I showed up actually like five minutes early. It was like eight minutes late. You said eight fifty. I mean, yeah, but you know, I, I waved to you when it was nine oh one, and that so that's when I noticed you were here. So. You can help yourself oh, yeah. to some water out there. Okay, yeah. I, Luke, can I you bring him though, some water? Get, can you turn on Tim's hose out there? I don't know. He's got. There's, oh, there's, there we go. Uh, there's, there's street sweeping going on. <laughs> I know. The, do you hear all the weed whackers too? It's a See, noisy. This is, noisy I don't know where this water came from. This is just in a mug. <laughs> uh, you want coffee? You want a filter? Or something? It's I'll Molly take a coffee water. and a water. Actually, oh, coffee and a water. It's, it's great to be here, though. Do you like milk in your coffee? No, I like oh, okay. black. Okay, good. Johnny, you're looking good. Your hair looks really tight right now. It does. Strong part. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Remember so. when I, we went? Remember when you? 
I, it must have been like eight, ten years ago. You were like, we got to get our haircuts. Let's go to Long Beach. We did, didn't we? And you took me to this barber shop in Long Beach. That was a I'm long a time ago. Guy. And um, <laughs> it was like it was like this total like rockabilly, rockabilly spot. And there uh -huh. was Playboys. Yeah. Oh, that's and yeah. they give you like vintage PBRs Playboy, to drink. Like vintage Playboys, like. From the 50s or something? Yeah, like they were like, like vintage Playboys mm -hmm. type. Back and it was like guys. Were it was right, like right. <laughs> only guys were allowed to go remember there. When we went, I think it's. You, oh, is that. It must have been uh oh. Oh, is that me? I sorry, hope that's, that's not me. me. Sorry. Okay. Is this an anyway. MK Ultra thing? <laughs> You're feeding anyway, back. that was a, yeah, that's what, a great memory, Johnny, and your haircut reminds me. Did you do it was like a, great a memory. hot shave in the neck, <laughs> that kind of thing? Like, get it. They give you they give you the works, yeah. Yeah. Got the leather strap. That yeah, they get that. Out. I love that. They slap that's... you and they make you touch a motorcycle. <laughs> it's real sweet. That's kind of cool. They should. They should actually have like you should sit on motorcycles. Like when I take my kid to get haircuts. Yeah. They get. They put them in little cars. Really? Yeah. Yeah. So is <laughs> the yeah, barber on the car? Or is the yeah, barber like snip every time the car comes around? <laughs> no, they're Why? Because kids their cars are aren't moving. They're they're sta They're stable. <laughs> There's like <laughs> they're bolted down. But is it because uh, yeah. kids are scared to get their haircuts? I think so. It's anything to distract them too. And also they have they put like TVs in front of them and with Netflix on and it's everything. Like so scare cuts. It's yeah, kind of like it's a scare cut. I don't exactly. like flying, and I mm -hmm. wish you know they put they do put TVs in front of you on yeah. the plane. I can but I wish they put dentist. me in little cars. I, I would, you know, can I they would have a section on the plane where you get to ride in? Yeah, it's a called little, first class, Doug. <laughs> you get to ride in a little car. It's called first class, okay? I don't. I've never seen that before. Uh huh. Am I hot? Is it? it am I hot? Like coming in hot? Yeah, am I coming in hot? That's good. We want mm -hmm. some okay. energy at the oh, top. We need no, that. I'm talking like, about. I'm talking about like, levels, like technical. Oh, no, you sound great. You sound down, good. You're mixed down. Down. Rush. Johnny, I thought of you the other day because my wife is a teacher. Mm-hmm. And she pulled her kids, uh, uh, like, what's the funniest movie you've ever seen? Without it, without, like, <laughs> the question, the funniest movie they've ever seen is uh, 21 Jump Street. What age are they? They're high school. That sounds They all right. said that. And then I, and I had never seen it. I didn't know anything about it, really. And we put it on. Oh, let my wife it. Turns out, like, work. a good friend of ours, uh, um, uh, Lindsay Br Lindsay Broad is in that. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that's and, and then, my and then I look over and like this is that is Johnny yeah. Pemberton over yeah. there, and you're amazing in it. So like the whole thing was funny. Mm. I, I was I just was not expecting to love that movie so much, but I try to bring a lot to the table. Yeah, you know, I try I to bring like a lot of options and, and stuff. And you were you were young in that because you were playing a high schooler, right? Yeah. Yeah. So you're but that was sort of an age. The movie's idea is like you know, it's like a what? Well, yeah, you're right though. Yeah. <laughs> well done. That's well, what I, just say. Uh, I remember what? in my day and age, there was 90210, mm -hmm. and those actors were like 40, and they were playing. <laughs> That's true. Yeah. They were playing high schoolers. You right. ever look at pictures from like the 50s of high schoolers, and you're like, that looks like my mom in her 40s. Right, right. Yeah, what's, why, why do old photos make people seem even older? I think it's because of the hard scrabble life back then. The hard people scrabble had to grow life. Up fast. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the, yeah. This, they had. The word selection on Scrabble was... It was hard. More Scrabble <laughs> life. Is that <laughs> what that very means? Very few vowels, yeah. You had to go to war and you had to spell it with two letters. <laughs> it's a killer joke. You guys want to take a Zoomer? So, we can do Gotta that. Gotta start somewhere, Johnny. Is this but, uh, but wait, be before... Yeah, you'll like, see... Oh. So, uh, can yeah, we talk about your shirt zoomer. real quick? Because yeah, what sure. is, Yes, what is this here? He makes... Uh, oh, yeah, this he's is He's making placement. merch where he takes a, a logo and then uh, changes it to be a different... Uh huh. Like kind of evil company usually. Yeah. Like, I mean, Raytheon's well, not evil. Evil though, subjective. Are they? Are they evil, evil subjective. They do good things, don't they? They do. They participate in pride. Right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They, they changed their logo. They're patriotic. Yeah. They yeah. did. Oh, they did. They definitely uh, did. I think you have to like gay pride. Like Raytheon that? has a gay pride. Absolutely. Really. Yeah. And what do they produce? They produce. Uh, they're a defense contractor. They produce a lot of stuff. So um, missiles for the like industrial um, missiles, engines, mm -hmm. um, military you know, industrial complex. probably yeah. some yeah. plastics, bombs, maybe uh, tanks, some maybe? Uh, airplanes. Mm -hmm. I think they bought Pratt and Whitney at one point, so that means they're in the airplane engine business. Oh. Whitney Cummings and um, Chris <laughs> Pratt. <laughs> yeah, they used to design engines for airplanes so not that long ago. That's how they got started, actually. Okay. Okay, we're just getting warmed up here. I'm going to go to the chat. I'm looking at the chat. If you guys have any um, questions down here, mm. we'll, we'll address those for can you I today. Check, can I and check the chat? Any, and, and we're also going to be taking Zoomers and Hot Hat Hot. I was going to say, yeah, get on the get on Yeah, YouTube.com slash Tim Heideck. Because, like, I don't, okay, I don't personally, I don't love Zoom because it stresses me out. 
I always find myself like looking at myself in the thing, and I'm like, I look. Oh, you weird. Turn, turn, turn that. Pro tip. Turn, se- turn, yeah, turn self, self you you off. Turn off. Turn pro self tip. you off. Oh, will never be the same. I didn't same. know there was an option. Yeah, because then it's just you're looking at them. Then you just see them as li- normal. Okay. Yeah. Because I hate, like I hate to going to like restaurants where there's like mirrors up, and I'm like watching myself eat, just stressed out. Um, but so if you, yeah, all right. So well, now let's take a zoomer. Let's let's do a zoomer. But I would also like some phone calls. His first time on the show. So let's talk to Scary Sherry. All right. Or is it Sherry? How do you pronounce that? Uh, it's Sherry. Scary Sherry. There you go. Oh, is look that at the this. bird's name? Uh, no, his name is Avery. Wow. That's he, a green he's one. A, he's an eclectus parrot. He uh, has uh, an insatiable appetite for food and sex. Wow. Okay. Does he, and uh, how do you know? Do you, I mean, do you have another one of those parrots so he can have sex with it? What? Uh, no, he he just needs uh, a surface that he can that oh. he can uh, oh, he grind. Can, he can do it himself. I feel like well, Vic already drank yeah. his three coffees today. <laughs> Am I like out? You're what? talking real fast. Am I really? <laughs> I think you sound you're, you're on pace with me. All man. right, I'm trying to keep up. Listen, I'm, I'm just drinking water. I'm random yeah. water. This could be any water. It could be parrot water for all we know. I'm <laughs> I am I am running on empty. That's why I'm chugging this coffee to fill up. I uh I was uh we like yesterday we had this big move. The movers were all there, and I'm stressed out. The house is a mess. <laughs> I know it's a mess, and then I was like trying to like because like I have to entertain people uh, with my videos. The movers? So, no, not that. Right, the movers show up. Like, like, hey, shot. check out this Trump I'm, video I'm, that I'm I finished, did. For Mike. No, I should have. I should have. <laughs> I was like editing while they were there, and I and they, and it was of course Trump on the on the screen. I was like, where, do they think I'm a fan or something? You know, but yes, well, scary Sherry. Did you have any questions? <laughs> I have a question for, for, for scary. scary yeah. for Sherry, scary. Why the head, not the shoulder? Hmm. Um, he has a little more traction on my head and I am working from home. So when I'm moving around, he sometimes when he's on the shoulder, he'll, you know, lose his footing. So this is, is uh, this is as good a spot for him as any. And I kind of just forget that he's out there while I'm working. I don't like that. He seems like it's digging into your skull. Cause that's a nice, like a grippy wool shirt. I could grab onto that. I mean, he, he sometimes prefers the head because uh, he likes to be elevated. Like, you know, it's the closest thing to a tree, as as I I guess he's used to. What are you, 6'5", 6'6"? 6'1". 6'1". That's pretty tall. It's taller than me. It's pretty tall. <laughs> yeah. Pretty tall. Um, you want to hear the a parrot saying, what the fuck? Here we go. Sure. <laughs> wow. Do you want to you hear a parrot do a horse? Yeah. Ready? Can you do a horse? Good. You want to hear, hear a parrot saying popcorn? Yeah. Popcorn. <laughs> <laughs> Can I hear a parrot saying, um, uh, making the sound of like a chainsaw? <laughs> you can Google that for real. You can Google it. Oh, there's birds in the, there's, there it is. Wait, I got one. Here we go. This is a parrot. Wow, they're really good. That sounds good. Yeah, they're good. What's your parrot do? Scary, Sherry? Oh, does it say anything? Uh, no, he's not really uh, like a mimic parrot. He he does make a lot of different sounds. That I'd say he has like 42, 42 different sounds in like his vocabulary, but he's not like a 42. word. <laughs> yeah, forty two is kind of specific. Yeah, yeah. you counted them. I I have. I've counted. Um, the number, the number of different calls he makes for distress or I want food or why are you not paying attention to me? And, uh, yeah, 42 is a pretty arbitrary number. (laughs) (laughs) You want to hear a parent say something about kissing a baby? Maybe, maybe you could, maybe you could teach my wife how to say some more things, more variety. (laughs) My wife's got 11 things. She she says, she says 11. She says 11. Uh, Okay. What are are a few of them? Uh, um, where have you been? Where have you been? What's this? (laughs) Who's that? Pick that up. Put that away. Uh, move your car. Um, it's pretty bright in here. <laughs> Who are you texting? And um, why do you have your shoes on? <laughs> How about this one? The gas bill is going up. We need to winterize the apartment. <laughs> this sounds like a the fetish. Baby. Sounds like a fetish. How, how long does that bastard live? Like not, 90 years? <laughs> they live a long time, don't they? 106. Uh, in captivity, 
35 for this guy. 35? Okay. That's a short one. Why'd you get wow. one that's so short-lived? How do you know he's a bastard? Um, well, what yeah. about outside of captivity? Uh, I think I think Ten around days. 40 is, is max for Eclectus. Uh, um, now, can I ask you, uh, what? where are you located? I'm in Chicago. Okay. So you Wait, probably don't want to send him free. Can ever. we roll that back? You said 30... And you said 40 outside of captivity. He lives shorter in captivity? No, he captivity? said in captivity 40. Right? Oh, I thought you said the flu. No, 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 no. Other way around. In captivity, uh, they live shorter lives. See, oh, this is bad. This okay. is a bad right. thing. Are they depressed? Is that what it is? Because they yeah, can't fly? Yeah, so he, he doesn't fly at all. Um, we no. you know, are in a, an apartment, and uh, we can't take him outside, obviously. Um, in the summertime, he does fly, but... Uh, of course, now it's getting to be cold. So, six months out of the year, he's resigned to being we both hit the on my sad head. Music at the same time. This is sad. Uh, do I you, think this is sad. Do you ever like take it out for a walk and like put a little like chain around its neck so it doesn't fly off or anything? Or can you do collar? that? No, is that what you mean? A like collar? a collar? Yeah, uh, like, yeah, a chain collar. Collar and a leash. Mm-hmm. A chain. He'll, he'll, a leash. he'll go out in a the chain. cage. Um, he doesn't really feel comfortable. You know, like we we go out to the park and other people have their dogs, so. We usually keep him in the cage, but he, he likes going outside now, when it's, you know, good climate. Are you going to bring him to uh, the hideout on January 20th when I'm there with Brent Weinbach? Mm. Bring him oh, to shows loose. eight and seven, uh, eight and nine. Wait. <laughs> I bet that, 100%. I bet, you're doing two, two, I'm just working good. in plugs wow. into the... Uh, uh... <laughs> uh, yeah, I wouldn't miss it for the world. Uh, Avery like... might not make it. Okay. Now, um, he's, he's not really crowd going or, or I mean, he would love stand up comedy, but he's he hasn't been exposed to a lot of that might be too shocking. All right. You know, I'm there's, make, a, there's a flock. Well, we could yeah, we can so, move on. But yeah, that's a great, great call. So um, that's um, a great start. And, and, and if there are any other uh, I mean, zoomers well, out you know, there, we have a long we have a yeah. long day. Let yeah. me ask you one more question. What do you yeah. do um, in Chicago? My home, my sweet home, my Chicago. alma mater. I'll just call it. Uh, I work in substance use treatment. I uh, help folks uh, get connected to My various man. agencies there you go. throughout Chicago for substance use. Um, and that's my MO. We all can grow and we all can learn. Well, thank you for your great work. Yes. And, uh, very Chicago. important. Very important stuff. Yeah. Uh, so yeah. how did you get? And thanks for having me on the show. Where, how how yeah, did the parrot here. come about? Did you so rescue it or did you my... just go to Petco and be like, I <clears> want a parrot? <throat> Uh, it's my girlfriend's parrot, and uh, she inherited him uh, from her brother. And I don't know the story or the origin before that. What is this? Meet uh, the parents <laughs> when you were dating her? Or? Hello. <laughs> That's good, actually. Are That's you gonna good. Are you gonna keep it That's till good. it till it passes? Yeah, yeah. He. What kind of question you know, is I'm that? I'm just wondering, like, because like, keep asking like, about Vic? the death date. No, are you parent, gonna like... keep it until it dies? <laughs> but the novelty. Hey, the hey, you novelty, gonna keep it until it dies? The novelty wears off. You nah, gotta, he'll... you gotta be like, oh, I got this damn bird oh, in my, my house now, right? Sick. Don't you know? I'm I mean, talking about the bird, right? Uh, yeah, the bird. Yeah, okay. <laughs> the, 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 yes, the the parakeet or whatever it is. That's what parrot. I said. To people want their kids. Are you gonna keep it until it dies? How long? How long is it gonna stick? That's a beautiful kid you got. You gonna keep it until it dies? Gonna end it off. You're, you're. Your son is so adorable. Are you going to keep him yeah. until keep he dies? Keep it until he stops being cute. <laughs> it's a bird. I mean, anyway. You're going to keep that thing until it goes to puberty? <laughs> Get rid of it. Get it out of here. Get it to Uncle Jack. <laughs> keep that damn chicken quiet. Um, so, All right. yeah. All right. But, well, but thank you. Uh, yeah. Thanks, Gary. Thanks for sharing. Thanks yes. for and, uh, If there's more people with pets, we want to see them. Um, oh, that's true. We should you know see. Thanks for having me. Yeah. Yes. Do you want to explain what's happening at when is it? Yeah, 11? So 10, 10. Uh, 10, 10 and yeah, 10 yeah, a.m. 10 a.m. Uh, more pets. Uh, we need more pets. Bring your pets. Get them on Zoom. We want to see them. Are you guys yeah, because David up? Cross is going to yes. rate your pets. Yes. Oh. I was trying to keep it a secret, but that's a shame. Well, well, you know the song now Shari Vary? All right, hold that pole. You guys are cast Ooh. up. You know the song? Wisconsin dud thing. See, that was the we'll angle get, he should have we'll started with. with that was the angle, mm-hmm. right? That's Everybody the else, get your pets angle. ready. Mm-hmm. Well, I see a lot of pets. That's good. Bovine dropping. That's the good angle. Bovine has got a pet. Oh, I love it. Oh, Ammon, what is that? Whoa. Oh, we have some good pets for David to write. This is going to be real nice. The pounding. You guys want to do... Uh, yeah, anyone have any horses? That would be City cool. of the day... Uh, 
Do you want to get a fake ad from somebody? Yes. <clears throat> Do we have? Yes. Yeah. yeah, Mr. Social, right? Yes. And if anybody else has them, DM. Yes. Because we're not doing a city of the day today. You're doing them. What do you mean I'm doing them? The, the, I'm talking the, to the, the audience. Are no. <laughs> You're doing them, audience. My tits are so Mr. Wet. Social. Go crazy. Hey, can you hear me okay? We can not hear really. you. We can't see you. You can't see me. There, oh, there you go. are. Uh, no. wow. Whoa, where are you? Hi, guys. Is that a pawn shop? Do you work at an MTA? I'm at work. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like the, uh, I work in a factory. It looks like you're in the booth at the subway in New York, you know? <laughs> Doesn't it? Take the oh, six. Wait, Take the on. six. Oh, yeah. What is, is, it a micro, is it a microphone? Where is he? Uh, no. Oh. No, no. Uh, I'm working in a factory where we produce headlamps for... Vehicle. Oh, okay, nice. Um, oh, why do why do they gotta be so uh, bright nowadays? <laughs> you know, this is the show right here. This them. is it. Right. I keep telling them. Can we? Yeah, can we see what what you do there? Or oh, he is in the middle of it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, Hello? let me give you a little tour. Yeah, yeah we've talked to Mister Social before. He's an old friend. I don't know if I've been in this in this Are you facility break? before though. His his connection's not great. <clears throat> it's all right. Make is this a union job? Shun. This has got to be union, right? Oh, we lost. Yeah, this. I was on the, uh, I guess on the Halloween episode. Here. <laughs> yeah, you know what, though? When you move around, yeah, Mr. Yeah, it Social, doesn't sound good, Mr. His, Social. His boss yeah, is caught him. Like, they, they, they unplug give us your, uh, they unplug the router. I'm getting give stressed here. I'm a little stressed out. Uh, oh, here he is. This is kind of a broken social scene. Sorry, I don't mean to stress you out. You know, I've got a break at... 10. You guys wanted to come back to me. Dude, look at those thanks. robots wow. making things behind you. Mr. Social, give us your fake ad and let's get you out of here. Okay, okay. That's <laughs> get that's you out of here. Okay. Let's get you back. Look at those <laughs> robots <laughs> behind him, though. That's yeah. pretty wild. Yeah. That is crazy. I want to see that. Yeah. Mr. No, no Social, slacking. work on your Wi Fi yeah. connection. I'm interested. You don't want but this is a disaster. Here. I don't want to see something, someone get hurt. You know what I mean? Like a robot grab something. All right, Chris Stein, you have a fake ad and a good connection. Thank you. Yeah, I just have a couple quick, tiny little lines here. This guy's you know? a professional wow. caller. Yeah. You look straight out of a like like a um, a library. Like, looks like uh, a Facebook like avatar. A, like a, yeah, a goatee. Mm -hmm. You look great. The carpet's yeah. clean. All clean. Right, and the and the, I like the black on black on black. The goatee oh. and the yeah, it all. And anyway, the, and no, the headset. No commenting on the looks. Okay, sorry. I'm just saying, I just appreciate. Good. I thought that's what you I started. Talking about. It. I know. You can't comment on looks. We're not gonna. Yeah, no more looks comment. Can I comment? You yeah. Can't say what we see. <laughs> Why? Oh, because it's, it's, it's a, I get it, I get it. I get it. Go, you don't go down a right, wrong Let path the man and... speak. He's got a fake ad. Oh, oh it's just, a, it's just, a, it's not a big, I'm just I'm here for the advertisement. I'm I appreciate gonna... all the compliments. Do you want the, the music, you want the music behind you? Yeah, just a tiny one. I only have a couple good lines, but yeah. <laughs> so today, today's show, City of the Day, <laughs> is brought to you by Fred Durst, Bratwurst, and Bread Hearst. You can come down to Fred Durst, Bratwurst, and Bread Hearst, get yourself a limp biscuit, or some hot dog flavored water, you can come in like a mother effing chainsaw. What? Yes, that's right. Fred Durst has his own hearse, and you can get bratwurst or bread at that hearse. Nothing crazy, but yes, Very please good. enjoy. Right. Okay, you know, this is I'm a start. Into that. I'm into that. It's a hearse. I thought the it's hearse. A hearse. <laughs> Isn't the hearse made of bread? That's the idea, right? So you bury the hearse with the body. It's a bread yeah, hearse. Yeah, that's exactly it. Fred yeah. Durst you, you, bread hearst. Hearst. You can buy bread, or it is a hearse made of bread. Yes, it is both. Yeah. Okay. Let's hear it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Thanks man, for having me. Love y'all. Love you, man. buddy. Thanks, Chris. That was great. I'm just trying to send somebody a link so they can zoom in. Is Chris still on? <clears throat> Chris Stein? <clears throat> He's the, I'm looking at him. Chris, what are you? Where are you, you located? To to more? Let's talk. Let's interview him a little bit. Can I guess? Yeah. yeah. Johnny's going to yeah, guess. Go ahead, where go guess where you're located? I'm yeah, going to go guess wrong. Arizona. You're not in Arizona. That is wrong. You're not in you're, Wyoming. You're correct on being wrong. I, I see a clue. I, I know we're not supposed to look at or talk about what they're wearing, but <laughs> no. your shirt says something. And That's a band, though. Oh, Aesop. That's a guy. That's a guy. Oh, Aesop Rock. Oh, okay. How about this? How about not New Mexico? You know, poor Aesop Rock, because all these all the Aesops came out. ASAP Rocky. You know, there's only one other one, Doug. There's only one. Well, there's ASAP the Rocky. Rocky. They do the ASAP Rocky. Rocky. Oh, yeah. It's a joke. Every he came time out way later than ASAP Rock. I'm spelling yeah, Aesop's poor ASAP Rock. Since the 90s. I think you're probably not in Washington State. That's also wrong. You're not in California. 
wrong. You're not in Texas. Right. Not in Oklahoma. I'm not in Texas. Nope. You're Wait, not you in, said wrong when you he when said you, when you said so you're, you're in not California. In, you're not in Texas. Well, he's said. he's right that he's wrong. He's he's just yeah, constantly he's wrong. You're not so, yeah. in Oklahoma. I'll affirm the right place. No, you're not in you any Carolina. More states to go. Not in any Carolina. Mm, close, but not quite. You're in Virginia. Nope. Fuck. Um, Georgia. Yeah. Oh, there you go. There we go. Oh, How good was that? That was good. Millions of peaches. There you yeah. go. <clears throat> you got in there just in time. I'm I would have never boy. guessed Georgia. Where in yeah. Georgia? Atlanta. Yep. Athens. There in Atlanta. Okay. Were, right. you, were you born there? Were you born there? <laughs> no. or you moved there. Okay, no. that's why. I'm from the from the northern parts of Michigan. So are oh, you go. are you yelling people? No, not yet. I mean, I'm I'm working. I'm working from home, so it's not so much I get to talk to people or to get that y'all. I mean, been here a year, can't even get that accent down yet. But we're getting there. We're getting there. I I'll yell you sometimes. I'm a yaller. You do a yaller? Yeah. I'm a yaller. yaller all well, you the grew time. up with yalling, right? No. No. Oh, a little just, bit. A little bit. I didn't. I don't think I knew anybody that yalled. I love y'all. Yeah. 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 It's, 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 it's homey. It comes with the sausage biscuits and extra sweet tea. Ooh. Y'all come dip it on the Triple Dippers 2014 <laughs> South American <laughs> oh, Tour. That's deep. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I love is uh, saying y'all to a single person. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Y'all that dog. Whoa. Whoa. Speaking of pets. Oh, yeah. so I got two little some guys. action. <laughs> oh, yeah. Matt left. So Matt, I guess Matt's we're, we're stuck with Chris for a while. Oh, so we've got a Jack Russell. Yeah, two Jack Russells. One Jack Russell, one Chihuahua. Wow. Thank you. All right, so seven hours and 33 minutes to go. Um, we, uh, we're, we're <laughs> trying to get the 6,000 patrons by Oh, yeah, that what's time? our patron count, Matt? Can you? Oh, um, look at those dogs. What are we at here? They're so cute. I would let those dogs bite me. <laughs> they, they would. They would, would, let, they would do would that to you. would be fine with it. No problem. Let them this bite. guy's got a diaper on. Oh, He's not incontinent. No. He's just, he just loves to spread his joy. Not a fan. Mm. Not a fan. Uh, dipe up. Tom, can you pull up this new innovation? Um, we're still at 5826. Oh. <laughs> but <laughs> I like that graphic. The good news is we have this graphic. Tom, can you pull this up for Is yeah, it gra- I mean the graphic can change? Actually? Yeah. Like, wow, this is advanced. You'll see. Maybe okay. I'll add to well, we'll, we can maybe add we won't see if I'll add a logo. What's... Chris, are you a patron? And let's do picture in picture for Yeah, that, for I, the well, I'm, I, okay, I that's think right. might expired. But yeah. I have a question. I, I, wait a minute. Wait, wait a on. minute. Then I had to, I did a re- big sweep uh, of my subscriptions recently. Uh, let's <laughs> okay. m- let's bring that number down. Get them out. We gotta get you. Uh, we gotta get you on the. Let's patron. update the chart. Yeah, uh, you gotta now, get back on. Uh, if you want to <clears> subscribe <throat> to the Patreon, you get a lot of great bonus stuff. So much bonus stuff. It's I mean, unbelievable. Yes, Johnny, you have a question. What's the minimum subscriber level? Just five is bucks it, a month. Five. Five bucks. Five bucks. Is that the maximum as well? No, maximum is sky's the limit. Okay. Sky's the limit. Yeah, you can do whatever but you want. But five is going to get you on the board. Absolutely. It's going to get you. Five's it's going to get you the compound. Sh- it's going to okay. get you the Joel hole. Yeah. Is, that beh- is that in That's there? That's on there. That's on there. We've got a lot of stuff. We got, what uh, else? Uh, stuff we you got get? Matt's, Matt's podcast. You get, you get messages from Tim every <laughs> week. Messages from Tim. You get yes. personal, yeah. personal, personal voice messages. So Tim messages 8,000 people No, no, no. Every well, week. He'll, you know, he'll put out a little personal diary kind of thing. But sometimes he does these things where he's like, hey, patrons, let's hang out. And he'll get on a personal Zoom and you can you can talk to Tim. Okay. Eight thousand yeah. people. Sometimes he shows up at their houses. Mm-hmm. Sometimes he will. <laughs> Gives them hand jobs. Right. <laughs> what if we that. lose subscribers on this show? This could I mean, happen. this could yeah. Could I don't the plug. think so. I think we're gonna hit six thousand, right, gang? My, uh, Matt, what's on the agenda? What's next? On this the is list? fun, by the way. Oh wait, You're having fun? Any questions? Guess what? Guess what? I love Let's it. Take news, guys. This yeah, is what, pretty fun. Hold on a second. So far, two good callers. Yeah, I like the camaraderie you have going on here. But wait a second! I got some big news, too. guys. Oh man, now what? We're up to fifty-eight twenty-nine. Wow! So that's that's a uh, oh we made it. That's we one. Got that's one. one. We got one. We got one. We right? got three. Oh, we got three. Oh 58, my god! Twenty-six to fifty. That calls for a one-two-three drop. Where is it? Let's see. Which one should I do? I what, got some. You got one. Dude, I have so many drops. It's insane. I'll it, do. I, um, it's hard to even find them. Anyone? About. One, two, three. Ooh. That's boys to men. One, two, three, three. Boys, dance, <laughs> It's probably oh, classic. You know, it's hard to boys. beat that classic. Yeah. One, two, three. One, two, three. That's, that's the best song. <laughs> what is that called again? <laughs> that whole song's amazing. What is who that is that? Song? It's very familiar. I don't know who it is. It's I think it's a like one-hit wonder. Or it's Play like it the again. clock. No, but this the singer sounds very I know familiar. It. It's, it's almost like Lou Bega, right? 
Wait, quiet. Oh. No. Wait, quiet. It's almost in the Huey Lewis kind of yeah. like section That's of the record say, store, like, you yeah. know? It's a little the section manlier, of the record though. store? Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, you know, like if you like Huey Lewis, you yeah, might like this. If you like gruff to? men who can sing through drugs. <laughs> can anyone identify that, please? Look Kitos. up. Scranton. Um, so, um, I know did we do voice. the, uh, what Sheboygan. is the city of the day? Did we do that already? Are we... We did we... not. You want to? You want to well, get a zoomer get to it, be? Get it out of the way. The what? The city of the day. Let's you Chicago. don't have one. Let's well, Chicago. The zoomer's gonna. Oh, wait, Chicago. I mean, we is. just did one. Oh, okay. oh, what is the city of? I see the yeah. actual city. Yeah, that's what I. Mean. Well, I guess that would be Atlanta. San Francisco. That's uh. Okay, there we go. Minneapolis. Um, so where are we at here? Zoomers. Any zoomers want to be the city of the day today? Yeah, I'll do it. Sure. <laughs> okay, hi. My name's uh Ben Ben Jackson. I'm in uh, a city of the day. Hi. How's it going, guys? God, I love hey, this show. Hey, where are you calling from, Ben? I'm in uh well, should I tell you now or do you want me to want to guess? <laughs> That's not really how I don't want to guess or make a, a made I'm, up city. I'm in city. Austin Albert Lee. <laughs> What's that? Austin Albert Lee. It's a it's a principal city in uh, southeast Minnesota. Hi. Austin Albert Lee. Where's your cricket uh, drops? <laughs> Go to a Zoomer. Uh, I'm Zoomer. Uh, I'm Ben, ben right. Stephen Jackson. All right, George Quick. <laughs> Hi, I'm Jewel Jackson. <laughs> George Quick, make it quick. No, I'm not so quick. We've already been over this. Have you been on before? Wait, Boonville? Are you, you go to Boonville? I was on with uh, Andy Richter's show. We did um, some album, we did some album pickings. You got a picture oh. of it? Best day of your life, huh? Yeah, it was. <laughs> Wait, um, so you go to Boonville, you go to uh, you go to New York. Do you do, what do you do there? I, I no, this is up in Northern California. This is oh, a brewery. Oh, okay, okay. That's where they do the weed and beer. <laughs> weed and they got some uh, sours. They got some gozes. They got some Jambers. fun things. Oh, is that a bear with uh, with moose uh, antlers? Is that what's going on there? Those are those are yeah, deer antlers. A, or deer antlers. I don't know the difference. There must be a nuclear plant nearby. Okay. <laughs> I don't know if I want to drink that beer with that. <laughs> Do I get to be city of the day? Yes. It's Boonville or Boonville, right? No, it's oh. San Francisco. Okay. You guys have never done San Francisco. Wow. Yeah, but we like to do deep cuts. You mm-hmm. know? Where are you? Are you born in San Francisco? No. Where I was are you born? born in Mansfield, Ohio. Now we're Whoa. talking. That's the city of the day, Mansfield, Ohio. Hell yes. Now we're talking. Now, what you, what brought you out to SF? You're thinking that's where Jerry's from. I gotta go to no, dude. I um, go to hate you probably remember that site, Fecal Face. Fecal the Face. Jo- yeah, what they also show? had a gallery. I they remember were this. I actually remember really, this. They were doing really cool stuff in San Francisco, and that was when like Ty Seagal and the OCs were like playing here. This was like ten years ago, and I was like, that's where I gotta be. That's where all the cool shit is. Wait, what's fecal face? Yeah, I don't know. That's what he just said. <laughs> it was, it, it was, it was a, a website. It was a really cool website. Wait, so how does this website relate to Ty Seagull and the OCs, which are great bands? But The fecal face was based in San Francisco. It was run by a guy named John Tripp, and it was all artists. And they like promoted a lot of really cool artists like Barry McGee and Jeremy Fish. And... Feces. <laughs> sure, Barry <laughs> McGee. Feces. And it was just a cool early HTML website that just showcased like art and I remember this now. It was crazy. It was wild. It, it, it was, was like kind of interactive a little bit. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I remember this. It was fun and crazy. And they had a gallery. They had a gallery, like a, a brick and mortar gallery where they did like art shows and people came. And like Mike Giant was uh, affiliated with like all those people. The just artist like Mike Giant. Of- Mm-hmm. The hand it, it was style just, like artist. a lot of cool art was happening through this gallery and it was just like art culture skateboarding i wanted to see all the famous spots like hubba hideout and pier seven and the three up three down all that stuff it just seemed like the place to be the stairs the hippie stairs the coffee shops yeah. the plants did the, you skate the, the houses uh, Escond- what's it called the escondido barcadero barcadero oh yeah the um Did you what's kick it the Gons kind of, gap? It wasn't there when I moved here. <laughs> what about Serpico? 
Oh, he's cool. He's yeah. got uh, he's, I like his ponchos. Do you have any products? Do you have any city of the day sponsors ideas? Yeah, I do. There oh. is actually a famous company that's from Mansfield, Ohio. And what is that called? Klondike ice cream bars. Oh, <laughs> so it just, it's a real ad. Yeah, just do a real ad. Really, Klond- yeah, I haven't that's, had a Klondike that, that's something in new. years. Yeah. What if we just started doing real just ads, real ads? <laughs> and and do it for free and see if they'll it's, pay us right. retroactively? Uh-huh. That's like, fine. I pay you in a stop you know, doing that. Our Klondike bars got a real big bump <laughs> right. in sales, They're... so we we owe you a little something. Uh huh. It should be a different. You know, Klondike can get into another business stream. They have a can... Patreon now. Klondike. Klondike's They're Patreon. On Patreon. What does that yeah. name mean? Where does that Klondike Shit, come from? What is that about? I think it's from like, uh, isn't it like a, in a city in Alaska or something? I don't know. I, it, it, they've, it's they've something stolen cold. It. They stole it. They stole it. And they're they're saying they're from Ohio? <clears throat> it's very confusing. It sounds like a ripoff. It sounds like a put on. <laughs> right. Oh, yeah. I have a question for the for the audience. My computer <laughs> says, your disc is full. And I just deleted oh. like a thousand things. He keeps oh, saying that. that How is... do I fix it? Any Mac heads out there? You got to empty Sci- the trash can. Sound off in the comments. <laughs> Have you emptied the trash can? That's what I just did. I emptied the trash, dude. I did it all. Have you restarted it? <sighs> no, oh, I'm doing a Jesus. show right now. I can't well, it's too oh. late now. I guess I could restart it. But... You know, I have an idea. Yeah? Tilt your camera down so you got to stoop to look into it. <laughs> <laughs> All the cameras are like, you got to be like this. <laughs> Wait, you mean these guys? The everybody. The everybody, yeah. if you come in on Zoom, tilt it down so you got to stoop. You got to be like this. <laughs> you got to stoop deep. Like, <laughs> hey, guys. Hey, guys. How's it going? <laughs> a deep stoop. Can you try that? Test it out. Bring your camera down a little bit. Yeah, tilt it down so it's and then, so you want to like, button. Yeah, you want to hunch down. There we now go. Now hunch down. There we go. Now hunch down to look into okay, it. Get down. Like you're on like, like physically, like yeah. There we yeah. go. There we go. Now whisper like you're in, like, like there's someone in the house mm-hmm. and you're telling the cops or your friend like, hey, there's somebody here. Go stupid. Hey, there's someone here. Okay, and now <laughs> smack the camera off there and then go blank. <laughs> I'm like, oh shit. Oh, there what it is. Happened? Wow. What happened, everybody? Well, Doug's disc is full. Good. My disc is full. Chuck a car. All right, next got, Uber. Uh, one last, one okay. last yeah. question. Yeah, for, yeah, we got uh, all day. Squad. Yeah, I mean, what's, there's no rush. <laughs> we literally <laughs> have get a lot of time to talk today. <laughs> we're uh, I'm it's getting uh, we're getting married next May, and I wondered if there's any cool like. Did you say unfortunately I'm getting married? Is that what oh. I said? Unfortunately. Oh, unf- oh okay. <laughs> Sorry. Wow. Well, no, I was mean. wondering if there's any cool like wedding ideas. Like I know people do like photo booths. Yeah, sign a and, sign like... a prenup in front of everybody. Do that right <laughs> at the start. I got a good one. Have you thought about doing a synchronized dance to uh, that song, uh, the Stomp and Clap be. song? Uh, Imagine Dragons has a great song. Oh, I know. Twenty seconds. Do 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 do. Coom, coom, coom. Ah, I wish I could marry you right now. And you come out. <laughs> Wait, how's Johnny, that, how's are that you go? a married how's man? Go? Yeah, I'm married. You're a married guy? Yep. We gotta, get, we gotta get Doug married. Maybe we can marry him off today. Yeah. <laughs> we got a lot of time. If we get to 6,000, Doug, we'll <laughs> Call get married. Her. Seven, eight, eight, nine hundred patron gets to hey, marry. If we get Doug. to six thousand, I'll marry the six thousand patron. <laughs> or, yeah. Cancel it. Quick, quick, cancel it. Wait, so you, what is the question? Just something wait, fun to do at the wedding? We already saw that it's do a do I just a think dance. that they sometimes do cool, like there's like weird, you know, interesting things where people they'll have like a, a photo booth. Dude, I know. Have yeah, like photo booth. Dude, is have a, way a to fake. Go. Yeah. During no the ceremony, cares. have a fake like like, like a terrorist attack. Like a, a terrorist attack. <laughs> yeah. You know? That'd be great. Like be like, what Bomb the fuck? Threat. Like have a big explosion. Like yeah. hire hire some pyrotechnic. <laughs> Uh, people that could do flash bangs or whatever, uh-huh. and then have a SWAT team come in, and then and then they're like, then they take off, they take off their SWAT outfits, and then they start you know dancing. fast rip away. That'd be great. And then they start doing the electric slide. What right. about or Mambo Number Five? What about a bunch of wasps? Get a bunch of wasps in there, <laughs> but like de-sting them. Uh, you know, like no. they take their. Oh, you want their stingers? No, okay. you want that stingers active. Okay, hot and active. Stingers. Active wasps. Hot I mean, and ready. People like would that. remember that. That's, you know, you know? be a cool idea. Get pizza. A lot of it. <laughs> Get a whole bunch of pizza, and Papa anybody John's. can have it except for one person. And when they try to get it, you just smack them with a big stick. You're like not you. <laughs> I got an idea. Have a ceremony. Have a five-minute long ceremony. 
Then let yeah. everyone just hang out. Oh, mm-hmm. oh open bar. Perfect. Open bar. Yeah. <laughs> open bar. <laughs> open bar. <laughs> Anybody can get whatever they want to drink until they do something that they can never not uh-huh. do. <laughs> How yeah, about a loaded right. gun? <laughs> is this an activity? Loaded, at a loaded the, gun bar. Is this something for like the the uh, the reception? Yeah, probably. Uh-huh. I got a bad kid to get some strange bad kids in there. <laughs> Just some, just some wild cards. Get them in right. there. Yeah, hire some <laughs> weird wild cards off a of Craigslist. Yeah. Be like, you just come to my wedding and you know add some flavor, add some strangers but, to the mix. You, you know? could steal Big my people. idea, actually, kid DJ. That's not Big my people in the shins. Oh, you can have a, D, a a playlist, a wedding playlist. You know, put all the hits mm-hmm. on there. Celebrate good time. Okay. Come on. Put on your Britney. Put on your. We are all family. family. Yeah, shades off brick. House. <laughs> All right, I got breaking news, guys. And then just have a kid be back there. Yeah. So right. he doesn't really have to. On the twos and ones. And have him be like three years old. Matt's got breaking news. I got breaking news. <laughs> oh, no. Thanks, George. Is it from CNN? What is it? It is. Got a Patreon update. We are up to 5835. Oh wow! Wow! Right. Can I see that on the on the thermometer? Yeah, I can't yeah, understand let's, that. Let's give Johnny. There you go. Oh, there it is! Wow! Yeah, 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 yeah. And we got a little more pizzazz. I like that we're using yeah. Phil to promote this too. <laughs> like, <laughs> this is well. You know what? How I want to do just, a little. How did, upgraded that image like is that so quickly. Phil Lesh? I would, <laughs> this is what we do for the Patreon community. Wow! Oh, so Your each time it goes up, is there a new graphic already? Oh, that's a good idea. That's a bonus. I just want to make my little pitch for you to join the Patreon now. You get. Office Hours East the supports that. That's crust gotta hurt. You get rock fossils. You get the main show ad free. You get two hours every week. You get Uncle Phil, his wig fun. And Matt even has that. a podcast. Now. I even have a podcast. And what's that called, Matt? It's called I Was At That Show. That's a good, is it about shows? About going to rock shows. <laughs> I've been in a lot of shows. Come on the show. I got ticket stubs I can show you. Whoa. I'd love to see them. Johnny. We gotta ask. Wait, you first concert, pictures? what was it? The oh. very first concert ever. Like, what is that? What's a concert though? What's the, th- the real thing? When that you maybe went, you just you had you went to a show and like, a band. It was, you saw a band. Like your decision to go. Not like not you're like, at like, the mall and there's somebody performing. You're yeah, at a not concert. Not let's go see Sharon Lois and Bram or something like that. You want to? Okay. You know, what's a real show that you went? First to? concert. It's kind of two. There's one I kind of went to. I didn't really know them, mm-hmm. but that I don't think that really counts. And who was it? Radiohead. It was. The Beastie Boys. Oh, really? But I was really young. I just didn't know. How did you go to the Beastie Boys? Yeah, my I, friend not... Eric asked me if I wanted to go, and I said, okay. Did you like it? I think I had a good time. What era was it yeah. with the big dick? Ill, Ill, Ill Communications yeah. tour. Oh, that's, okay. that's after, their, after their that earlier. Was, that was 92, wasn't it? It was. Uh, I was in seventh grade, I think. Maybe seven, something like that. And then the first real concert that I went to that we had to ask, we had to use the phone at the middle school to call to get the tickets. Oh. But the nun let us use it. That was for REM with Sonic Youth. Wow. Whoa. It was great. Not five, not four, not two, just three. That's Thank a pretty you, cool Jesus. concert, Johnny. Sonic, cool. and Sonic Youth and REM played together. Oh, Sonic Youth opened. Huh. Yeah. When we got there late, and just like today, I was, you know, marginally <laughs> late. Fashion uh, late. And, what kind of uh, venue was it? It was the Target Center in Minneapolis. It's big, big venue. Is no. it seated? Big. It has seats, but no one was sitting down. They were standing up. So Just, there was no mosh pit. What what album was that for REM? That would have been. It was Monster. It was Monster. Yeah. yeah. You know, hits, what such album hits? for REM? Uh, That's uh, Sonic what's Youth. It, experimental what's Jet Set it? Trash and No Star, I believe. Uh-huh. Right when we got there, they were playing Starfield Road, and the whole place was rumbling. It was pretty cool. Wow. Yeah. Did they play? They played a bunch of early stuff. They did. Yeah. Uh, they played. You know, my friends all bought washing machine T-shirts because you got to have that T-shirt. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Right. That's the T-shirt you got to have to go to the record fair. Well, got to have your washing machine T-shirt so everyone knows that you are in the know. I'm just a human being, and I go to the bathroom like everybody else. <laughs> So um, I think Johnny's so, a little out of focus. If we can fix that, oh no! I, I, I requested soft. Actually, <laughs> oh, you got soft. Okay. I requested soft. I put a little Vaseline up there, just to, you know, to hide, to make me look, uh-huh. make me pop. Um, do we uh, want to take a, a caller, like a like a phone call, just to show that it can happen? And can we give the phone number? Did out? we run it because there's no callers on the hotline? What wow. is the uh, what is the number? I don't even know what it is. Remember Let's when people used to uh, use Tom. phones? Remember that. <laughs> 
You know what people used to call people instead of zooming them? God forbid you should call somebody. You got to yeah. see my face? Okay, come on. Let's bring back calls, everybody. Phone number. You pick up your phone, you dial the number. Now you got to log into Zoom, have the host admit you. What is this crap? And cell phones, like, you don't even remember people's numbers anymore. No. Like, there's no, like, somebody asked me the other day to, to you know, call this person. I didn't have my phone. Like, I remember numbers. How are you going to know? I, you remember numbers? I spent a lot of time. Wow. You study. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah, we got to bring back back, um, back that parrot guy. So, yeah, I want to hear the parrot guy again. But listen, we got, if you guys want to get on the horn, the actual horn phone, uh, you can call the studio. I'm just going to read the bottom here. 818-804-4478. We want to hear you now. First person to get through, uh, we will say hello to. So let's just wait. Sometimes I look at this and there's just the camera's just sitting on me and I'm not saying. Oh anything. no! <laughs> I just <laughs> I just, just told Tom about, about that. Disturbing. <laughs> go to the wide shot. <laughs> yeah. There we go. That, that should be the shot. default. So we got anybody? But, you uh, know, let's thank. Let's I just take a second. And thank Tom for sitting in today. Wes is traveling. Yeah. Couldn't be here. Yeah. Thanks. Uh, yeah. Thanks. Thanks to Luke stuff. and Tom for being here all day. Um, the guys we in the know booth. Tom the... helped me edit the latest episode yeah. of the Compound. That's right. Only yes. on, this one is only on Patreon. And, and we're going to look at yeah. some a couple of the earlier what episodes today. Yes, we are. Uh, what is that? Well, <laughs> stick around and find out. When is that going to be? That sounded really nice. It's like, like a drop, right? Yeah. You're not, I am do a that. voice artist, right? Yeah, now. just quiet and then do, do it, do it again so it's like a clean... Go ahead. What is that? Wow. You sound somebody, like Michael Barbaro. Yeah, somebody send That's, that to us. At 12 o'clock noon, we're going to look at the Do you guys have notes? I can change it. No, I think that was like bassy enough. How about this? What is that? <laughs> I can change it again. I can change it infinitely. Do it a little higher, higher. What is that? And then do it high and then drop it low for the, the you know, that kind of thing. What is that? That's pretty good. I got a drop of you, Johnny. Want to hear it? Yeah, I want to hear it. Contra <laughs> oh, That's me affected, though. Here's Johnny. 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 So any hothead hotline callers? There's nobody want to call. I, don't, the I wonder if something's people. going on because it's well. The phone Luke, do you know if it's I up just go running? to a Zoomer. Yeah, let's talk to a Zoomer. Zoomers Maya's back with her keyboard. Yeah, they could let's just turn the camera. Off. You guys want to see my new hat? You wouldn't even know. Oh yeah, let's see it. Hi. Whoa. Very cool. Do you like <laughs> this hat? Um. <laughs> Can you Just see a her. Zoomer? Who's there? Who we got here? This is Maya with her keyboard. I learned a new song on the piano. Got a lot of background All noise. All right. Someone's there... got a preschool at home. Matt, can we see it up here? Is it... Yeah, what's up with that? Oh, there we go. Okay, let's hear your oh, song. Oh, is that a Rhodes? Okay. Uh, hold Rhodes. on. I can't tell. Um, That's not a Rhodes. Oh, there's a cat, too. Wow. Michaela and I are just having a conversation. This week on Hoarders. <laughs> Could you imagine preparing for something okay. ever? I'm about to play this song. Guys, Before, you know, you Maya, and this is a note to all the Zoomers. I know you think it's a good idea to like show us your surroundings, but when you pick your computer up and move it around, it's terrible. I think oh, it looks fine. It looks fine to me, I'm man. I'm, I'm all into this. I'm into it. I'm I feel like I'm there. I can't see anything going on. I'm getting a headache. Oh, it's fine. This is, you know what? This is like the, this is the equivalent of someone being in line at the post office. <laughs> you know what I mean? And when they're like, they get to the okay. window and they don't have anything written yeah, down. Yeah, it shows a lack of respect. Okay. Like just, just have the address written down. Have some maybe a payment method. Know what you want to do. Maya's know been what you came too. I like she it that it's filling up our eight hours here. You know, so it's, I'm it's ready to show the time them. you need. I'm ready to show the song. Well, you're not and showing anything because your mm -hmm. camera's off. Wow. Happy Halloween. Can y'all even hear that? It's it's a nightmare. Yeah. Thank I, you. I, heard, I heard it. <laughs> go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. With all due ahead. respect. <laughs> All right, that's enough. That's like haunted house music. <laughs> Welcome to I'm the haunted that. house. I, I, I can't be polite about this one anymore. The, the camera's turning off. Okay. There's noise in the background. Okay. This calls a disaster. Do you like to be trick or treat? Mm -hmm. No shoes. The caller's not wearing shoes. I can see a foot. Sorry, Maya. That was rude. I take it back. You know what? Me and Vic so, are nice guys. We we're nice guys. I would have sat we're there all day. We're going to be positive about day. any caller. Yeah. I'll be And guess what? Guy. 
I had never learned how to play the piano, and um, but I think I can play the piano. You know what I mean? I bet I could sit there and play, you think and it'll like be a, like it'll sound the, nice. Doing like the Dunning Kruger effect. I could just go to that piano <laughs> and play a song, just and it'll be like, like I bet it could, I could be, do it. Like, would you also write it, or would it be a cover of something? I, no, I can't do a cover. I can't okay. like play a song. So this would be an original. But I could sit at that like piano, straight from and the it'll heart. be like I could play a song. The feel, yeah, it's, it's all right about feel. confidence. It's yeah. not about skill. That is true. Yeah. I mean, you can like power through anything if you're just if you believe you can do it, then you can do it. I think Guys, if I wanna, just don't press notes that are next to each other, wanna, they won't be sour. Do you want to try that a little later, or do you want to do it now? When or? should I try I think my like, piano experience? I think... Experient. I think, <laughs> it's an experiment think, experience. When, when should we... Uh, when should Doug do You've this? You've never played the piano. Come on. I mean, I've sat there, but He's like... tickled the I've, keys a little bit. I think I could sit there. I've watched you edit, and it's like watching someone play the piano. Mm -hmm. It's like... Right. Well, no, you that I can gum, do. And you're I can't play the piano. But I could play the piano if I tried. You're playing the piano when you're editing. You're using all four all four fingers. You're just ripping it up. <laughs> Let me know when you want me to do it. Here's it could be a boring segment. Well, the hotline has <laughs> How did filled I not up. Have that up for <laughs> <laughs> do you want to take a hot hand? You know what that is? That's weird, Al. That's okay, well, oh, well, hold is, me huh? to that because I want to show off, or I want to prove that I can play the piano. I you believe know, you. Want to do that? Do it now. I can play beautiful music. You want to do it now? Do it now. We can go to the hotline. Is after. this going to be a dead segment, and people are going to be like, "We're going to lose some, no, we're going to lose patrons." So. Dead segment. <laughs> dead segment. All right, let's talk to I'll a hotline. Let's do it. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'll sit over. I'll sit over there. Hey, okay. everybody! Doug plays the piano. Do I need my headphones for anything? There's a. You can just plug it in right over there if you want. Oh, okay. Plug it in. Plug it in. Is this plug and play? All right, while you're getting set up, we'll talk to a hothead. Yeah, I, yeah. Let's. No, we'll do it in between yeah. calls. Is yeah. a hothead someone who's coming in hot, like they're pissed? Yeah, See, Anthony's. This, so I was against hot. this name because it like it it like implies that you have to be mad. All right, Anthony, angry, three one seven. You, know you are live on the air. Turn this down. Hey, how's it going, everybody? What's up, Hello. Anthony? Where are you calling from, buddy? I'm in uh, Newark, New York. There you go. Ooh, that's hot. Ooh. Say hi I to Jonathan. To say, uh, congratulations to you guys for doing the whole nine to five, like real workers in the field, digging graves, doing it right. You know, Th proud thank of you. you. What do you like? How would you rate the show so far? The first 53 minutes of the show, would you give it a, a one, two, or three? Uh, I'm going to go with a solid 1.8. I feel like you could have got up to a two uh, had you been uh, had you been really dancing, right. moving. I feel like you were talking a lot about getting more patrons. Sounds you know? good. Oh, so it's so it's a little too much patron talk, right? We don't need to talk business too much. I, I also have a note right? for you, Vic. Okay. Let's not mention how long it's been because I think that highlights how slow it's moving. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all yeah. right. Well. Um, uh, you know, but this guy had a beef, right? A hot beef. Oh, you, oh, he's got a hot beef. I had a beef with him. Okay, well, we'll him. this is we'll the perfect relay, time to bring it up. We'll relay it to him. I'm, I'll be Tim. I'll be Tim. Yeah, Tim. Tim's here. We've got a uh, Johnny is Tim. Go what ahead. What is it? What? Okay. Huh? What is uh, it? The beef is. You've been coming in my dreams, uh, oh my and I'm having dreams of you and stuff. The beautiful women, and you come in. I'm coming. You I'm coming no. in your dreams. <laughs> I'm coming. Okay, cool. That's great. The, you walk. No, you're not coming. No coming happening. You just That's said it. You just said. You just said coming. What this guy's, what's happening in your dreams? He said sir? coming. I'm like uh, getting the feeling well, of coming. Well, you see, in the oh, I work at a, I work at a at theater. Uh, <laughs> a lot of, lot of beautiful women come into the theater. Scarlett Johansson, Celine Dion, people like this. Just a bit. And I see yeah. them in my dreams. Okay, this guy's goofing. And Seems like they, a bit. I messed a bit. They come in. Tim comes in. He says no for love. He says no to love for you. Oh my God! And uh, so I wanted to tell him that. Well, how do you like when you wake up? When you wake up after these these dreams, what? Do you, how are you feeling? Does it like mess up the, your day, or is it, like is it upsetting? Is it? Or do you like it? It's confusing. I mean, it, it's sort of. Uh, it gets it. You know, it makes gets in the way of the love. Uh, but uh, Johnny, it, Tim, it is, you want to hang up on this guy? It's certainly interesting. Uh, we're done. <laughs> oh man. Was that, was that the Midnight Cowboy or something? <laughs> What's going on here? Did well, look, John Schlesinger like direct that up. call? Let's uh, let's check over to right. the uh, the piano boy over Thanks here. Thanks for we the got, beef, Anthony. We got Doug on the keys. Enjoy the music, everybody. Thank you, Johnny. Can you guys hear me and see me? Is oh, yeah. This, yeah. yeah. Is this Sounds one great. going? That, um, can you see what I'm can doing? We, is the... Uh, 
Tom, can you see? Tom Doug? is the, uh, the the piano cam. Oh, it's not oh, plugged in. Oh my god. Okay. Well, can I just turn one of these around? Yeah, just uh, just take my one. camera and just just wreck it. Yeah, right? I'm gonna turn mine. I'll do it. I'll do it. Hold just wreck oh, Vic Vision. Let's get Vic Vision going. Go grab the Vic Vision cam from Tom. Oh, he's out here. Yeah. The Vic Vision, Doug. It sounds good. And let's it sounds not leave kind of, uh, uh, Vic's empty uh, picture up on the screen. It sounds spacey and nice and Please. good. Because right. I feel like you need to see me to understand my. There That's you go. part of the performance is not just hearing it. Right. But it's. That actually works. That cell phone. Yeah, that's that's live cool. right now. Yeah. You know, I Shut don't up. know. The, I don't know. Yeah, that's the, the Vic Vision cam. Can you show uh, Johnny the Vic Vision cam on I'm his, intrigued. Uh, oh. No way, that's that's like streaming to a device isn't right it now. Crazy? You gotta Ready? teach me about right, this. I wanna learn. Aesop Rock is still on the line, ready to talk. I'm it sounds like Nina's right here too. Right here. Nina, come on in. Ah, uh, Vic Vision went down? What happened? This was by Did you turn it down. off? Why don't you just turn the internet down? Wow. Oh, man. Well, it wouldn't. Are you sure it was the stream? It might have just been in here. The we'll stream go. did Move too. Your camera back then. Wow, the stream we'll went there. down. I just want to make sure you're setting up again. Okay. We're What's back. The, I'm hearing a a woman talking. Is that from Zoom or is that in the control room? Okay. Can you send her in, please? Aesop Rock is still here. Let's too. get her set up because we have a call at ten. <laughs> cool. Thank you. Okay, we're back, hey, guys. We're, we're back here. We're back. Hey. Can I just play a song for a minute? And yeah, go ahead, go ahead. Can I get it proper? We don't, don't have a camera on you. Do you want me to introduce you, Doug? Yeah. Doug, you want me to introduce you? Okay. Yes. Hey, everybody. Uh, coming up right now, we have a first-time piano performance from Doug Lussenhub. This is the first time he has ever touched a piano in his entire life. He's seeking to prove that... You do not need skill to play the piano, but literally just confidence in your ability to play. Here he goes. Doug, piano. Do you want me to sing with you? Be careful, you're trailing. Can I sing along, Doug? Of course. Okay, can you start from the top? Everybody loves a DJ, Doug. Everybody wants to live there. I don't know where you're going with this chord progression. beauty in the morning i can't stand it he's Holy never cow. touched a piano before he's the he's a uh, savant. savant a savant he's a savant a savant a savant is that an <laughs> organ though that's right that's a piano what are the it's a uh, piano. i should yeah, live welcome to the show hey. nina nina tar is here everybody hey. Hey, nina tar Hi. and that's my cue to leave <laughs> no no hang on, no, no, no johnny no, stick no, around johnny, no no that's johnny. my no i know no, legally don't he has johnny. to leave no, now I, that i'm here i know you have a restraining a order against him? <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. I've already broken it if I did. He's already broken it. Um, but why would I have a restraining... Why would she have a restraining order against me? Maybe... Oh, maybe, vice versa. Maybe I have a restraining order. Yeah, you know, women can also uh, be... Uh, restrained. C- restrained. Against. Men. Yeah. That's right. How's it going? Great. Nina, let's talk punk rock. You got a minute, man. <laughs> wow, okay. He's going to 
fire right Let's into it. Go right it. into okay. it. Okay. I mean, it's the elephant in the room. Okay? Who you got the stern hat on now? Who are huh? the guys? Stern, you got that stern hat. You're like, let's talk about this. Let's dive in. <laughs> Snap in. Uh, Johnny's first show was Sonic Youth and R.E.M. Punk adjacent. Wow. That's not my. Cool. That's not on me though. It's my friend Steve. No, I mean How that's pretty cool. I don't know what age I was. Really? I wasn't thinking about that's that. That's like a twelve. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, I wasn't thinking about what age I was. I wasn't like, ooh, I'm this age at this show. Ooh, I can't ooh. wait to tell my fellow uh Yeah, imagine store seeing employees. Sonic Youth playing uh, Daydream Nation. Wow. Wow. And, or, or Catholic Block. And you're oh, thinking, what wow. age am I? What age am I saying? I never forget you. Nina, what was your first concert? Let's get into it. Okay, first concert. I mean, first official concert. Well, okay, I have a few this Actually, what is the official concert? That is that is a question. What is the official? Well, the first concert. See, that's the thing. It's like, is it something like that you chose that you feel like you had like a? This is what I'm saying. You know, like or is it something that your parents are like, you're gonna love John Fogerty? Oh, okay. Yeah, because I mean. My first mm-hmm. one was like my mom being like, "You gotta come to this concert." Yeah, you're gonna see Boz, Boz Stags. Boz Stags. <laughs> you gotta see Boz, Boz Stags, Boz. dog. Boz. You gotta see him. Uh, first one that I went to that like I was a body in a place was Destiny's Child. Whoa. Okay. Wow. Hello. I was seven. Wow. So was, was Timbaland back back there running <laughs> the boards? That's pretty good. I was yeah. I was seven. By the way, I know what age. Oh I was. my god. Seven. Wow. She put Seven. down a little concert Seven. notebook. Dog. Yeah. No, I just what? you know I have a good recall. Is that like ninety nine? I was what so old. That uh, I it was ninety seven. Oh, oh okay. okay. Yeah, I it was, or ninety eight. Well, I was. I thought eight. it was uh, newer than that. Oh. No, no, it was in the yeah. it was I in the late. I started listening older. to it. Yeah. It was pre nine eleven. I will assure you that. <laughs> All my concerts were pre nine eleven. I stopped going after nine eleven. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Stand in solidarity. But my first like concert I went to that I was like. I am now, uh, I'm listening to music and my own volition and I have taste that I have created myself was, uh, it was in Orange County at the Galaxy and it was TSOL, Agent Orange. Um, this is very cool. What is TSOL? This is very What's, cool. This is, this is hardcore. I don't know that. This is some hardcore yeah. stuff. This is, but it was some also SoCal SoCal punk. punk. Um, well, who else was it? Uh, I said Agent Orange, Adolescence, and then Manic Hispanic, which are the members of Suicidal Tendencies. Oh. I was 13, and there was wow. a guy that was, TSOL unfortunately has a huge contingency of like skinhead following. Isn't so, it like anti, isn't it uh, anti-Nazi skinheads? Well, I don't think so. I mean, you know how con- like confusion, I don't know, there's a lot of blurred lines in that. I don't know. I don't think that the band themselves like mm-hmm. likes that ideology, but uh, basically what occurred was that there was a huge, there was a bunch of skinheads there, and there was this big oafish looking guy, and he was wearing this like shirt that said SS, it's a white thing, and then there was all oh, cool. of these Mexican dudes there because of Manic Hispanic, and then there was an actual full just giant fight and I was 13 and I saw this this skin had just get like <gasps> get booted uh, and then no. yeah so anyway I was, that that's was my a, first so yeah I wouldn't go to did you get that. <laughs> did you get in the pit <clears throat> I think so yeah probably I don't I, when Could, I was a teenager I would would you mind um, moving your mic back <laughs> Maybe just in, like that, just so I could see you better. Oh yeah, is this better? Yeah, that's good. Speaking this of rock and roll, I want have, you to be comfortable. Uh, but. We have a, a guy who's kind of a known to the rock world on Zoom right now. Ooh, la, la. David Cross, are you there? Uh, yeah, that's I'm right stupid. here. Whoa! You hear me? Or wow! See look me? at this. We got David wow. Cross. Welcome, David Cross. Thank you, David. Welcome. Thank you for what being here. What should I be here. looking at here? Do I need to look um, at something? I don't. Th- well, <laughs> right, not right now. I don't think you need to look at the people. Or, uh, out there, if you, you see, see um, um, Office Hours Live, yeah. it'll show you yeah. who yeah. you're talking to in here. Doug and I have kind of like matching outfits yeah, on here. I got gotcha. Yellow and orange. Yep. Maybe well, you should tilt your camera down too. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. That's it. That's the look. There it is. No, there we no, go. it was great before. That's the look. <laughs> That's the I look. Like, kind of, I'm, I like this. I don't yeah. mind it. <laughs> and then I think you want to stoop to get in the frame. <laughs> You're gonna, you gonna go. wanna, you're gonna wanna crook your neck. That's it. That's oh, the that's look. good. <laughs> <laughs> that's the look. There it is. Now it's yeah, it's excellent right there. This is a. Uh, um, <laughs> and if, could you could you move the chair out of the way too? It's kind of blocking our view here. This looks like a hostage yeah. video. Thank you. <laughs> There we go. Looks great. Perfect. Oh, that's good. <laughs> Perfect. All right. So, um, 
So this is uh, what's this, this segment, is, uh, Vic? This is uh, the cross talk. This is uh, we're gonna we're gonna talk to Mr. David Cross here. Um, I don't. Do you have any questions for David? Well, <laughs> isn't he gonna look at pets or something? Was well, we're funny? gonna do that, but yeah, I wanted to, I wanted to shoot the shit a little bit. I wanted okay. to I wanted to get get real here and say thank you for. Thank, thank you, you for all the thank content you for all you've the, given yeah, I mean, us this throughout is like, the years. Yeah, it's, this is your hero of, of everybody's. And, uh, oh, um, thanks. I, yeah. I, have one, I have one more thing I can share. <laughs> uh, yeah. Hang on a second. <laughs> I like I his, his, his bike looks down like, by I, more, it looks like a cartoon drawing yeah. of a bike. Like the wheels are too small. It looks like a, there's just a, a painting. It's a facade. Uh -huh. And it's just a, a wall. That it's this is at. something that... Uh, I was going through some stuff and I don't know what it's from, but it's clearly a prop from something that I just found. I want to say it was from the something that Bob and I did called the uh, it's like the David Cross experience or something like that. I, it was like a failed sitcom we did for H, but I think it was for that, but it's a pamphlet that says, wake up USA. There's no such thing as a good morning and it's morning is in, you know, <laughs> right. Right. One morning. It makes Uncle Sam cry. I just found that. That's a cool little tip. Yeah, how, yeah. yeah, how much do you want for it? Yeah, how much do you want? Yeah, is that a, it's going up Are on eBay? Are we this? Like, it's a, I'm, you know, it's an NFT. So, <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm just, I, I mean, if you, it's different. If I could get paid in Krugerrands, I'd be. <laughs> that's what I'd take. I like how the okay. USA is kind of flesh colored. It's a nice. Oh, it's, the body, it's, it's of the body Uncle of Uncle Sam. Sam. Yeah. I'll start with. Yeah. Uh, I'll start the bidding. Um, yeah. You'll start it at. Like, is that number? You're going to give a number. Like or? Fifteen. Or I'll do fifteen grand. I hope. Yeah, yeah. I hope grand. One, we'll one crew grand. One. I'll do one. Oh, I, I only need like two or three. Okay. Well, I I had to start at one, then we'll build up to the. One get a mile, one one, one 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 get a one get a one 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 one. Who's two two got two two get a one two. Okay, we're good. We got it. Got it. Now, Vic, you guys are you. This happened because you're. Yeah, I mean, we don't. We've never. I'm not friends with David. How did this happen? How did you guys become friends? He happened to follow me on Twitter, and I was like, "That's insane," you know. And especially. Oh well, thank you, thank you very much, thank you. So I was like, a lot of. A lot of TikTokers and Instagram livers, and uh, a lot of people uh, coming up in the in the biz. You know. Yeah, yeah, you're, you're aware. You're, you're aware of what's going on out there, and mm. yeah. Well, thank you. Um, but like you were, you were huge for me back uh, right around 9/11 because your "Let America Laugh" uh, album came out, and that was huge for me. And the documentary that went with it, and and I just remember at the, around that time. Uh, everyone's it's dark of course and everything but then you had a joke where you knew everything was going to kind of get back to uh, semi-normalcy when you saw a, a man on a uh, on a garbage truck like that was real. whistling that was real. whistling to a, like a pretty lady right like <laughs> yeah trying to pick her up right right I, I, and I was just wondering like are there any moments like that now because we're coming out well I don't know if we're coming out of the pandemic but we're in the middle of this hellscape is there anything that we can be like positive about? Is it is it gonna get yeah, better? Man. Yeah, yeah. Burn, Burning Man and yeah. the, <laughs> the gathering of the Juggalos. Uh huh. Um, and I, I would love to get those two groups together one day uh -huh. and just do a big gathering of the Juggalos at Burning Man. That'd be <laughs> interesting. That would be um, fun. Yeah, I mean, uh, I guess I'm I'm seeing I, I'm in New York right now, but I'm seeing more. Uh, like dead rats around mm -hmm. that feels like it's getting back to normal That's a little bit progress i mean yeah. nobody needs us you know hey for real yeah. for real uh three nights ago i saw a possum shooting out of a in new york city <laughs> wow i've seen speaking of like, a possum i've seen a lot of dead opossums around i've been driving Ooh. over them a lot. i mean no joke yeah i don't know what that is about You're driving over them i've been well You've they're been already dead, dead. Possums, they're already hence dead. The, what am i gonna do you know all the dead possums because right, you're been, actively killing I'm, them i am I someone's am. been driving yeah. too fast right right we got we got johnny the patrol patrol over here but slow then, down I mean, um, there's another thing though that, that you're probably familiar with and waiting for is uh, Mr. JFK Jr.'s coming back. Are you keeping a track on that? You watching over that? Yeah. Well, well, what a lot of people don't understand is he's coming back again. He already came back. <laughs> oh, okay. And okay. he didn't. He was just kind of uh, 
incognito, mm-hmm. uh, kind of like you know, those old things when uh, Michael Jackson used to wear like uh, kind of lighten his skin so uh-huh. he could go unnoticed. And and uh, and so yeah, he's he was back for about a week and a half. Mm-hmm. And uh, oddly enough, I know I just mentioned it, but he went to both the uh, uh, Juggalo gathering of the Juggalo and. <laughs> And he did Burning Man, um, and uh, and also was uh, was also on the Blue Origin, which went up into um, almost space. Wow! And he was on that. Oh, so he's couple. been busy. That's why he's making everybody oh, wait two weeks uh, at, 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 in Dallas there at Dealey Plaza. So is it true yeah. that uh, he is uh, in disguise as Kimberly Guilfoyle? I read something <laughs> about that. Oh yeah. Um, I, I don't think so. I mean, okay. that's, that I, I've heard that and that just seems, uh, that seems ridiculous. <laughs> I'm writing it down. <laughs> so that it's ridiculous. When, what happened at Daily Plaza to heat? So he never got hit or he got hit and he got better. Well, no, this is that's JFK. The, no, no, this is the dad. Are oh, you talking about Junior? Junior, Junior oh, who so died the, in the plane crash, oh, allegedly. So the, the plane mm-hmm. crash was a drone plane. Many people or what are saying that it was he died Don Junior. Yeah, no, no, it was it was JFK Junior. And Don Junior's, I don't know, he's part. They of should do a on. showdown. Yeah, but JFK Junior at this point is how old? I mean, like he, he would be probably, probably in his fifties, probably. Yeah. yeah, but yeah, he's not coming back. He's um, almost fifty, sadly. But um, so like uh. Are you a, a tech guy? Or are you going to go out and, uh, you know, beat the I'm lines? I'm so sorry, Vic. I'm having trouble hearing you. Uh-oh. Our connection is poor. No, no, no. I just can't. I can't. Oh. You need to, you'll need to um, uh, talk a little louder, please. Are you? Um, are you? I have, my, I, have my, I have my computer all the way up. The oh. volume is all the way up. Okay. It's just... it, might, it might help to sit a little closer. Yeah, can you come closer? <laughs> because you're... You're kind of hard to hear, to be honest. Are Are you much of a tech tech oh, guy? No, and... I'm not hard of hearing at all. <laughs> I don't, no, my hearing is fine. Oh, I don't I mean, know. I got, any... tested, uh, I got tested about I want to say 45 years ago, and uh, <laughs> so you're good. <laughs> Uh, it's like I mean, it's I, like IQ. It doesn't I, change throughout the lifetimes. Like you, once wait, you is get, that you know, true yeah, about IQ? It is true about Damn, IQ. Damn, I'm and dumb now. as hell. I yeah, have no yeah, idea. That's right. How yeah. diggity? That's dog. pretty cool. Um, so what, like, I was just wondering: are you are you buying anything on Black Friday? Is that you gonna be excited about anything? Do you need any? Am I buy or black? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Can you move closer to the uh, <laughs> microphone? I, mean, I just have natural kind of olive skin, uh-huh, but uh-huh. wouldn't. It, wouldn't you, I, you know, I pass. I guess. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I okay. think you should get a mic and a and headphones. All right. <laughs> no, I, I not, said it. Oh, that'll make some. He's going to Best Buy uh, right content. now. He's going out and getting it. Should I? Somebody had to say it. Somebody. I'm leaving soon. No, he was fine. Uh, he well, no. I mean, this is not <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> It's actually worse. <laughs> is that plugged into anything, or is it just a loose hanging cord? There we go. Uh, just put it into your I mean, belly button. See yeah, what happens. Uh, USB. Plug it into the headset, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> Find an orifice yeah, and get, put it get, in. Get plugged in is if I get, uh, if I get closer to the... You, yeah, you monitor. could. I mean, you don't. You don't have to. I mean, we can. We can kind of hear. It's just. Not fucking thing, right. guys. I'm sorry. Shit. <laughs> so muffled. This is like. It's like you're underwater, or I'm underwater, or I've got headphones on. One of the three. <laughs> it's not. I'm so sorry. i This is not working for me. I got. That, I'm gonna have to take these off. That's okay. No, that's okay. Putting them on, but that was not a good idea. It's worth <laughs> worth a shot, but it wasn't. It was it a good idea, really Johnny. Fun. You tried. You know. <laughs> Why don't you move forward a little bit in your chair? Just maybe, yeah. like in the but move the actual chair. There we go. There. <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes. <laughs> I mean, if so you had, we're, we're if you had the bike, you, uh, could, you could you could ride the bike I in a circle know. if you want. They're the they're. This is them. This is their idea. I don't know. <laughs> Who's in the room with you? Yeah, who's over there? Is there I, have a, I have a pinball machine. Mm, <laughs> with sentience? 
Do you want to raid well, some pets? Well, do you, do you have any animals there that you can that you can show us? Well, we have some animals over here. I don't know if David has anything. Are you an animal lover? I got a tech guy. Um, I can I, get a hold of. Actually, I do have something I can show you real quick. Okay. Yeah. Hang I'd on. love to see it. Okay. Hang on. Okay. Um. You know, Michael. Pretty Mann. cool to be interviewing David Cross's chair. <laughs> oh, look at this. So this, let me go hang glasses here. I have two. Um, I don't know if you can see this here. Oh boy. These are um, these are the certificate of cremation to certify Ollie Red Sox, the beloved pet of David Cross, oh. was uh, privately cremated by Abby Glenn. Oh, jeez. Happy Tuesday. <laughs> it's a real, real upper of a show today. Is that, is that, <laughs> okay. Is that a fresh pickup or did you, I mean, you yeah. don't have it displayed out anywhere? We're going to keep um, it. Yeah. No, that, uh, the, I just, uh, I got those uh, recently and I'm going to take them upstate to, uh, oh, hang on a second. Sorry. <laughs> Condolences. On yeah, your... that's. Cat? Was it a cat? Yeah. Was no, it was a there? dog. I think it was oh. a dog. Um, yeah, 15 years old. Oh. I mean, 15 is pretty um, old. It's up there for dogs, right? Isn't it? Um, Still not any... legal, though, you know, guys? So. Not... Oh, okay. Are you, do you plan on getting another dog? <laughs> Down, girl. <laughs> um, I, I mean, that's... It, I've thought about it, but then I was thinking, I guess there's so much work, and I have a, I have a, a daughter, a young daughter, and there's so much work with having a dog and i was thinking maybe just once a year i go get ashes of, of a dog <laughs> you know right. kind of fills the uh yeah. the, the need. void uh -huh. are you gonna ask the question the, vic well, i don't even know what the question was the question you asked about oh, yeah. the parrot the, oh i i thought about it but i'm not okay. going to ask about no yeah i don't want to go down that road now um what you have a parrot ash? No, I was just well. He was because I asked how long he was going to keep the parrot, you know. But he was Johnny wanted me to ask how long he's going to keep the kid alive. Is that what you're saying? No, I was not oh, going to ask that okay. actually. Anyway, anyway, so oh, like well, um, there you go. Yeah. So no, so um, well, I get, no. The question was, and this is not for me. This is from the other guys. Is you have a daughter? So how long were you planning on keeping her? <laughs> I mean, you know, that's a daily thing. That's the kind of thing. <laughs> just, uh, you know, you take it one day at a time, and. Um, what age? But what today age? you're probably going to keep her for today. Oh yeah, we have a. I have a plane ticket. We have to go tomorrow to Atlanta, so I'm not going to. Uh, you know, I don't want to waste my money on that. So I have a, a, a ticket and a return ticket. So we'll we'll. She'll make it through Atlanta at least. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. I've been there. We had a guy. That went, yeah. So well, well, now that you're, uh, you know, pet free, maybe we can inspire you to uh, maybe there's you'll see something here um, that you might want to get. And uh, if you're looking, you know, you can you can rate you, maybe what, how are we going to do the rating system? One, two, three or I don't know. One, two, three is three the best. Well, I three mean, do we need to I don't know how to rate these dogs. Or you can, yeah, you can cats. Yeah. Yeah. But I, I mean, I would I would go uh, I'd go up to a thousand. OK. OK. Um, and I like I'd say, that. You know, a thousand, um, zero to a one, thousand. So one to a thousand bricks. Okay. <laughs> bricks? Bricks? With a, with a, with a thousand bricks, like a brick wall. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. uh, uh, and a thousand being the highest. Okay. And a thousand bricks is a full stand up like a comedy wall behind you. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. <laughs> and a thousand bricks is the highest and one brick is the lowest. And then 500 bricks is halfway, and 250 bricks is a quarter of the way. Mm. And 750 bricks is three quarters of the way. All right, there we go. Let's let's I see. All right, no, Cammy, no, let's see what we got. got it. Let's see what we got. Let's rate like this dog. It's like one to ten almost, but more. But it, yeah, more <laughs> yeah. important when there's thousands involved here. Okay, here we go. Hi. Hi. This is my dog, Jade. Jade? Yeah. Her name's Jade. Can we get a full she's body awesome. shot? Yeah, can we, yeah see... can we get a body shot? We need yeah, a body shot. I need to see paws. Oh, she, she's a oh, sweetie. Pause. That's I a don't even. One. How that's many bricks, that's Dave, a, David? Off top. How, tall? how many bricks are you thinking? 
829. Wow. Wow. That's a good Not rating. Bad. He won, Jamie. He won. He won. Yes. It's a B plus already. Awesome. And you get your That's tree right. up. You're ready to go there for uh for I'm ready. Awesome. Thanks, Cammy. Wonderful. We, we were talking yeah, more about your connection. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where'd she go? Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> you know who she sounds like? She sounds like this. <laughs> so, yeah, where'd the dog run off to? You just, is the dog going to be all right there? Where'd he go? He got go? scared and ran away. I'm taking, I'm taking some bricks away. I'm taking some... I'm taking <laughs> oh, that's a shame. I'm taking 200 bricks away. That's rude, Man. and it's insolent, and it... Yeah, and it take some bricks away I mean, from yeah. that. Speaks poorly of you. We right. got a brick deduction happening. What about that white tip of the tail? That that added some bricks for me, to be honest. I mean, with I wanted you. the body shot before I gave my brick. Well, you know, I got to see the full body before mm-hmm. you know. You know. Wow, we I got don't... some. Do you want to get into some exotic pets? Oh wow! I see some exotic oh, pets. Check this. Yeah. What's this gonna be? Thanks, Cammy. Thanks, Cammy. Thank Rocky. <laughs> Rocky, what is going on there? What's going? This we like got bullfrog journey. All right. Turn yourself up there, Rocky. No, not your not your angle. Let's see that bullfrog. Un- what, do, what do we... Oh, I see. There's Rocky. And there's, is that Rocky, turtle? unmute, please. Can you hear me? Yes. <laughs> Perfect. This is my African bullfrog, Bernie. He's a thick boy. How do we see it? Oh, it's a frog. Tom, um, Matt, we need to see this guy. Yeah. Tom, can you can you pull up? Oh, maybe the pets should all be muted. That way you can just judge them on appearance. (laughs) Yeah, I mean, that's how usually you should rate like the physicality. (laughs) Bullfrog guy, you have to speak up. So why do you have an African bullfrog? Are those legal to own? I guess so. Are those are, are those legal to eat? (laughs) <laughs> Do they are they the ones that get you high if you look like the back their back or Rocky, whatever? please stop muting and please say something so your camera comes up for us. Hello? There we go. You're asking a lot of a bullfrog owner. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, hear me now? Barely. Just okay, can you just scream down. for a second so we can <laughs> get you through? Scream. There he is. Kind of a croak. Yeah, yeah it does yeah. Oh, oh my god. god. That is nuts. Oh my god. Whoa, okay. Wow. It looks like a hamburger patty. See what I'm saying? You had to see it. That's cool. It is. It, wow. Um, hey, Rocky, can I ask how much joy does that frog bring? <laughs> <laughs> so much. He's literally like a pet avocado. He doesn't really do much. He just kind of sits around. So, But he's he's fun to look at. How, how so, old is he? He's four and a half. Wow. How, how long do they live? They can live actually like up to twenty five years. Fuck. Oh, <laughs> yeah. that's you're gonna ridiculous. Keep, you're gonna keep it? I I am gonna keep him until he dies. Me and Bernie are wow. We're, we're in it for Bernie the or bust. That's really cute. Yeah. Exactly. Are you gonna cremate that bastard when he's done? <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Ah. That's the meanest well, thing I've ever done. It's a question. Uh, we're all we all want to know. Like, do you cremate stuff like yeah. that? I mean, or do you just throw or it in the ground? About um. African bullfrogs is they actually have like teeth and fangs, like in dontoids they're called. So it's Oof. a frog with teeth. So one thing I was thinking on doing is actually um, getting like his bones preserved, oh. like his skull. Okay, no, apocalypse no, now. No. Oh my god! <laughs> All right, we're gonna alert the Well, you know they make be cool to display. That. You can make jewelry out of. You its can make teeth. handbags out of frogs. I've yeah. Seen. You can oh. Do that. Well, I mean, I think a nice little a little necklace, a little a little necklace of the teeth of the bullfrog, I think would be quite becoming. I hope you guys agree. Can I just say I'm against hey, it? Um, I gotta show them can I can I ask a question? Yes. What is this show? What are we doing here? <laughs> <laughs> We're trying to figure that out as well. Uh, normally, our captain is Tim Heidecker. Tim Heidecker is making us uh, do a. An uh, eight-hour well, marathon. What is what is it? What is? Oh, it's oh, office it? hours with Tim Heidecker. Yeah, it's a, it's a, Aren't you a patron? <laughs> we're trying to get we're trying to get six thousand. We'll give you a discount. Today. Patrons? You but, mean um, Patreon subscribers? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, but can't you just call them patrons? I think that's, they're Patreonians. Patreons. That's the level Patreons. we're at here. I don't know, there, you got your NFL hat on there, Johnny. Yeah, love that. <laughs> um, yeah, so it's a, it's a it's a weekly show. Every Thursday morning, uh, we're here. It's Tim, Doug, and myself, and Matt. Um, and, uh, we have fun, you know, there's a music chat, 
Um, but it's a it's a Zoom thing. Like you you everybody just joins us via Zoom. Yeah, or? we're we're well, broadcasting well, on YouTube right now. Yeah, it's a little so confusing. We're going out on Tim's YouTube channel. Yeah, it's, so we're live, it's a podcast. and the and the the Zoomers are just watching. They're not really, and they can you can talk and everything. But then it's also oh, but a then podcast. there's other people beyond them watching. Right, how, it's, it's on how YouTube. Can I, how can I monetize this for myself? <laughs> Well, uh, that's a tough being, one. We we you don't could really, make an NFT out of your. We haven't appearance. figured that out yet. Yeah. Okay. Or if you have anything to promote, we have how many people are watching? There's a maybe a hundred watch. I don't know what have we got. Six hundred. Um, if you have anything you want to promote, your uh, Instagram but, or anything like that. Why well, don't we rate some more pets? <laughs> Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Rocky. Wait, yeah, how we didn't we rate got? the frog? Oh, t- I oh, said yeah. two bricks. Two bricks. Okay. Wow. Coffee kittens. This is going to be a win. I got to agree with David on those on that brick count. Because... Really, I'm I'm going to give it a higher brick count personally. But coffee I didn't kittens can you unmute? I don't think you're going to give bricks at all. I just want to. I don't get to give bricks as the only woman on the show. Oh, I don't mean to be rude, but you should get your own thing. I mean, that's my thing. Oh, you're the brick guy. Okay. I'm not doing anything. I'm not rating at all. You're above rating, or do you just like I'm all just, animals? It's not equally. my thing. I'm no David's rating, and I'm just here. <laughs> I'll just say right it's, on, a shit, it's a shit pet, or it's worth keeping. <laughs> <laughs> or what's next there, Matt? Go ahead, pot, throw him up there. On it. All right, Joshua Levy, are you there? What's up, guys? Oh. There we go. That's what we like to see. Oh, look That's at that nice. smile. Yeah. yeah. One of, <laughs> from, yeah. I like David. Yeah, we should David has a nice smile. How big yeah. David's going to be a lot of bricks. <laughs> <laughs> we have a lot of bricks coming. This is I one of my mom's the guy. Where, what happened to him? Uh, what's where, where, uh, please, please speak and tell us your do- tell us about your dog. Can you not hear me? Oh yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. No. This is my mom. One of my mom's three pugs that she has. She she has many pugs. It's a big grumble over here. Wow. What's uh, what's his or her name? This is Ellie, uh, named after Villanelle from uh, Killing Eve. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> My mom loves Killing Eve. She's ridiculous. Um, she also has Brady and Frankie, which is like the most boring name for a dog ever. I'm going to go with 762 bricks. Pretty good. Wow. That's a pretty Thank big, you. That's, that's Thank up you. there. Good brick count there. You beat the spread. Thanks, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> go, go, go ahead. Uh, let him lick you. Look at you some more. Let's see some more licks. I did want to say hi to Vic again because we saw Ween together two weeks ago. Oh, yeah, buddy. Yes. I ran into you at Ween. Yes. Yeah, what drugs really were you on? <laughs> we're just not there for a while. And Brendan kept looking at me being like, did you see where Vic went? <laughs> I went out wandering. Yeah, I was uh, just went around talking to people. And stuff. I assumed you just couldn't find the bathroom or something. I, that's honestly what it was. I didn't so know where the bathroom weird. was. And then there was all these different like areas where I I walked into the wrong aisle and I just gave up. Yeah. Yeah. So, but no. yeah, no, Very nice cool. to meet you, man. Nice to meet you too. It was a really good show. All right. Are you gonna keep Yo. your dog? Are you gonna keep it like till Alive? the end? Till the end. You're gonna it's do not that? his dog. It's his oh, mom's, it's his mom's dog. dog. Okay. Anyway, they don't live very long. They live like eight to twelve years at the most. Oh. Actually, one recently but right. uh way it goes they can't breathe at all all right matt next next, josh. next what do we got thank Thanks, you josh man. let's let's get david smiling here that's that's what we want to do well we got some let's go with another exotic first ammon miller i want to see an 800 brick pet you guys yeah. <laughs> oh whoa wow. look at the video quality I know, the quality no. is the 800 brick for sure like this guy Wow. Thank you very much. This is Jace, my bearded dragon. She's about five years old. Is there a pet up in that say, hole is that, up, is up that above you? We got yeah, cats. Yeah, that's, that's, that oh. that's my cat ghost. She's sleeping. Oh, that's a cat. Okay. 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 Wow. So you have Cute. a, what is that, a bearded lizard? Bearded dragon, yeah. Bearded dragon. Hmm. Wow, dog. Um. <laughs> <laughs> uh, do you like, do you, do you hold this and watch TV and pet it and stuff like yeah. that? Yeah. yeah. Okay. She's good, and sometimes I just hold her while I'm working here. Does she like? I mean, a lizard has a permanent One smile more. frozen on she their face. So good. can you tell when they're upset? Yeah, that's where the beard actually comes in. She'll puff it out, and it turns really black. That's um, when they're upset. Wow. wow. Yeah. David, exactly. you wanna you wanna throw some bricks at this? <laughs> yeah, I mean, I I would give uh, a lower brick rating, but I like the party trick. Uh, <laughs> black, so I'm gonna go. Four hundred and 
39 bricks. Not, not bad. I not bad. bad. I mean, didn't beat the spread. That's good for yeah. a cold-blooded animal. Yeah. I appreciate that. <laughs> well, thanks for calling in, buddy, and, uh, and uh, we'll thanks, talk Evan. to you soon. Thanks. We'll talk to you soon. I've got a good feeling about this <laughs> Call one. in Tyler. again next week. PP out. Never win. Tyler, speak up. Hello. Speak. There we go. Okay. Can you hear me? Look at this. Wow. Oh, look at this. Look at that look at one. Fella. Zoe. Oh, pretty cute. Beautiful. Right. Yeah. That's Zoe. I don't want to sway the judge, but that's a pretty nice dog you got there. That's a sweet dog. And uh, not, too much, not too much shit in the eyes, which is good. <laughs> yeah, what is all no that shit? What is that? Whatsoever. It's called tears. What is it? It's a, it's a burn a doodle. They, they shit t- they, uh, a burn a doodle? Yes. It's a combination of two different doodles or what? Yeah, it's as designer as it gets. Um, <laughs> wow, that dog. Right, well, I'm going to have to take off the yeah. bricks for that. I mean, <laughs> The, it's no fault of the dog at all. The dog didn't choose its life. The dog just <laughs> in the laboratory. Um, but that's its life. That's Zoe's life. So, yes, welcome to it. Um, yes. <laughs> I will. I will give uh, six hundred ninety nine bricks. Wow! All right, we'll take it. All Beat right. the spread. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. For designer dog. Can that's I high. ask real quick? It's a combination of a poodle and what? A Bernese. Uh, a Bernese Mountain Dog. Which is oh. The most, oh, it's not like Bernie's Doodle. Bernie's the most no. short-lived dog in the world. How really? long does it live? I think they live um, max actually, like, of like seven. Like, oh, what? Come on. That's my kind of dog. Oh, yeah? <laughs> dog. I just like to get a new, time for a new one once yeah. in a while. Yeah, yeah. You uh-huh. want to upgrade. Yeah. It's like yeah. dating the model. You know what I mean? <laughs> once they get to a certain age, you got to say goodbye. All right, let's, all right guys. This has been fun with the pets. Let's do one more pet, and then we'll, we'll let uh, Mr. Cross uh, on his way to pick out his next pet. Okay? All right, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll take off. Thank you guys so much. <laughs> uh, I will see you guys. It's been a treat. And, and you know, keep safe, everybody. And uh... On behalf of Tim, our yeah. apologies, David. No, no. <laughs> or if you had so much fun, you can, we'll be here till 5. Uh, just stop in again, okay? Did he really bail? I think you did. <laughs> Thank you, David. Thanks, David. Vic, Vic Berger the third. Whoa. Are you on the line? Oh, I guess I'm on the line. There yep. he is. How are you? Wow. Oh, wow. wow. How's it going? How you doing, Dad? Yeah, I want to know how to monetize this stuff too. You know? Yeah, you try. Well, Cross want to know how to monetize everything. Oh my God! <laughs> Wait, maybe the third can. Are you I the fifth or the fourth? I'm the fourth. This wow. is maybe this the is third. Number three. Fourth? We can still talk about some pets. I'm the third. I'm the third too. You're Johnny what? Pemberton the third. I had Why don't no you put idea. that through? Yeah, Johnny the third. Oh. Be proud. I'm surprised that we're just learning about yeah, that. Yeah, what the heck? Especially Doug. Y'all are yeah, close my, friends. Well, I mean, Barry well, the my third. My grandfather always. My grandfather always called me the turd. That wasn't uh, very good. No. Hey. Hey. Big bird hey. the turd. Hey. The turd. <laughs> turd, turd, turd. The turd's the word. <laughs> Dad, are you proud of all my fart drops I got here? Not really. <laughs> Thousands and thousands of dollars for, for college, and this is what you do. And this is it. This is what you get. So Berkeley College of Music, yeah. and you know. Yeah. What are you gonna do? Thousands of dollars, and I, I get a hat. See. Yeah, you, you get that. <laughs> we had a lot, so I just figured. This I'd is send a proud dad right here, <laughs> Vic. Yeah. Yeah, Why don't you keep I'm it proud. on? Put it on. What do you? What? <laughs> Yo, why'd you take uh, it off? Uh, it's the wrong color. No, there that's the same color as my oh, hat. Yeah. He's got a, he's got his purple NFL hat. You got the purple <laughs> office hours hat, or blue, I guess it is. Proud, um, damn. I'm proud. You can't, you can't see Johnny. He's he's invisible. I'm proud. Yeah. I am proud. He has a job and he doesn't live at home. Yay! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that's an accomplishment. That's pretty good. Yeah. Oh. Set the bar low. That's a very uh, very high bar here. So <laughs> good. Make Sometimes they good. come home. What are you up to today, Dad? What are you doing today? What am I up to? Well, it took me an hour and a half to figure out how to get the Zoom going. I figured you were having some happy. issues. <laughs> just use the phone. And then I right, set it call. up. Yeah, we could have. And then you and well, Doug disconnected it, and it, I had to restart I, everything. I blame Matt. Matt Matt did that. It was all his problem. Oh, Matt did it. Yeah, it was Matt. Um, so, I have a question. <clears throat> Go ahead. Um, you, you can't, number three can't see me, right? I don't Vic, think he can Vic see you. Three? Oh, yeah, I can see you. Why? Oh, you, you can see You can see Johnny? <laughs> Yeah. Oh, okay. How do I, I Johnny. how do I get out of here? <laughs> <laughs> I gotta go, but I don't know how to. I just how say to I gotta go. We just walk out. Just go. Just go. Walk out. Okay. Just walk out. Yeah. I gotta nice go. See you, Johnny. Nice to meet you, Johnny. Johnny Raytheon. 
Johnny, you got anything you want to plug? Nice talking to you. Nice talking to you. Uh, I like to plug that I'm the third. Uh, you can check out, you know, the Leather Rose podcast. It's the new one. On the, the Leather block. Rose? The Leather okay. Rose, baby. Wow, okay. Check it out. Where do you get those shirts hey, then, you're, too? This will be on sale probably. Just look on my look at my socials. I know where to find stuff. Okay. We'll okay. Find Johnny it. Pemberton's a I don't know if it's like a one What is that logo yeah. from? Is this is the Kirkland, Kirkland Signature logo. Kirkland Signature. Okay. Yeah. Yes. Okay, it was great to see everybody. Thanks, Johnny. Thanks, Johnny. Appreciate your Bye. time. Yeah, Johnny. Fun, buddy. I enjoyed. I enjoyed you. You're really funny. Oh, you hear what? that? You hear that? I missed it. Say it again. Vic, Vic Say it again. Vic I really Vic enjoyed you on the show here. You're really funny. Oh my Yo, God. From a third wow. to a third. Wow. Are you supposed to be a comedian though? Is that what you are? Oh, whoa. Oh. Whoa. Oh. whoa. Oh. He's unplugged. <laughs> He's unplugged. <laughs> oh my God. He is Excellent. a comedian. Excellent. Excellent. Do you want to give out some fatherly advice, Vic Berger the third? Yeah, Dad. You want to do some? Let's do some oh, advice no, no, here. No, no. You want to talk I to Zoomers? I think the third should talk to Nina, and we'll do a Nina to the third. Oh wow! Yeah. Honor. <laughs> Why not? Oh, okay. yeah, we have She's a lot like, to talk about. I looked you up, Nina. I looked you up, Nina. It said you were a vinyl DJ. Was that vinyl you? Vinyl DJ. Oh wow! Wow. Oh, man. He's, yes. he's doing some research Did you do that? here. Was that you? That's me. That's correct. I'm well, I'm I'm cleaning out my. Uh, Mother's house, you had to go to a nursing home. So I go in, there's thousands and thousands of records from my dad. So did you use these kind of records? Oh, my God. He's wow, got his Peter record collection. Frampton. Oh, Frampton. 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 Looking hot oh, wait, Look at the name. Look at the, what's, Dad, can you say the name of it? What's I, the, I'm the in name you. of it? <laughs> I, whoa, whoa, no, no. Can I, that's not good. What's it called, Dad? Say it. No, let's see another record. I'm, it said, I'm in you. Wow. I like how that's just <laughs> oh, yeah, an arrival. Yeah. Did I'm you ever play you. that one? Uh, not Crampton. Oh, oh, Rod oh, Stewart. Rod. So this Rod is your Rod father's. Stewart. This Wait. is the second. Rock this is record number two. Collection. This was his records. Yeah. He, Interesting. Yes. He has older I mean, man, he, but he's yeah, into. But he's into this rock. Yeah. I guess. He's, he's also into poker. He, he, just he was bought, a col- he was a collector. He just he's a thousands hoarder. Thousands of them. Yeah. A hoarder with the rec- all kinds stones, of format. Who's this? This the is the stones. Uh, Rolling Stones. Why yeah. you got a swimsuit on? Which one's like that? that? Eight, I don't know. This must be from 80 or something. Anyway, what's, 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 a, what's that record called? You got any Rick Astley in there, Dad? <laughs> made, made in the Shade. Made in the there Shade. You, go. you got any Aaron Neville, Dad? Know. You're a big oh, Neville head. There we go. Neville's well, great. I, no, I didn't go. That was I'm only one stack here. I went through. There's no thousands Neville? Thousands of them. I could tell it yeah. like it is. Yeah. Tell no. Tell no. Like tell it. Don't think so. Uh-huh. That's a great one. <laughs> That's good stuff. Yeah. So what, what kind of stuff did you play, Nina? A lot of a lot Not of different stuff. stuff. A lot of lot of soul and funk and Ooh. disco and some boogie Ooh, and some good. post-punk and some new wave wow. and some glam. And... What's an example of boogie? Um, I would say like uh uh, oh, like Cool in the Gang or oh, like yeah. um, the Gap Band. Yes, Daz, exactly. Right? Daz, Zap. Yeah. Zap. I mm. love that. More Bounce to the Ounce. Yeah. I used to love that song Party oh, Train wow. by the Gap Band. Oh, the, have you oh, seen yeah. the video, the music oh, yeah. video? That's I was a, a kid, great I used to watch video. That video. Also, that's the video where they're at the boardwalk in Venice in Beach. In Venice Beach. Yeah, oh. and they have like a boxing match and mm-hmm. everything. There's also that whole band, the Gap Band is there because they're kind of Bootsy Collins adjacent, you know, with their look. You know, because they, they kind of remind wearing, me of the old Navy band. They were wearing like, like, like <laughs> fucking <laughs> leather, like cowboy hats and shit. Yeah, you know, I like, I like it. It had a big influence on me. As so, Dad, <laughs> Dad, you just got a new, uh, um, a new van. Well, it's, it's a not oh, a new van. Well, it's new talking. to you. But it has a it has a tape uh, no. player. It has a tepid history. It. it has a tape player in it. Well, yeah, you yeah, speaking yeah. of uh, uh, you, my, you, my uncle passed away. Yeah, last I was gonna say he's taking everything from all these dead people. Go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> hey, you get what you get. You know, it's a Chevy van. You know, maybe I'm gonna put some shag uh, carpet in there. Okay. I don't know. Shag and I wagon. It. <laughs> it's uh, 1987 saying, Chevy. I'm in you. Okay. Yeah. Wait. What kind I of think, van? What year is it? Yeah, I know, but I, it doesn't have a record player, and it. it has a cassette player in it. Great cassette and CDs. So I will have to do that. What are you gonna listen so, to in it? Like, what do you have any? Uh, do you gotta buy Chicago. Some? I like. I go. Yeah. yeah, I got a lot of, and my dad also collected those. So there's thousands of these cassette <laughs> tapes here. So I'm set for that. Got everything. But so there's so, a Betamax tape too, but we won't use that. So you're you're learning a lot because you're gonna give some advice to Zoomers. Like, would you say to oh, to not, load up on no, tapes and records? Is know. that is that something we should do? Load up in tapes and records so their kids no. our kids have to clean up. No, 
Okay. <laughs> no, I have no place to put them, so I'm thinking of going digital with all this stuff. Hey, I because uh, we did this move. Did I? T- I don't know if I told you this, Dad, but I got rid of my Blu-ray and DVD collection. Did I tell you that? Oh no! Yeah, I, gave I it heard to, that. And gave it to Mauricio, CDs, right? Yeah, CDs are gone oh, years wow. ago, but yeah, I got got rid of my my DVDs, which was tough. Oh, jeez. Um, but that's I mean, sad. I know this is. I'm, I love to bring the show to a screeching halt here. Um, yeah, I know. I'm just trying to. I'm just waiting for the sign from this Matt is... that we have a that we have uh, somebody that wants advice. Go on, Matt, get a phone call. You want to talk to a zoomer? You want to talk to a hothead? What do you guys want to do? Do it. Do a hothead. Oh, I don't know. Let's oh, talk to a hothead. Oh, no. oh. Who's a yeah. hothead? What's a hothead? It's just a phone Uh-oh. call. Uh-oh. We have the hothead hotline anonymous. at eight one eight eight zero four 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 seven eight and uh, five zero one. You are live on the air with Vic Burger the Third. Hey, how's it going, everybody? What's up? Hello. So you got, uh, you got hey, my dad's uh, full I've attention. got a pun for you. Okay. <laughs> I've got a pun. Sure. Who cares? Okay, <laughs> well, here's the pun. <laughs> Let's hear it. Okay. Um, <laughs> okay, so I was, I've been reading about the, reading an article about this uh, socialized medicine they have up there in Canada. You heard about this? The, uh, the Canadian government is actually is, is now offering sex therapy for all Canadians. Kind of, kind of weird, kind of crazy. That's right. Uh, I was reading about it on the CBC. There was a woman. Uh, she went to the sex therapist wanting advice for her marriage. She needed to spice things up a bit, as you do. You know, things get kind of stale over the years. So the therapist said, "Hey, here, try these uh, sex toys and and give those a shot, and then we'll meet next week." And then the lady, she comes back next week to the appointment, sex therapist, and says, uh, the therapist says, tell me about your experience with these, these dang toys. Was it helpful? How did you feel? So the, the lady says, well, you know, it's a little weird at times at first, but then we really got going, reached a, a, a pinnacle climax there. The therapist goes, okay, well, tell me about that. Tell me about the time you felt your most orgasmic. And the lady goes, hmm, well, the time I felt the most climactic was when I pegged. What? what? When you what? <laughs> when you what? Is when I it? peg. Peg? VB the third, you peg. can now hang up on any What is the pun like. there? Just give us the word. That's a pun. Lot. You're lucky this is an eight-hour show. And you're lucky Tim's uh, not here. When I win a peg. Like, you can't. Oh. Win a peg. Oh. Oh. I think that, yeah, okay. Yeah, I find uh, a joke to be uh, good when you have to describe it and everyone in the room is confused. <laughs> right. Yeah. <laughs> Exactly. Well, do you, do you, um, <laughs> can wow. my can my dad help you out with anything? Is there uh, anything? I think I think we should hang up. I was gonna say. <laughs> sure. Yeah. I need dad, what do you think? Yeah. You've got me. Think dad. Well, well, thanks for the thanks, thanks for, for calling. Yeah. yeah thank you. Me. Thanks for calling. Yeah, dad. Do, do you have any? Uh, you know the, okay. Dad, do you, he, he was talking about sex and stuff. What's this? I said Canada's largest import to the United States is cold air, and we're starting to get some right. Those winds are blowing. That's a good one. Yeah, <laughs> well, I like that one. So right. no, but thanks, Colin. Chilly. But you, he was talking about sex and stuff. Can you give any sex right. advice, Dad? Is this? Oh, can you? you wanna... Oh, I don't know. At least they'll have to, they do provide that service in Canada. Healthcare. It'll keep oh, busy they? for the winter and okay. we're all cold winter. I guess. <laughs> Nothing to do. All right. Yeah. Um, cool. you know. All right. Thanks, caller. <laughs> <laughs> any you zoomers? Any you zoomers looking for he advice? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Gilbert, is that is that why your hand is up? You want some advice? <laughs> you don't have to type, just nod yes or no. Wake up. Wave your hands if you want advice from Vic Burger the third, please. <laughs> you don't want advice Wake from up. me. Nobody Wake wants up. advice from you. Nobody. What's going Come on. on. Oh, no, Kyle. you're good. That's good. Really? Kyle Keith. Everybody's got it all figured out, they th- they say. They all have puns, they all no. have steak. Hello, Mr. Burger. Good. Nice to meet you. Hello, nice to meet you too. So, for buying a home, do you recommend a fixed rate mortgage, <laughs> thirty years or fifteen years? Ah, uh, let's see, fixed rate, fifteen years if you can do it. Oh. Okay, thanks. And if you can't do it, buy a, buy a cheaper house. Buy a cheaper house, not one of these California houses. No, you know. No. Oh, here we go. Oh, yeah. Here we yeah. go. Where, here it comes. Where here does that? Where do you live, Vic Vic Burger the Third? Thanks, Kyle. Uh, let's see, Pennsylvania, Allen near near Allentown. What's your You're address? What's your exact address? <laughs> hey, hey, hey! Don't get personal. Where? Uh, you know well, what about is. the Zoomer? Where are you? Where are you buying a house, sir? Oh, I think he, he, gone? he did his joke. He, I think that's. I mean, he wanted he to talk more. 
Yeah, what else? Yeah, um, me, uh, maybe it's a real question. I'm in the uh, Western New York, Greater Buffalo area. Uh, Buffalo. Uh, Say hi okay. to Mike well, Allen. You can, afford a, you can afford a house there. You know Mike Allen from the We Like Having Fun podcast? Oh, is he on there? there? Yeah, the guy that hates every uh, single fake podcast. ad I do. I haven't met him. Yeah. Say no. hi to him. I've pound. watched his uh, workout videos, though. Yeah, he's the hippie workout. Oh, he does yeah. workout videos? Oh. I call you Don Don. So that's yeah, that's so you're gonna run out and get your mortgage now? <laughs> no, I just right back into that. Dad, so that well, I thought we we're still on because he's up here, you know. All right, all right. Well, next, yeah, that's a great question. Yes, thanks, Kyle. Now, Vic, yeah, what did you go with? With what? Yeah, oh, 15 the, year, 30 year? I did. Maybe it's uh, too personal to talk about. No, but. I did. I did. It's probably 120 years. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Oh, my God. Wow. 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 Roasted. Wow. You know, this is Vic, the fourth show. Yeah, this is the third <laughs> show. Right. I know. He's taking well, you the know alpha what? role. Take He's it. got yeah. an alpha. If we get, we some, swap if we get some more Patreon yeah. subscribers, yeah. Could, maybe Vic can well, get down that. to a 15 year. That's a good point. Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. We're picking up a notch. You know we got to do the 30 years out here the only way uh, who else 30 years no you gotta go to the net afterlife out there we gotta we gotta do seven year arms i got a lot of mortgage when like you. like i'm like because like you're bald of course and i'm going massively hey, bald hey. it's going rapidly <laughs> these days what when did it happen for you like what you were young though you're younger than i was weren't you you're in your like 20s. no i don't think so really <laughs> No, in the oh. 30s. The 30s. <laughs> I'm never right. You go, to, okay. you, you go to the family weddings and funerals, and you look around, they're all funerals. bald. And both sides of my family are all bald. I had no chance. Yeah. Except for one cousin. He had a big head of hair. You know, so you, I don't know that remind, you would always from. say, like you, like, you never see your family unless you go to a funeral. And then don't you normally go to these funerals and then you hang out with the cousins you've never you like talk to really like right and you didn't you go yeah. golfing after some like grandmother's uh, funeral or something yeah my grand after grandfather dies somebody get the idea let's go golfing so yeah. first time i golf that was good so that's first yeah you're time. making you're making yeah you're making uh yeah, lemons first time out of, out of funeral. Lemonade, that, yeah. i've been golfing since yeah you that's your that's your workout thing that's how you're losing weight a little bit yeah that's what mom told me she said oh he's he's so in shape she said something like that to me so I was like, oh yeah okay I bet. <laughs> i'm serious how do you <laughs> How do you, how does golf be a you walk? Well, you yeah, walk around. Walk. Do, when does the heart does the heart rate right. get above eighty BPM? Well, BPM. <laughs> well, <laughs> we're DJs. You get yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Speaking my language, high, I'll tell you that. Oh man, you, ne you never golfed. I can tell. <laughs> wow, it's div delivering Blood the rose today. Up. Yeah, you got a caddy oh, if you want to make if you want to like work out. You got to be a oh, caddy. Oh, a caddy. Oh, uh -huh. well, I don't have that California money. No, no. <laughs> well, no. Some caddies will pay to caddy because it's a yeah. workout. They pay to caddy. The caddy workout. Nobody Just, pays why not? to caddy. Oh, it's good. It's good for the caddy. He loses weight. Yeah, and it's good you. to like meet people. That's how Dan Scavino got got into the White House with uh he was Mr. Trump's um caddy. And he, grew, oh, and he worked his way up, and he's running social media. For I can him. imagine that being like Caddyshack, where Trump, oh, Trump yeah. is that one guy right. from Too Close for Comfort. You know what I'm talking about? I don't, no, I don't remember that. that. The, what is that? The guy that's the bad guy from Caddyshack. In Caddyshack, yeah, the like the, the like rich, oh, like rich. snobby yeah. guy. Right, right, right. Yeah. 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 I know who you mean. I know. <laughs> it's a long show. We got that's, a lot of time. I know. We got a lot. Any other Zoomers? Did you ever a... golf, Doug? Doug, did you ever golf yourself? I do mini. Did you golf, Doug? I've golfed. I, it's golfing is funny. Funny. Fun. funny it's a funny, funny. Thing to do. oh okay no, golf golf is golf can be fun but sometimes if you're gonna do an 18 hole it's like give yeah. me a break it's but a you did time. you did a lot of uh handball <laughs> i remember playing handball with you as a kid we'd go to the y remember that yeah you know, i don't remember strong, you moving strong around memories you know of golf that. would be funny yeah. fun i, I don't remember golf would be fun handball with no clubs yeah. and you just can you just go and throw a ball just if you don't have clubs can you just yeah you know what that's amazing You've tried that? Last time I went out, I tried that, and it's a lot easier. It just rolls right in the hole. I tried what? that. Because you have a I stick, it doesn't work. Oh, my God. I did. Right in the hole. It's like, and I tried it with the club. Forget it. Does anybody want to? It's harder. We I, did have a request I, from the uh, YouTube chatters. They they want to hear a Gur baby from you. There VB3. we go. Oh, man. That's been a while. Wait, wait hold on, hold Forget on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I have an hold idea on. for a hold sport on. while, while <laughs> we're holding on. Mm -hmm. Golf, but you put the clubs instead of clubs, it's like a shoe. So it, imagine a shoe with like a nine oh, iron in the front oh, of it. And you, oh, and so you, you, kick, you kick it from the like you a kick. side. Well, you kick it with it's a, a combination of soccer yeah. and golf. Oh, interesting. But you kick it with a prosthetic foot, not your own foot. 
right? It's a shoe, but at the front of the shoe, it, imagine. But you're holding the other shoe. It's not your one of your feet. It's one of your feet. It's one of your feet. On your so shoe. you have to do this. It's the club. You kick. But do you have to use yeah. your arms to do it, or hey, you just do no it No arms yourself? at all. No arms. <laughs> Hands free. Hands free. And you only need one hey, club. You only need your feet. Hey, you don't need to carry Nike. a bag. You, you don't have a, a, a bag full of that. shoes, though. A bag full of shoes. That's yeah. The, that's the thing. Yes. <laughs> Go ahead. Go ahead, Dad. That's just silly. I don't know. <laughs> what did you ask? Oh, we want to. We want to get a Gur baby. Let me give a a drum roll real quick. Sorry, I said hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Grr, baby. That wasn't that good. That was great. What? Grr, baby. I mean, beautiful. Grr, I don't, I don't think I've ever heard a bad Grr, baby from you. So. Oh, man. Grr, but, baby. I still have that license plate. Well, listen, we're going to, we're going to, oh, you, you just, he actually does have a license plate that says Gur Baby. So if you see him around Bethlehem, yeah. Pennsylvania. Is that his catchphrase? I'm late. That's to his catchphrase. Yeah. 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 He's, yeah. Hey, I want to know what cars these guys are driving. I drive, I was driving a Miata. <laughs> I was a Miata. You, how many about, Miatas Doug, do you have? You how many Miatas do you have? What are you guys? driving? I'm picking on Doug. should have been the segment. What are you driving? A, um, BB3. I got a 2005 Subaru Forester. Wow. And I oh, have a good. 1991 <laughs> High Ace, and Toyota High Ace. You know, High Ace, Dad. The, it's a, like a, ooh, it's a it's like a like camper van, right? No, no. no my dad's a big camper. One. Two cars. No, I'm not. Well, not that you <laughs> got a van. We could do, we can go vanning sometimes. Yeah, I got a van. I got I got two Miatas, two Kias, uh, now a Chevy van. What else? You know, let a me out of old here. Pontiac vibe. My old vibe. Get me out of here. <laughs> I got big, no mortgage. No mortgage, but a big insurance bill for yeah, cars. Yeah, you got to work on that. And also, you should maybe get a garage or a par- a driveway or yeah, something. Yeah, that's next. <laughs> yeah, that's well, next. okay. Well, that's, that's next. That's you know, good. if we get how enough about, Patreon subscribers, you, Nina, I can finally get that 2009 car. Kia Sportage. I'm I have a, a 2010 Ooh. Toyota Prius Silver. Oh, that's Pretty nice. Fun, that's huh? what your health Classic. 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 Environmentally conscious. Yeah. That's good. <laughs> Well, you're. Are you going to get an electric car? I know that you were talking about that. Well, maybe. You want to well, save the, we're save at the, the planet? The Chevy, the Chevy Bolt, but um, yeah, the bolts are nice. Battery problems. I don't know what you're going to do with that. Uh, it starts smoking. Yeah. Well, well, it's blow right. up. I don't drive that far, so that's okay. Um, oh, okay. <laughs> so listen, drive we're gonna, I think we're going to get. <laughs> We're gonna move on here. We got we got a lot to get to. You better Dad. move on. Chase is yawning there. Wake up, Chase. Right. <laughs> That's the coffee. That's the coffee. No, no, is there anybody else? Raise your hand if you want uh, one more piece of advice for my dad. Is there anything? Advice. Joe LaRocca? Is anybody that why anyone actually asked him advice? Yeah. Joe LaRocca. Let's go. We had one good question. Joe LaRocca. Hello. There we go. Hello. We Whoa. hear you loud and clear, oh, Joe. Wow. I'm here in Milwaukee, Hello. Wisconsin. Why? <laughs> it's cold there, isn't it? Why? It's a little cold. Is it cold there? Why? Yeah. It's cold. I'm, okay, Milwaukee. Hello. <laughs> so I was wondering, I need to buy a soprano saxophone. And I'm just wondering if I should Ooh, get a Japanese Mikey. new model, like a Yanagasawa, or an old school Selmer yeah, Mark VI restored. What do you oh, think? I'd say old school, man. You want you want that sound, you know, the old school sound there, man. It's mellow. Huh. Takes the instrument some time to develop a sound of its own. So I, okay. That sounds good to me. One with the story. Thought, or buy both. Why not? Get both. <laughs> well, I'm a poor musician, so I can't afford both. Oh, yeah, I know. <laughs> but I, I got some, too. I, I used got to some bone marrow to sell. Oh, geez. It was not that <laughs> bad. <laughs> Hey, I was in a rock band and I had hair all the way down to my shoulders, you know. We did some, we had seven white guys and we did a, we were in a soul band. I don't know how we got away with that. Wow. You know? What, what was the band called? We did the step. We did the steps. Um, yeah, you had, let's see, uh, the fabulous duration. The fabulous duration? <laughs> duration, yep. Duration, we had the jacket durations, the, like plural? Like, like the length time, of time? Time signature. Multiple. Fed? Time. Oh, okay. oh. And more than one. Yeah, more than one. Oh, durations. Yes, more than one. one. Okay. I don't know why it's not yeah. a household name. Durations. The fa- we did Chicago, though. A lot of good, lot of good instruments, yeah, you though. Did. Your favorite band, too. 
and then, Chicago. And then growing yeah, up, like Chicago, Saturday, yeah. Saturday nights, you we would uh, Chicago. You'd go out to the the Elks and uh, play playing your polka band. You play well, bass. Well, that was a wedding band. Wedding we, band. The wedding band. We had four people. We made money. The, the uh, rock band. We had seven people. We had fun, but no money. Well, Dad. So um, <laughs> we're gonna let you go here, but I just want to know um, how you're okay. enjoying your Patreon subscription. You're into that. You like what what you're getting? Oh, I didn't know I had one. Oh, you, oh. are you taking money from me? No, I just checking out. Oh, I thought I just hey. assumed you had one, so you don't okay, have no, one. No, I got to check on that right, well, now. Go sign up now, okay? I can't. I got to pay my car insurance. Oh yeah, so don't, have yeah. To check that. That's the problem. <laughs> Was this a grassroots campaign <laughs> well, to get your dad to subscribe <laughs> to your Patreon? Want to be proud. Hey, you thanks know? for having me on. Nice meeting you, Nina. And nice uh, to meet you. Have a have a good uh, a Priya's. Uh, Take care of your Prius, right? <laughs> <laughs> see you, Mr. Right. Burger. Fatherly advice Bye-bye. from Vic Burger. Thank you. Three. Thank you, Mr. Thank you, Burger. Dad. Wake Take up, care. Chris. Come on, Chase. Thank you. I woke him up. Okay, Chase. Wake up. Bye-bye. See you, Dad. Bye. Well, how about that? Where else can you get wow. V3 on the line here? V3. You know, like, no, nowhere else out there that you can we get have new, that. Some, we, we have got some a new couple of more guests, guests in yeah. the studio. And it's nice to see and, them. Uh, Let me tell you. It's been a while. It's been a while. We have it's J.P. Been a while. Hassan. Hi. Hey. I'm <laughs> giving <laughs> some drops, Vic. Oh, well, oh, sorry. I'm like, yeah. And we also have Mikey Campman. Mikey Campman. <laughs> I, this the, Thanks this for the, joining, guys. Thanks yeah. for joining us. Thanks for hanging out, guys. What are you, so, what are you guys been up to today? We're going to go have lunch in a little while. Whoa. Oh, did you pick out a place? Um, not yet. Actually, why don't you help us pick out some lunch for us to order? Oh, okay. Got the, wow. I, glad I came. You can crowdsource <laughs> where you guys should go eat for lunch. Oh, let's crowdsource their lunch mm-hmm. spot, yeah. too. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, so I just where, where, what neighborhood are we are you, talking? Did we give Mikey a are microphone? Guys, oh, yeah, he's gone. Oh, he's gone. Are you, is anybody vegan? Is that... No. no nobody's, okay, so that, that helps that. Okay. I need to get my mail from my P.O. box in Atwater Village, so... <laughs> I'd like to go somewhere around there. Um, go to Dune. You know what I love. Oh, Dune's great. What, Dune. Why don't you get that a closer PO list. box? Because well, like, you're not in that one. I like village, are you? Noodle. Like, no. Why don't you just get one closer? Okay, this is great. Cr- right, we don't, don't, don't need it. to talk about <laughs> Atwater Village lunch <laughs> selections. I mean, I know it's kind of my idea. I think the, the specificity is right. really going to. It's, get, it's riveting. Do you guys want sage? We do have to actually order our lunch. Uh huh. That's why you go. You know, I like. I'll do sage, of course. Yeah, know. yeah. All right. Mm. I'll, I'll, I'll text I'll you what I, li- I I know what I get over there. Okay. What time is it? It's it is almost eleven. Yeah, you almost have, 11. I have to go soon. Okay. okay. Um, well, well, Nina, what would you, why don't yeah. you plug anything? Yeah. That you yeah. Oh, want to plug? okay. Well, yeah. uh, hey guys, I got a lot of stuff. Uh, Let, real quick, let's do a quick. <laughs> yeah. Let's do like a one minute interview. So, Nina, you recently uh, moved to New York, and you're like a bi coastal. DJ, comedian, what else do you what else do you do? You're like me. <laughs> I'm a lot like Doug. <laughs> Doug's my muse. Um, Doug. Doug. my protege. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. I what what's the question? I don't know. <laughs> to, for why did you move to for, New York? Why and, but you also are living here. Okay, so I'm from here. I was here my whole life and I never lived anywhere else. And I was moving. I was living back and forth between LA and New York for the last three years. And I had a place in Williamsburg and a place in Los Feliz, and I was going back and forth. And I really like the comedy community in New York. I think it's really accommodating. It's really lovely. There's uh, there's a lot more shows to do out there, so that was really nice. Um, I study with this uh, in, in an acting studio, and it's based in New York. So I've put way more. I've kind of pivoted my career more into like acting too. So, you know, stand up, but I like acting all this stuff. Uh, pandemic hit and I was fucking done. Uh, I was I was trapped in LA the whole time and, and I really missed New York. And so I wanted to move and I did. And I procured a, a great apartment during the pandemic and I got like a two year lease. And I live in Lower East Side. I'm happy. Yeah, it's a. I feel so lame for being genuine. <laughs> yeah, I, know. I shouldn't have. I should not have done anything. That was genuine. really you'll, lame. You'll have that that's that's so lame. That's the whole time. This, this the is best. the wrong form. That, that, that was stupid. I'm fully embarrassed. So that's you, very embarrassing. What you, you said that. <laughs> I know, honestly, um, you, that honestly. I feel ashamed. <laughs> what's What's the latest uh, record you've picked up? Okay. Um, now we're talking. Now we're talking. Now the real wow. questions are coming. Yeah, in. guys. I don't know. It's a little personal. Um. Uh, gosh, I guess a lot. I, I buy 
a lot of shit on Discogs. I already have a huge oh. record collection, so I don't really go like go scouring. Specific. Yeah, yeah, I'm like, okay, I really need this like uh, Ian Dury record because I really want to play this song right. or something. So I'm actually I'm waiting for some things in the mail. Okay. So uh, yeah. you now, know, when you you're stuff. a vinyl DJ, how many how many? That's a heavy. It's heavy. heavy. How many do you bring to a gig? A lot, like. 80 or 90 records i have like a how many milk crate? crates is that uh I, I i have like a ud i have like a udg bag which is like a it's like a it's made specifically to carry around vinyl and it's like a suitcase almost oh, so you can roll it i can yeah and i fly i fly a lot with the records so i have to have it you know is this interesting to yes, anyone it is, it is. <laughs> okay how do you uh, what is it yeah how do you oh, oh you so have like can a, let her go she's gotta go oh yeah <laughs> what's that generational sort of general okay okay oh, okay well, thank you for being here. Thank you this guys. was fun. We have wow. to do it again. What a what a pleasure. Yeah. Honestly. Next time, next yeah, time you're here, back. Tim will be there. Oh yeah. Unless he sees us and he's like, "I'm not coming back." <laughs> you know? No. Nice. You're welcome back well, anytime, yes. Nina. Oh, you guys are angels. Have Fun a great time. day, guys. I hope you have a wonderful lunch. Thank okay. You. Bye. Thank Thanks, you. Thanks, Nina, so much. <laughs> bye. bye. All right, generationals are here, Grant, and. Where'd Ted go? Here's We're gonna Ted. get to Mikey and JP soon soon enough. Yeah, they can jump in this. We've got a full show, and you too. can jump in on this too. Oh, cool. I can we stand <laughs> over here? Can we do this? Now the generationals asked me to make a music video. <laughs> yeah. And I did. I did a great video. Who's that? That's Ted? Is that you Ted talking? Yeah, can you hear me? What is this Ted Talk? <laughs> That's Ted. Hi, Ted. This is a Ted Talk. Cross talk to Ted Talk. Who else is on the line? Hi, Ted. I'm here too. I, can you guys hear me? I, I don't know if it's coming through. We're we're down here at, uh, on Bourbon Street. Just thought we'd try to get down into the heart of the town. I don't know if I'm coming through. Oh yeah. How's Bourbon? You can tell. You guys live in uh, you guys live in um, New Orleans, correct? Yeah. It's, yeah, that's it's right. Popping off right now. Um, it's going. It's really going hard <laughs> downtown. Uh, and you know, I just figured if we're gonna be in Nola, we might as well. Go down there and, and just kind of broadcast from the heart of it all. So it's going wonderful. All right. So <laughs> <laughs> do you guys hang out at, I mean, if you're living in New Orleans, you got to be down at Bourbon Street every night, you know, taking advantage every of day, it. Every day. Yeah. I mean, we live on Bourbon. We both live, most of the city. Most of the citizens of New Orleans live on Bourbon Street. And how do those? I'm actually down here right now, as I said before. Still down here. <laughs> yeah, I can hear that. By the way, Doug, Doug, <laughs> I got a little bit of a bone to pick here. Uh, the other, the other day, you guys were doing an episode. Tim was talking about how he was down here working on a movie, and uh, Doug, you asked him if he had spent any time hanging out in the whiskey district. <laughs> Which, <laughs> that's not that's not it that's, that's not, not a district okay. here and uh yeah some people down here were pretty PO'd when they heard about that it's not it's bourbon street please and bourbon is what well are you trying to say it's the same thing we might as well it's well, what is bourbon can you define bourbon it's a spirit um specifically distilled a type of grains Haha. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay. I'm kind of, see, I'm kind of right. Mm. It's the whiskey district. Right. Why don't you rebrand it the Doug, whiskey why district? Why don't you come on down, get in the cab, and ask him to take you to the whiskey district? <laughs> He'll know what I mean. <laughs> yeah. He'll yeah. know what I we'll mean. Meet. Kick you we'll meet. Yeah. Makes sense no, to me. Good. You got wine country. Now, you got how the do the necklaces? District? How do those necklaces work down there in the whiskey district? <laughs> you know those necklaces they seem to wear. Ted, you can take yeah. this one. Uh, no, Mardi Gras Day, it's all about the necklaces. And, you know, that's actually our currency. That's how you, that's how you pay for stuff. That's how you build wealth. There's just necklaces for Mardi Gras. And uh, how do they be, how do they exchange? They're not for money. They're for. Yeah, can, can oh, you... there's all kinds of, th there's all kinds of things. Can you, you get can a do. shot of whiskey with a, with a necklace? To be clear, Doug, did we cut you off at the top of this? Were you were you about to say something? <laughs> oh, we can get to the meat. We can get to the meat. Uh, the uh, potatoes and meat. The meat and potatoes of the interview. I mean, no, we were. We I made a video for you guys, right? Are we going to check did. that out, Matt? We hired. Yeah, yeah. You, yeah. Made, you made a video for us. Yeah, we'd like to 
speak about it a little bit. Can we watch it? Yeah, why don't we watch it? Yeah, let's just watch it. We'll roll the video. This song is called I Was a Tunnel. Yep, that's right. The Generational. Tom, you ready to pull up this video? And uh, then, you know, we can talk about it afterwards. All right, let's go. Hey, Doug, what's up? How's it going? (laughs) Good. Hi. Um, So, yeah, we're just checking in on the video. Um, How did it come out? Well, you didn't really give me much to work with. It just... Some shot of a band playing live. I don't know what to do with that. Okay. Uh, can we can we see the cut? Can we see the cut? Here you go. So all those sound effects, that's all going to stay in there? Yeah. I had to spice it up. It was boring. I even had to hire a Bulgarian animator on Fiverr. So that's the final cut. Yeah, that's the final cut. I'm done. Smell good? Smells good. Beautiful. Beautiful. What an incredible video that I did for you guys. Yeah. 
Um, yeah, I mean... I like how we're going from Zoom to, like, more <laughs> Zoom. What else is there to discuss, fellas? <laughs> I guess that pretty Do much I get said a necklace? it all. Do I get a necklace for that one? In yeah. The Whiskey District? Uh, yeah. yeah. Come to the Whiskey District and tell them you're ready for a necklace uh, and just go wherever they point you. You'll get one. Um, but uh, no, Doug, look, we just want to let you know, you know, that, that video was a huge headache for us. A lot of people got very upset about <laughs> people got the drop. Upset? <laughs> yeah, we got a lot of calls, um, complaints, letters written in. It was just our, our fan base was very confused and, and upset by what you did caused us a lot of headaches and i just want to let you know you know we have we've actually gone to some therapy and and talked it over and we're ready to forgive you for how bad you wrecked our music video and move on oh. from it we're here to to uh, bury the hatchet that's right well yeah i'm sorry you didn't i'm sorry you feel that way and um, I'm ready to accept your forgiveness. Good. Then we can we can put this whole thing behind us and just focus on the positive and hmm. you know. Hmm. I'm sorry. You, you know, I apologize to your fan base. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I I'm, I I I'm sorry that they feel that way, and I'm sorry if anything I did um, upset them. Thank you, Doug. Thank you, Doug. Appreciate you saying that. Are you guys going to be able to put the pieces back together, or is the band broken up? We're gonna we're we're gonna we're continuing to go to therapy over it. And if anything, thinking, this kind of this kind of drew us together. You know, it's created it's, a new it's, bond. It's made yeah. us closer yet, and uh, I think we're gonna we're gonna get out of it. Okay. All right. You're not gonna do like a Metallica thing where you fire the bass player and stuff. <laughs> That may happen he's, still. Okay. Yeah. He's yeah, he's probably gone, but all right. Yeah. Well, the bass player from TSOL might be available. You can get him. Vic, where did you see <laughs> Ween play? We saw Ween. I don't know. I don't even remember where it was. Oh, it's it was the Wiltern. region or the Wiltern. The Wiltern. Wiltern. The Wiltern and I, uh, are, is, are, the, are you guys going on tour or is this is probably leading to a big plug? So let's right. Hear it. Are you touring with with <laughs> Ween? Uh, no, no, we're oh. not. But that would be a dream come true. Yeah. Um, yeah, uh, we just put out an EP, uh, of which Tunnel was one of the main singles. And uh, we're going to be putting out some new music coming up very soon in 2022. So stay tuned for that. We'll be doing a, a one-show tour uh, on New Year's Eve at a little little club down here in NOLA called the Saturn Bar. Uh, so anybody trying to have a good time, down in New Orleans wow. on New Year's Eve. Are you, uh, you playing till midnight? Are you gonna you know stick around? Oh night? god, that's way too late. <laughs> you play um, from seven till eight, and then <laughs> they leave. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. we'll be gone. We'll be we'll be okay. long gone. That's so good. By the time the New Year thing happens. So yeah, you can catch up the next later. day. What happened the night before? That's fine. They'll tell us. They'll yeah, tell us they'll let you know. Yeah. Cool. Well, I had a blast. You know, I had a blast making your video, and thanks for asking me to do it. Sorry it didn't work out, but. You it know, was a good, I had fun. yeah, we appreciated the effort you put into it, you know, results be damned, but um, it was fun. It was a fun time. Thank you for doing it, Doug. My pleasure, guys. Yeah, let's do it again. Hell yeah. I get another try. Yeah, there we go. But not a lot of people get like, you know. What if the next one I do, I just strip their music completely <laughs> out? And it's, it's only the sounds. Yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. Whittle it down um, until there's very nothing left. Were they? Is that a is that a term people use? Pound core. I saw that in the chat. <laughs> Pound core. <laughs> I think there's a new genre here that's just been coined. This would be in the history books. They'll say the first time that term has been said was on a was in a chat. Are you? I think I, I saw it on the chat okay. during the video. This is a pound core style of editing. Which, when I look through it, look at it through that prism, it makes more sense. The pounding. Um, what was I gonna say? <laughs> anything I was gonna, else? <laughs> I was gonna say, no, what I mean, else you got to promote? Like, what else? Anything well, we else? Got a new P another EP album? Come another? We got a, or anything? We got side a new projects? EP. Oh, oh, hey, well, I did, I did want to run this one by you. We were thinking about launching. Uh, I know you guys are big on Patreon. We we're thinking about launching a new thing called a Patreon, and that's where 
you post a bunch of songs and your haters can go on there and they pay you to take the songs down. Oh. Um, oh, there's something to that. So yeah, there's with something every there. new benchmark, with every new benchmark you hit, um, you, one of the songs would be pulled down off of there. Or, or for like a comedian, the Patreon subscribers, every time they hit a certain mark, they could stay, they could stick to comedy, and stop talking about politics. Uh-huh, or, we know uh-huh. whatever, like a, yeah, just make us laugh, like clown. That. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So maybe when we get that off the ground. We could we come back on and and give give you guys a little taste of it and uh, um, yeah. But until then, that's that's all we got. I'm sorry we're not doing more. I know you guys have a lot more going on, but that's just that's all we got. That's for right it. Now. That's great. No, that, that's a lot more than uh, than most people have going. So congratulations. Doug, I heard your uh, piano playing, and if you're down to tour, go on tour with us. <laughs> I'm down. It was, I'm yeah. down. Just let me just, know what notes are the wrong notes for. No, just no practice. <laughs> No rehearsal, just like come, just totally fresh. Clearly, I have. Do what you t- clearly, I know what I'm doing, and I could. Yeah, you proved that it's not about skill at all. Thanks. Do you guys need a, a road manager? Because we have one in the house. Yeah, here. we got JP. Ha- JP can. Uh, he's ready to go right now. Oh, talk to us, JP. Get on the plane. Go down to Nolan. What's your this What's your policy? <laughs> <laughs> How do you? What's your technique to like get everybody corralled, ready to get back on the bus after the show? Do you have any tips? What's your um, what do I do? I have any tips? Um, I'd rather hear about tour routing. Really get into the nitty gritty. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm routing a tour right now. Um, <laughs> I would say, uh, yeah, just threaten threaten people with threatening physical violence or with money or no, just threatening people with the um, idle threats, the guilt that uh, the potential guilt that like the staff doesn't want you there anymore. So I think it's more so of like cool. be, Please be leave nice the to the room. artist like all day. And then when it's time, if they're screwing up, then you, you shift. And then they're like, Oh, this is serious. Something uh, like that. Yeah. I think if yeah. you, if you, you know set, I mean? if you set a nice tone throughout the tour, mm-hmm. then people, if, if your tone suddenly shifts, yeah. people will know that something. Voice gets Do you guys have deeper. a, tr- have trouble with like band members not getting on the <clears throat> bus in time? Uh, no, that's not an issue with us. Um, Are you on a bus? And that is mainly due to the fact that we do not tour on a bus. Uh, that's <laughs> not been an issue. You had a couple but, of Priuses? Uh, yeah. We, yeah, we do a Phalanx, like a little car. Volvo uh, wagon. Yeah, Volvo wagon. Uh, and you, ride, you drive two abreast and block the whole freeway? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right. No one can pass. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's how we get a lot of our advertising out. We put a big sign on the back yeah. and people just get bottled up back there. They have to read all the dates. Mm-hmm. You, know, you got to find ways to get around the indie, indie music scene. You don't have money to get on TV commercials. So you got to do stuff like that. I heard your, I heard this is a true story. I heard one of your songs in a Chipotle and I shazammed it. And that's how I first that, heard about you guys. That's that how is, most people oh. yeah. hear about us. How did you get on that's, the Chipotle playlist? Cause that's my dream. We don't they, know. I went in there and they said, if you can take down 10 burrito bowls in one day. <laughs> if you we'll go in you there on. and your song's playing, can you be like, I swear to God, this is my song. Can I just, can you hook me up? <laughs> uh, the, the staff, they don't really care about that kind of stuff. They're just like, yeah, man. I'm, they actually, they get mad. They just go like, uh, Pinto or Black. Yeah, or Pinto or Black. This is the 10th time I've heard this song this week. If you could just leave now, you're actually dead. Yeah, they're actually. I yeah, actually hate this song. Yeah. It's on a loop. Right. Right. Yeah. 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 So no luck. Well, there. congrats on the Chipotle playlist. That's, yeah, it's huge. And I'm serious. That's a that's yeah, huge. that's big time. That's big. That's big. That Thank you big. for that. Thank you. Appreciate it. Uh, um, you guys gonna go down to the whiskey district now? And yeah. Yeah. Are you up to yeah. The rest we're gonna of the day? get back. We, we We're got here. People waiting for us. Waiting for us <laughs> oh, yeah, inside. Right. Some of these clubs, uh, they're waiting for us inside, and they're holding our bar stool. Could I? Could you put the phone up, phone up so I could hear the music in the background? You got it. Is it? Is there? Uh, yeah. Are they still playing? I'm just cue the band. There they are. They're they're inside there, and so wow. My drink. They they're saying it's waiting for me on the bar. So incredible. Well, have have just, a fun day and uh, and tip well. Okay. Absolutely. Chug some Thank you, boys. Go have a good. Thank one. you guys. All right. Later on. Take care, everybody. Thank you, Jerry. Nice working with you. And yes. let's, let's do it again. Yeah. Doug, thanks for having us. So, guys, I got uh, I got some good news and some bad news here. 
Oh, great. Uh, what do you want well, first? How about our guests? We should talk yeah. to Mike. Yeah. Mikey just, has can, can, I, um, can I just can I do yeah, impre- say this let's, business let's real quick? Matt, can you give me oh, a second? Uh, Matt will say the business. <laughs> <laughs> so the good news is the Patreon has increased again. So let's pull that up real quick. <sighs> I thought we were going to lose Quick wow. check-in. I know. I thought it was in, going in down. Subscription price? Yes, we're up to 58.48, which is a good number. And if you look at the uh, the image, we got it. Got Joel Hole in there. Whoa, Very look important. at that. There's Joel Hole. There's the compound. Uh, Phil. How much it? fill material do you get for the subscription? A lot of fill. Now, the bad news. <laughs> yeah, a lot of filler. I got real bad news to go with that good news. Uh oh. They're uh, no longer serving breakfast. Yeah. Oh. We got to adjust our order. I just, yeah. I, th- I, thought, I put a breakfast burrito in it. I saw it was like, oh, 10 20, 10 50 50 a. Oh, I, I, thought, I thought you did great. You were bringing it with the energy. Oh, um, wait, wait. Hold wait, on. Um, can Generationals. Can we? Um, <laughs> oh, they're still on. Matt, what is to remind everybody and myself? Uh, what is the the hothead hotline? What is it? The number again? Uh, hold on, eight one eight. Eight one eight. Hold on, hold on. This has been fun. <laughs> this is a great <laughs> show. Really good. Wow. Okay. I, I Thanks, Mikey. You can't just it. look at the. Doc. I couldn't find it. It's what on you, the. What do you think doc. you're going to order, Mikey? Eight one eight eight zero four 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 seven eight. Eight one eight eight zero four 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 seven eight. But now let's get back to our lunch menu. That's a. Yeah, so I'm gonna pass this <laughs> back, back around. <laughs> Let's talk to our um, guests now. Yes? Yeah, so so Mike, can I just I, show you guys? I, I, can, yeah. can I can I give everyone maybe like uh, the audience or the listeners like a show them what it's like to be on the show mm-hmm. while 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 we're here? <laughs> sure. Okay, so you're here, right? Yes. You're like cool. Okay, I'm here. I'm sitting, and it's great. And then meanwhile. Like every fi- like five minutes, someone comes in, comes in like through the door, <laughs> like <laughs> grabbing wire. Like right. it's all quiet too. It's so awkward. Everyone's like, down. <laughs> and then people are like talking, yeah. and then there's like sidebar yeah. conversations yeah. going on where it's like texting, but yeah. like not. We're doing our lunch order. No, I know, but it's funny. It's funny, I'm because I'm just sitting here observing. You know, it's because Tim demands that the help and the tech department can't make eye contact. Right, right. They know they have have to to stay at like ankle level. There's so many like layers of of, uh, communication going on. We're doing a live show here, man. And Tom are not to be seen. Yeah, we should can't cut something back. Maybe there's too much going on. Too much stimulation. Mikey, I'm surprised that you're surprised. After all of the, you know, props you put and actually, out on Mikey, stage, that was your job on tour. Tim and Eric. Oh yeah, yeah. You don't want to shit so on somebody that does what just you do, right? For the yeah. listeners, to a little backstory, uh, JP has been a tour manager with Tim and Eric. He also does JP Incorporated, his own, um, you know, his own comedy act. Which you open for Devo. Is that what I'm hearing? In my ear? Yeah, we, we had uh, Josh, Josh Fries. Fries right in here. He sat right where Mikey See, is. Look at this, huh? You can still feel it, right? Yeah. And anyway, he's been our tour manager for a minute. I've, when I went on tour with, I think, a little bit with, yeah, with Eric Andre, mm-hmm. you did that one in Australia. Mm-hmm. And I've probably gone on tour with you with Tim and Eric like six times or something, right? It's probably Many something times. like that. Many four, times. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine times. Yeah, it's been like so over it's been it should yeah. be called and then mikey <laughs> mikey is uh often <laughs> often the sort of uh he's the prop master like the prop master yeah. stage hand you're the all uh yeah. jack of all trades yeah he's, yeah he's like and you're the, burying the lead peter pitsman he's the yeah and he's peter pitsman yeah pitsman. he's more like an assistant but yeah um jp's understudy we've had fun on tour he's like an intern any questions out there yeah, any questions? Yeah, let's get to some Zoomers, right? Let's go to some Zoomers. Feel free to put a drop anytime there's <laughs> I know, well, dead air. I'm, I'm having to reorder my lunch thing, so I'm so like oh, distracted. It's the collective. <laughs> it's the collective view. Right. Vic's texting. Sadie Teal. <laughs> I know, it's like, good, good job, point. Daddy. <laughs> Sadie. Hey guys. Do you all really believe? Hi, Sadie. This? How are you today? You hear me okay? Yeah, yeah. you clear. sound great. Awesome. Um, I have some Thanksgiving puns, a whole list of them. Oh, yes. Beautiful. Yes. Uh, so I'll start with one. If you like it, I'll keep going, but I'll just go ahead and start. All right. So I'm getting older. It sucks. Doug, what would you say is the worst thing about getting older? Probably the stuffing. 
I, I think that's incorrect. <laughs> What would be I'll tell you what the worst thing about getting older is. <laughs> what is this it? morning? I got out of the shower. I looked down. I'm getting a gray V. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's good. I like wow. that. Wow. So wow. far, so nice. good. Okay. So far, so good. You just want a pair of socks. Salt, salt and pepper. Oh, thank you. Salt and pepper or just gravy? Bam. <laughs> uh, it's going pure gray. <laughs> On its way to white, yeah. But anyway, all right, next one. Sound healthy. Mm. It's a Mrs. Claus. No, I know. It's it's a problem. Um, the opioid crisis. Terrible, right, Vic? Yes, I'm not a fan of it. Yes, I've always I've always uh, said that I'm not a fan of the opioid crisis. Happy Thanksgiving. <laughs> yeah. Famously, um, he said that many times. Uh-huh. Well, it's horrible. So I went to the emergency room the other day, and I was prescribed a bunch of opioids, but it didn't take much. Only one pill. I'm addicted. Wait, hold on. I fucked that one up. Can no, I start telling over? Take it back from the top. Yeah, hold on, back to the up. top. Even okay, I went top. to the emergency room the other day, and I got addicted just after one pill. Grim, huh? Pilgrim? Oh. oh yeah. Pilgrim? Okay, all right. I, it was better when you were talking one. about your uh, pussy that was, that was gray. <laughs> oh, I've, got, I've got another one like that. Okay, okay. Let's get into it. So my best friend is an actress and she loves her job, but she's really nervous for her next role. She has a nude scene and she's like spread Eagle right in front of the camera. Mm, So she was like, I need a body double, but she complained to me. It took her so long to cast her whole casserole. Casserole. (laughs) Does that make sense? I'm Can it. I keep going? I have yeah, two these more. Are good. Ones. These are okay. good. <laughs> Barbie dolls. Everybody knows Barbie dolls, right? Oh yeah. Man, she is looking really horny today. I bet she's gonna go home and pump Ken. <laughs> pump Ken. <laughs> I'm into it. All yes. right, last one. This one is a stretch. <laughs> Greg Turkington. Matt, do you know this guy? I do. I do. He's funny. He makes me laugh a lot. Funny guy. Actually, I actually have a nickname for him. This is not the joke. I call him Turkey. I think it's fun. Hey, Turkey. <laughs> but I have to change his nickname. Apparently, he's a cannibal. And he eats his own family members. <laughs> Sick guy. So now I've changed his nickname to Turkey, their mom eater. <laughs> Turkey, their mom eater. Does that make sense? That's all I have. Very good. Excellent. Okay. Seriously, send wow, me a message. Yeah, I'll yeah. get you some socks. That's a winning call. Will do. <laughs> well do. Well done. Well like done. The, I like that she's going blue. Follow me on too. Twitter. Yeah. yeah, what's what's, what's your, your Twitter, Twitter handle? Uh, uh, Sadie and Hades. I'm actually also doing a TikTok every day as a like creative experiment. So oh. Sadie and mm-hmm. Hades, you said? What is uh, it? Yeah, how do you spell that? S-A-D-I-E-H-A-D-E-S. Are you wearing a heavy metal t-shirt? Um, Sonata Arctica. What the heck is it's that? It's like a Finnish metal band. I got this in high school. It's, oh, okay. it's really old. I, I don't even listen to them that, that much. All right, well, thanks yeah. for being that on much. the show and great puns. <laughs> that much. You know? yeah. yeah. Cut above. Yeah. Take care, yeah. Those are a cut above. Thank you. Amazing, I love your show. Amazing call. We have pizzas. We have 300 hamburgers. Many, many French Mikey, where, where, are, where are you eating uh, your turkey day dinner? Are you having a turkey day dinner? Uh, no? Well... Uh, uh, <laughs> we are gonna get. I did. Do I have to start over? <laughs> lunch. <laughs> Sorry, Mikey. Um, where do the turkey dinner questions end and the lunch debates <laughs> begin? <laughs> you just don't know. Just try to like, like, cause you're you're a roamer, you're a rover, a roamer. What's the word? You're around. You don't. You don't, you don't like, yeah, you don't, you don't settle in one place. You're like a rolling stone, right? Yeah. Do you want the, uh, well, the sad truth? I'll be, I'll be just. No, we don't want to hear that. I'll just be pulled over on the side of the road, (laughs) sitting in my van, eating like, uh. On the side of the freeway. What are you going to get? Side of the freeway. Can you you get fast food turkey turkey dinner? Is that like a thing? I guess Uh, Boston Market would have that. Yeah. You could go to Boston Market. Are, Are you the kind of guy, I know you travel a lot. 
driving yourself, are you the kind of guy that if you have to use the restroom, will you just pull over to the side of the freeway? <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, man. I, I, don't... See, I always see families just pulled over yeah. to the side of the with, freeway. With the, with the doors open, If right? you use so public so you restrooms, the, but the they're like shot. two twisted. exits away yeah, that's, from... Yeah, but sometimes kids just like, it's coming out now. You okay. know what I mean? So sometimes I do that. I mean, I actually, I, I do have to... Do you know about the knee pee? The, the knee pee? Knee pee? Knee pee, no. So if you have a pair of shorts on, you oh. can take a knee... Uh huh. And well, I guess this is good for for men probably, uh-huh. or if any women have a big dick, <laughs> um, a very long urethra. Yeah. Um, <laughs> sorry. Uh, yeah. You just take a knee uh-huh. and then you pull up your leg just a little bit, and everyone yeah. just thinks you're like. This is, huh. I'll do like the. I'll you know I'll go next to a like a. I'll go next to like a field of flowers and take a knee. And then I'm just looking like I'm down on my knees, like getting a close look at these flowers, these uh-huh. beautiful. But I'm really, and, but you're really pain. relieving yourself. Yeah, I I to- totally We're, believe that. Like, uh, okay, <laughs> well, dogs. We we all live in a world where we agree that dogs can just pee and poo anywhere, uh, yeah, and that's fine. Yeah, but well, suddenly humans are off that list. But like, where do you where are you doing this in the where where are you finding flowers? Or you're or just like you pulling off on the side of the road. Well, mate, that's the beginning of the search. You oh. gotta first start looking for flowers. But it doesn't look odd to somebody like going by like that. Guy, what's this guy doing? No, just taking a knee. I've peed in public, yeah. and you have to sometimes when it's an emergency, and you the trick <laughs> is to get away with it. Is don't look down. Oh don't yeah, do the don't pee look. I, look elsewhere. Yeah, and do the pee down here, but then be looking. At, yeah, I, I saw did that about the, the next thing you know, I, your shoes all wet. I did. I did that. We went to the beach. <laughs> nah, not when you got to aim like me. <laughs> like I six forgot. months ago, I did that. Where like we're, we're like we're with the kids and everything, and I'm walking down the beach, and we're like our Airbnb was like way down the other thing, and there's people all around. So I just like just let it go, like from there. Yeah, like that. Like. Right in the water. I don't know. Anyway, um, in the like, ocean. In the ocean, as I'm walking, but like I was like halfway in the water, so oh. it was like it was only only the, up to my waist, and I don't know. So. I have a but pee I, trick. The whole I thing. Have I, was a, like, I have a um, my signature pee trick for the beach. What's that? I know. I know. Mikey it. knows it. If you ever at the beach with Doug and he's lying on his stomach, uh, and you're telling him a story and he's not listening, it's because he's dug a hole oh, about a what? foot deep, and he lays on his stomach and just pees into the hole. I mean, presumably, do you ever does it ever fill up and you touch? Yeah. No way. I mean, the sand is just it just it disappears just it. down, and yeah. people get offended when they find out. They're like, "You're peeing right next to me," but uh, it's buried underneath there, like six, twelve inches. Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. <laughs> if you believe in stardust, you lay down on your stomach, and <laughs> then you can kind of sneak yeah. the peen around the corner. You know what I mean? Mm. If you believe that we're all, <laughs> yeah, I know, you, I know you can mean. pee around a corner, wow, like around the corner of your shorts. Uh-huh, uh-huh. No one can tell what's going on. Right. It's okay. the world. The world is a disgusting place at the end of the day, and um, I don't feel any shame about just being a wild animal. Yeah. I mean, think about how much whale shit. Well, there. and when the option <laughs> is pulling over to a Chevron and right. the toilet, a, a is toilet that they can a recycle toxic waste. And, Some yeah, people think, yeah. oh, just go in the water and pee. You know, that's somehow better. Swimming in your piss is better than having it be out of sight under a mine, six inches under some sand. And I mean, <laughs> with the tide too, it's eventually the piss is going to come back into the ocean anyway. Yeah. It's if we all knew what we were, what we were breathing in every yeah. fucking day. Well, I mean, while like we were walking, yeah. and we'd be <laughs> repulsed. I think. Well, I have my mask on all day, so I don't have to worry about yeah. it. This has been fun. Yeah. What a great so, yeah chat. Yeah. What else do you, you guys want to say? Hi. Anything to, uh, you want to get off your chest? Do you want to take a zoomer? Can we talk Let's to uh, take a hothead hotline. Are you on the air? Is it uh, B Man? Are you there? The uh, actually, this is the devil. Oh, sorry. Oh, devil is the devil. devil there. This is the devil. And this is the devil's friend. And it's this bit. We're going to sing a song to you about hell. Welcome to hell. We're in hell. Welcome to hell. We go to hell. We roll hell. Hitler moves down here. So don't we down here. George Bush Sr. is in heaven. Oh. <laughs> Hello? 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 
Yes, who's who is this? Hey, can you hear? Is this still the devil and his this friend? Is the this is the man in the A train, Hellman. Uh, okay. We have pranked you guys. Oh, oh wow, we really I got thought, pranked. I by thought it Brendan was the Walsh devil. and Amanda A train. Yeah. Hey, Brendan. Hey, Brendan. Hey, what's up, guys? Oh, you got your own drops over there. Hey, guys. Yeah. How's it terrible. going? I, I I wish we could see you. Yeah. Do you have a whole? Do you have Aaron? Is we he should, doing the should. clapping in there? No, that's that's uh, that's, that's me. That's we have that. Oh, but we have cool. some exciting news. We have some exciting news for you guys. All right, let's hear it. Cool. Uh, what was that? <laughs> okay, so uh, well, do you guys, uh, who do you guys have there with you today? Mikey Catman and JP Hassan. Oh, I know, I know those guys. Hey guys, what's up? Hey, we should hang out now. <laughs> So I'll hang out now. We'll meet you uh, do you guys Dolphins do you guys have anything 20. that's chapping? Would, would any of you guys like to step into the rant corner and <laughs> say what's chapping your ass? <laughs> the ramp corner. The rant corner. Rant Mike, corner. Do you have anything rant. for the rant corner? Rant. Oh, rant. rant. Yeah. Like, I'll get. I'll get it started. Okay. I'll, okay, I'll, yeah. I'll show you how it's done. Fuckers out there, you know what really chaps my ass? When you go into a store and they ask you to put on a mask and all these vaccine mandates, they don't even know what's in these vaccines. I heard Bill Gates is putting microchips in there. If you're crazy, if you take these microchip vaccines. And I think another thing is that, uh, that also it, it bugs me when there's a le- person in the left-hand lane driving 40 miles an hour on the freeway. Get in the slow lane, you old bitch! <laughs> wow. Okay, so that's you guys, a great way to feel, get Do you feel better now, B-Man? Does that it does. It really, yeah. it, it really has to be I feel like the chat. way that this is working is like they have to just talk, and then when they're done, we talk because it's so, so much the sound work. is messed yeah. up. It's right. so much work to go on a rant. You got to learn guitar, <laughs> yeah. then you got to get <laughs> audio equipment to record, pre record a rant. <laughs> then you got to experience the world driving around and meeting old bitches who drive in the left <laughs> lane or some shit. I don't know, man. Uh, no. <laughs> Who's this talking? It's Mikey, Amanda. Or A train. Oh, what's up, Mikey? Hey, um, there's nothing that chaps your ass or grinds your ears. <laughs> I got some stuff that chaps my ass. You want to hear it? I see your tweet. I see yeah, your tweet. Yeah, go for it. He's stepping into the red corner. Go. This is what chaps my ass. The fucking vampires out there that they don't fucking care about people who uh who can't who care. Okay, all they do is they want to suck your energy dry. Why? For some personal gain. Uh, as if we're all, like, we all know we're going to fucking die. This is the shortest time we have just to be alive and maybe love each other and take care of something. But no one cares about that. They're really to, to fucking triple down on fucking just getting ahead of someone. Why? So they can die in a nicer house? Go fuck yourself, you know? Try living in your car on the side of the road, eating Thanksgiving dinner out of a bag of Lay's, you know? <laughs> oh, anyway, that's... Right. Sounds well like done, well done. Like somebody... <laughs> Sounds like somebody's coffee got switched with ayahuasca this morning. <laughs> <laughs> Folgers ayahuasca. And also... Also, uh, I don't... I mean, not... I don't... You can't really prove that we're all going to die. Uh, I have a game uh, lined up. If I know, I know Doug's uh, familiar with this game. Let's do it. If you guys are interested in playing a quick phone game, I am. I'm way uh, into games. Okay, well, Doug, you know this game from uh, just from real life. Real life. Uh, it's, wow. it's, a, it's a game called High Low. <clears throat> high Low. Yeah, yeah. Do you want to play some High Low? I don't think I really know this game that much. Can you tell us how it goes real quick? You know it from, from uh, when we would play games at your house. It's when we call pizza places and we all bet oh, on whether the right. person who the answers voice. the phone. Higher low voice. Oh. Well, yes, of course. <laughs> <laughs> this is an amazing game. <laughs> Very good game. So I picked up. 
I picked uh, actually the we used to call when we would play it off the clock was uh, we would call dominoes, but every single dominoes has like a, a super long out, like outgoing recorded <laughs> message now because of COVID. So I have uh, explain. I'll, I'll give you guys. This Can you is explain all the, the game to the listeners and viewers real quick? Yeah. So the game. I mean, I, I think I just did. It's really. It's just we're going to call pizza places. And before we call, we're all going to place bets on whether or not whether the person who answers the phone will have a high voice or a low voice. And if it's a man who answers the phone, it's not automatically low. Some guys have high voices, and the same goes for ladies. So we're all going to have and to who's, agree. Who's going to be the judge on whether the voice is high or low? Because we need a third and impartial I mean, I, judge. I think by committee or if somebody wants to sit it out, I think JP is probably the best uh, – I'll judge it. I would put okay, my trust JP in JP. Will judge. All right. Thanks, Brendan. Okay, so who's who all's playing? Uh, me, Vic, and Mikey, and maybe Matt. Okay, and if, if Vic and, comes and back, A Train will play as well. Play. play. I'll pinch hit and, for Vic. Uh, I guess that Aaron back. can have a vote too. We don't want it to take back. too long. Okay, and here's all the information you need. This is not a chain. I'm just I'm calling pizza places in Indianapolis. Okay. okay well, so for right now we'll take the. High or low, and then you make the call. Right. Okay. So let's start the betting with. Uh, well, we'll start with A Train since you're right here and there's no delay. Do we get I'm the name of low. the pizza parlor? Okay. Yeah, I think that needs. We need that. Did we just lose them? Oh, sh- Shit! Is that what that was, Luke? Oh, what no. happened? Oh wait, no. Were you still? What the hell? <laughs> I was r- getting right oh, to it. Oh man. <laughs> All right, let me try calling them back. Okay, well, we can fill some time here. Uh... <laughs> oh, God. What's that, Luke? Is that you? Could play high and low with them. Who will answer, Amanda or Brendan? <laughs> right. No, we can have a moment of silence on the show, too. That's fine as well. I just got a text from T-Mobile. I'm going to read some of these comments here. Yeah, let's hear from some people. I like those puns. Yeah, we can think of some more Thanksgiving puns, I guess. Yeah, uh, who's got any of you uh, hand raisers have some puns for us? Shaquan? All right, Shaquan, what do you got? Hey, guys, how's it going? Pretty What's good. Up? Can you guys hear me? Yeah, Loud we and can clear. Hear you. you sound very professional. Compared okay, to good. those A-train crabbers. <laughs> nice, nice live drop. Nice. I'm a big fan of you guys, uh, individual. Um, I, I think I have a pun. It's like a short story, though. Um, do you mind if I tell it? How short? Sweet. Uh, it's like maybe 15 seconds. Oh, perfect. Yeah, tell it, please. Yeah. Okay, so there was this uh, this turkey. He was having an identity, identity crisis, and he changed, you know, to a the duck at one point and he kept clucking oh, I'm sorry he kept uh, what do ducks do? Quack they kept quacking uh, and then his boss at work was like you suck you, you shouldn't do that you're a turkey so then he changed to a chicken uh, and then his boss was like you're clucking That's you're, you're a turkey get out of here so I have a question for you guys why did the chicken's boss explode <laughs> Why? Why did, to get him from squawk and jive. He was a turkey. <laughs> okay. That, that's all I got. He's a jive squawk and turkey. <laughs> yeah. Well, usually it's like he gets, you know, he gets to the other side, but this time he was just squawk and jive. All right. <laughs> Love it. That's it. Well Thank done. you guys. Well Thanks, man. Happy Thanksgiving. Thanks a lot. Happy Thanksgiving. You too. All right. Um, are they back, Matt? No, we're trying to work it out. So yeah, sorry about that. that. <clears throat> uh, you, let's talk to another <laughs> hotheader, though. Yeah, that's right. Telephone tough guy. Uh, someone has a bone to pick Piggy. with Come me. On, Take it easy. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Bo, 805. Hey, Tom. Go oh, fuck yourself. 805. What the fuck are you oh, what's somebody? going on? 805, Go you're on the air. Okay. What? Hello? Hello? Did 805, you you're on the line. What? 
Yeah, this is Bo. Uh, I've got a bone to pick with producer Matt. Uh oh. All right, let me have it. Uh, you seem cranky. Like all the time, you seem kind of cranky. <laughs> <laughs> you try working with these guys. See how you feel. It's like herding cats. Well, you you know you come at you come at Vic all hard all the time. It's like all the time. All That's not Vic. true. We all love the Joel Hole. I'm a number one Joel Hole. Who do you fan. think makes Who do you think okay. makes the Joel Hole happen? Who do you think found the editor? Who do you think talks to the editor? Who do you think Mr. pays the editor? Burger. Me. Burger. That's true. He, he burger. He writes <laughs> it. And he's, yes, it's like all Vic, but who do you think facilitates everything you like on the show, Bo? Oh, look, I do. Look, I'm the I'm one who you, knocks. When you come to Vic with like, oh, it looks like Vic had too much coffee. That hurts. That hurts his feelings probably. You know? <laughs> too true. much coffee. Well, he was coming in hot today. We, he, when Tim's not here, I got to keep the boys in line. See, and I would consider that you coming in hot, producer Matt. Well, <laughs> I kind of like this caller. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, yeah. all I have to say is any, any day you want, uh, come, come who, trade it? places with me and see how uh, long you last without being cranky. That's all, all I'll right. say. Let's trade jobs. <laughs> What's Let's your job, Bo? What is that uh, sound? Assistant winemaker. <laughs> assistant winemaker. That sounds pretty fun, actually. It sounds pretty low level. It sounds like not much responsibility. <laughs> See, look how look, wow. look at the difference right there. Vic is all sweet. Mm-hmm. Sounds nice, you know. See that? I'm not a nice guy. Then, it's true. <laughs> yeah, I, I guess not. That's yeah, that's all I wanted to say. Vic, love you. All right, right well, I'm gonna put the boss on the line because <laughs> I appreciate Tim, it, buddy. Tim's here. And you can register your complaint straight to the so top. Yeah, I had Matt and my dad coming out. You know who today. I got a bone to pick with? Archaeologists. <laughs> Who's that? Tim and Eric, are you there? <laughs> hey. Hey, he guys. Liked, he liked my joke. Oh, that was wow. Good. Wow, look at this. Hey, guys. That was a good joke. Tom, can we pull up the... Uh, there you go. Is that a, is that a real se- Is that a real city behind you guys? <laughs> <laughs> what city are you in? Well, we're in Los Angeles. We're uh, we're filming G two today. Uh, that's why we can't be in there live. But yeah, let's take a, let's take a tour yeah. of the set. So yeah, we're filming G two. This is Godfather. I mean, uh, Goodfellas two. <laughs> Goodfellas two. Martin Scorsese directing. We got luckily both cast on the new film, which was very exciting for us. Big yeah, thing. we are. Um, just a couple of ge- good fellas. Yeah. <laughs> more from like the, the this G2 is more about the uh, Philadelphia mob. And it's set in 1993. <laughs> so this is the back lot here. And one cool thing is Mark, uh, Martin Scorsese is the director. Yeah. Um, he hasn't been on set yet, but uh, we're very excited to meet him and work out some scenes. And we're, we have a dialogue dialect coach too for- i don't i don't mean to interrupt you tim but i heard you call him martin i know like his close friends call him marty is that a well it's true yeah we do we call him marty we oh, okay so marty Mart, marty was sort of very involved early on when we were rehearsing and getting yeah. meetings we we're in a lot of zoom meetings with him mm-hmm. but now we're five days into shooting and he has it's basically been the ad's the uh, assistant director yeah. handling a lot of the day-to-day sure. stuff they they, keep, they call this as like the B unit, you know, like second unit. Second unit. Yeah. So we haven't really seen much action. But well, let's take a look at the set because this is this is downtown Philly for G two. G two. South <laughs> South Street Italian market, that kind of vibe. This is Eric's trailer here. Uh, it's very nice. Oh. What kind of stuff could we ex- could we expect on G two that we didn't get in G one? Uh, you're gonna n- notch it up. The violence. No spoilers, and the, but there's yeah. a big, good, big Italian cooking scene with Eric where he makes lasagna and yeah. everything. I do like my Sunday sauce, um, <laughs> which I've done other things. I've done in a Tim and Eric show as well, but um, I try to squeeze that in. They said it's okay. We heard Martin it's like yeah, G- Gabe. Go for it, Gabe, who's sort of the, been our day to day director, passed along the message that Marty's been thrilled with everything that we we've been doing. <laughs> And uh, there's been a, I was involved, we were involved in a lovemaking scene that went pretty well. Who, with who? Yeah. It was a, um, you too? A uh, menage a trois yeah. scene. Oh, who was the third? <clears throat> the guys, one girl thing. Yeah. Are you guys, what's Part your, the- are you guys strapper number one and strapper number two? 
it was like two guys in a gumar so yeah. you can, <laughs> we don't want to like go too deep we're not supposed we signed an nda we're not supposed to talk about the plot but it's been a lot we yesterday we shot for almost all day eric cooking yeah pretty much real time and Just then i was sauce. off camera a lot of the time i was off camera but um yeah, but, pretty, yeah, go ahead. I was just to say we're trying to keep um, morale, you know, like up. It's not. We were like, our call time was 6 a.m. this morning, and we have yet to see any of the, of the crew. Seems like it's a fucking ghost town down there in Philadelphia these days. <laughs> well, it's a, yeah, there's a lot to shoot still. And I think they're yeah. on another. I think they're actually out on location today. Most of the people. Yeah, we do. Uh, we do ask questions to our, you know, the, the second AD and. Like, when can we see some action? Like, and they're just like, we'll let you know. So we've been hanging by the trailer and doing a lot of these kind of videos for YouTube, just kind of showing off Philadelphia <laughs> and what mob life was really like back then. I want to, my, this is again, five, six days in, I want to get one of the, like a gun or a, a weapon or something yeah. to play around with. And a costume, because they haven't given me a costume yet. Yeah, they've been shooting us in this kind of stuff. And I'm like, that's not really... How's that gonna play? Yeah. You know? How's that gonna play? I yeah. haven't been through makeup. Yeah. I haven't been through wardrobe or hair yeah. or anything like that. So it's just and been a little confusing. We shoot with these on. They yeah. say they're gonna do something digital with smiles. <laughs> they said, don't worry about the Italian accent, just do do your thing. So. Yeah. yeah. I haven't signed any paperwork. SAG isn't even called or whatever. <laughs> Anyways, but it's definitely it ha- it's definitely happening, right? Are you sure? <laughs> it's definitely a it's definitely going. Yeah, it's a it's a greenlit project. We we we're here. We're here early. Um, we did, did yeah the sauce. We did the th- the threesome. I mean, please don't. You know who's been cool? Now, now who shot cool the threesome? Mark, Scors- Mark Scorsese has been very. He's intimate. been awesome. He's been yeah. very helpful. Who's Mark that? Scorsese is Martin's son. Who's 16, I think, oh. 16, 17. And he's been a lot of fun to play around with and goof around with. He's yeah. shot a lot of stuff on his iPhone of us cooking and oh, that's yeah. cool. the menage a trois scene yeah. with, all, with all Marty. Uh-huh. With all Mark. Mark. Mark, yeah. Marky. Yeah, we were wondering where the where where's the film cameras? We know, you know, Marty shoots on 35, you know. Um well, I mean, uh, like iPhones look pretty iPhone. good, though. They can, there's like, yeah, there's like there's like things they can do on the computer and make it look nice. You know, make it look like. Yeah, they you're gonna add film yeah. grain, yeah. film grain, and kind of that the shutter the shutter motion, so it right. does look kind of timey and Philadelphia and all that stuff. So, have you met any other know? actors besides uh, Mark? Well, they say that Robert De Niro and uh, Joe Pesci and everybody's in the yeah. movie from the Ray original. Leona's going to be there. Like... Yeah. Lauren Bracco. Yeah. Uh, Leota? Ray Leota is, yeah, but. Hold on. I'm getting a call from Mark Scorsese. Hold on. Hey, Mark. <laughs> yeah. Oh, are you available this weekend as well? Oh, yeah. Thursday. That's Thanksgiving. Yeah, we're yeah, not Thanksgiving. Oh, he's, he's saying we have to reshoot the Monaco Trois. Like, really? <laughs> what the heck, Mark? We already shot the Kumar stuff. Like, that was cool. On Thanksgiving, we're doing that? Thanksgiving, 5 p.m. That, that's, Where? When, that's when most families are doing turkey. Now we got to do Kumar. Here? Back here. Call time. What's call time? 5 a.m. Okay, we'll see you then, Mark. It's that's it's uh-huh. just part of it's just an insight to the Hollywood process. You have to really yeah, both it- dedicate yourself to the art. Is Marty going to be there? Or is it just going to be Mark again? Mark said he just has to do a reshoot something with like he had it on. It's the wrong setting on the phone. Now, is this the beginning of more G's or is it going to end at G2? Do you know? That's not a legitimate question. <laughs> That's ancient wisdom shit. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's take these... a trip around the corner here and see yeah. some of the. I mean, there is a, the, the second unit starting to amass okay. and get the. Get yeah. the, I guess people are finally showing up now. It's almost yeah. noon. It's an exciting part of the day. Everyone's kind of getting warmed up, stretching, getting the cameras out. Mm-hmm. Oh, only a couple people here. These so two guys. These guys might know it. Well, let's show them this. This is where we've been shooting a lot of. This is where we shot the Menager Trois. Yeah, can we right check down? that out? Oh. The uh, it's 
the menage a trois scene in, in houses in Philly are their townhouses. You can so, see how tight these are. Yeah. And we said, in, in, I don't know if you can see inside, but it's not dressed or painted yet. And Mark said, don't worry about it. We're going to handle that in post. <laughs> um, it's going to look like a cool, like, Italian American house. And One interesting, like, I never knew this because I haven't really shot. I'm going to be, this is where at the Paramount lot. And they're so strict now because of COVID that they don't want, they can't, they don't just give anybody a pass to come on the set. So what Mark's been doing is picking us up in the pass band. And we go in the back of the pass van and hide under the covers. And yeah. Come in that way. <laughs> they use they, they use what's called like a ferny pad. And Mark says, Get, dive under the ferny pad. And we're like, okay. He, he's just at efficiency sake, so we don't have to download the codes and all that stuff. Yeah. So we yeah. get under I mean, you think Marty would be able to pull some strings, but I mean, that's probably easier. He doesn't have to bother his dad. He's busy. And, yeah. you know, we're, we feel like he's going to pipe in soon on giving us notes and everything. But who shot the menage? Mark. Mark, and by just well, he, just just by himself. Yeah, he shot it on the new cinema mode, but for some reason, when he when he downloaded it, it was the focus was fully off, oh, so oh, he oh. couldn't he couldn't was, get it in. You know, it's weird about a little something. I don't know what I don't know when Mark when Marty had Mark, but he seems like he's gonna be the same age as Marty. Yeah, <laughs> so he <laughs> seems kind of old. Is it silver? Old. Uh -huh. Silver hair. Silver hair. The, how about the eyebrows? Like, does he have those famous? Doesn't look like Martin. No, no he doesn't look like Martin oh. Scorsese at all. Oh. Have you asked yeah. for any no. uh, proof of ID, ID for this guy? I mean, how did you even learn that you got booked on G two? We got a call from Mark and uh, Mark Scorsese, so we're like. That was the uh, funny part. Yeah. Eric says Martin Scorsese called. Martin Scorsese called. We're gonna be in G two. I was like M. I was like M. Scorsese Mark, he goes, Mark, Mark, Mark Scorsese called, and he had the mask on. So I yeah. think you said Mark Scorsese originally. I did. I guess that's what he said. Wait. So during the 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 sex scene, where you um, it was simulated. Oh. It was not at that. Not at that point. No. It was, not at that point. Uh, it was for uh, in the script. It was written as a simulated in the yeah. But this uh, in, on the day. We got out of it. Things kind of, we got into it. Yeah. You know? And the thing about Scorsese is he's known to doing 20, 30 takes of a scene. Of, that's Martin Scorsese. But Mark Scorsese, he'll do up to 60 takes of the menage. Mm -hmm. um, it, it, got, it got raw. Did you finish, T? No, we're still shooting. No, I mean, did you finish? You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, I know what you mean. Yeah, we finished. Was T was T <laughs> was T receiving or T giving? Thanksgiving. <laughs> T giving. Nice one, Mikey. It was, it was all it was everything, it was, you know. Yeah, it went, it oh, went okay. All the all different ways. I don't know if you. Yeah, it's it was a lot. It was a lot. It was it was a, it was a hard day. And the worst part about it was now we're reshooting on Thanksgiving. Oh, yeah. great. Mark was like. Mark drops us off to back at our cars, which is in Reseda for some reason. That's where a base camp is. Um, so we got under the, after shooting many takes of the Menage, we have to get under the Fernies and a long, bumpy ride back to Reseda. <laughs> oh, boy. Yeah. Um, in that holiday this, traffic. This, just thinking about those takes, the, the in and out, and yeah. just the positions. Was, it was rough, but that's like an actor's life. And that's why we. One of the most embarrassing, it's really one of the most embarrassing moments of my life was being with you in the back under the fernies and being so close and yeah. just being so intimate all day. Yeah. It was being, just like hot breath, like, and, and also the holes. These were all over every, everything. Did Mark he at least hook you up with some craft service or lunch or anything? Yeah, there's, we, we were actually poaching off of the, how I met your father set. We were yeah. shooting on set here. There's a spin off the hot. Oh, you were able to graze off of theirs. Yeah. yeah there's, there's and they're sponsored by you who strawberry. So. We were filled up with that. Milk. I was, yeah, I was, and hey, next time they serve you strawberry, how about put it on ice? Because whatever we got was not. Yeah. So he on has some ice. lukewarm yoohoo for lunch after all that. Yeah, and why don't you why don't you give us a lactate here there because we're gonna be on the for about two hours. <laughs> One of us has some. Uh, and, uh, and, uh, and, uh, but I got a, I got a kind bar after a few hours. Mark scored me a kind bar. Mm -hmm. So I would go for a kind bar. <laughs> anyway, and we no, should get probably get back because we're 
looks like yeah, it looks maybe like things going, are, going are happening. Yeah, there's a lot of activity now. Yeah, it looks like yeah. there's uh yeah, there's a lot of hustle and bustle there on the Hollywood set. So Yeah. Yeah. Well, congrats. How's the marathon going? Congrats, guys. Uh, <laughs> How's the marathon going? Oh, Everybody man, how are our numbers looking? Our numbers are going up, Tim, so it's kind of a, it's a success. It's hard, it's hard yeah, hard so to far. track. I mean, I don't know how close fast. we are to our goal. <laughs> are we going we gonna to make well, it? I'm going to be able to stop by, it looks like, later in the day. So once, we, once oh, Mark we says, gives us the okay to wrap. <clears throat> back to, then yeah. you got to head back to Great. base camp, and then you should be, all right, well. Looks more like Chernobyl than fucking Philly. The way no one's, All right, fuck no you, Mike. Whoa. You don't have an attitude about shit. Whoa. You're in my house. Even though I might not be there, you're in my house. I'm going to come there and my... smash your head into the wall. I love being here without you. <laughs> Let me see this shot. Hey, it's a pretty cool... You guys should see the shot, Eric. What's the shot? That's a good shot. I would love to know who's filming. Is that Mark? <laughs> oh hi mark oh hi mark yeah. <laughs> oh hi mark hi thanks thanks for having us great to see you guys well, thanks, for, guys. thanks for checking in on the film. thanks for checking in Tay. great to look, take a look behind the curtain wow. of thanks Cappy. magic some hollywood magic here yeah on office hours marathon nine to five we're Sounds at like uh, a rough I mean, day we're at 58 cool 52 right now yeah. not bad yeah. What are we at? You were asking about the numbers. Oh, what are we at? 5852. 5852. That's, wow. Oh. Thank you, guys. That's wonderful. Um, that's, that's, that's almost 30. I mean, that's we like... gained almost 30. I think, yeah, like 148 more, right? And then you uh, need to space it out a little more, Matt, I think, when you post them. Sort of. <laughs> sort of 30. What's your goal? All right. 6,000. 6, Today? It's looking grim. So we started what? We're only 148 off. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's yeah. You guys yeah. are right there. Yeah, yeah, it's You're, right there. Yeah, you could right. get an afternoon pickup. Oh yeah. Yeah. People oh. are talking. <laughs> many, many it's online are chatter. Talking. Yeah. Ready to you go guys, yeah. yeah, you guys ready? Do you want? We're, we're out of here. Okay. Thanks right. for stopping by. Oh, it's been. Where a you pleasure. gotta eat, man? Good to see you guys. Uh, we're gonna have that conversation <laughs> yeah. privately. Oh, outside. that would have been cool to know. You know. Yeah. Oh yeah. Then people watching live would could have. Oh yeah, you know, oh, head yeah. to Atwater and look we don't for Mikey need that. and JP. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You'll be mobbed. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna vo- I'm gonna put in my vote for Viet Noodle. Oh, it's that's great. A different flavor. You know that's it's, my it's favorite. Consistent. That's my favorite spot. It's the best. I haven't been in a long time. Atwater. Um, do you guys want to do? We should order the compound from there today. Yeah. Watch along and let Maylee get set up because Maylee needs. Yeah, a let's do it. Right Absolutely. Here. Is she here? She is. We could yeah, take a quick. Well, let's wait. A, let's wait and let her put on a little music or something. Oh yeah, is there any kind of break? Um, We've gone three hours. I know. Well, Please, Mikey. do you want to watch? We could do a compound. Oh, thanks. We could do yeah. a compound uh, marathon of both, and then come chat Thank about it. JP. Thanks for stopping by. Uh, yeah, so let's watch the compound episode one and two. This is a show that is for Patreon subscribers only. Right. Except right now, I guess. Right now, but I mean, kind of there's more it. episodes available behind the yeah. Patreon wall. Um, and this is basically, I guess you'll, you'll figure it out. But after the show is done, this this is kind of like what when this show takes place. Right. Is when the podcast is finished. When we say bye bye. Or before the show, this is sort right. of a behind this the is scenes. What you're not seeing. It's a behind during... the scenes kind of show. Right. And, so. Uh, uh, enjoy all right everybody that's our show today thank you so much for joining us all our wonderful guests all our great zoomers uh we're going to take a few minutes here and then we'll be back with after hours all right great show everybody great show yeah so funny great show great show tim and the numbers are up what about you you got nothing to say yeah great show (laughs) haha very funny Oh, it's so funny. How come you're sitting there the whole show with a fucking attitude? My feet are freezing in here. Fuck you just say? I'm gonna go pick up lunch. How come Matt and Vic get to wear shoes and I gotta take mine off? Oh, because Matt and Vic have respect for this place. When they come through this door, I know that they come from a home where their floors are kept clean. Not like you when you're out all night on the skate parks and some dive bar hanging out with some coos sleeping on her fucking futon. You don't know shit about my shoes. They're fucking clean, T. 
You done? What if I wear brand new shoes? The shoes, stay off! You know what? I'm out of here. No, so, what about after hours? Do it without me. This fucking thing. Stupid foot fuck! He's dead. Oh my god. Should we call 911? Oh no. No cops. I don't want them tipping off the building inspector. This, uh, this garage here ain't exactly up the code. Well, I've got plenty of drops. We could handle the show, just you and me. Easily. So, you think I could get a cut of his profits, then? Well, producer Matt's not gonna be getting any of it, huh? <laughs> <laughs> you sure he's dead? Tell you what, why don't you go down there and give him a little pump on the chest, just to be sure. That's the least we could do. What happened? Uh, you dozed off. Something's different. It happens. Uh, hey guys, we gotta get going on after hours. You want the sandwiches now or later? Yeah, I'll take mine now. Yeah, now. All right, I got a mortadella, extra pickles for you, Tim. Got a horseradish ham for you, Vic. And I got a veggie for you, Doug. And whatever's left for me. Wolf, Marone, this New Jersey Michaels is the best. You gotta think about the juices, T. What part of the horse does a radish come from anyway? Probably his balls. <laughs> <laughs> hey, welcome to After Hours, everybody. Sorry we're, uh, we're eating, I know that's a little rude, but we are starving. And, uh, ah, you don't care, right? You don't care. You guys can eat. If you guys are hungry, you guys can eat. Anyways, uh, let's take a zoomer. Oh, there he is. Hey, Skip, got your uh, classic rock TV for you there. <laughs> all right. It's got everything I asked for on here, the stones, the birds, the doobies. Yeah, it's all there. It's up till 4 a.m. Uh, making sure it's all right. Oh, boo-hoo. Like, you're the only one that works hard around here. Hey, I got my own sleep deficits. All right. Sit down. Oh, where the fuck is Doug? The show's starting any minute. Morning, guys. There he is, Rip Van Winkle. I'm one minute late. The fuck you say to me? Sorry, T. Won't happen again. What the fuck are those? These are brand new slippers, so my feet don't get cold. Oh, I got a way to keep your feet warm. Ah! 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 My fucking feet are burning! Ah! Ah! You, me, outside. Look, I need you to take your shoes off in the studio, all right? Why? So Vic thinks I favor him, so he keeps making those classic rock DVDs I need so badly. But I could burn those for you, too. You want to be up till 4 a.m. working on that? No, I need you sharp, bright-eyed, and bushy for those drops. Besides, Vic knows classic rock. If it was you, you'd be sending me that Aphex Slim techno bullshit. All right, T. I'll keep my shoes off. Come here. You're still my number one guy, all right? Guys, we're going live in five minutes, okay? Uh, T, can I get a quick word with you? <sighs> Come on. Where is it? Hey, T, uh, you think Vic could do some editing for me also? I wouldn't mind a DVD of my favorite post-punk videos, you know? You fucking crazy? No. Maybe Doug? No. Well, what if I were to, uh, show him this video? What do you think they're talking about? Well, I hope it's not about me. Just keep your head down, keep doing your job. Good plan. All right, yeah. Maybe uh, Vic can spare a few minutes, put together a little post-punk DVD compilation. What do you like, a little gang of four, some para-ubus? 
U.S. Maple. I'll send you a playlist. You rat fuck. All right, you guys ready? Yep. Yep. We're live in five, four. Vic, you're gonna make me a DVD. Back on here, guys. Here's are we back? We're Man. back. Scorsese well, has nothing on that. Who thinks that should be? My dream is that that's sh- that become. We pitched that as a show. It's on HBO. Put on HBO. I mean, it's on Adult Swim. It's on HBO. And then and that's only three minutes then, an episode. Imagine and then, like, like years from hour. now, yeah. I think we've made this joke before, but <clears> I'm just gonna repeat it. Yeah. Years from now, they'll be like, "Did you know that 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 show, The Compound, that used to be a." A podcast? Right. You can that go podcast, back and listen yeah. to it. There was a podcast called Office Hours, and that's where it <laughs> Yeah, began. it came from this it, thing yeah. called Office Hours. <laughs> that was, uh, I mean, be like uh, Mork you, and Mindy, right? Didn't that come from... Oh, yeah, uh, from uh, Happy Days. Happy Days? Yeah, a little spinoff. Well, there. that's from another show. <laughs> and uh, Young Sheldon, you know, came from Sheldon, or from... Right. Laverne well, and Shirley. A lot of things spun off of, of Happy Days. Happy Joni Days. Loves Chachi, Laverne and Shirley. You wouldn't have jumped the shark, that phrase, without... Fonzie, Fonzie literally jumping, jumping a shark. shark. Yeah, so important show. Yeah, and what's his name? Ron? Do you say Ron Howard already? So when, send a yeah. letter to your t- TV executive. <laughs> right. To your senator. Say, to your local TV executive just, and tell them you want Compound right. to be. Just, we need the Compound. Just That's all you got to say and yeah. sign your name to it. But before you do that, sign up for the Patreon. Yeah, do that. To and see then, episode three. Right, episode three <laughs> is out. And... It's a dark one. If we hit six, I guarantee we'll be making we'll be, more pounds. Oh, yeah. More compounds. A lot more. A lot more compounds. A lot more uh, holes. Can we talk to anyone? Yeah, yeah let's let's anybody, check Or is Maylee ready Becca. to perform? Well, I'm ready. Oh, you are? <laughs> yeah. Really? Let's, let's take... I want to see, one, I wanna see one, what's going on here. Yeah, let's this. check in with oh. Becca real quick, yeah. and then we'll... What's, what is, He's uh, back at work. He's I wanna, like, I like live streaming angle. his work day here. <laughs> Who is that? That's um. We were talking to him before. Or what's his name? Oh, is he not muted? Can't... Oh, Becca, uh, are you there? My eyes are so bad. Shaquan, yeah, I think I'm here. That shirt. Is that Shaquan? Hey, oh, there he is. See? <laughs> He's like, to <laughs> well, I don't think the, the viewers can see what we're seeing. I guess they can. Oh, we, yeah, oh, we can see. We're, uh, how Becca, are, what are you doing? Up going? This? Yeah, what are you? What are you loading up? Well, you want to talk to Shaquan more? Oh, he can't. He's oh, I, He's sorry. Nervous. I just talked to whoever's like in hey, front of me. So hey, hey, sorry, I'm here. Oh, yeah. Where are you at? What are you loading up there, buddy? Uh, I'm at work. I work in a scenic apartment, so I'm just loading up a kit for a location here. Oh, okay. Um, You're in the business. I see a guitar back there, too. Oh, yeah. My coworker Chris here, he's an electric guy. He was playing. He's, he was in a band. He was playing guitar before because ah. I brought it just for fun because, you know, we have a shorter week. Stay limber. Are you working on G2? Stay limber. <laughs> I'm on, yeah, I'm on G2. I'm in the paint department. <laughs> <laughs> they got me working on the moles, so, nice. you know. <laughs> Cool. Well, awesome. Uh, we're, yeah, yeah. We're, yeah th- uh, we'll we'll check in again if you got your uh, camera going there. I want to see where that uh, that's headed. All right. Yeah. First cin- cinematic sure. shot. You. So makes yeah. sense. Yeah. Thank you so much. All right. Take care, buddy. Okay. See you. Take it away, Matt. Me? What oh, I don't know. Doing? Oh, who are we? Uh, take it away. I thought Matt. you had somebody lined up besides Shaquan. Sorry. Uh, Becca, are There's you me. on? <laughs> yeah. There we go. <laughs> yeah. Here we go. Hi, Becca. Hi. Where are you calling? Zooming from. Savannah, Georgia. A lot of Georgians uh, today. Right? You know, I hear a lot. I know. Of, I hear a lot weird, of great things it? about Savannah, Georgia. That's like secret. The it's under, really fun. Honestly, uh, I moved on. It's hot. Why are you wearing that I'm fuzzy in... ass shirt? <laughs> because it's cold here. Actually, it's like fifty degrees today, which is cold now. <laughs> yeah, hey, oh. when it gets into fifties in LA, it's a nightmare. It's, uh, <laughs> it's freezing. I don't like it. I moved down here from washington state because i just never tolerated the cold well um so i moved like to the hottest place i could think of oh, man. <laughs> yeah i thought i was gonna miss like the the cold and the, the the snow and all that but like not at all it's like not at all you don't need it you know people can you can leave all that behind 
you can go visit where they like we're going up to see my family for christmas and it's like oh it'll be fun to have snow but right i want to come back where it's warm the the last time i went home for christmas i was like oh it's gonna be snowy and everything it was just rain the entire time and like gross warm weather like not what you want to see so i haven't been back since what do you do Mm -hmm, in savannah mm -hmm. if we may ask um actually right now i'm working from home i normally work that's the reason i can talk to you guys i normally work offshore but um i finished up my rotations for this year and international waters what do you mean offshore (laughs) i work um i'm a marine geologist oh wow mostly yeah mostly wind farm surveys actually so i've been doing a lot of work on the east coast and i'm working from home now just processing some data from um a job that's going on now how is the wind going to fill out a survey yeah what's going on there (laughs) no (laughs) a wind farm survey like like the seabed oh okay oh yeah we know we're 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 joking around over here (laughs) sorry my audio like cut so i missed the joke but um i actually i have a thanksgiving pun um for you guys if you're interested all right of course we are So I don't know about you guys, but like sometimes I get so overwhelmed for things, you know, there's so much to do. You have to start prepping, going to the grocery store, everything weeks in advance. There's organizing with the family and all that stuff. And sometimes it just gets to this time of year. And I just think, you know what? I can, I cranberry do it. (laughs) <laughs> i like it there you know is. i was i was thinking yeah. about a uh cranberry pun and she nailed it that's amazing well done <laughs> well done it, it was like the one pun that i came up with what's that autograph Thank behind you. you you have a you have a signed plaque behind you if i could ask is that a autograph that's actually no that's well kind of it's my um you... husband's dad oh. i don't know if you'll be able to tell it was like some weird jujitsu he was a green beret and it was Whoa. like some weird jujitsu training thing that he did and like that's um, cool. t- was it thailand or something like okay. that yeah so yeah wow. is he a tough guy he was, he was a fighter oh this is such a downer um <laughs> oh no he died actually i'm sorry i'm sorry was it no, during no, a fight no, no, no. or was it, oh, okay. just don't no, ask questions. I know why I, I shouldn't ask any questions that's don't what ask I, questions. I just like it's either a screeching no, it's halt fine. or i bring up death <laughs> that's been a fair amount ago. of death it's actually a lot a training of this mission. Uh-huh. Oh. I can I can salvage this though something kind of interesting so he died during a training mission oh, man. and um, there were multiple other Green Beret casualties around the same time and it was actually happening around the time of Waco oh. and so there, it started this whole big conspiracy theory that the Green Berets were actually like deployed to Waco Oh no, man! You remember Which that? Doug, is like kind David of an Koresh? interesting. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh huh. But yeah, is I just think uh. like I had no clue about it until I met my husband and then heard about you know his dad and stuff. But yeah, it started this whole. I mean, this was before like forums and stuff. But I can only imagine how you know it, right. it's that looking at the roots of all this right wing bullshit. You oh, know, <laughs> like God. how big that could have gotten. Right. Wake up. All right, uh, take yeah, it away, Bailey. Little... So uh, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> so, just dive right know. in. Can we? Yeah, well, no, we have kidding. a guest. Uh, we have a, we have a musical kidding. guest here. Yeah, this will this will cheer just you up kidding. after after my questioning. Um, and you're gonna you're gonna enjoy this. Uh, Rebecca, peace and, uh, and love to you. Yes, Thank have you for a the call. happy Thanksgiving. Thank you guys. Take great care. puns. Yes, you do. Yeah, great, great puns. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> we have a musical guest here. And you're from, you hail from Canada. That's originally. right, Toronto, Canada. We have Maylee yes. Todd in the studio. Thanks, y'all. And you Thanks have a for really cool, we, you have a really cool, um, is that made by Yamaha? Yes. Um, what's the, the inventor's name? Oh, and we're talking Toshi. to your avatar right now. That's oh, right. Yes. Lou. Look at this. Wow. La, la, yeah, we're talking la, to Lou, la, not Maylee. Oh, my bad. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I've got this uh, Tenorion sequencer um, made by Toshi. Uh, with Yamaha. So I got some tunes, some sci-fi tunes for you. You ready? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. It's, all, it's all good to go. I guess we're good to go. Do yeah. you right. need a line check? You're all right? You got your I sounds? I think we're good. I think we are good. Thank you. Take it away. Thank you. 
you. Thanks. That was awesome. Wow. wow. I got I got one more tune. Is that t- time oh, for t- one more tune? There's plenty of time for yeah, one yeah, more tune for yeah. sure. Sweet. Nice. <clears throat> That was wow. killer. I mean, Thanks. Thanks so much. Thanks for having me. That was incredible. So Yeah, I I could listen to that and yeah. see that like all the rest of the show. I mean Yeah. So you Shelby wanna, can you do yeah, you wanna, yeah. <laughs> What are you doing incredible. for the next five yeah. hours? <laughs> what do you got? What you got cool going just on? going? Uh, well, you know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How long have you been here so far? Since like nine twenty o'clock. hours. Like three, yeah, nine nine three and a half. Started, oh, just nine. getting started, you know. Nice. But uh yeah. Getting our goat and, yeah. Wow, just that was, that's really cool. amazing. So are you you based out here? Well, I moved here September 1st, so I have a visa for a year. Okay. Uh, So we're going to see how that goes. Hopefully I can extend it. um, And uh, yeah, but I'd I'd like to live out here. The weather alone is like already nailing it. Everybody in Toronto is probably getting really depressed at this point. Right, yeah. Yeah. (laughs) He's happy out here, though. What up? How did um, you get into AI and like where's... things. Yeah, where does that come from? Like or like... Yeah. I, I just I guess I've never seen anything live like this before. You know? Awesome. Well, I was hoping yeah. to get onto Alter Ego. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Did he say all those billboards? I was like, oh damn, oh, true. Yeah. <laughs> this is happening here and now. Right, How do I get right. my avatar on here? <laughs> um, I got uh, before the pandemic hit. I was working for a company called Occupy VR, and we're working on video games. So it was, my job was like character building, not like actually building them, but. Mm-hmm. Um, uh, just like their story and world building story, stuff like that. And then the pandemic hit and I really got into 3D modeling and then just kind of figured this stuff out via YouTube tutorials okay. and all. That's really fun. Yeah. Yeah. It's yeah. Great. Cool. And what, uh, 
Is there a, a story with Lou? Is there, <laughs> is there, you know, is there history there? Or what's, like, why did he choose Lou to look like this? Yeah. Right. Okay. So, actually, there's... Um, I've created a bunch of different avatars. The The album that will be out on Stone's Throw is going to be in March, and it's called Malou. Um, and Malou is like a AI learning machine, AI um, that um, is traveling around uh, the multiverse and is like landing on these different planets and meeting all these different species, but also struggles with like human mental health issues okay <laughs> earthling yeah, yeah, mental yeah, health sure. issues <laughs> um so that's sort of the idea malu was made by the children of ooh lou is like um i mean i just graced secrets out i just graced uh this pink um scaly thing lou <laughs> like the other day named it because i figured i should put a name to it yeah. but um yeah it was just like these are just like kind of tests that i'm like running to a degree to see how the motion tracking and stuff works mm-hmm. Um, but I thought Lou was just like a really fun, um, fun, fun character, fun looking character and, 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 and fun to kind of be in like digital drag, if you will, to a, to a degree. I'm, uh, Matt just put the image of me up there and I don't want to see myself when I'm (laughs) talking. Could we, could we get me an AI for the show? You know what? If I, if I knew (laughs) that Jim would appear, I would have sculpted him. Oh man. And then (laughs) one of you could have puppeted Uh him or you like play his go-to sayings. Does he have go-to sayings? I don't know. Like catchphrases? Yeah. My, yeah, my catchphrase is, hello everybody. <laughs> so we could do that, you know. Yeah, we could do that. We could 3D okay. model you. That'd and be then cool. Yeah. You would, like, yeah. you would uh-huh. then <laughs> right. control yourself uh-huh. and all your dreams could come true. Yeah. yeah. Matt, Matt, metaverse. Matt, can we go full AI on this? Yes, let's do sure. it. Show. Come on, Matt. <laughs> It's it's all if we hit 6,000, let's go. Anything let's do is it. Possible. <laughs> Can you make me look like Bosch? That's what I want. I don't know. <laughs> like yeah. the food? Like no, the tasty treater? No, the, 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 like uh, the dishwasher. Uh, the drill? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> no, Harry Bosch. Harry Bosch, right here, uh, from the show Bosch. Um, so that was, yeah, that was pretty fascinating. And then I want to know where, like, the, the music, like, where, where did you start from? Did you start on keyboard or did you have training in some instrument? Yeah, where did I mean, it all start? It's, where did it all start? And and the the song form doesn't seem like a traditional song form, right? It's it's kind of not. There's not like choruses, right? Like repeat choruses and or is kind there? Of. Is there? Is there? Okay, maybe <laughs> it's kind of catchy. Okay. Yeah, yeah, no, I know it's catchy, but it's no, it, uh, it just seems like a different song form. For sure. Yeah, yeah, it makes sense. What mm-hmm. you're saying, I, I did repeat a verse and a chorus oh, okay, over okay, and over okay. again, okay. but uh, yeah, it's hard to distinguish what one is the chorus mm-hmm. and which one is the verse. I'd say mu- music probably started uh, when I was very young. I didn't. I wasn't trained or anything. My dad was an Elvis impersonator. Whoa. So, wow. Yeah. Wow. So you <laughs> oh, see yeah. the does world Does he still do it? it? Yeah. Uh, he does it, and he does like some questionable impersonators too, but... <laughs> questionable. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, what is it like? He goes through the Rat Pack, you know, A through Z. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah. But, uh-huh. um, Sammy Davis. Little Sammy. Yeah. That's I don't know. I think maybe uh-huh. he'll leave that one out, but... Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> he'll, like Neil Diamond, he'll like wear like a backwards dress, like a sequence backwards dress he gets from Value Village. Do you have a Value Village here? It's I've probably heard heard of that I but feel i don't like know. there is is it a thrift store, store or yeah, is it a 99 store. Store. Oh, yeah we have Val- yeah really oh. well, i gotta get we have valley right. village close to <laughs> close to where i live there's this building i gotta get a picture of it there's a there's a um on the left on the side of the building i guess it's i don't know if it's two dollar stores or whatever but there's a 99 cent store on the left and then on the right is a 98 cent store like so it's 98 <laughs> and they're sharing the same Building is bizarre. Who's so. getting more traffic? Yeah, that's what I want to know. Probably the 98 cents. You got to go 98 yeah. first. And if they don't yeah. have what you need, you got yeah, to get that extra. Just go over grab like, your pennies. You, you got to you you yeah, you get what get you pay for. You know, now, so. do you have a favorite brand of um, maple syrup? <laughs> <laughs> You know, <laughs> that goes right for the uh, stereotypes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm this glad. is a question. You know it is a question for the agents. Somebody asked oh, in you the got, chat yeah. here, oh, really? and I okay. think it might okay. be an interesting um, question. Yeah. You know, um, how Canadian are you? That's yeah, the question. let's see. Do you skate? Okay. Do you ice skate? I I have. I've done that. Yes. Uh, <laughs> yes, I do drink out of bags of milk for sure. We collect <laughs> loonies and toonies and throw them in the queen for the jar for the queen, who we uh, still uh, we love and adore to this day. Uh, maple syrup. I mean, you go for the classic, the old Canadian maple syrup brand. 
See, the, I was gonna. I was hoping you'd say we just make it. You know, we just boil it out you back. Tap it. Yeah. I tap, tap my own. It. You tap it. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, we tap. Is that how you I, make maple? Well, well you yeah. Put, you put a yeah. little jam in there. Are you asking me how to? I mean, make it? I've seen it. <laughs> I've Canadian. seen it done before. No, you I've done tap it. it, and then they have to like boil it down. Yeah, they it's have to it's reduce fu- it. like um, like my wife's uh, family like goes up to Canada and. One of the people up there has Why? well for fun for no they just for forever they've gone there for vacation and oh, it's like cool. on a lake and stuff so oh, lovely. it's cool it's really cool uh, up in, near, near Ontario and um, but like the neighbor has taps in all these trees and then you know when it gets I guess whatever cool enough warm enough or whatever then you tap it and then you collect it all and then you get in this like sugar shack. And you're boiling it, and it just smells good. Wow, I and love that you drink that you whiskey do this. with it. Oh, <laughs> yeah, you drink uh, yeah. whiskey. Cl- that's you got the it. You got it. Yeah. You stay. You keep warm that I mean, way. I don't know yeah. many Canadians that visit the CN Tower or make their own meal, uh, maple syrup or uh, have their favorite brand uh-huh. of maple syrup. But I do think that this is like a cool yeah. vacation. Jam, yeah, for sure. Yeah, it's fun, yeah fun. you're getting into nature. Right, you're learning it's a little a, touristy. You learning know, a jam, whatever, but yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Why yeah, why not? When in when in Canada, why not? You know, so. Yeah. Do you want to do one more? I don't know. What do you want to do? <laughs> what, how do you want to do work? another one? Yeah. Just, <laughs> if you'd like do you, to. Do you like feel, Jamie I mean, will come in? What's that? And then Jamie can come in? Yeah. You want to, yeah. If you get, one you of you guys one more? Or do you only have two songs and that's it? <laughs> <laughs> that's, yeah. No pressure. No pressure. Uh, yeah, you don't have to. Yeah. You don't I mean, have to. You, don't, you know, if, yeah. what, whatever works, uh, I could. Uh, but I don't have to. So what is this? I mean, mean? Is this, uh, yeah. Do one well, more. Do yeah, an encore. Yeah, we'd, okay. we'd, we'd love you to. We'd love you. Yeah, yeah. If you that don't want to, the coolest do it, musical. Yeah, act I, yeah. I've seen. I'm getting in the zone. In my life. Life. <laughs> it like calm me. It calmed me down. Oh, did it? Lot. Okay. Like, yeah. Seriously, I have nice. Massive anxiety, but now I'm like calm. <laughs> oh, good. Okay. So it worked out. It worked out. See that mental health vibe. See, that's exactly right. What's going on? Need Xanax. Just have maybe just yeah. Right. Just sing at you with an avatar. Okay. <laughs> oh, sorry. One more question. Yeah, please. When you do live shows, do people see you or do they only see Lou? Yeah, they yep. the the last show I did. I mean, I just am testing this out. Um, so I think it's kind of cool that people see me because they see what's going on. But yeah. the last show, like right now, I'm doing everything. I'm doing face tracking through my my phone. So on stage, it's like a little tricky because it's darker, so it's harder for it to pick right. up the 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 um the the facial expressions mm-hmm. and uh and I also look like an insane narcissist <laughs> like holding my phone around <laughs> while I'm like singing tunes while people are staring right, at me there's like many right. layers to that so uh yeah I gotta figure out another yeah, situation. You like some kind of maybe you could put the ping pong balls on yeah <laughs> that'll look really yeah, cool it's so. <laughs> a cool look <laughs> put your face green you yeah <laughs> Or don't even show up at all. Just play the video of the avatar. And right. They say, you know, hey, that's right. the dream come true, I think, for right. the future, yeah. right? Just do it from anywhere. Yeah. Uh-huh. yeah. You really can. Oh, yeah. Do it from yeah. home. Yeah. 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 They wouldn't know. You know. I did it at a show. I like appeared as another avatar on another show. <laughs> and like, obviously, I was at home because it was like during the pandemic. Right. But that was really fun. Nice. Yeah. That's yeah. the future. That's yeah. the future. Here we are. So We're witnessing cool. it right now, right, right here. <laughs> <laughs> I love watching the Avatar laugh. I'm like, <laughs> just having a it time. Looks like so, so it looks like happy. so happy. Yeah. Or it's Lou looks one. very very oh, healthy teeth ooh, too, kind of which is sassy. Cool. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> I can't get the can't get the <laughs> some things going. I'm gonna have to work on work on that. And then I get distracted by the texts coming in from uh, Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, they're popping in on your phone. Popping uh, in and popping uh, out. I go, oh, okay. Well I guess I'll have to figure that out later. Thanks. All right, here we go. <laughs> This version of myself has got to end So I'm redefining no It means I'll have more space to find new growth You know all I do is dream with you Oh, 
Thank you so much. Thanks so Thank much. You. That was, that all right, was we're so going to cool. take a quick couple minute break now, and then we're going to bring in our next guest, Jamie Loftus. Right, guys? Give it up for me. Can you unmute, time. please? Once Thanks more. so much yes. for having me. Thanks. That Jamie, was so cool. that was really fun. Thank you. Not muted? Um, I mean, I could fill the time. Can I talk to somebody or do anything? Well, we so need to do some so there's not just around. So let's just do whatever you like. Yeah. Yeah. All right, so we're going to take a little little break, and then um, oh, if you got some when this song, when this song uh, ends, we will be back with uh, Jamie Loftus, Loftus, as Matt just said. <laughs> my thoughts, rambling, my hopes, tiptoe. My dreams leave the world behind. Welcome to my mind. Welcome to my mind. The world is lonely, and my heart beats only for a star. To cast a magic spell Daylight filters through the darkness When we climb out of our shell Hello, step into your fears apart, rush into my arms, tingle down my spine, welcome to my mind, welcome to my mind. Just flew through me like a wave that never finds a shore. Yes, a daylight fountain sprinkles through my lifetime. And who could ask, ask for more? This happened once before, I came through your door, no reply. 
Vic, you can take a break. If you want. Like, just, start, start for a break. just tell me. The photo of me? Yeah, I have it. Is that what we're talking about at the top here? I like to, yeah. 
Okay, you want to stop the music? Are we unmuted? All right, we are back. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I like this. That was <laughs> this shot of just like pick. Just <laughs> what is it? I oh, just me. It's just like. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, welcome back to the Office yeah. Hours 8-hour 9-to-5 marathon. Uh, uh, what are our uh, uh, Patreon yeah, are numbers looking numbers like, Matt? That's Have we the, made that's any the, progress? That's the main thing. Oh, you're springing this on me. I was getting other stuff. Huh? Well, since we have um, it on the screen well, here, we can get I have back a bone to, to pick with you. Oh, oh no! This. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, yeah. Can people see this at home? Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay, I'm ready to answer so, this. Well, welcome to the show, <laughs> Jamie yeah, welcome Loftus. Welcome to the show, Jamie Loftus. The legendary Jamie Loftus. Oh, yeah. Um, uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. Right. And, and okay. Matt right. referred to you as, oh, she's she's an intellectual. That's the, remember oh, that? Oh, no. Yeah, so oh, that's just, not good. just uh, you know, I watch I said you were the intellectual it. dark web. You're on Rogan a lot. Right, you're on oh, Rogan, you do yeah, all yeah, that. Yeah. That sort of thing. Yeah, yeah, no, I have bad opinions. Yes. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> exactly. I don't know what I'm talking about. Well, Lolita's yeah. kind of an intellectual... Yeah, yeah, no, that's a that's a that's a dark one, and I never know how to uh, answer for it. So, what is that for the layman or someone who doesn't know that podcast you do called Lolita? Yeah, it sounds. I mean, if you don't know what it is, it I am coming off very badly right now. But it uh, what? <laughs> it's uh, it's so normally I do comedy stuff, but last year I did a whole podcast that was like uh, unpacking the. Uh, cultural legacy of Lolita and how it like kind of got strayed from the book, which I think is pretty good, and then turned into a bunch of nasty stuff that's pretty bad and harmful. Didn't Kubrick make a movie? Yeah, he made a weird one too because it was. How like, do you feel about his take? Did he add his own stuff to it or whatever? He, like kind of. It was kind of like he just couldn't even attempt to adapt it because he made it in like the early '60s, so there were still so many studio restrictions that it turned out as kind of like a weird comedy starring Peter Sellers and who plays a bunch of characters and it just like, it didn't, it didn't make any sense, but it's better than the one that came out in the nineties was real bad. Cause that was like, they, they were just like, look at this incredible love story. And so it was, uh, it was not good. Right. Yeah. And what, 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 how do they get it wrong? The ones that get it wrong. By saying, and we should listen is... to your podcast basically. I know. Yeah, th- this is like, yeah, we did a lot I of homework. I just wanted here. a little, no, just a, uh, just a way a in. How do we? Yeah, no, what are we? Good. I yeah. think it's good that we're starting from the most depressing mm-hmm. thing I've ever made, <laughs> and then we'll just kind of work our way right, out of right. there. Oh, we can there. believe me. We can go lower. We, uh, we like depressing stuff. <laughs> yeah. Anything about death? Uh, maybe we can talk more about. Yeah, Mikey's I mean, sad that's how the show's been going so far. Do... Yeah. Any dead animals you can? Yeah, discuss? anything. I any do... animals that are about to die too. Just let us know. I like that. I like going to someone's house and then immediately having to talk about the worst thing that's ever happened to you. That's. I feel like I've done that uh, for for podcasts before, but uh, Lolita. I mean, Lolita. They just are like, oh, look at this incredible May December romance. Instead of like, this is a, a crime being. Right. This is it's the worst thing that could possibly yeah. happen. Yeah. She's twelve. Yeah. Yeah. So, but the, but the book. Would you say the book is is good? Is yeah, it, the is book. It, is the, it, I haven't. I haven't. I don't read books, you know. So. I usually don't either. Uh, no, the book no. is good. The book knows that it's a crime, uh, which okay, is really just okay. the baseline of how you okay. need to operate. That's how it's, it. yeah, that's where the fun, yeah, start right there. It is well, maybe good. it's a work of art and different people can interpret it differently. That's a C, and now you're going into a dangerous <laughs> territory. There we go. There you go. This is the last show with Wait, Doug. Please enjoy come your, in hot. Yeah. Enjoy your <laughs> four hours. Obviously, I'm playing that, uh, that character. Oh, of course. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. Um, but I, uh, since okay. we had this image up here, you, I think I was familiar but, with you at the time. I thought you were just a writer, or what does that be called, a reporter, a journalist? Uh, I wouldn't call what I was I don't know what, I don't, journalism. yeah. But, like, I, yeah, and you interviewed me for, what was it, Dead Spin or Dead, what's it called? Inverse, it, I inverse, think it would have been at was. that time. I yeah. don't know if it still exists and then, anymore. And then you're also, I found out you're an artist by because um. of this picture. <laughs> that, <laughs> where'd that okay. go? There it is. Okay. There it is. This so, was what, yeah. this is five years ago? I think it's six years ago. Okay. Yeah. So I'm uh I'm I'm ready to be canceled for this. <laughs> Wait, is that you? Oh, wrong for that. Yeah, she that was me. a picture of you? I yeah. Was, I was wrong for that. <laughs> okay. I was like, you're gonna recreate this intro. I love it. I, love I just it. Every, yeah. I I was making everyone look real sleepy back then. <laughs> Everyone it's, was just basically yeah. asleep. And the got teeth, some nice choppers the too. The teeth, I yeah. know. Yeah. Oh like, yeah. Had them implanted or something, but no, that was, and that was like seriously like one of the first 
interviews I've ever done. Like, really? Yeah, yeah. Wild. Yeah, because I was only like in it for a few months at that time, like a year or whatever, doing that stuff. So. Well, I was yeah. very excited to talk to you at the time, and to be at the time. <laughs> at the t- no, I, and now I'm upset. <laughs> yes, yes. And, but no, I was like so stoked to do <laughs> that, and um, I didn't. I don't know why they asked me to illustrate my own uh, pieces because it's I feel great. like it's it a really, good character. Uh, <laughs> it does. <laughs> Did you draw it with a mouse? I yeah oh yeah I, I draw them all I draw everything with a mouse. Oh my god! I've never um I've never I I've tried with a tablet but I'm not very good at it. I yeah so wow it's okay only with, it's only with the mouse on uh on Sketchbook Pro, which oh, costs right. twenty dollars. Whoa okay <laughs> yeah, very cool. Yeah so I uh, I can't apologize to you enough. <laughs> okay, <for that. laughs> it's all good. It's all good. Um. So from there, I I also know you from uh, being on Behind the Bastards. Yeah, I love that. So oh, with man. Uh, Robert, um, Robert Evans, Robert Evans, yeah, the great Robert Evans. He t- he tracks some of the worst people <laughs> in our country. Basically, just America, right? It's not he's not outside of it, or is he? He's no. We well, did a the first one I ever did with him was on um, Saddam Hussein's oh, okay, then, um, yeah. novels that he would write. Oh, <laughs> Okay. He wrote like romance. So novels. it's like behind the music for bastards. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It's an excellent podcast, and uh, I, lo- I love it. I love it. Um, and he's just he's like great. he tracks all these people, and just like it's nice to have just a document of who these people are. For you know, just everyone should know who some of these people are, even though they're the worst people. But uh, yeah. a lot of alt right idiots and, mm-hmm. and all that. But there's like I don't know, good podcast I could say. Um, and um, I'm trying to think. And the Bechtel what, cast. The Bechtel cast. Yeah. Yes, you do. I mean, yeah. we're just going through all her IMDb here. We're, the- yeah. <laughs> we're just going uh, Wikipedia. Do you, do you guys want to explain <laughs> what's going to go on? Yeah, so yeah, this is, yeah. This so everybody show? knows Jamie Loftus already. And now yeah. is your chance to talk to her yeah. um, on the show. And Doug and I are going are gonna to slip out here and you can talk to Jamie. So call in, zoom in. Uh, questions. It's the Jamie Loftus takeover. Whatever this you want to do. It. Yeah. Any questions? We're any... just going to wolf down our food. In yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah. Like, you guys are yeah. four we'll hours back. in, right? We'll You're yeah, four yeah. hours. Are you tired? What is, what's the situation? I'm, not tired. I'm all right. I'm, I'm fine. Yeah, I'm just getting good. warmed yeah, up. Yeah. Need... All right. Yeah. All right, good. But I all think good, we so... need, you know, we get accused a lot on this show of being too too male. You know, there's a lot of males. Yeah. It's a lot of A lot of white dudes. Not masculine. And that's too many white dudes with beards. We're working on that. Yeah. I was actually, I was out there like drafting an essay about that. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I was going to draw another picture, picture of Vic. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> <Yeah. laughs> yeah. So the concept here is like let's let's get a different voice. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. In the host chair. Okay, we're going to uh-huh. call gonna the shots. You tell up. us what to do. Yeah. You can yell at us if you need. Okay. You can be polite if you prefer. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. And then, yeah, we'll give us. you some we're t- leaving. Yeah. yeah, we're going. No, they're leaving. The floor is going to be yours. So Zoomers hotheads. Well, you can talk to people on the the Hothead Hotline, which is an audio only a phone call. Oh, okay. Or people on Zoom, which right. is just random people all over the world. All right. Let's do or it. Or you could right. just do a monologue. Or whatever you or want. Or you could just yes. talk, yeah. You could talk about Sh- the Shrek the Musical, which yeah. is like, because you're like, I love that. I love that. And, I, and some, I think it was Aristotle. Remember Aristotle? Like, yeah. <laughs> like, oh, I thought you guys know Aristotle. Yeah, man. yeah. He was early, uh, he was early Matt, right? Kind of thing. Oh, yeah, yes. yeah. But um, but he, he mentioned that you're a huge uh, Shrek two or Shrek fan. So yeah, I'm a big Shrek, Shrek the musical. Kid. All right, everybody, here we All go. Right. Kim, okay, they're canceled. They're gone, we're and um, uh, it can't feel good for them. <laughs> it's all good. Say goodbye. Uh, Kim from Australia is on the line. Oh, oh, oh you're soft. Very close. It's to good. It's good. And I'm here to help. I'm not going anywhere. You're not going okay, and it sounds like a threat when you say it like that. <laughs> there. <laughs> Sorry, I swear. No, it's okay. It's nice because now we're in the windowless room together, and <laughs> this is a little creepy, isn't I it? I think, I think it's mainly creepy because of. I mean, and I, I, I'm assuming that people who are watching can't tell. Just we're like just far enough away from each other that it's kind of scary. <laughs> <laughs> well, I hope I'm not threatening. Oh, look, they. I think they're pulling up a shot to show the. Uh, oh. The thing. Anyway, let's change the subject. Subject: Kim from Australia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's on your mind? Ah, uh, yeah. Well, Shrek talk. Oh, hi! Wow. Shrek two. Uh huh. I think it's a popular opinion actually that it's the better of the two. Interesting. Okay. Is What's it? Is your that? Take? Your, is that your opinion? My popular opinion. No, uh, I feel like it's. I've heard it more than once. Okay. Soundtrack is great. Storyline's great. 
The sa- you know, I found out recently about Shrek 2 that it competed for the, I- I've never tried to say this out loud, but the, the Palme d'Or in France. It like competed at Cannes Film Festival. It, it did oh. not win, but I I like, hmm, I like Shrek 2 a lot. I feel like they tried to, you know, they tried to give Fiona her own little journey, but <laughs> ultimately uh, it just launches her back into the arms of Shrek. I don't know. What do you think about Shrek and Fiona's relationship? Is it toxic, perhaps? <laughs> Go off. Um, hey, how about the metaphor of he loved her even as an ogre? That's uh-huh. a good metaphor. And that's my take on Shrek and Fiona. But here's my question is like, can people, can people, could I have sex with Shrek? I'm just, I'm a person. Can I have sex with Shrek or is Mm. that not okay? Like what are the rules in the universe? Do you have to, can only ogres have sex with ogres or could I or you who, I love your pajamas also. You look like you're like on the side of like, you look like you're in a succession scene or something. (laughs) Just watched that last night, actually. Um, Well, Donkey and the dragon, who might be named Lizzie, they have children. Right, they do have children. I wish, I would like to get into that a little more. Yeah, I would like to. I should, although I I mean, it's, there's no, I don't mean to like encourage people to make more Shrek themed porn. I have, (laughs) I feel like I've seen some against my will. Um, Mm honestly i don't know like when scrolling too far down in google image search on (laughs) you one random phrase it's like i i feel like it is like an intr and then it's also just like an intrusive thought i'll have every once in a while have you ever seen the one where it's like i feel like there's an iconic nude shrek where it's like really and i hesitate to use the word like turgid but that's like the word that is (laughs) do you know the one i'm talking about i don't but i I can certainly imagine it. Yeah. There's all the Shrek is love, Shrek is life. Oh, right. Yeah. That's I went to, this is going to sound like I made it up, but it's true. I went to like a a conference um, about, it was like 20 years of Shrek. What is the intellectual legacy of Shrek? And I went and it like, it was on Zoom, but it was in England. So I had to wake up at like three in the morning to go. And it was just like. A, bu- a bunch of people um yeah I was really tired but they were they were um they really think that there's a lot going on there so I think that they and they would agree with you about Shrek 2 as well mm, good oh good I yeah. mean good company yeah um yes I'm not I'm new to you today this second oh hi um hi I <laughs> I came in at the second that they showed the um picture of Vic your little illustration of Vic I was not prepared for that yeah I wasn't prepared to have to answer (laughs) for that six years yeah he really got my ass right at the top which is interesting because we had we had we I think that this is our first time meeting in person and I I didn't see it coming at all (laughs) yeah Uh, Yeah. and it definitely has have you ever seen um Chris Simpson's artist yes yeah I love this very Chris Simpson's artist very that is so that long, is nice to hear. Um, yes, he's got that like very like neat paint, like Microsoft Paint drawing done with the cursor. So as in with the mouse, so that get yeah. that vibe. I like that. I mean, I th- I think I'm assuming for him that that's like an artistic choice, <laughs> but for me, it's just like where my skill kind of like to- <laughs> tops out. But mm. I like that people have interpreted it as a like, well, she could do more, but I can't, and I am um, <laughs> not going to learn how. But I have reached my potential. Mm-hmm. There's no other. Yeah, I've made um, upwards of fourteen dollars doing that shit. So I think you know why. Was gonna have. Why improve? I don't know how far <laughs> that goes in Australia. Where do you? Um, is is it a time that makes sense to be in bed, or do you just happen to be in bed? No, it's eight a.m. So oh, okay. woke up at seven thirty. In the attempt to get on mm-hmm. success, thank you, Matt. And wow. yeah, first, really... first try, your first call. And really? Yeah, time, which is not. Nice. Well, that's. I feel bad that you had to talk to a total stranger who you've never heard of before, instead of um, assuming who you watch the show for. It's fine. I did. I came prepared with 
with specifically Vic and Doug questions, but it's Wait, been a very no, conversation. No, no, we no. can answer for them. Yeah, I think that we can take that. Oh, all right. Okay. Um, how does the soundboard work? How For Farago. You... It's a program called Farago. It's a program called you... Farago, and we've been using <laughs> it for many years. They are AGO, and we tried to get them to sponsor us. We did. And um, they were real dicks about it. They were oh. so rude. Yeah. They were like not I wonder if their product no. they feel like hasn't been used for how they wanted it to be used. Say it again? Maybe their product hasn't been used how they intended it to be used so no, they no, don't it's want it's literally support. a soundboard software so you would think like how many people are okay. knocking down their door to do Matt free is ads so for? mad about this i, I wasn't am. ready for how pissed he is <laughs> speaking on behalf of, of of vic and doug i'm also f absolutely <laughs> fucking furious about this they wouldn't be furious. they're oh and i and also i take it back what was your next <laughs> what was your next question well more on the soundboard okay my I can't wrap my head around how quick to respond with a completely accurate sound bite. <laughs> These are like the exact questions we can't answer at all. <laughs> oh, damn. <laughs> oh, I'm going to do, I, uh, what, so how, like what the timing is? Yeah, like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How are they Extremely so well drops? contextualized drop. It was just, well, I believe that there is a training session. I think that I, if I'm speaking on behalf of them, I think that they meet up a couple times a week for three or four hours and they just practice their timing and they practice their trigger fingers. And yeah. uh, Black metal! see, you can't just do that. You know, that doesn't just, just happen. You did it without even sitting there. That's amazing. Yeah. Yeah. What? So do you have drops, Matt? I, I always have a couple on reserve just in case, but I don't get to use them much. What are your faves? Um, I like the James Hetfields. I like the, okay. um, but the thing is I don't have them synced. I have selective sync. I don't um, know what that means. Or on my Dropbox, you know? Oh, okay. I know what that means. Yeah, so like it's, oh, here's one. Do! There you go. <laughs> That's a fun one. And then this is actually, I think Vic uses this one. This was actually, I think it was my discovery. Oh my God, Ooh, that's yes. Nice. This one gets stuck in my head. Yeah, that's a good one. That's nice. That's like a hometown parade. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, it was that's nice beautiful. talking to you, Down Under. Thank you very much for having yeah. me. Shrek 2 is the is the better Shrek. You've sold me. Yes. Oh, thank goodness. Another one. <laughs> Saved. Take care, Kim. Bye, Kim. Thanks, guys. Bye. Um, anyone else? I liked Kim. Oh, there we go. I'll give you my oh. Did you ever play in a marching band? No. I, uh, they were trying to recruit me. This is a true oh. story to play drums in the marching band. That's in, cool. Um, like middle school. For, on what grounds? No, I mean, like, what do you, what did they see in you that was like, now that's a, a pulse. A pu you know, they were Jesus. desperate. Okay, okay. For members, because it's kind of a nerdy thing to do. My brother got recruited for the tuba, but it was because of his physical size. Mm. He was like six foot three or something, it's and they're like, boy. "We gotta put." Yeah, you see a big, <laughs> this little pervert, the band director would see a big boy, mm -hmm. and he would have to put a tuba in the hands of the big boy. I get it. Yeah, I get it. Why they... he gave me an oboe, we don't know. I am sure he had a little perverted reason. They, uh, yeah, and he, <laughs> they tried to recruit me, and it was, uh, I have a distinct memory. The band director was like, listen, I'm not trying to blow smoke up your you-know-what. This is going to be really good wow. for your college career. And I was like, I, I, no I feel thanks. like it would have just been better if he said ass. Yeah, <laughs> that's <was> rough stuff. <laughs> but Duncan Carey. <gasps> Duncan, Duncan Carey. Do you Duncan, know Duncan? Duncan's my friend, yeah. Oh, cool. oh I do. Reunite. Wait, Duncan, what's up? How's it going? Oh, it's going. Oh, wow. So festive. Yeah, yeah. Um, I actually had some Thanksgiving puns, um, if that's okay. Please, yeah. All right. Um, well, I know we were talking about podcasts earlier, uh, and mm. I'm actually producing a new podcast. Uh, it features a famous new, new metal band, and um, they just review deli salads. It's called Corn on the Cob. <laughs> I like it. Where's the cob? Um, What's the cob part? Cob salad. Oh, you know? cob salad. Yes, yes. Gotta get out of your salad. <laughs> your salad puns. Right. Um, yeah. 
but also too like they kind of inspired me like when I was producing the podcast to kind of start doing music on my own mm -hmm. and I actually came up with a whole new genre I think um, I don't know if anyone has done this before but okay. I recorded a whole album um, just in my mom's old Voyager minivan uh, so it's called Plymouth Rock Wait, oh okay that one took me a second that one took me a second okay. but then I got really lucky like after I produced that uh, album uh, this company heard it and they're putting on like this really fancy uh, gathering like it's just a big get together it's like it's a pretty well known margarine company uh -huh. um, but the event's called the I Can't Believe It's Not Butterball <laughs> yeah. I'll be honest that's the first one I genuinely understood right away <laughs> Um, but that's it. That, uh, that was the uh, the suite of uh, Thanksgiving puns and jokes. Uh, I love Duncan, did you ever, do you remember when they made blue margarine? Do you remember when they made food all different colors and you could just buy it at the store? I don't remember blue margarine, but I do remember when they had like peanut butter and jelly in the same jar. That's fun. I like that. I got, I got uh, mayo chup recently. <laughs> just kind of just like a pale pink. <laughs> creamy substance that you can you can buy for four dollars for too much you know you could just get yeah yeah well because it's just really complicated to have like two different jars and everything sometimes you just need one just bottle and you can just yeah get it all right there from the source you really do pay for the convenience there um but i do yeah. think that the color is off-putting enough that they should stop making it uh <laughs> but they used to they used to have like blue margarine they would make like a stick of blue whatever and then you could you could uh bring it to dinner and really freak out your dad i don't know i do remember that being a thing though uh, 90s kids will remember this uh but of just like products and stuff uh to like freak out your like parents or siblings like they had like the creepy crawlers or whatever just like a super hot oven to make sticky bugs yeah i had that and it was just like in the commercial like oh you're gonna impress everyone like they're gonna be so freaked out and then like you make it and then like it falls apart in 20 seconds you're like well this sucks no one likes me <laughs> <laughs> i wish that there's i wonder if that's still a thriving industry of like uh products that your parents can buy you to upset them later because i think <laughs> that that was a that was i mean it seemed to be working i wonder if that still happens now or if there's um or if you can just do it for free on the internet i don't really know yeah I yeah i was gonna say i feel that's like the move now is just put youtube on in front of your kid like that happened to me uh, a week ago. Um, I was in a restaurant getting ready to leave and then a uh, family came up and like immediately they just had like a baby who was like getting ready to cry and they just put YouTube on and mm -hmm. it stopped. But then all of us had to listen to the same song for like 20 minutes and it was just like, isn't that interesting? It's like, yeah, there's, if you go to m most public places, there's just like a kid being like black pilled in front of you on YouTube. And it's like, well, that's not my kid. I can't do anything to stop it. But they should probably stop black pilling that kid, you know, at yeah. the store. But, you know, if you sometimes there's a whole generation of kids that are going to get black pilled because they just they couldn't shut up at the store. Doesn't seem fair. <laughs> as long as uh, Steven Crowder doesn't start making songs, I think we're safe. <laughs> I hope so. I, I want to start making videos for for them to that that'll, uh, that'll that are just straight up boring. I don't know. Did you see like. <laughs> There was like a whole thing where they're like videos of like Spider-Man getting run over by a car. No. <laughs> okay. Well, I don't, if, if you've got a kid, <laughs> don't let them watch that video. A lot of kids are watching that video. I'll have to look that up. Um, but yeah, it is, uh, it's a, a wonderful world we live in, I think is a big takeaway. And that's just kind of what I want to yeah. wrap up. by saying. Oh, I feel very safe. Yeah. Thanks, yeah. Duncan. Yeah. All right. Thanks, Jamie. Good to see you, Duncan. I'll see you soon. Oops. He mean, okay. How about a hothead? But, uh, yeah. Yeah. Hot bring on a hothead. Hot Ooh. All right. Oh, actually, wait, this would not make sense. That's someone. This is like a hard line to my brain. Is it this too is loud? Wild. No, it just can really feel it. Yeah, it's right. I feel in there, very though. engaged. All right. Three, four, seven. You are live on the air. Sal, Sal or Saul, is it? Saul? Three, four, seven. Oh, hello. 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 Yes, Saul. Hi, this is Saul. Hi, what's up? Hi, who are you, and why are you talking to him? Oh, uh, my name is Jamie, and I'm. Are you talking about Matt? Is that the him you're talking about? No, no, Matt's a very handsome man. I'm not talking about him. I, I actually, 
I need to talk to you guys about my doctor's appointment. And I was wondering if okay. you could listen to me. I, I have yeah. very bad problems. I, well, you need to be quiet because I have warts bad and I need help. All right. Let's okay. uh, get to your point or we're going to have to hang up on you and show some respect for our guest today, please. Uh, wow. Thank you. Is it thank Sal or Sal? Sal? I, well, I'm, I'm, it's Sal Rosenberg. I think you okay. might know me. Anyway, I, I, I'm sorry. I'm just in a lot of pain, young ma'am. And I have, I have very bad warts. Okay. That doesn't sound comfortable my, at all. My, my ass is killing me. Oh, God. Saul, I'm so sorry. Yes. Are you well, standing okay, right now? I was wondering if you could come over. Well, I'm, I'm sitting down. Oh, God. Oh, oh. Saul. You're going to want to stand up, buddy. Oh, God. Okay. Please help me. Oh, God. Oh. Okay. Now I feel like I'm participating in a fetish stream. <laughs> yeah, I think that's <laughs> enough. Thanks, Saul. Thanks for the call. That was nice. Okay. You have a nice day, young lady. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stand up, buddy. Wasn't okay, I will. And I'm going to get some help. Okay, get some Good help. We're proud that. of you. Isn't... Um... Okay, thank you. Oh, whoops, sorry, what? Saul. Is, was that actually a jerky boy? I don't know. Isn't Saul Rosenberg like a... Yeah, you know I mean, Saul Rosenberg is. is. I'm not jerky boy literate. That was... I feel like that was uh, someone pretending oh. to be jerky boys. Okay. Damn. It was the sense I got, but I don't know. Yeah. I wasn't feeling it. Were you feeling it? You well, weren't. <laughs> what if I was like, I was really feeling it. <clears throat> we can call him I'm back. Mad. Well, we were. Yeah, let's, let's call Saul back. Give him a call. It might. I mean, honestly. I don't know, Vic. Do you think you can help him out? I yeah, doubt. I could help. I him doubt out. it. Yeah. They were on. We hold. were. Uh, they were on hold for three hours. We, we've been trying oh to get. Gosh. We've been trying to get him. Uh, get him on here. Welcome back, Vic. Hey, everybody. Yeah. How was lunch? Hey, it was wonderful. Scar- hey, hello, everybody. I, I scarfed down my burrito. Nice. My vegan burrito. You um, got a white claw. I got a white claw, too. I saw that in there. It was like all these tall cans, and Ooh, I went starting early. Yeah, it's only one. You know, <laughs> that's, that's, yeah. Is that your white claw of, of, of preference? I don't, honestly, I don't drink these things, but that's the only uh, alcohol beverage in there. So I'm just mm-hmm. having that right now. Um, and yeah, I'm kind of stuffed right now. So. But everybody should be happy that we didn't eat on air. Um, I know that that's been a big complaint. Do you get oh you get complaints about like misophonia a lot? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, yeah, I didn't even know what that was. <sighs> yeah, know? I get that sometimes yeah. too. Is that and like it, a mouth sound? <clears throat> yeah, it's like if you're, yeah. if anyone, and I'm just like, well, yeah. I get hung, it's, I, I, I have sympathy to a point. Uh huh. But if I want a snack, what am I supposed to do? Just turn your radio off if you have a problem yeah, with it. I, I was like, it's it's free. I don't like if you don't. <laughs> right. It's free. No one's you can forcing just shut you it to off. listen. Yeah. Uh, well, I don't know. I, I've eaten macaroni on air before. That's not. I mean, nice. that's yeah. That's more of a. <laughs> that's not nice. Squishy. Uh, yeah. yeah. We yeah. did. Uh, we did get admonished in the chat. Ooh, for uh, what? By the boss, Tim Heidecker, <gasps> for not pushing the Patreon enough. Oh no! Oh, Check in. We're we're stalled out, quite frankly. Oh, at fifty eight fifty six. This might not happen. I don't know. We might be stuck be a, here forever. Be a downer at Thanksgiving to have to tell my kids that we didn't we didn't get there. <laughs> Thanksgiving so. is canceled. Yeah, so we might not. We have Come on, turkey. listeners. We only need a hundred. Let's go. And might be 40, having spam again this year. Forty four. Does that math work out? Forty. 46, 40, 144. 144. 144 okay. more. Let's yeah. do it. We can make it. Jamie, why are you a patron of uh, Office Hours Live? <laughs> why am I a patron of Office Hours Live? Well, let me count the ways. Mm. Uh, are you more into the Joel hole or the compound? I've got to say, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm uh, Joel hole all the way. Oh, and wow. always, And that's something that I've always wow. felt uh, really fire. strongly. Oh, really cool. strongly. And I, I did mean that to come off exactly as it did. <laughs> Should we try another uh, pothead? See if there's someone let's, less uh, let's see. Yeah. less hot, but a little bit hot. Ooh. How have the calls been since we were out? Terrible. Wow. Well, no, that's, one good one. That's maybe. why our patron numbers are so low then. Okay, I feel personally responsible, mm-hmm. and no, I'm so sorry, guys. No, no, no we had a, we had a rude that. hothead, which I guess is to be expected. But. Well, yeah. We did. That's you know what happens hothead. on the hothead, Jamie? They try to do shit. to go live, huh? That's exhausting. Yeah. All right, 509. Matt? Oh, hi, guys. How's it going this morning? I got hair. Good. It's going great this morning. I'm on the air. It's pretty good. Hi. How, um, who's uh, who's the, this uh, female has a very, um, a very smooth, uh, very radio-like voice? Who is that? Who's hmm. the female? Who's the female? 
Uh, well, I, I'm I'm the female. My name is Jamie. Thanks for um, thanks for oh. liking my voice. Oh, this is that oh, nut yeah, job from Spokane. Well. Yeah. Oh, it's that nut job from um, Spokane. Oh, gr- glad he got through. <laughs> yeah. So, well, I had a, like a super uh, simple question because uh, before you get to that, to, I want to um, just check in. I just want to. Oh. That I've I've noticed you've left a lot of voicemails on the Hothead Hotline, Matt from Spokane. Oh yeah, is um, everything all right? I'm, I'm sure you guys are being really uh, getting annoyed by huh? Well, I don't listen to them; they're very long. But well, I just give us noticed. A, why don't you like 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 do a, leave a message now for us? <laughs> yeah, and we'll be we're quiet and then. Catch us uh, up. So, okay. <laughs> Hothead Hotline, leave a message. Um, you have two minutes. Okay. Hi guys, uh, I'm just gonna leave this message for you guys. Um, I made gifts for all of you, and uh, I'm looking for whatever PO box to, to to mail it to. I think I'm gonna take a pass on you a know, gift a from you. You're gonna pass. It's not a, a BOM. You seem a little unhinged. What's the What's the get? I'll tell you what, what they are. They're paintings, and because um, mm-hmm. I'm a uh, Obsessive about the paintings. It's like a meditation and uh, more of like uh, self therapy for me. Now, with this, all due respect, uh, it's a hard pass. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. What? What? what oh. um, wait, what? It's not a hard pass for me. Send the painting. Send them. Yeah, Send them. Oh, well, yeah. That's the cranky this, guy. Uh, That's true. Uh, uh, we'll give you Doug's PO box. Wants, uh, <clears throat> contact us offline. So what? So you, that, so um, what do you mean? It's like a therapy for you? How does how does it how does it work as a therapy? Well, as a meditation, um, it's a, I do a lot of repetitive, uh, uh, you know, very abstract, very layered stuff. So uh, okay. I guess it's more of the time and uh, that I put into it allows me to, because I find it very hard to uh, get calmed down because I got bipolar. Or I uh-huh. was diagnosed with the bipolar, uh, you know, with the manic uh, depression, but they got me on that Seroquel and that, that SF Talibram, so... Mm-hmm. It kind of, yeah, that's helping a little bit, but uh, but uh, if I didn't have the art and the music, I'd I'd probably just be on the street somewhere, like with it. <clears throat> I don't know. That's, but no, that's you guys really helped me. Uh, but if it is a, a, a no, like it's new <clears throat> paintings or no, it's not a pass, man. Not a pass at all. Send it uh, for real. Like, where oh. do we have a yeah peel box mat or a what peel box mat? What are you? I'll, I'll send. Just send I got okay. a message. Pen. I have, I have a pen and a piece of paper. Oh, right you want here. to do it the old school way? All right. Let's <laughs> do it. Let's do it. Uh, Please don't send oh, yeah, us analog. a letter bomb or anything. <laughs> yeah, only, or anything. only non lethal right. paintings, please. 3756. 3756. W, as in West. W, Avenue 40. Avenue 40. Number K204. Number K as in Kurt Cobain? Correct. K, yeah. K as in and correct. Then what was the following? 204. 204. Two is in Los two Angeles, way. California, 90065. 90065. I'm sorry, that last part. <clears throat> Los Angeles, California, 90065. Wait, what, what was the, the first what? number again? What was it? It starts with a Angeles. three. All right, can you read it back to us? Yeah. I'll read it to you backwards. Backwards, it would be 40 (laughs) Avenue West, 6573. All right. 402K Suite. Thank you. All right. So can I confirm it's a PO box? Yes, it's confirmed. Thank you, sir. All right. Uh, 556. 3756, right? Sure. West Avenue 40. Uh huh. Number Kirk Cobain 204, mm-hmm. Los Angeles, California. Yes, I attention, did not Kirk get that Cobain. Now, are these what watercolors? Are these? Yeah, I don't want to hear anything. I just want to see. Oh. <laughs> no, get this guy uh, off the line. Yeah, as soon I as I have to agree with Matt on that. All right, All right. thanks, well, Matt. We wish you the best. Thank yes, you for and thank uh, you for uh, listening and for. But I didn't get the uh, I didn't get the area code. The area code of the address is three one three. Nine zero zero six five. Nine zero zero six five is nine, this. he's talking about the zip, zip, zip code is nine zero zero six five. Chucky dang darn. All right, this is really nine zero zero six five. Correct. 
You don't have to all right, thanks a lot. All, the time. I got it. all right, buddy. Take, take care. Gotta, keep painting, gotta, all right? Yeah, keep painting. Stay healthy. I got to wish you guys a happy holidays, and uh, thank you so much for taking my calls. We love you. Of course, buddy. Goodbye. We love you. I love you. <laughs> Whoops. All right. Uh, do we want to try our chances with another hothead? Yes. Yeah, let's do it. <clears throat> All right. The female. That's I haven't yeah, gotten female. that one in yeah. a while. <laughs> that's fun. You know it's gonna be good when that's the stuff. Oh yeah. <laughs> uh, two six nine. Dawn is on the line. <coughs> Dawn, are you there? Am I on the line? Yes, you're, you're live on the air. Oh my gosh, this is incredible. I never thought this would happen. <laughs> Don! Well, you had to know there's some chance that uh, you'd get on because you're calling I, I in, know. right? I didn't know what the odds were. Well, you hit the I lottery, didn't know how many buddy. There might be. Yeah. I guess so. It's so great to, to talk to you guys. I don't well, really have quality, to call to say. I guess. It. Can I just uh, lay my lay myself at the feet of Doug and Vic for a few minutes and, and just and just tell them about the effects they've had on my life? Oh please, and yes, I'll, I'll pat your head as you as you uh, are down there. Okay, will do. I'm also I, I have to say I I wasn't familiar with Jamie, but I'm really enjoying her presence on the show. So see that. I mean, Thanks, awesome. Very nice. Right. Anyway, best call of the day so far. Here. Wow. Doug and Vic. I, I, I started listening to this show because I was like a, you know, a pretty long time to that fan, but the drop, I mean, just kills me. And so much so, like me and a couple of my close friends, we play video games, like on the computer and stuff. And we have, uh, through the use of MIDI controllers and software, we've, we've got it now to where we, should, we do drops in like the voice channel on our Discord server and nice. stuff. Nice. So just, just know that you're a huge inspiration to us all out there. Wow. Thank you, Tim. <laughs> Well, that's Thank awesome, you. man. What Great do you want to you want to give us a what, you want to give us a sample like what kind of drops you have on your channel? No more. Um, well, you know we've uh, we've got some, some some classics from you guys, obviously, and then I don't know. I guess I'm proud to say we've delved off into our own little dark corners of the internet to find sound bites from the things we like. So I don't nice. know about everything. We, I got a lot of chubby checker on there. Oh, that's uh, what I like to hear. Now we're talking about it. Beautiful. Yeah. So now, Great do you? Stuff. So are I you gonna know. are you gonna go check out uh, some of Jamie's podcasts? Absolutely. I was on uh, earlier wow. talking wow. about the what was it behind the bastard? Thanks for shilling. Behind the bas behind the bastard, you will love it. Yeah, that sounds incredibly intriguing. I was just like listening to her kind of describe the premise of that. I don't know. I'm all about it. You know, Sweet. obviously, like she said, there's the worst people, and it's uh, maybe difficult to know about them. But yeah. I don't know. Sounds fascinating. Well, that's a good question. Cool. So, um, all right. Well, all right, he's, well. he's really noisy. Yeah. I think we should... yeah. Oh yeah, we're hearing a lot yeah, of you had a lot of buses. Track, What's going buses on? going by. Side, so. Sorry about that. Don't get hit by a car. What's that? Yeah. Be careful. Don't don't run out in traffic. Okay. Thanks, Don. Well, I'm in a car, but oh, I think it's a risk show up. Thanks, guys. All right, you. Don. Have a good day. Bye, Don. Thanks for calling. See you too. Go oh, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> that one was not intentional, I promise. You guys are so loved. That is so Isn't nice. That nice. Yeah. That nice. It's nice. You see, if you come to us with love, I'll be a loving guy too. Jeez. <laughs> come. Some, we we had a, a complaint lodged earlier oh. about me, and I'm still a little uh, prickly about it. Fix it. <laughs> that hurts. <laughs> Tom that on Zoom. For me. That is painful. Whoa. Whoa. Look at this. Whoa. Whoa. Look at this red Hello, couch. Big. Love it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> couch hey, how's it going? Are Good. you at work? I am at work. Yeah, well, I'm on my lunch break. I got a little bit left. Is that your office? Yes. This is my office. Are I'm you, at, are uh, you an editor? I'm a producer editor. See, I knew it. Studio. I could tell by that couch that in the room, back. Yeah. Whoa. That's, that's the that's the over my shoulder edits that's couch. That's the over the shoulder yeah. spot. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hey, I uh, I know got some fans of the Beach Boys mm. over there. I was just yep. curious if you'd ever heard their party album. Uh yeah, sure, sure. I I Where have, and um, it's fascinating. There's like, <laughs> there you go. It's like build as a live thing. But they like yeah. re they overdubbed like I don't know four or five of all of them. So they they did this sing along, and then the whole band did multiple overdubs of them like clapping along and singing along, and it's just like a real loud party atmosphere. It's, it was clearly just like we need a hit or we need to you know put out an album you know contractually. So they, they, they yeah. it's a good idea though. I mean, and that's where of course where uh, Barbara Ann comes from. That's where that was recorded. 
I like how you kind of hear them get progressively more drunk as the album right. goes on. I heard so you can hear people start. individually talking about specific yeah, conversations. Yeah, you can. Yeah, yeah. Wow. See, Doug is getting into the Beach Boys here. Somebody, He's, well, uh, since some, I said the Beach Boys thing, uh -huh. somebody DM me. They're like, you got to check out the party because you can hear people. Maybe that uh -huh. was him. I don't know. Maybe, yeah. Did you DM me about this, sir? I don't think so. No. Interesting. You got See, two well, people. Then it's everybody's talking about the party. Um, Any questions for Jamie? I don't know. Uh, I sadly only was able to tune in just a bit ago for my lunch break. So I, I'm going to have to go back and watch. I was going to have to study up. And check out. But I know you have a podcast, so I'll keep an ear for her. <laughs> that's really that. people's only takeaway so far is. <laughs> She's a female. Really last caller. In a podcast. Female. But you're, I mean, you're, you, you write on TV shows. Is that They're, correct? Uh, uh, yes, yes. Right, yes. Can we? Uh, do we know any of these TV cops? shows? Yeah, what, what <laughs> cops? Cops? What, what yeah, is this? actually, I, I do uh, some of the premise setups for uh -huh. cops, and then they kind of improvise inside. It's all, of them. yeah. It's, right, right. People it's think more, it's a reality show. Yeah, it's, it's more totally of a creative staged. consultant kind uh -huh. of role. Yeah, yeah. No, I just, I, uh, I just, I just wrote on a cartoon called Teenage Euthanasia. Then that, mm -hmm. that oh, with uh, Alyssa, out. friend of the show. Yeah, yeah. 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 Alyssa's the best. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Alyssa Nutting. She's been oh, in, wow. well, when we had the old couch. Oh, yeah. Yeah. What happened to the old couch? We got rid of it. We got mm -hmm. these nicer chairs. You don't want to know what happened. I like these. <laughs> Some real It was given away stuff. in a loving home. These are good. Yeah. These are nice. I like these. The couch made everyone kind of slouch, so it wasn't the greatest for... Oh. Was that fun to work on uh, So did everyone, everyone looked bad? They just looked slouchy? Yeah, a little slouchy. Okay. A little slouchy. slouchy couch. But was uh, mm -hmm. euthanasia fun to work on? It was really fun to work on. Yeah, it was great. And it was uh, out here? The room was out here in L.A.? It, uh, yeah, it was like right at the beginning of the pandemic. So we were all, I mean, there were like a bunch of writers in New York and I think a couple kind of scattered around. A lot of people like quarantining from their parents. Mm. Um, and we wrote the whole season in like a month and a half. And it's they're doing a second, right? Yeah. Congrats. Nice. Thanks. And uh, yeah, so it was uh, it was mm. fun. And now you know two things about me, or three, because <laughs> of the female thing. That you own a computer. Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. I have a computer. <laughs> is that my apartment right now? <laughs> when you is write on a cartoon show like that, is it like a writer's room short situation or are you like writing a script start to finish? No, it's like two weeks of uh two weeks of just like talking and pitching stuff and then it's like it was a month of working on stuff on our own. But it was nice. I don't know. I just like I had no uh purpose or direction during that time, so it was nice to have a task. There it is. There it is. <laughs> That's, you, That's wrote that. you wrote that sound. If you need any cartoon yeah. sound effects, let me know. I feel like Tom's <laughs> really uh, gently putting up with me right now. <laughs> He's really... Well, I want to know. Oh, well, what happens is that just stays on the screen. Mm -hmm. Well, so. I just, if you can't <clears throat> see it, He's really, he's got a very polite smile on but, right now. Yeah. Yeah. Tom, really, what did you have for lunch? Oh, he's muted. Hold on. I'm he's trying like, to juggle a couple of things right well, Just now. tell us in sign language. <laughs> there you go. Um, ice cream. I, oh, oh there, you, you bought oh. Uh, chips from the vending machine. Just Pringles. Point. Oh. Poke. Uh, poke. Poke bowl. Po Whoa. Oh. Wow. <laughs> At, wow. Right. And what are you editing? Oh, I like this. Charades. Charades. Yeah, the charades. Charades. Yeah, the charades. charades. This is a good. This is a good <clears throat> game. And yeah, like. Wait, what are you gonna have for dinner? <laughs> oh, he knows. Cut. Oh. Okay. Cut. Um, it's your boiling oh, water. Uh, Pasta. Wait, what's no. the the first thing he did? Do the first move cut. again. Cut. He's gonna chop. I'm gonna cut. I'm gonna cut. Cut. Uh. I'm cut me. Cut me. Me cut. I'm gonna. Hmm. Cut meat. Huh. No. You're going to eat. I, I'm well, eat. yeah, we know. It's I'm not going to eat. Not gonna oh, you're eat. not going to eat dinner. He's cutting it out. He's, oh. He's cutting, He's out cutting dinner food out of, out of his diet. diet. There it is. I think we got, just act wow. like we got it right. Yes. Thumbs up. Give us, there it is. <laughs> okay. There it is. <laughs> okay, so he's, he's skipping meals and that's not healthy. No. Okay, thanks, Tom. Man, all right. Well, we got an old friend of the show on the uh, hotline right now that will, if you weren't confused before, Jamie, you'll be probably even more confused now. Uh, Al, are you on the line? Guess who? Oh, wow. Is this weird Al Pacino? Is this weird Al Pacino? Wow. Oh, my God. Wow. Where the hell have I been? Jesus Christ know. almighty. <laughs> 
Do you know you're calling up to a podcast? Huh? Do you know? I mean, do you are you familiar with? I guess you're familiar with this podcast because you he's been you, on. He's it. been on it. That's right. Several okay. times. Excuse I'm me. No, sorry. Wait a second. I'm calling about insurance, baby. <laughs> for for what? Like Give me a, the deal. Like a like a motorcycle bombers, or something, baby. Bombers. I drive an old El Camino. <laughs> I need insurance on it. Let me ask you a question. Where have I been? Why haven't I been on the show in the past three years? Huh? You had a guy on last week who played the first vampire killed in a Corey Feldman movie. And I'm persona non grata? Oof. <laughs> I believe yeah, he's referring to uh, Alex God. Winter there, right? Alex Winter. Oh. Have you ever worked with Alex Winter? Oh. I've never worked with Alex, but uh, he seems like a great guy, right? Hmm? <laughs> he was a great guest. Nice guy. Here's the question. Who do you got after me? Carrot Top? <laughs> Judy Tenuta? I don't, I mean. Uh, I should be back in the studio with you freaks. You should be here. I should be closing out the show. Al, where are, where are you now? Yeah. Should be can you, can you give us a little insight into what you're up to? That's a great question. I, I think I'm in Italy. I have no idea. I might be in a Carabas. Great ass! But, uh, <laughs> that's right. What are you doing? Uh, Judy uh, Tenuta's got a great ass. What are you doing out there? That's a good question. I woke <laughs> up, and um, I think I'm in Italy. I got a... I got a bowl of pasta, and a lot of people, I don't understand what they're saying to me. Well, why are you worried about... I think about, I'm doing a movie out here. Why are you worried about yeah. car insurance? I, like I said, I drive an El Camino. I need good, straightforward insurance. I don't want to mess around, all right? You brought your El Camino to Italy? Of course. Oh, Who okay. doesn't? Sorry, that was a dumb question. Who is this? Yeah. Who sorry. the hell are you? Sorry. <laughs> careful, careful. That's our Jamie guest, Loftus, Al. That's careful, Jamie Loftus. Weirdo. She's a television writer. She might she might have a good part for oh you. We might, might work together one day. Uh-huh. That would be great. I, you know, look, Hollywood is on the decline, as we all know. Uh, uh, hello? Sure. What was yes. the bad? Weirdo. I think he was waiting have for you, us to what was let the, him keep yeah. going there. What was the... Uh, yeah, sure. What was the... Last good movie you saw, Al? I haven't seen many good movies. I saw a great movie called Wonton Tom, The Dog Who Saves Hollywood. <laughs> and if you know about this, this is a great film. Directed by the venerable Michael Winner, who also did a movie that I was considered for, Death Wish. Oof. Oh, mm. the, the first oh, one. one. Wait, are you talking about oh. Wonton Tom, the 1976? <laughs> Correct. <laughs> oh, look at this guy. Doing all the time this. That's the last good film you saw? <laughs> that was probably the last good film that I saw. You know, I, I just read an article that uh, there's, not a, there's a good movie every once, every maybe 15 to 20 years. But I read an article that there, a bad movie is going to come out very, very soon. Do you know who's in it? <laughs> who? No, who? Jonah Hill. He's playing Jerry Garcia. Oh, that's Who right. thought this was a good idea? Well, I mean, are you a dead fan? Like a deadhead? Is that like... I don't know What's why the problem you're so with upset? Jonah Hill yeah. playing... He could, I think it's a great idea. I thought... It, I used to party with Phil Lesh back in the day, oh. but uh, I don't really remember those days. I just don't think that this is a good idea for a film. Like, it, I mean, could... Is that something you... Are you interested in playing that? I could, I could play, I could play, I could play a six-string Stratocaster if I, uh, if I got my druthers, you know. Uh-huh. Uh huh. But you know, it's all about remakes and biopics these days. They're making the. Uh, I was approached to play Grandpa Al Lewis in the new Monsters mm. film by uh, Robert A. Zombie. Oh. But uh, <laughs> I wanted to play Eddie. Have you seen any of Robert A. Zombie's boy. films that he's directed? <laughs> he's one of the greats, isn't he? He's good. He's one of the great directors of our time, you know? Yeah. And uh, I, was, I was approached to play Grandpa, but I said, no, I want to play Eddie. That's more my speed, you know what I mean? Uh-huh. So I decided I'm going to do another remake 
of a horror family, and I'm going to call them the Griers. Wow. Like, like the, the cheese? Monsters, but the, yeah. Oh, I see. Oh, okay. 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 Oh, it's a, just a little joke there, fellas. Yeah. <laughs> Al, are you ever going to retire from acting? I mean, when was the last film you've done? Never. Never. Who the hell would want me to retire? Maybe Bobby De Niro would. Right. Why? I just want to do... I want to do movies where I can show up for three days and then collect a paycheck and then stare at a wall for seven years. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, That's so on your I free time, do. you just stare at a wall? You don't play golf or do any leisure activities? What about the El Camino? No, that's for, that's for bozos. I like to stare at a blank wall. I don't have any, I don't have nothing hanging up in my house. Yeah, no what about car. the Camino? <laughs> Aren't you driving that, cruising the strip? Right. I stare at the road when I'm driving the Camino, pal. No, You're, I mean... Uh, what is wrong with you? <laughs> My goodness. Well, you, you, you brought but, up... Uh, you yeah, brought up I want to do a movie with... Yeah, it's about the Gruyers, and it's going to be uh, it's gonna be me, mm. Craig T. Nelson, uh-huh. Meredith Baxter Burney, great ass, by the way, <laughs> and uh, the ghost of Lee Strasberg. Wow. Heavy hitters. Okay, I, this doesn't seem like it's for your audience, all right? But uh, that's fine. Yeah. Hey, Al, how's Bev doing? Usually when you I... talk to Bev lately? Oh, Bev's great. I love Bev. Who is that? She yeah. makes me these little little hors d'oeuvres every now and then. I like grilled cheese sandwiches. Mm. Uh, she puts a little uh, olives in there and cuts the crust off. Mm. She's great. We go bowling every now and then. Even though you're you're divorced, weren't you married? Well, we weren't really married. We were uh, a common partnership, is what I like to call it in Hollywood. You know. But you keep it on. Teresa good terms. Russell and I had. That's right. You know, there there are a few broads out there that I was, <laughs> I was involved with, but never never married. Huh. That's for. That's for the bozos, you know. Marriage is for the birds. Are you uh, are you going to be spending any time with uh, Guy over the, this holiday? Uh, you know your buddy Guy Fieri. A guy? Like, is he going to? Is he going to? Oh, you're friends with Guy. Oh, yeah. Guy. Wow, mm-hmm. nice. Is he cooking you a nice turkey? This guy is. Oh my God, he likes to he likes to bake a turkey in the oven uh-huh. Uh-huh. for 17 hours until it's like a jerky. That's how I like my turkey. I like jerky turkey. Jerky turkey. You know what I mean? Come on, Vic. Give me something. Yeah, that's. I mean, that sounds good. Do you like the mashed potatoes? What, like, why don't you just list, list off your dream uh, dinner? I, I fill my uh, pockets with saran wrap, mm-hmm. and then I put mm-hmm. leftovers in there so I can eat it in the bathroom so I don't have to uh, embarrass myself. Yeah. I just pick at the table, though. You know what I mean? You just pick. Is it embarrassing how you eat? You know who doesn't pick at the table? Jonah Hill. He doesn't pick at the table at all. <laughs> My God. <laughs> hey, let me ask you a question. You think they're going to use a Rolling Stone song in the trailer for this movie? <laughs> now, that's a great question. That's a great question. That's what I wonder. Marty Scorsese loves the Stones. Why is he doing a Grateful Dead pick? Oof, pass. Wow. <laughs> Did they come to you for this one, Al? Did they offer you a part? They did, and that's why I'm a, a little bit bitter about it. It sounds like you, you know? can't get no satisfaction. How is that a party? Am I... <laughs> I think you'd be a good Bill Kreitzman. Ooh, that's a good one. <laughs> or what's I'm going to contact my. Uh, I'm going to contact Rick Nasita about <laughs> that one. You could see him you know, doing a pig pen. I was though. at a party with. Uh, <laughs> I was at a party with uh, uh, Ken Sunshine, who's a good friend of mine. And I remember Jonah Hill starts singing along with Swoozie Kurtz. And I was like, my God, these people suck. They, have no, they can't carry a tune to save the goddamn lives. Mm-hmm. It, it sounds like you have something against Jonah Hill. Yeah, what's, what's, what's your yeah. beef with what's Jonah Hill? What's going on there? I don't want to talk about it, all oh. right? Jeez. <laughs> Not a fan. Wow. <laughs> Did he take a part of yours or something like one time? No, he did not. Hmm. Okay. Absolutely you, not. Do you know him like personally? Do you know him personally, or just met him in passing? Or I met him once at uh, getting a hot dog over at Pink's. <laughs> <laughs> and 
And uh, okay. yeah, I stood in line with him for about three hours. It was awful. Wow. Uh, he could not carry a tune. <laughs> he was singing in line? Fuck with better harmony. <laughs> what song was he What's singing that? in the line of pinks? Oh, my God. He was doing something from Jesus Christ Superstar. Oh, my God. Singing like it was his last goddamn night on earth. <laughs> I guess I wouldn't like him either. Why am I in the... How come... I want to know why I'm not in the studio with I mean, you fools. We've got open huh? chairs here, uh, yeah. Weird Al, if you want to come on down here. I don't know. I, yeah, Al, we'd I'll love be to there have you back. I'll be there hours when the yeah. show's just getting started. Oh, well, you got ca- okay. to catch a flight, too, from Italy, so... Right. Maybe next, maybe next marathon we'll have you sit in. Oh, that's right. I'm in Italy. I'm sorry. I insulted you. <laughs> well, Al, you know, did you uh, did you have any other jokes you uh, wrote down that you wanted to get to? Talk you about... think I write this shit? <laughs> <laughs> right off the head. Buddy. Talk about queuing him up. <laughs> right off the dome. <laughs> what's sorry. Why what's... is Matt in such a bad mood all the time? That's what I want. <laughs> You're, no, you're not the first done. Zoomer to ask that question. <laughs> that's that's a you were definitely a hothead today. Oh, right. Don Simpson and Matt, they remind me a lot of each other. Don, Don Simpson, Simpson and Matt yeah, were both very successful guys. <laughs> very successful. Don very Simpson, successful. he wrote the Simpsons, yeah. right? Is that the guy? No, he um He did a few of those. He movies. was a Hollywood producer yeah, in the eighties. There was a movie with him called What's that? I'm sorry. Well, I was <laughs> explaining to Matt who Don Simpson is. He he worked with um who's that guy you're looking at there? That's Don Simpson. Can oh you get a JPEG of him up? Of course. Dude, you gotta read his book. Uh there's a book oh, about his life. Oh, he is just a raging Whoa. the Don. Okay. He, he did uh Rage of Hulk. It is a fantastic Beverly book. Hills he Cop was where he right. kinda got his start. Okay. But he just had he just had cocaine flowing oh. through his veins for a long time and he was a just a wild character. Mm-hmm. Is he a director a or wow. producer? Just the producer. Not okay. Producer. Yeah. Producer, baby. Don Simpson. Simpson Bruckheimer. Look yeah, Bruckheimer. Oh, he worked okay. he did movies with Bruckheimer. So you had a wild you had a wild night out with him one time or what? <laughs> Al, did we lose yeah. you? Screeching Holt Vig. There it goes again. Oh my god. Oh, did we disconnect? <laughs> yeah. What's going on? Well, it's a, I mean, maybe there's the storms in Italy. Italy or something. You know, yeah. it's like uh, there's a lot of rain. Man, that guy, the Don wow. Simpson's forehead uh, looks rigid. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> very rigid. I like oh, I think that was on our side oh, again. I think no. Oh, I, we Are lost. We we're, I liked it. We're down. I know. Oh, Al's a good friend shit. of the show. Matt, I Man. think the show is down. The whole show? Well, yeah, I'm looking at the stream. It's yeah. stuck. It's it's. It's oh, really there, well, I oh mean, no. it could be just our just the one internet. Let's Tech see. guys, Zoom crashed. Yeah, no, <sighs> but we're, we're still in the same stream. We're streaming. Yeah. Okay. We lost Zoom. We lost. <gasps> okay. Okay, we'll be all right. No worries. And uh, is Hotline coming back up? It seems like we lost Al. We lost Al. Who is Al? Al's a good friend of the show. He seems like a sweetheart. He's a great guy. Mm. Okay. Uh, wh- oh, I heard it disconnect. I heard the, the beeping. Okay, thanks. And um, I think the Wi-Fi is down if you want the truth. Yeah, from what I mean, I'm gathering. Is, yeah, I had like a spectrum outage when I left my apartment earlier. I think that there's been... Oh, okay. okay. We have two... What goes on is we have two <clears throat> internet lines. Two, wow. One sending yeah, the show, and then another fancy. one that runs all of our computers and the Hothead hotline and that stuff, and it sounds like the uh, Zoom and Hothead mm. is down, unfortunately. Mm-hmm. So, mm-hmm. And Al- is Allison here yet? Mm-hmm. Can we talk to Fart Simpson? Yeah, is Fart on? Well, we can't Ooh. talk to anyone because the Zoom just got oh. uh. mm. Yeah, I think mm. we're just disconnected. Mm. Um, is Sarah, did Sarah arrive yet? Okay. Mm. Right. So are we off right now? No, we're, we're are broadcasting. We, still live? Oh, we're we are. Just... Okay, well. <clears throat> so, what do you feel like talking about? Yeah, what do you guys want to do? Hmm. 
Jamie, tell us about yeah. uh, that uh, interesting stuff you were talking about. Can we play a game or something? Yeah, Ooh. sure. <gasps> I'm kind of in a I'll be right coma back. if you want the truth. Yeah, I am Get too. Get my brain back yeah. in the game. You kind of yeah. what? Need, eat, eat too much. Just post lunch. You need you know. to be stimulated. Oh, yeah. Just a little post lunch deal. Yeah. Speaking yeah, of, yeah, I'll yeah. be right back. Okay. Oh, Matt's leaving. I'm out of here. He's leaving. I'm oh, good. It'll be like a lot more levity. Mm, in yes. The room. That's good. You know? <laughs> Um, let's see. Let's see what we got here. Doug, what'd you have for lunch? We had sage. Um, do you know sage? Yeah. We ordered from sage. That's nice. And I got a cauliflower buffalo pizza. You had a whole pizza? I ate the whole pizza. That's oh, you why ate the whole thing. I didn't no really. wonder you're wow. tired. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's a very They're thin that, crust. Yeah. But, okay. And it's backing. But, you know, it's off. but and then the cauliflower is going to give you a lot of fullness and cauliflower. You didn't think right? that one through. Yeah. <sighs> well, Please. if I'm gonna order from Sage, I gotta get the thing I like. You gotta get the best. That's true. Yeah. Gotta get That's the best true. item. <sighs> What'd you have for lunch? I had Easy Mac at my oh. house. <laughs> <laughs> easy. I had an Easy Mac How, at my is house. Is that easier than regular Mac? Just uh, microwave it or something? Yeah, you you microwave it and the por- it's all portioned out for you. I'm not. G- I like. Uh, I, I I eat whatever is in front of me, and so I need it. Pre-portioned stuff oh. works for me better. Like a otherwise you'll just like eat the whole damn thing. That's, I'll eat the whole box. I mean that's what I, I do. That, yeah. I, that's why I ate the whole yeah. pizza. You ate the whole pizza. I would have eaten the whole box, and then I would have. Um, I would have been tired when I got here. But I had a perfectly uh, orchestrated. Uh, bowl of mac and cheese. Wow. And do, you, do you put any, anything in your mac and cheese? Yeah, I put barbecue sauce in it. Mm. Barbe- barbecue sauce? Really? I put, I put Sweet Baby Ray's barbecue wow. sauce in my Easy Mac. Yeah. My grandmother would put like, uh, I think tomato sauce on it. You ever have that? It's, no. it's I don't really it care good? for it. I don't it's care for it. It's like soup? It, yeah, it's like soupy. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's soupy and she'd just open up the can you know, on it. Sweet Baby Ray's barbecue sauce, though. That's, that's good never, in the Easy Mac. I would have never thought of that. I feel like recently I put, um, I do like fake oh. mac and cheese that has like mm. plant-based cashew oh, cheese, but I also oh. add, I think I put like mushrooms in it, and like I like to augment my mac and cheese with other stuff, so it's not just a one-note mm-hmm. right. bite. Yeah. I'll even that put it on like advanced. a piece of toast or something. Oh, really? I go crazy. Ooh. I was going to say you should you ever try chips. It. I'll use it as yeah. salsa. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. And uh, get some crunch. I like to get a little crunch involved. Interesting. And then it's a dip. Well, I was going to say yeah, you should bake it, and then you keep, you know, bake it for a while with the, with the foil on it, and then take it off, brown the top. Have you ever been to Van mm. Llewellyn's Ice Cream? No. No? <laughs> what? It um, sounds nice. You know, it's one of these nicer ice cream. That sounds. You know, there's yeah. like ice cream places everywhere in LA mm-hmm. now. Yeah, and then it's like the flavors sound like candles. Yeah, the flavors are crazy. Yeah. This one has a mac and cheese flavored ice cream. Did you try it? I haven't tried it. That sounds. Mm. Uh, that sounds like it's trying to trick me into wanting it, and probably right. isn't actually very right. good. I don't. I mean, at that point, you it's know, like. Is that what it's called? It. Yeah. Um, if I'm putting the mac and cheese in the oven, then I feel like at that the point I've back. undermined the Easy Mac. Right. I've had the ones at when you get mac and cheese at mm-hmm. the um, the restaurant and they like bake it. That's good. And you know, to be honest, with all due respect, Vic, mm-hmm. just give me the the crappy stuff from a box. You yeah. Know? Wow. I get, like it to I be. Get it. I get it. Yeah, <laughs> gonna you do get all it. these fancy cheeses. You want the Velveeta style. Yeah, like, you want that Velveeta yeah. crappy but, stuff. I will say Trader Joe's does have like frozen mac and cheese, and you just microwave it. It's uh, it's insanely it's good. good. It's very good. Yeah. I don't Who? Know how they're doing Trader that Joe's. Thing. It's really good. Mm. Mm-hmm. This is exciting. Mm-hmm. This is exciting <laughs> stuff. Tim is probably watching, <laughs> I know. just like ah, freaking out right what? now. Well, we do thinking. have a very cool guest coming in in a minute. We're gonna get her set up. Sarah from Sela. Hmm. <gasps> and Sela, are you familiar, Jamie? Yeah, I love Sela. Oh, great! Mm-hmm. This is great. We ne- we didn't really discuss this in advance, but um, Sela <clears throat> is a great uh, nonprofit organization out here in LA, mm-hmm. and uh, they are we, they're actually uh, our big holiday show on the 16th is uh, a benefit for Sela. So we wanted to have somebody come in and talk about it. And um, now I need to vamp more because I thought you, she'd be. Thought it's she'd a neighborhood. Be <laughs> Oh wait, homeless are we still... coalition. Oh, I thought you were gonna start talking about ice cream again. <laughs> oh, let's get back. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what's your go-to scoop? 
was my go-to scoop. <laughs> I don't. I I like black raspberry. Ooh, that's a rare flavor. Yeah, really? it's good. It's very I, New England flavor. What about flavor. pistachio? Is delicious. guys, are we back up on Zoom yet? <laughs> Pistachio is a great. It's, yeah, you into it? I yeah. love it. Oh, good, good. And you know what I do? I've been getting into pistachios. They have them what? at the bins that, that are oh, already just shelled. Nuts. Oh, oh, shelled, I bought some today actually. Shelled pistachios. Yeah, there's wow. some in there. Oh. And um, I'll put that in, in the ice cream. In ice cream, I'll put that Whoa, in everything. Wow. Unhinged. I'll put. I forgot where yeah. I put it. Yeah, I some made kind, a smoothie yeah. last night, and I just put pistachios in there. Oh. And it was wild. I want that. Got to admit. Yeah. He's out of control. Yeah, <laughs> He's out of control. All. It's incredible. Nuts Do we want to um, give Mr. Social another chance with yes, his fake ad? Yes, get, him, get yeah. him in here. Get him in here. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll get my, I'll oh, tell you my down. flavors. What's your flavors? Well, classic chocolate. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Pretty much chocolate. Ch- chocolate fudge. Mm-hmm. I am, I and, am. You uh, guys got to just log chip, in. I like mint chip. Mint chip is good, yeah. But when I get ice cream, mm. I just like to do it right. I got to get two scoops. You do two? Okay. So uh, you and I always have home. to say, can you put the, the better flavor on the bottom oh, of the one you, I want to finish with? Oh, I'll start light with wow. the mint chip on top, then I lick down, I've, and then I've, I'm at the chocolate fudge brownie. I've honestly never thought of getting two different flavors in the same cone. I've really? Never, I've never thought that was even an option. That's... Kind of wild. Yeah, I'm gonna. St- yeah. I mean, you gotta start living. I know. Dude, live you sheltered. Well, that's pretty cool. Um, wait, wait. So, what would the bottom flavor normally be? Like, what's the? Yeah. The, what do you work? Oh, then I. It's, and then, I. I could, you know, it, it varies from my what mood I'm in, but typically mm-hmm. it's the most chocolatey thing they have. Mm-hmm. Chocolate fudge brownie. That's the bottom layer, is and a, then is if they have that. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Like Van Llewellyn happens to have that. Mm. Van Llewellyn, like that's cashew milk. Right. That sounds oh. too nice. That sounds too nice too good. to be an ice cream place. Hi. Right. Hi, Sarah. Sarah. This is Sarah the from Sela. Welcome to the show. Have a seat. Get comfortable. Luke's going to plug in your Sound headphones. off in the comments and what flavors you like. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Someone's saying Rocky Road. What is that? Rocky God. Road. What is in? That's from the '80s. It's like oh. we don't need that flavor. You never heard okay. of Rocky Road? No, it's like I just don't know what I've heard it's of it. A bizarre but I don't know what one. It's, it's, uh, it's a mix of stuff. I think it's like chocolate, but then there's like marshmallow. It's marshmallows, yeah, marshmallows, peanuts, peanuts oh. and oh. chocolate. That's too much. Yeah, and it's a fudge swirl, right? Hard pass. Mm-hmm. And there's yeah. peanut. Yeah, peanuts. I think he's. Just <laughs> you have any ice there. cream talk, Sarah? Yeah. yeah. No, but I'm with you. Hard pass. We could go another. Is her mic up? What's going on? Are you doing hard pass on Rocky Road too? Yeah, it's disgusting. Wow. Thank you. I agree. Okay, I hope that commenter feels like I'll go shit right now. Hard pass <laughs> on the ice cream and on the actual roadway. Give me a nice paved yeah, road. Right. <laughs> you don't want to be bumping around. So Sarah is here from Sela. <laughs> Hi Sarah. And Sela is a, you want to tell us a little How about many people have Sela? left in the yeah, last five minutes? What's that? <laughs> Yeah, sure. I can tell you a little bit about okay, Sela. We're talking loose tracks. Yeah. We're talking chocolate mint chip. Thank you. Ooh, we're loose tracks. Well, I'm about to bring. Or we could talk about ice cream. No, we'll talk about. <laughs> no. I'm sorry. I'm I have had enough. Ice cream I said talk sound off in the comments, and they're doing. What, it, I mean, we're what, back. If you're about to have an ice cream cone, what are you gonna have? Mm. What kind of flavor. Oh, could we post made some ice cream for the yes. end of the show, Matt? Banana mm. split. Oh, you know, yeah. we should get a pie from uh, an ice cream pie from uh, Magpies. Whoa. There we go. Oh, there so we go. Good. Yeah. I feel like I have like an unfortunately Proustian connection to like Dairy Queen. Oh, oh it's terrible. Okay. But remember being like a little kid mm-hmm. and getting chocolate chip cookie dough at Dairy Queen? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Definitely. Get a blizzard. Yes. Yeah, right. And when they dip it. Oh, they do yeah. The thing, yeah. They yeah. Dip it. Do they still yeah. do that? I have no hot, idea. hot dipping and hot fudge. Thanks. You don't like my late night sound? <laughs> <laughs> it's probably for camera reasons. Oh, that yeah. <laughs> Thanks. Do you want me to tell you about Sela? Yes, okay. we want to yeah. hear all okay, about so it. And, uh, yeah, let's yeah let's set the uh, Sarah. You work with Sela, a neighborhood homeless coalition, yes. and yes, tell us more. It's um, definitely a shift in conversation from ice cream. So sorry about that. But uh, so Sela okay. is a uh, solutions-oriented, volunteer-led community outreach organization, which is a mouthful. And we work with our unhoused neighbors to connect them with things like housing, other resources that they need. Um, Yeah, it was founded in 2017 by a core group of people who were seeing how Los Angeles's 
housing solutions were pretty disparate and that there just needed to be sort of an on the ground, less clinical facilitation role. And so we got to know all the different agencies that were working with our neighbors. We got to connect our neighbors with them and we just have sort of served in that role ever since. So LA has a huge homeless problem, obviously. Yeah. Yeah. It's massive. Can you give us some bullet points on like <clears throat> ways to solve it or <laughs> sure, I'll get, <laughs> work towards oh, you guys that? Want to fix know? it. Yeah. yeah. Uh, fix it. Yeah. Is there an easy... Like three to four steps. It doesn't sound easy, but it's so multifaceted. It's, no one's ever asked before. What's your dream? Ah. What's your dream way of cl- fixing it? <laughs> Universal basic income, and <laughs> mm-hmm. um, but I think that uh, so yeah, LA does have a massive population. The last count uh, in twenty twenty was sixty six thousand people were either in shelters in their cars or on the streets, um, and that's just in LA County. It doesn't count like anything else around. Um, which is devastating, obviously. Uh, about 9,000 people have gone through Project Room Key. I don't know if you guys know what that is, but mm-hmm. during COVID, um, the city decided to start offering up hotel rooms to people for them to stay in. And so about 9,000 people have gone through that program, which has been great, but it's a temporary solution. So um, I think everything that we see, all the shelter programs, everything are all temporary. Like they're all temporary solutions. And I would love to see a more permanent one where it's like, everyone having the dignity of a home, uh, mm. what that looks like, a massive influx of money, <laughs> I mm. suppose. Um, so yeah, I think uh, SELA definitely um, ro- serves in a role of both connecting people with those resources, but also advocating for this kind of thinking as well. It's really, really easy in LA to walk around and just sort of blindly walk by the people that we our neighbors and Sila really, really encourages sort of a mindset of um, individuality and humanity, which I really appreciate. Um, you, I mean, uh, I assume we're familiar with the Echo Lake Park uh, shutdown where they fenced it off. And yeah. Like what, what was going on there? Why, like? <laughs> um, yeah, there was not a lot of dignity going on there. I think that um, people have a tendency to. I don't know. I'm, we can get into like my personal philosophy, mm. but um, I think people can only express so much empathy before it just starts to hurt and yeah. we just like shut off. It's where gallows humor comes from, mm. um, which I love gallows humor. I think it's great. I work in international development for an organization called The Hunger Project. If we couldn't find some levity, I would never do any smiling in my life. Um, but you can't sort of like process the trauma of an unlived or an unhoused person, like what they're going through every single day when you're trying to like look at the turtles and ride in your little swan paddle boat. I don't want yeah. to diminish those. Those are fun. But yeah, but I, no, I get it. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. that's what it was. I think people just sort of reached their max of empathy, especially during COVID. Like we're all maxed out, man. So like it would make sense that they're like, I just can't look at, I can't look at it anymore. Yeah. That was so nuts to me where it was like just a city councilman directly pandering to homeowners associations that mm-hmm. were just like, I don't know, just, so so much of what's been going on seems like it's just um, at- attacking the unhoused based on visible homelessness and just like intentionally shuffling people around and not giving any permanent solutions and seeing it happen yeah. on that scale. And still yeah. now, like, I have to imagine it, if you're just visiting Echo Park Lake, it's very confusing of like, why is this whole place yeah. just there's no way to get out. There's like yeah. one entrance and one exit and it's this massive park and it's like. I don't know. Does it permanently have a fence around it now? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. God. Yeah. Really? Permanently? Well, I don't know if it's permanent, but it's that definitely like, yeah. it's been there. Probably I accidentally year. got stuck in there last weekend <laughs> oh, because it was like, I thought I was going to just walk a few blocks and then get, but you can't. Like, yeah. you have to walk the entire park once you're in because it's like the city councilman in that area is so opposed to yeah. um, unhoused people camping there, which is like ridiculous. It's and, public land. And yeah. like, what, like, what are they, people expect? them to do i mean the, the the cost of homes here is like insane like what mm-hmm. yeah like, like and you know and I, I don't know just like what what can be done about that like like bringing the home prices down or building more <laughs> yeah homes? What, how do you what would be a like a, what would be a, a step up yeah, from step. like this temporary like hotel room situation yeah um well i'm i think the step up is just as i said sort of reallocating resources to this like i think right now there's a vote happening to increase the police department budget by like 213 million dollars at the exact same time in a different room they're trying to pass a law to make homelessness illegal Mm -hmm. so i think it's just sort of redistributing how we understand those 
where where we're allocating those resources. It doesn't necessarily have to come from the PD, but I think that that would be the first thing. And all of that obviously comes down to the most boring answer, which is vote for people who have your interests at mind. Yeah, but I guess my <laughs> question is: say there's bu- there is funding and all that. Oh, like unlimited. Like how how you know for 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 homeless, like what would be, um, how would that be used? If, if like would there be like a building? made that you know like yeah affordable housing like, or, like, yeah like mm-hmm. yeah there are actually a couple of really cool affordable housing projects here in mm-hmm. los angeles i don't know if you guys have seen them but um yeah they have affordable housing uh that would be a huge thing because a lot of people are just housing insecure but because as you said it's so expensive to live here i think they said in a recent meeting that like f- you have to have a median income of forty five thousand dollars just to afford a studio ap- apartment which is like <laughs> just not how most of the right. population lives. Right. Um, so uh, affordable housing would be one really good answer because, again, you're reaching those people who don't have very much in the way of resources. And um, and then you also just need f- free housing options that come coupled with care facilities. So you've got like mental health crises mm-hmm. happening. You've got mm-hmm. a lot of addiction that is often cropping up as a coping mechanism. So you sort of have to have this like um, all-inclusive health care home solution and if we could just create a bunch of those as well as in tandem with destigmatizing poverty which is a huge problem like we as i think any job you apply to they're like you must have a four-year degree or yeah. you have to in order to even get a job or a driver's license you have to have a permanent residence mm-hmm. right which is right. like oh my gosh such a barrier so if we could destigmatize along with actually just getting people housed it would both like fix the sort of reputational problem as well as instill a lot of dignity in the people who are unhoused because really having someone believe in you goes so far. Yeah. Like my, my day job is, um, it's like I said, with an organization called the hunger project and it's a community led development model, which is basically like the solutions to something huge, like world hunger, aren't going to come from Elon Musk tweeting and being like, I've got $6 billion, bro. Like they're <laughs> going to come from people in the community living in hunger who are have the solutions they just don't have the connections to the resources so the same thing that's what drew me to CELA was that same model and and how I think we could find a solution which is if you show people that you believe in them and that they are worth having like dignity and agency they will do a lot of the work themselves so when you're asking like how do we fix it we just invest in people Mm -hmm. if we just invested in people you don't have to think about the infrastructure because they will find ways to invest in themselves Mm -hmm. obviously there have to be safety nets for people who are going through other crises but like yeah, I mean, it's it seems so simple to be like, oh, just think of people as people. That would help a lot, right. but it would actually go a long way. Yeah. yeah. And I'm so glad that SEAL exists because it seems like it is patching over this huge issue that um, city government is not handling while we're, like, giving more money to cops who are mistreating the unhoused in this yeah. insane carceral way. SEAL rocks. Yeah, have mm-hmm. you done any volunteer work with us? Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's awesome. That's fun. That's cool. Do where do you reach? Do you do Silver Lake? Yeah, I go to uh, the Silver Lake Church sometimes. That's awesome. Well, then yeah. I've definitely That's seen fun. you there. I've been. I've maybe. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Cool. All right. So. Cool. Um, yeah. Yeah. And uh, so this is. Kind of, oh, go sorry, ahead. Go ahead. No, go ahead. Go ahead. Well, <clears> I <throat> I don't know. I don't want to spring this on you exactly, but it's kind of interesting. One of our regulars said he was actually homeless for a while, and lived oh. in a ch- in a. Uh, 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 some sort of house, a shelter, and it helped mm-hmm. him get it off his feet. Mm-hmm. Do we want to talk to him? Sure. On his feet. Sure. Get on his feet. Off yes. his feet. Get, <laughs> get off his feet. <laughs> Hello? We usually hey. uh, ah. yell at Chase and tease <coughs> yeah. him and uh, <laughs> rag on him. I never is... rag on Chase. No. <laughs> good we background. Yeah. Yeah. Chase back. is a very good friend of the show. Yeah, so... Um, a couple of years ago, it was uh, 2019, I was homeless and had nowhere to go. And I found this place in Nashville called a uh, Safe Haven Shelter. Mm-hmm. And I lived uh, there for six months with my daughter. And they helped me get a house. They helped me get a job. Yeah. So, yeah, it was awesome. Did you like, have a, it, 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 oh, Sorry, can I ask a question? It was, it was nothing like, you know, you imagine what a homeless shelter is. And it was nothing like that at all. Can you do, can you describe? I mean, uh, well, what, what okay, it was first like? off, first off, being a father with a child, 
mm-hmm. it was hard to find somewhere because most places, like one of the places said, can you give your daughter to a family member? And you could mm-hmm. go to a men's homeless shelter. And I was like, hell no, I can't just give my daughter to someone else. Right. So I found this place that took in families and uh, yeah, it was really nice. They like provided dinner. They gave you a room. They talked with you every day through your like mental health problems. Mm-hmm. They helped you set up a job. It was cool. Did you have a dedicated caseworker or was it just uh, someone assigned yeah. to the, Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. They assign you each family gets assigned someone. That's huge. That's massive. That's such a cool yeah. program. Yeah, it was great. Congratulations. Yeah, I mean, yeah that's awesome. I was at at that time I had nothing I had no belongings. I had no car. I had zero money, nothing. And uh, my friend, uh, his grandfather died, so his he sold me his grandfather's car for two hundred dollars and that helped me get a job. Nice. So it's just like everything came together and then the pandemic hit. <laughs> like right as it, I, I got my house in October of 2019 and I worked until March 2020 mm. wow. that was crazy how's your daughter doing <laughs> oh she's great yeah I mean I don't I feel like there was other kids there so I feel like she wasn't as affected yeah oh, that's like so it was nice. just kind of like a play place for her that's awesome so there's like yeah. a lot of community-based activities that go on there too Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They would have, uh, like, every day somebody would come in, like, you know, reading day or go outside day, play. But yeah, it was it was a great place. So Safe Haven in Nashville, look them up. Yeah. Excellent. Shout out. Thanks That's for cool. sharing that. Awesome. Yeah, thank you. Thank you so much. No problem. I wish we had more programs like that here. That's so awesome. So that's exactly, I mean, that's a perfect example. And thank you so much for sharing that. Cause I know that again, like we've talked about stigma, but it's massive to just say, yeah, you went into a program that supported you and then you were able to get a job and begin the process of supporting yourself. So, um, as much as possible. So thank you so much for sharing that. That was awesome. So do you want to, Take some you want to hang out, yeah, Sarah, and bit? chat with her, and just hang out and if it's useful, goof around. Yeah. Sure, it's always useful to goof around. <laughs> yeah, oh, no, ice cream then, flavors. Yeah, yeah, uh, ice oh cream yeah, flavors. so yeah, let's start back. I, I, to I, I'm, I was, yeah. was going to say calling that, a moratorium on. But like, ice cream the, our, our remind everybody that the the live show we're doing in December. Yes, benefits. Fun, benefits. Uh, yeah. So. So buy your tickets. So buy your ticket and donate. December 23rd at the Regent. Is, that, is it 23rd? Or? December 16th. 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 Yeah. Yes. Right. December, it's so December 25th I know at noon. Are. Right. Yeah. Damn it. It's not a problem. Yeah, the tickets or sales are bad. Uh-huh. Uh, yeah. Devin, are you there? What's going on? Devin has, Devin is another regular, speaking of regulars wow. like Chase, and he has fun game for us if he can oh, yes. turn his computer on. Oh. His camera, I mean. What's going on, Devin? Okay, okay. Hello? Oh, yeah. Hey. What's up, man? Hey. There he is. <laughs> one, of the, one of the best Zoomers of all yes. time. Whoa. If not one of the best, the best. The best. Hey, you guys. This has been a real fun marathon. You know, it's been a, it's been a journey today. Well, that's good to hear. Yeah. I, I was uh, pretty nervous at the outset here, but I think I think we're we're getting through it. You know. What makes you nervous? You got all the oh, support. what doesn't make me nervous? The world. <laughs> <laughs> this is very nerve wracking. The whole, <clears throat> the whole Patreon community is rooting for you. Well, thank now, you. Here's the thing, Matt. I, I sent you something that it's. I sent it in the email. My my son made this great animation. Oh, you want me to play Patreon. something? Is that what's going on? Oh. It's a very short animation. I, I emailed it to you. Okay. It's it's in the effort of getting all the Patreons we're looking for today. Gotcha. Wow. For let the me, community. Uh, wonderful. Download. And so do you want to start with this as the idea? This is like your intro? I would love to. Okay. Hold on this is my 10-year-old boy. All right, give me one gifted. sec, Tom. I'm going to set oh, this so up. Excited. <gasps> Whoa. Okay. Oh, hold on. Brand new show. Oh, wait a minute. What? All right, here we go. Wow. It's a, it's a, it's in from the tundra. Can, this December, uh, you want to mute for a, a second, brand new Devin? show for patrons only. Lo- Tuning in from the tundra. Oh. A show for patrons only this December. Doppled songers with the banjo boy. Of course, wouldn't be a show without him. That's all for today. Make sure, if you're not a patron, to be one, because you're not going to want to miss this.
Wow. So you are wow. going to do the show. Wow, it's happening. It's huh? happening. That's my guy. That's it's... my guy right there. Wow. Well, this is exciting. He, he's excited about the community, you know? That's the cool. He knows what's up. How old is he? He's 10. And he's making these animations already. I, I, I'm excited about it. And that's his dog, Peanut. Oh, man. And uh, anyway, yes, we're, you know, Matt and I, Matt's been very patient with me, everybody. Uh, well, see, that's, see, at least one see? at least one person gets some uh, patience. <laughs> that's that's nice. Ooh. I'm a nice man. I, it's a lot. Listen, everyone should understand Matt has a lot on his plate today. Yes. Having to carry, <laughs> that's right. Carry an eight Thank hour you. Get, a, get a bigger plate. Thanks, you know? Do you have any doppelsongers for us today? I do. Yeah, let's get into it. I do. So basically the, the concept of the show is this. And uh, it's basically, it's not about songs that are ripoffs. I don't, I don't want people to approach it like that. It's not ripoffs. It's about the primordial soup, right? The collective okay. subconscious. All right. So these are songs that existed. So episode one, for instance, is a comparison between Donna Summer, Need Your Love, right? Uh -huh. Need Your Love. Love, or, and yeah. cheap trick right around the same era that goes need you love, need you love, oh. do you understand like yeah it's these or i songs feel love i feel love right is, or, there is, you go yeah, sorry yeah. I, no, that's okay. I feel love, I feel love I feel, but, yeah and then and then cheap trick may have like heard this song on the radio and like yeah i'm gonna write a song today and then that's in the back of their head and we and we dig deep i have i have and, guests we dig deep into wonderful why that is mm -hmm. and it also kind of digs into the whole like you know the disco sucks era which yeah. i don't agree with but well, it's lay some on us Devin. Yeah. do you have any here all right so today i have i have this just an example of what the show Whoa. is wow all right just happens ready? To have a guitar i was like i didn't there. see an <laughs> instrument coming into frame yeah, it's always always right there I'm straight up. I'm in. I'm in a restaurant in rural Minnesota right now, and I'm talking what? to Tom. Are you serious? Wow. What? Free show. It's Can you, we're gonna need you to pan <laughs> around to just to give us a free. view at some point. Yeah. What's everyone uh, up to? What's oh my God! You are. Oh my God. No way. It's I'm thinking. I'm how can you get away with that? Well, he's empty. there's no one in there except him. Wow, this is cool. No, there's people, there's Maybe they're not there because he is in there. The staff is about I to got, be so I got to sneak out. You're a local but celebrity. I, they're I, like, uh, yeah, they're, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is why I love you guys. Okay, so I'm, it's gonna be a little bit of the humble game, right? So we're, I'm gonna give you a little hint, but these are two songs that are connected. Okay, so it's like. <laughs> Here it comes. I know it. Can I say it? Yeah, tell me. Are, are those two songs? That's one song. So that's okay. one song. Yeah, I know what I that know is. That one. Do you want me to save it for the. There's no, way, no, no. Tell me what... Okay, that is what? When the Bullet Hits the Bone by. Oh my God! What are they called? Uh, radar? No, Radar Gold, Love is their other song. They're called. Earring. What are they called? Golden Earring. Golden Earring. Golden there Earring. There it is. Wow, you guys are so Doug. Good. Oh my God. All right, now here's the real I'm challenge, though. Can you guess the <laughs> dog song? Can you guess the this is doppelsanger? music nerd stuff. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> no, that's the whole point of the show. Yeah. Yeah. Can you guess the doppelsanger? Right. So let me do. Let me give you a hear. Help! I'm stepping in twi the twilight zone. Places a madhouse feel like being cloned. My beacon's been moved under a moon and star. Where am I gone? When I gone too far? When I'm wrong gone? When a bullet meets a bone. Okay. That's the original. Yeah. That's the original. But does anybody know what the doppelsanger might be? Because it's a well-known name. Which I mean, that whole melody is is doodle, 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 similar. Doodle, doodle, doodle. Or is check it, it just, out. Mm -hmm. Is it just the last part? I'm trying to introduce the idea of doppelsangers, and this is, this is a big one for me. Okay. 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 Hold on. Now, wait a second. It's okay. I crapped out on the melody, but it's Bruce Springsteen. Bruce Springsteen oh. has a song. There's a song, Outside of the Rain, The Driving Snow, 
I can hear the wild, wild wind blowing. Turn out the light, bolt the door. I ain't going out there no. See, okay, oh, I didn't okay. develop it. Oh. Yeah, we you, you don't. Guys, we don't. I mean, Tim's the uh, the the boss man. You know, yeah, we're not the boss heads so, here. <laughs> what is, I don't unless know. Unless you guys are boss heads. Much. Yeah. You guys, you guys is, that, boss? is that more of a deep cut? Is that or is that a single? <laughs> or is that a hit? Is it's that a, kind of a sing. It's off darkness on darkness on the edge of town. Tim's gonna scold us for not knowing this. Wow. Yeah, I, I'm I gonna. I'm scolded because I couldn't pull it off. Oh no, I I love this idea. All right, I'm gonna check the chat. Hey Devin, is it true that you're on a desktop computer that you took into that restaurant? Like an old uh, no 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 this is I, I have a PC. phone and a weird budget microphone from Walmart. Let's play something, Devin. I got a guitar. Here. Dueling guitars. Okay. What do you want to play? Oh, I, <laughs> are they telling you, you, you know can't dueling sing? banjos? No singing allowed. Do you? Do you you're, can I uh, introduce you to the to the gang? This is uh, a bartender here. Hi. Hi. <laughs> this how, do you, is a, how do you feel? How do you feel about this guy? You're on a show. Yeah, this <laughs> is a podcast. And, now you're on a show. Uh, now you're on. Get a get a signed release, Devin. Wow. I was just gonna ask about consent rules. Here. I don't want to get anybody in trouble. But uh, yes, they're very sweet. This is uh, oh, Purim, Minnesota. Being very nice. I just wanted to come and listen to you. Honestly. Okay. Well, nice. all right. Oh, so it's so allowed. We do, yeah, so we, we thought you were getting shut down. Yeah, we thought this was it. Should we do a full on uh, a humdinger? Let's do it. Yeah, give us a hum. Oh, give us a go. hummable. All right, let's do it. Do you guys it. ready? This is his usual game. He's gonna hum a tune, and we have to guess what the song. Let's is. hum a tune. But here, this is the point of 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 doppelsangers, right? Does that make sense to everyone? Yeah, totally. Yes. We're, yeah. we're doing. It's like you have a song from the same era, like "Need Your Love" and "I Feel Love." Mm-hmm. Obviously, Donna Summer's the best. But let's think of another one here. Oh, country songs are one of my favorites. Yes. Anybody got it? <laughs> Johnny Cash. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, there John Denver. <laughs> Each time I see Jackson. <laughs> Garth Brooks. <laughs> <laughs> Did somebody say oh, go? No, that's, I mean, that's Patsy Klein. That is Patsy Klein. Oh. All right, all right, let's try another one. Um, let me think, let me think of something a little bit trickier for everybody. Oh, no. Yeah, oh, actually, yeah, I'll let me let me see. What? Oh my god, okay, this has come up recently. Oh my god, I don't know if I can do it. Are they? Okay, I don't know. Okay, give me. Okay, I'm just gonna sing this one melody wise. This is from our new friend <laughs> the dog here is howling at the there. restaurant. Oh, there we go. Oh, it's a sublime. Yes, Santa Maria. Santa Maria. Okay. There we go. That was quick. Yeah. That would be the only one I know either. <laughs> Done. Wasn't Tim saying he likes Sublime He's, last week? <laughs> that was a little that's, controversial. We gotta, yeah, that doesn't make any that sense. That doesn't, yeah. Well, well I think not, something new for me. He's determined though, right? they're not bad. Right. He's like, also the drummer from Sublime was in the room, too, at the time. I was very too. surprised. <laughs> okay, and then what's the doppelsanger? I think the we're off that? doppelsangers. We're doing hummables now. I got it. Wait, can I do it? Can I do a doppel? Oh, doppel that was songer? not a songer. That's the point. I wanted to encourage other people to right. suggest doppels. I bless the day I found you. I want to I stay around, you. around you. And so I beg you. Oh, Vic, you beautiful man. Let it be me. I love that song. You know that one, right? That's the, that's the Everly oh, Brothers. Of course. And now. You and I must make a yeah. pact. Oh. We must bring, must bring salvation, salvation back. Where there is love. I'll be there. Something like that, right? Jackson 5, That's right? Great right, there we go. See? Do you need a co host? I got it right. <laughs> Wait, who, who did it <laughs> first? Everly, Everly must have done it Everly first. Brothers okay. first, yeah. Okay. Yeah, but who's the second one? Because I need that. Jackson 5. The sec- Jackson 5. 
Oh my God, you're right. Yep. I'll be there. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Oh, that's a great yeah, double there you go. See, so that's what I wanted to ask of everyone here in the community, especially those who've been here all day. God bless you. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Especially us, you know. Doppelsangers, <laughs> send send them to me, send them to Matt. We're, this is going to be something we're going to be trying out, and I'm excited about Are it you, because yeah. it's worth looking into. That? It's interesting, especially when you look at the decades. <laughs> like the Cheap Trick Donna Summer one is fascinating to me because Cheap Trick had a great song, and then the only point where it gets it goes kind of south is when they stop doing like a cool disco groove. Uh huh. Uh -huh. You know what I mean? And that's whole. That's like a you know kind of a social political thing where it's like disco sucked and i don't think cheap trick fell into that anyway we go into it episode one that's awesome thanks Man. Devin. Yeah. Yeah. Next. That's awesome. and then and Devin, where can people find you to follow this fun stuff that you do you're where can well, they see I've, more of your crazy brain Matt and well it's coming at... soon to office no i know so but like online no but i mean is there is there like i mean obviously yes, uh, office i don't hours, think Devin has like, anything to promote but no this. but do you have an it like an instagram do you have a twitter whatever yeah, it is yeah. where do you where do people sure. find you uh, well, you know, uh, I don't know. I'll send it to Matt. Is that, I don't know. How it's it coming works. soon. <laughs> okay, okay. I don't think you have anything to actually promote yet, Devin. Do you? What's the best not, not item quite. on the menu? I have a, yeah. it's, it's very much edited, but, uh, I love that new idea. And if anybody else has ideas, I will put it in the chat. How about that? Beautiful. Yeah, you and what's your favorite ice cream scoop? What's the... <laughs> these doppelsongers, they just keep coming. Yes. I got you a know? doppel Thanks, scooper. Devin. <laughs> What's a I got doppel a doppel scooper? scooper. <laughs> Rocky Road and Moose Tracks. Oh, there it <laughs> What's is. What's the difference? Yeah. What's the dang difference? It's just a. <laughs> yeah. What is the difference? What's the dang difference? Yeah, there's marshmallow in both, right? <laughs> I think oh it's God. nuts, right? Do That's going to be my new side project. <laughs> yeah. Does Moose doppel Tracks have the marshmallow? Doppel scoopers. It does. <laughs> Last thing I wanted to say is Doug, Doug, I just wanted to tell you, man, when you were talking about how <laughs> snakes have. <laughs> <laughs> I said snakes have about a hundred bones. <laughs> that was the other day. Oh, the, when I was talking about <laughs> eating snake ribs. <laughs> There's a lot of ribs. There. <laughs> he loves it. <laughs> Thanks, Stop buddy. Not. Appreciate that. Thanks, guys. All right, buddy. <laughs> Yeah, order Love some the food. whole community. I hope we, yeah. let's get to six thousand today. Okay. Oh, there we go. Yeah. You gonna you gonna order something there while you're in the diner? Oh, I guess not. Well, <laughs> All right. Thanks, Devin. Yeah, I guess we lost. We he lost his connection. So nice we do have. Uh, I wanted to put this out there. Any if yeah. you guys have to split, just don't you know. Feel free to hang out, but if you have to go, don't be shy. Just oh, okay. let us know. Uh, and I think. Is th there's another guest coming in. Moose track sounds better than Rocky Road. It's it does. Rocky, vanilla ice yeah. cream with peanut butter cups, which I like. That's, That's yeah. good. And famous Moose Tracks fudge. So it's got okay. it's got the vanilla ice cream with this fudge swirl. Right. But then instead of doesn't Rocky Road have like uh, like uh, pretzels in it or something? Or am I making that up? There's something that has pretzels it's in it. It's too crunchy for ice yeah, cream. I, don't I think like there that. should be a rule yeah. like yeah. no crunch on no, ice cream. Yeah, we don't need that. Yeah. You want to check in on our patron count? Sure. Real quick. Yeah. Screw Rocky Road. I'm okay? trying to get away from this ice <laughs> cream. Matt's really... so mad about it. Well, it's, it's just really, really getting mad. very boring. Okay, <laughs> I, I was wrong when I said Moose Tracks was the same. We... What's the what's the number? What are 58, we at? 68. Oh, we're moving up. Oh. 58, 68. It's pretty good. Not bad. So what did we start with? What? 8, 26? 58, 26. We gained about 40. 42? Hey. That's incredible. Thank Not you, everybody. Bad, this is, yeah. We'll take it. That's incredible. We'll, we'll take, take it. it. <laughs> I just want to congratulate you guys. That's awesome. Yes. We'll talk to a Zoomer. We probably lost yeah. like 40. I know. Right, right, some yeah, more. But then yeah. came back. Yeah. Uh huh. Uh huh. What do you guys feel like doing? Let's take some calls or keep it. Let's some hotheads or yeah, do some. I just like talking to random. Yeah. People. Let's just bring yeah. people up here. Bring them in. Wait. Just can throw we do someone in? Can we do a? How about a Zoomer and a hothead at the same time? Is that too? Is it pushing it? I don't. Know. We let's can just do give it a shot. We want. Let's yeah. try it. Let's try it. That's the White Claw talking. Yeah, that's <laughs> great. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay, that's okay. I know. Uh, it's the... Uh, shoot, this looks like the hothead. She's down. Oh, here we go. Oh, yeah. 509, are you there? Here. 509, you're live on the air. All righty, fantastic. You know, I've actually been waiting for some time. Uh, you know, Weird Al... Um, Meant to call in a little bit ago, lost his phone number, <laughs> accidentally crashed his El Camino. That's so fair. he really does need to get that insurance agent on the line. 
It's Patrick. Huh? Is it? Wait, no Patrick, else? you're saying wait. Uncle... Wait, 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 I'm Uncle sorry. Al. You're saying Al crashed his Camino? In Italy? No, 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 no. While he was in the hotel, he let me, you know, take the keys for it, take a little spin. Oh, no. Who's this? You work but, at the you know, hotel? I'm not too good at driving on those Italian roads. <laughs> uh-huh. <laughs> was yeah. it, is that a, was, Where's his cricket is, drop? Come on. Is everybody okay, though? Is that, was anyone hurt? Any bystanders or anything? <laughs> No, no one was hurt. Luckily, luckily, you know. Oh, good. So I'm, I'm just over here enjoying a nice little bit of mint gelato, waiting to, for Uncle Al to give me a call back. But sadly, you know, it's I've had more luck getting through to you guys. Wow. Well, is there anything else you want to talk about besides? You know, this is not uh, Weird Al Pacino's phone number. You're calling. You're calling a, a podcast. Yeah. Is that the last number oh, in his phone that he called or something? <laughs> I think this is just oh, a, just a bit that's not working. Uh, that's no, my okay. assessment. Let's take that's another call. Definitely not. You know. <laughs> Enjoy the gelato. Do you want to have a normal conversation like for a second? Have a good day. But, so, take care, man. All right, thanks for calling. Okay, thanks for nothing. <laughs> you got it. You got to no, try. I'm stay positive. I'm you know not what? You try anything. things out. Anything. I'm just going to. Especially say. when the boss is away, that the mice will play, and you know, try it out. Well, listen, here, not? I. It's it's yeah. all in good fun. If someone does a stinker, we have to let them have it. You know, that's the risk. That's right, right. Let's just keep them coming. Yeah, Matt. just keep it going. Yeah, I'm no, trying. we don't. Need... Yeah, the... I'll do Ain't a no hot head or I'll do now. Just keep it. Just keep it going. No downtime in between. Keep it hot. Fart Simpson is here. Oh, there we Fart go. Simpson. Now, we're, hey everybody. Now we're talking. Yeah, I mean, I can't tell if it's who's the best humor. <laughs> oh, there's, there he is. There's William Whoa, Joel. Look at, oh, what's wow. happening to Billy Joel back there? Sorry, I'm taking things in. <laughs> he looks one like he's in the, the Hobbit. <laughs> like I've been in the Joel hole. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what's yeah, up, this Fart? has been so much fun. This has been amazing, but I um. Yeah, so I thank you for this. But have I have some new us? mashups. I do. Oh, yes. Ooh, yes. So we want to try some new mashups? Where he match, mashes up two songs, but their titles go together. Oh, For okay. example... CeeLo Green Day. CeeLo yeah. Green Day. Okay. okay, it'd be okay. like two bands that you, he'll play a little bit of each. All right, let me know if this sounds okay. I'm, I'm on board. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sean Paul Simon. Oh. Wow, that was really good. That was fast. <laughs> yeah, I like how there's a long <laughs> intro. I'm like, that was awesome. gonna be, yeah. yeah, some of these, a little long intro. That's fine. This one, I think we got all day. Yeah. That's right. This one was good. Yeah, two Sean and a half Paul? hours left. <laughs> Us? No, no. Three. <laughs> Some, se, seven Mary, three doors down. So, oh, so close. You got the down? second half. Yeah, you got the second half. Oh, the chat's got it. It's oh, really no. good. I, I like it's, it. It's uh, 311 doors down. Oh. 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 I hate that I knew oh. the words. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, like lost <laughs> physics, but I have that. Crap. <laughs> Both of those songs sound like a school bus. <laughs> <laughs> it's like those bands cancel each other out. Yeah. <laughs> I couldn't hear any music in there. Right. You, know? you were just rocking too hard. Uh, you want to plow through these? I have a few. Oh, yeah, yeah keep do going. It dude, okay. This is awesome. Right, we got all afternoon. This one, the intro is a little long. Hold on. Let it Funky. ride. Let it roll. Yeah, it's fine.
This is a Missy Elliott one time experience. Missy Elliott Smith? <laughs> there it is. I like how she says her name in the beginning, though. It's kind of cheating. I want to hear, hear where it goes. Yeah, let's see. It was hard to find the instrumental. Wow. I think those tempos to match up. Oh my god. This is yeah. I'm gonna get a nosebleed. <laughs> yeah, it definitely has a swing tempo. Incredible. All right, yeah, this like is some a, punk rock. We got some punk rock some fans. Attack. Yeah, we yes. got punk rock yeah. fans. Okay. Nothing. Half of it is Tool. I hear that. Okay. Well, his other band. Oh. oh. Okay, I'm out. A perfect is circle, circle jerk. Circle jerks? Hey! Oh. Oh. Yeah. Kind of works. Is that Wild in the Streets? I think so. I don't know. It's the only instrumental I can find. <laughs> this one's really funny. This is tricky. This is just uh, instrumental. Somebody talking. Oh. Oh, These are instrumentals. But I I just don't know the second one. I'm gonna slap the face off him and that's it. I'm cool with all the gods. Gods recognize gods. Dance for me, mate. Sinead O'Connor. Uh, oh. Yeah, it's Sinead O'Connor. It's, it's, is, it, is it a fighter? Or you a oh, Sinead O'Connor. 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 That's That'll amazing. That is great. Oh, oh shit. God. All right. Uh, this is some. Ooh, I'm going to give ska? Jamie the point for that because I think. Anybody? Let's do, let's do one more. We had the more kind of synergy then, going. Yeah. Let's do one more and then we do have another guest waiting Sounds to come good. in. I don't oh, want to keep them waiting in that too case. much longer. Oof, we should do okay. a full Fart Simpson hour. I know. I'm going to. Yeah. We should have. Yeah, Fart is, Simpson game this, night. This yeah. is still on yeah. the same tip of an instrumental and somebody talking. I like this. <laughs> okay. I like where these are going. They're getting more mm-hmm. abstract. <laughs> Missy Elliott Smith, that was. Oh, was on a, oh, son, I'm on acid uh, in the yeah. pot. Crazy. And I was in Vietnam on top of it. And I, I, I in my life, I, but you know what? Cocaine kept me balanced <laughs> and kept me inquisitive. Mm-hmm. Drugs, 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 drugs. Do I look like I'm insane here? <laughs> so the instrumental of that is an old 90s band. Oh, so a, Oliver Stone Temple Pilots. Damn, Doug. Wow. wow. Oh, I, didn't, I didn't hear the song. What was, was there it? not even an instrumental? It was. It's, I had to bury it. That's, that's funny. That's unbelievable. Right. <laughs> <laughs> this is one game I'm good at. I usually yeah, lose every game we ever play. This is a good party trick. That's yeah. Pretty neat. Like, I've never yeah. been less prepared for a game in my entire <laughs> life. So I do feel great. like I missed a day at school. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't know if the quiz. I'm sorry. Dude, you couldn't oh, find like oh, yeah. plush oh. or something. Like, <laughs> dun, dun. It was the only instrumental I could find. Really quick. Oh, okay, okay. I wanted to see if I could submit. I wanted to give these drops to you. I found a good Rogan drop. Oh. Uh, mm. It's not even a word. Just listen. Yeah. Okay. And I got Wadi from the Exploited saying, uh, "Saying it's not very punk rock." <laughs> <laughs> Somebody punk rock. And then I got James Hetfield saying jug of nacho. Jug of nacho. <laughs> oh. What? Well, I got a lot of Johnny Rotten drops here. Well, hello. <laughs> fucking bullshit. And what if I'm exploited? What the fuck? Fucking no shit. Bullshit. When uh, <laughs> sex pistols came to you, you ain't <laughs> okay, that. Sorry, well, 
All right. We're having too I much fun it. with fart. I know. <laughs> Oh no! Who's waiting? No, we're good. Yeah, bring it yeah, in. Do you want someone? Could do you want to? Um, Allison, why don't you come on in and let's find a spot for you? Well, I can head out too. I won't take up valuable space. Yeah, yeah so I got. I gotta good. tap out. Yeah, too. you guys have been here okay. a while. Thank you so right. much for oh, helping so out. Much. Can I shout out Cela one more time? Of course. Yes. Yes. And where can we find Cela? And yeah, so if you go to s e l a h dot or yep, Cela n h c dot org. Um, it stands for Cela Neighborhood. Homeless right. Coalition. Um, volunteer, come volunteer, check us out. Um, you can also do hygiene kit builds. So if you want to do some stuff like put a bunch of socks and hygiene materials in a bag and drop them off, you can do that. Um, and more importantly than anything else, like just walk away with the idea that your unhoused neighbors are your neighbors. So maybe stop and say hi and tell them your name. And um, yeah, just be cool about it. Thanks so much for letting us awesome. be here. Cool. Yeah. Thank you. Thank, Thank you so you. much. Thank you for your work. Jamie, thank what? you. Thank and thanks you for having me. Great to meet you after all these years. I know. Thank you for the yeah. call out immediately, and uh, I'll, I'll I've never been bounce waiting. back. I've been waiting. So. I know it was a slow burn. Yeah, but it was yeah. Worth it. And tell Jared I said hi. You're like close with him, right, Jared? Andrews? Yeah, yeah, he's okay. the best. Awesome, Jared Fogel. Oh. Yeah, Jared Fogel. <laughs> yeah, when, when he's visit, the best. Yeah, he's, he's, he's I good. think we can all agree. The hoagie man. <laughs> he's a hoagie. He's a hoagie boy. Oh look, at who's this next caller we got in here? We got a zoomer. We got a hothead. We got a hothead. Real hotheads. Are you there? Hey, who's this? <laughs> You're on the line. What's up, T? Hey Dodgers guy. Yeah, how's it going? Pretty good. Yeah, uh, we're we're man. almost there. I'm excited. It's the home stretch. It. I'm exhausted. I should say oh. exhausted. <laughs> I don't know about you guys, but I've just been going all day, working yeah. hard. What? We saw you standing Getting around. Wait, yeah, what? <laughs> yeah, it yeah. looks like you were you had a good twenty a minute break. Uh, yeah. Hey hell? Tim, why don't you welcome yeah. our, our guest who just walked in, Allison? What Allison from that Elvis Costello song? <laughs> Actually, kind of. No, oh. Allison from the Pixie song. After? I was named after that song. Yeah. Wow. That's why it's one L. Wow. Well, oh, well, really? Yeah, it's interesting. so funny to be seeing you after so long, girl. Do you get annoyed when people do this? Way you <laughs> you <look laughs> yeah, it happens the all the time. You were not impressed. <laughs> <laughs> Take off your party dress. I'm not gonna, <laughs> I'm not gonna get too sentimental like those other sicko valentines. Does he say other sicko valentines? Other sticky valentines. Yeah. He's saying sicko. No, oh, is it sicko? He's saying sick. Sicko Valentine. Uh, oh, I thought it was like sticky Valentine's, like some kind of creepy thing. I'm only yeah, realizing yeah, now how else. fucked up it is. I was named after that song. <laughs> it's fucked. How are you gonna play crickets right away? Oh, <laughs> well, this guy, no <laughs> crickets asshole. the whole show yeah. with all these stinky uh, I callers. I don't do guitar. I, I play piano. I so and then I the boss calls yeah, and the crickets are right that. there. What do you think of that? It's pretty good, right? That's the first time ever he's done that. I tried to watch for a minute and then I bailed. It was so boring. <laughs> Wait, which? Doug's piano. I Doug think. Oh. <laughs> so wait, tell me what oh. happened with uh, David Cross. <laughs> uh, he, he left in a real hot. He huff. humored us. Did he text you or something? Is he, he humored us it? and then he no. dumped no, no, us. He had fun. He had a lot of fun. No, but I was going to say he was on forever. Every time I checked in, he was on. He was on but a long I, time, yeah. But then I checked in like 40 minutes in. And he was like, oh, this is what I turned in on. He goes, I have a question. What is this? Yeah. <laughs> and that's when he I'm was like, gone 30 you... seconds later. Yeah. So. Yeah, but it was like. He was on for a long time. Yeah. Uh, I mean, hopefully, I mean, I don't know if he was pissed. I don't know him and all, but like, uh, hopefully he was okay with it, you know? Well, you know, usually Somebody I'm the, the only one rude enough to get rid of people, and I didn't feel uh, yeah. comfortable getting rid of him. So, yeah. Oh, good. Well, I was uh, so relieved that you guys were, were dealing with him because, you know, <laughs> you know, we're, we're on live. The air we're, now, live. Tim. we're live. I, well, no, I lo- no, I'll be, I'll be honest. I love David, but he can be like, you know, he, he, you have to be really on your on your A game to keep up with him. Right, very right. Smart. You know what I mean? Yeah. You've got to be very quick, and you can't show any weakness. He hijacks you. Yeah. Oh, wow. Exactly. Oh. He, alpha, he alphas me off, out of the The higher room. Heidecker. Wow. Yeah, so I was just glad. Not that I don't I mean, I love him. I just, you know. He was holding I'd rather no, you guys. No, he was yeah, holding when, back on, yeah. on uh, Alpha. When I asked he him. He was letting yeah. it. Yeah. He was putting up with well, it but yeah. the pet stuff he was smells, good yeah 
he smells weakness over oh. there. And if I was there, he'd have smelt he'd have smelt competition. Right. And he would have right. been aggressively trying to take me down like two tigers in the jungle. <laughs> no, nah, he didn't smell that? weakness. He loved his we, he, we yeah, dazzled him. We he was like, you know what? Yeah. I've got a couple of puppy dogs here. I'm going to treat him like a puppy dog. Well, and they got to give him a chance to show off his, wow. his ashes of his dog and stuff. So I guess that's you know, Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. He, he, Somebody he, asked, if, am, I, am I coming down with a cold? I'll be honest with you. I got one, baby. Uh-oh. I am oh. in the cold zone. Uh. And, but, what you know, I, I power through. I just, I don't, I don't let it put me out. I don't let it stop me. I don't let it drag me down. I keep pushing through, you know? Alice, you, you, get, you get sick this year yet? Any, any, uh, any oh, yeah. non-COVID stuff? Like like the old sniffles and whatnot? <sighs> yeah, I had some congestion. What about COVID, COVID? You get COVID? I don't know. You should, you should try it. I think it. I did, but I didn't yeah. like... We're all positive here. Yeah, yeah. I didn't get tested, so I just assumed... I think I had the diarrhea kind. Oh, yeah. Is that what yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. That strain. <laughs> nice. That's, yes. Yeah, yeah. They got diarrhea that's like COVID the, now? That's the better kind. That, I think that was one of the originals and nobody knew. So a bunch of people just had a bunch of diarrhea uh-huh. for like a week and were like, oh, this is fine. Man, and I've then... had COVID for 10 years then. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Shit. Hey, Allison, what's your deal? Who are you? Who are you? <laughs> Uh, I don't know. Uh, you know, a, a comedian. Did you get a Did you get a proper introduction from the guys? Or? I, no, I, I don't you think came so. In, you hijacked yeah, you, her you, entrance. Yeah. I, I did. I just Tim, they just oh, told Tim me to did. sit down. So <laughs> yeah, we didn't. Should we try? This is Allison you Stevenson. Do you want, want me to walk yeah, back I'll in? Play, I'll play a song. Yeah, I think I'm, pl- I'm like plugged ahead, into we'll stuff now. All right. All right. Here we go. Go ahead. Okay. All right. Let's see. Ladies and gentlemen, right. gentlemen, Allison Stevenson is here. All right. Good to see you, Allison. Hey, everybody. And, uh, All right. Tim, is, Tim is on the line here. So. Oh, oh, hey. Oh, hey. Uh, fun fact, That's I was named after the Elvis Costello song. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do a little tour of the, of the lot. Are you guys want to see a dog? Let us let us check out your star wagon. I was gonna say you didn't. Oh my god! Wait, what God. the hell is that? Is that? F- Wait a Why minute. Why is there a dog in a cage right there? <laughs> Wait a minute. You what kind the, of sick? You the yeah, what kind of sick show are you working on? What is on? this? <laughs> it's, 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 uh, I like the it's shoving G2. the phone in its face. What it's other G2. horrors do you is have? That, is that uh, is Mark? Is Mark gonna have you do anything with that doggy? Mark, uh, yeah, we have a pretty sal- salacious scene with the dog. Oh later today. wow! All right going to be mark hey what about this what about this the furniture the furniture warehouse can you see that uh-huh are there any <laughs> are there any cool. furniture you recognize in there oh, actually i want to show you guys something that you want to see uh actually this is for you guys check it out hello editing. wow oh wow there i love is. that stuff <laughs> i love editing wait a minute <laughs> i'm going to show you guys i'm going to show you guys some of the movies that have been shot uh, at this stage, are you ready for that? Yeah. See if you can play. See if we can get a game out of this somehow. Uh, Anything from Don Simpson? <laughs> all right. See if can we can we read those? Yeah. Oh, there we go. Okay. Do, uh, anything? <laughs> are, are these <laughs> nothing ringing a bell? No, nothing. <laughs> these, I don't think these are real movies. The Joker's Wild is either that sounds a game like it show should be or something. Houseboat. Houseboat. <laughs> okay. Oh, there there we go. go. There we go. That's a big. That's one. where we picked ding, it up. Ding ding ding. Ready for this shit? Star Trek Voyager. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> then all downhill from there. Mm. Oh, look at that. Oh, I've seen that. Oh, one. this is a cool movie. Look at uh, Dinner Dinner for Schmuck. <laughs> <laughs> what year is that? Ooh, my favorite Mission Impossible mm-hmm. 3. Uh, 2010. Look at this one, Doug. Oh, Pretty in Pink. Pretty in Pink, Dougie. It's a big one. She's having a baby. A lot of Star Trek. So, wow. and then G2. And then G2 is going to be up there. Seems like there's a yeah. lot of downtime on your job today. Too. <laughs> well, it's lunch. They take an hour lunch. At 247? <laughs> it's a yeah. little too ethical. <laughs> well, we start at three. We start lunch at two and it goes for an hour. So they're, they're, we're in the pocket. Of course, I'm first in line at lunch, so I'm fully fed by now. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of uh craft service <laughs> what kind of craft service they got t i'll take a look <laughs> <laughs> i 
I'm not eating though. You know me. I'm just yeah. I'm I'm eat. I have my lunch and I didn't have anything to eat until two o'clock. I want to I want to see what you what you looked at and you had the strength not to eat. All right, let's find out. You guys talk amongst yourselves. It's gonna take me a few seconds to get down there. Allison, go ahead. What have you been up to? <laughs> what have you been up to? Yeah, well, fuck. I told you about the diarrhea. So yeah. is that those? That there's the Delta strain, and then that's the Toto strain. The Toto. <laughs> <laughs> the Toto strain. Oh, Togo, like it's the like sandwich. A, shop? It's like a toilet brand. I don't know. Mm. I'm trying to make a joke there. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right, good news. We're, we're coming up. We're coming up on the crowd. Oh, we're interviewing. So You're gonna have to stand tight. by there, bro. Hold on. <laughs> stand down. <laughs> we're talking. Stand by and stand down. All right, here we go. Okay. It's coming up. Hello. Good, how are you? Well, can I just show my friends what's in this trailer or no? <laughs> show my friends. Is it an NDA kind of situation? So I just want to show everybody what they have to so Zoom. Hey, can you fill a okay. bag Zoom up and bring them back to the compound for us? We're hungry. Please. Yeah, Tim, take a garbage bag. Take your arm <laughs> and just wipe it in. Uh -huh. Fill them up. Wipe it off oh, the shale. Famous Amos. I'm going to get you some oh, of these, Doug. <laughs> Sven Hartz. Sven Hartz. <laughs> Variety pack. Oh, this Danish Kringle's good. Oh, that's the uh, best. I love those. Uh, did John? Did John? Uh, oh, those hey, are amazing. Did Mugar send that Kringle to you? There it is. Oh, there they are. Yeah. Yeah. You, yeah, that's the good stuff. You know what? I'm gonna say nothing. I'm gonna have nothing for snacks. <laughs> I'm gonna be a good boy. Well done. You know, that's, you can have a water. that's called um, that's called self control. Tim, right? The dare yeah. to get into that golf cart. Just hit it. <laughs> I'm not going to steal the golf cart. You ever do you get carted around today on the golf cart? Do you rank that high in Hollywood? No, I don't cuz I, I want to walk. I want to get my uh my miles in. Want to get, get my steps. steps. So it looks like everyone's coming back from lunch. We the deal is this. We've got two more shots and then I can get out of here. But I mean to be honest, obviously we're not shooting good fellas too. That was a routine. <laughs> that was a comedy routine. What? Um yes, yeah, sorry guys. <laughs> But we are shooting a uh, commercial, and we're ahead of schedule, you know? Mm -hmm. But I still will have to, like, have a uh, celebratory, you know, toast with the, uh, with the commercial people, right? Oh, yeah, commercials always do that, right? They always bring beer out at the end of, like, a two-day uh, shoot. We did it! We, hooray! We did it! <laughs> and we made a commercial for Toto Toilets. <laughs> It always seems so a bit anyway, much. So anyway, I'm going to try to get, I'm going to try to get there be five, by like 4:30 and just be be in the studio with you to, to wrap things up. I mean, we can stay till seven or eight and if you guys want. We can keep maybe going. Hold, yeah, just till we hit. Well, 6, it doesn't 000. look like we're anywhere near Dude, six thousand. So. I, yeah. I am on the road at 5:01. Oh, that's right. <laughs> you can What's take the matter with you? you I got to go to the from? airport though. I do have an excuse. Uh, well, I can I can swap out for you. Okay. There you go. Keep going. Do 24 hours. Mm-hmm. Yeah, nowhere to be. Yeah, why not? I, I mean, we can let Allison run probably, it for. Yeah, you know, she can have a solo. Uh -huh. It'd be my honor. We could talk. Yeah, you want to take zoomers. some? You want to take some zoomers? You want to? You talk to some people on Zoom? Yeah. I sure. Okay. Yeah, I can talk to them. Yeah. 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 Do that. Uh, Who else called in that I missed? Anybody yes. fun? Um, Devin, our old friend Devin. Oh yeah, Devin. Devin. Fart, Fart Simpson. Fart Devin Simpson. Fart Simpson. Fart Simpson bangers, were just I caught, we killing it. I caught some of that game. It was cool. We gotta bring some. Of that we gotta bring Fart back. Fart, we gotta bring Fart in in studio. Is I hope he's he still listening. We could do uh, a few more. I think Bilbert had a fake ad or something. Is that right, Bilbert? How about uh, Brendan Walsh? Did he bother us? Some he, internet. He pranks us. Technic, tech, it was a tech fail. Oh, good. Shock. Um, <laughs> oh, good. So we haven't had a... doesn't deliver. Hey, there we go. Here we go. Mikey and JP showed up. <laughs> who's, who's on the line I saw there? that. That was cute. So we haven't had a city of the day yet? There we go. Okay. We have. We have. Is we that, did. But we'll, that oh, we can do Was that straight off the top? We like, can do, do another. During the first hour? Let's no, do we're let's pitching them pitch to us all day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's but no stopping. Okay. Oh, we've had a city of the day, but not we we have... I know, oh, I know I've heard a lot of uh, puns. We could use mm -hmm. it. Uh, Let's do it. You got an ad? You so, got a city? What do you got? I have a city and an ad. The city of the day is Drain, Oregon. Hmm. The city of the day is brought to you by Lump Bob Glow Pants. Have you ever been on a bike ride when you hop off at your favorite coffee shop and while you're standing in line for a mocha? Not only do you feel rather 
cold and exposed in your bicycling tights. You feel unusually constricted as well. Furthermore, you're concerned riding at night may make it hard, hard for you to be seen on the road. That's why there's bu Wump Bob Glow Pants. These bright yellow seven-way stretch pants were developed by Boeing engineers specifically to keep you compressed in all the right places and covered but able to move in other areas. Riding around Seattle all the time, they had to endure rain, rain, wind, rain, and more rain, along with funny looks at their most precious cargo. Enter Wump Bob Glow Pants. Now your legs will glow brighter than Angel's Gate Lighthouse while maintaining toasty modesty up front right where you want it. Lump Bob Glow Pants is also available in lift and separate models for the muscular cyclist looking to draw attention behind you. Lump Bob Glow Pants are just $399.98 per pair with free shipping anywhere in the continental United States. Last graph. Order now with wow. the offer, <laughs> thing order now with the offer code Office Hours, and you can get a discount on your our other product line, Lump Bob Glow Plants. <laughs> with these luminous glowing That's silicone tight. plant pots, your precious growings will get natural light 24 hours a day. No need to invest in expensive grow lights. Just keep your plants locked in a cage in your backyard, exposed to the sky and they'll store the sun's light and keep glowing all day long. Order now at glowmypants.com. Wow. Thank you. Thank you. Very okay. good. Very what, so good. what are they? I will, say, I will say that I would love you to read our ads because I love the, the, the performance of the read. Well, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Is this, are you? Uh, let me jump. Let this me, oh, no. Oh, oh, here we go. Uh oh, Tim has some notes. Uh, no, listen, I'll be honest. I'm not, I don't have the greatest attention span. <laughs> I understand. I, I dropped out pretty early on, but I, but it's, and I didn't follow what was, uh, what was going on there, but it had the sound, like Doug said, it had the sound of some of that direct, that, uh, like, wait, wait, don't tell me shit. Oh, yes. <laughs> Drek. Like that, that, uh, that, uh, you know, NPR afternoon time killing. But you know, I pounded what? it out last night. But that's what, <laughs> but, but, but what, what that makes me think is, well, maybe that has a shot to be more popular. You know, that, yeah. that maybe that's, what, that's the direction we should be going in. Cause that's very, people seem to want mm -hmm. that. So maybe you should be our new ad guy. But I agree. The, the copy itself, the material itself, is a very long. It needs a lot of work. It needs a lot of work. <laughs> Good performance, right? But probably, if you guys want to any time, I'm looking for the positive things here. I think you did a great read. It sounded like I'm it saying. was for Let's rich people. <laughs> yeah, that's definitely oh, of for rich people. Anytime I go on uh, Instagram, I keep getting ads for like a nice decent pair of pants that I would pay 40, maybe $50 for. And it's like 80. And I'm like, who is buying these $198 <laughs> pants? I have another Repulse job for Bill Burt. Yeah. I think he could be our Matt Iglesias mm. impressionist. Oh, could sure. Do that? Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, Matt, yeah. Matt, why don't we uh, do this? Why don't we have Bill Burt yeah, I mean, record that's... like the last three ads as we've written them and see if the matching of the creative writing with the performance creates something really truly special I like sure that. thank you yeah, i mean there's something to be said for that sure <laughs> yeah it's interesting you know matt kind of talks like that too yeah. though, sometimes. Oh, yeah i don't have a high voice yeah you go up there yeah. and you go down <laughs> you're way up like, there sometimes like high and low yeah, like you were playing over you, you. <laughs> Yeah, we should have him record one. Support for this. Yeah, Bilber. Let's get do it. Touch. Yeah, it's getting Have your agent. Have your agent. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> to protect homes and businesses. I'm my agent. Yeah. Thanks, Bill. Thank you. Thanks, Bill Bird is a great fan. We Thanks, see your Bill. stuff the best. online. I'm touched. I'm touched by the creativity out there in the office hours community. It's a great community. Allison, you should know that. I'm, I mean, I've like, been, been very good to the Jews. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Allison, where are you from? I'm from the Valley. Oh, you're hmm. an original L.A. Yeah. Well, have you people lived, debate that. Have you ever lived <laughs> anywhere else? I, I've lived in the Bay Area a little bit. What did you like? Did you like it up there? I no? did. I did. I kind of miss it. But it's also a lot different now. You know what I mean? Yeah. 
then how? It, yeah, right. It's just not what it used to be. So. Well, back in the '60s, it was crazy. <laughs> the Grateful Dead. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Thing. Yeah. <laughs> and then back in the you know 1840s, you had the gold rush going on up there. <laughs> It cha- it's always changing. Uh-huh. <laughs> I'm talking about when there was like a cool video store, and now that video <laughs> store isn't there anymore. So I'm like, oh, this place sucks. Right. Was it like your favorite video store? Like, yeah, I mean, this is like a real. I yeah. guess if you ever heard of Lost Weekend Video, and they had that underground, like the basement was like oh. a really cool comedy venue, uh-huh. and it was just like so oh, wow. beautiful and precious, and it's gone. Shame. Yeah, yeah. Nothing, Vidiots is coming back, though. They're uh, speaking of VHS, they're got a storefront if you know them. Okay, so I guess they're a famous anyway. I don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> <laughs> Getting a little delirious. Video is coming back. Vid- Vid- Vidiots, you know who they are, Doug, right? Absolutely, okay. they're opening okay. up, yeah, they're opening back up yeah. on Eagle Rock Boulevard. That's yeah. exactly right. See, <laughs> well, we're talking about the Bay Area, LA oh. already kicks ass. Just, we already know, yeah, it's yeah, it's cool yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, guys. Yeah, I mean, Yes, Tate. Big, big news. Uh, my <laughs> pies video went just went viral again. Oh man! Oh, here comes the star. Hold on. I'll, hold <laughs> Wait, on. pies video? Shot. There he is. Here he How's comes. The show going, everyone. It's going great. Yeah. I just came back from another scene. It was more of a rehearsal with Mark. <laughs> He's away. So, <laughs> wait a minute. What? Uh, I just had a private rehearsal with Mark. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Wait, it wasn't a. Wait, was James, it with three people just, uh, or yeah. just two? With Mark in the trailer, and it oh. was not fun. So, <laughs> just not really in the mood for any of this stuff right uh-huh. now. <laughs> you you know, must be drained. What, what happened in the in the trailer over there? <laughs> yeah. Mark told me to come and he thought he said we we're gonna talk about the some some of the lines and it turned into a full Fred's rehearsal. It's hot. It's you who everywhere. Talk about climaxing, like how to do a real climax. Like what's that what's that like for you? I, I said I can explain it. He's like, well, let's just why don't you do it? Why don't you go ahead and do it? No, we haven't shot anything yet. Yeah. And a lot of rehearsals, a lot of iPhone footage. Eric's giving out copies of his book on set. That's kind of a fun part of the day. Always be merching, even with Mark Scorchess. Eh? <laughs> All right. That's beautiful, huh? Look at this. This is living the dream. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody's thrilled to be working with us, that's for sure. Yeah. Real oh, here, We're so There's not- Mark Scorsese, and there he is, the long hair. Yeah. <laughs> he just came from from uh, working with you pretty hard. Yeah. Worked you hard. He's in a sweat. <laughs> he saw a lot. Yeah. <laughs> All right. All right. Good luck right. with uh, day two. Good luck, everybody. All right. Have fun. Don't get cleaned up. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, guys. All right. I'll let you go. All right. Hey, you guys are almost there. I mean, what? It's, it's, you got two more hours to go. Yeah. I feel great. Are you guys, how are you guys feeling? I'm feeling fine. Fine. And I feel Could like use that magpie. Numbers, oh, those, you want to? Uh, we don't YouTube need to. It's have been holding the hot, holding steady. They deliver. <clears throat> huh? Those YouTube numbers have been holding steady as well. People are, are not, you know, oh, they're, yeah. they're staying, staying along for the ride. True heads know. All right, um, let's get us over six thousand. We got two hours. We, what we got? Like, a, we need to get hundred over a hundred new patrons. It's not gonna happen. We gotta talk you know to Allison we need? We need because one we got rich a lot person. Of stuff to get to. We need one rich person to come in and buy like a hundred memberships. Uh huh. Or they could just That's buy one membership happen. and have a huge monthly. Right. Well, no, that wouldn't give the number. Though. Right. I see. Maybe we should have a dollar goal. Too late for that. <laughs> Uh, I might see you in a few hours. <clears throat> Thanks, T. Thank you, Tim. Good luck with your final two shots. <laughs> <laughs> Just hard cut is, uh, to... Uh, is his uh, name okay. Bilber? Bilbert. Bilbert. Yeah, he's with very active on social media. With a V or B? B. Bilbert. B- Bilbert. Okay, Bilbert. okay. Yeah, any questions for I Allison? Mean, there's something to that. I mean, you know... <laughs> Well, let's, could we talk to a Zoomer? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Let's talk well, we to got, a Zoomer. We got, sure. we got, uh, we got, um, 
Who, uh, uh, I can't see the, uh, there, your videos on Zoom, hot, so DM me with topics or whatever. Uh, Does anyone bet. have anything for uh, Allison here? <laughs> yeah, you know, I'll just, I'll just say it. Let's take it's a, fine. No, let's take a Zoomer. No, we're, we'll take a Zoomer, of course. <laughs> Todd Blazer with cats, are you there? Hello. Hi, Todd, you're on the air. Producer Matt, thank you. Hey, anytime. Here, let me get him. Come here. Ah, oh, look at that. Look at that. Is that a Maine cat. Coon? No, what is that? Is that a Bobcat? It does oh. look like a Bobcat. <laughs> is that a Maine Coon or no? I have no clue, but she's real fluffy. Yeah, usually. Where'd you, where'd you find her? Um, some friends of mine had them in Tallahassee, Florida, and I adopted them. I got one more. Hold on. Let me grab her. Yeah. Is it, is it a, we're showing pets today? Is mm-hmm. that what's going on? <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. well, that was the bit earlier with uh, David Cross was rating people's pets on a scale of zero to 1,000 bricks. Oh, interesting. Do okay. you have any? You could rate pets, I do, too, if I you do. want. Yeah. What do you got? Actually, I have a streaming show that I do, and we do a thing where we assess how Jewish your pet is. Oh. Hot, hot, hot button issue. How, how can a yeah. pet be Jewish? It's You can just, it's a vibe. Now, I'm going to preface this by saying I'm Jewish, so I can say this. Yeah, uh, me too. They have a big schnozzle. Is that like you know, part it, of it? It's like, it's a, one of those things where it's like, I'm allowed to assess, on, as you would also, like we can be anti-Semitic. I get it. So yeah, I can be like, look at that nose. Like a Dachshund or something. Or right, 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 right. clearly a Jewish dog. Any there kind of, yeah, Look at yeah. this one. Oh, I These like guys this can't one. Weigh in on that. That's a, that's a very Aryan cat right there. That's not a Jewish cat. The yeah, other yeah. one looked like a Jewish cat. A little bit, yeah. Maybe half. Maybe the father's side, so not like actually <laughs> Jewish. We oh wait, we've never done this game. Well, we've done a game with records, but now I see some CDs back there. Pick the how CD are you game. Seeing, Pick, how are you seeing oh with this guy? Yeah, yeah. I'm not seeing any video from our zoomers. Uh oh. Or is this what happened? It's it, it's just like the connection's all fucked today. Oh man. Can he hear us? Oh, can you hear us? Hello? Oh, there we go. There we go. He can hear us. He's just a little okay. uh, slow to respond. <laughs> is, is there anything else you Todd, want you to got talk about? Or pick just a, a cat. Can we see a CD? What, pick one CD from back there. Let's see what we got here. Todd's oh, living life in the slow lane. That's fine. I like it. Life in the slow lane. <laughs> Since we had uh, some mashups earlier, three three eleven. There what, what it is, it? three doors down. <laughs> three eleven doors down. Three hundred eleven doors <laughs> down. Uh, well, I gotta guess, ask, yeah. why do you own a three doors down CD? <laughs> From high school, man. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I I got rid of it. I uh, here, I'll give you some more. Sincerely bought stuff. a Creed record when it came out. I'm embarrassed about Creed. That. Yeah, I did. I bought bought a CD. Oh, we. Here's some foxing for you. All right. Thanks for showing us There we go. There we go. <laughs> I asked. I was the one. I know. I know. Yeah. I think we should uh, let Todd go. Yeah. All right. So, <laughs> Todd, thanks for, thanks for hanging thanks, with Todd. us, man. And, and I was a, on earlier. I had to come back. Yes. Have a, have oh, a, have a, on. Have a happy TG. TG. I was on. I didn't remember he was on earlier. Did you? Want to talk to a guy from New Zealand? Nah. <laughs> <laughs> Guy from New hello, Zealand. Hello. Oh, too late. Good day, wow. mate. Hey, good day. How are you? How are you going? Is it tomorrow? Or yeah, what? <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're in the future. You won't, you won't believe what happens tomorrow. <laughs> Everything's fixed. Whereabouts in New Zealand are you? I'm in Christchurch, hmm. South Island. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. We're talking about Jews here, not. Uh, and how was that? <laughs> yeah. Is that city still yeah, in, uh, in shambles from that earthquake? Uh, it's, um, yeah, like a little bit. It's, it's, there's, you kind of um, be driving around town and there's all these beautiful new buildings. And then you look to your right and there's just a massive abandoned lot that just, it all depends on who owned that building and whether they've rebuilt it or not, essentially. So it's, it's a bit of a mix of, Everything's Bummy really out. new and really fresh, but then you just there's also a derelict building right in the middle of town that just hasn't been that nothing has been done to. 
What else is going on? Do you have anything else you want to talk about? <laughs> Whoa. Oh, bro. How do the Zoomers have less energy than us? What's going on here? I mean, once in a while, we want we want a caller to kind of pick up our slack. Where are you going to? Where are you driving? They, I literally, I'm just pulling in. I'm pulling in home now, oh, right, okay. right now. So where were you? Go. You've got my. Uh, I was across town. I had a I had a meeting. It's it's twelve o eight over here. So you had a meeting at twelve o eight. At midday, midday. Oh. Oh no, no. Is it twelve o eight right now? Anyway. <laughs> um, this is getting ridiculous. I think a lot of people who call into I, this show don't realize it's a call-in show. They think they're just joining like a work meeting. <laughs> yeah. I, I had a, um, well, it is an a, office a funny hour. story about um, we, we did this, this show a few years ago. I was playing in a band, and we got booked to open for Elvis Costello. Mm. And um, I was named was after that song, Allison. Wow. There you go. Well, I, I, had, I had no idea who he was before we did the show. <laughs> but um, I'm, I'm, I know he's amazing, apparently. But um, <laughs> so this band I was playing in is sort of like, you know, a 90s kind of like semi-grungy, super grassy kind of thing. And then he, he was doing the show as part of uh, an art festival over here. And we were doing the show... And then you can imagine the kind of audience who would buy a seated concert for Elvis Costello. And so to have this kind of, you know, a band that wasn't amazingly interesting to them playing, it was it was so-so. But then towards the end of our set, we're doing this song that's kind of, uh, you know, it's not like the, the biggest song we'd ever done, but just the audience started freaking out and just started applauding and going insane and like, started clapping and, and got a, getting a standing ovation and sort of the, the final few bars of the song. And I was talking to, we were like talking about it afterwards and it turned out that our keyboardist on a sampler had accidentally pressed an applause sample <laughs> that had gone through the front of house into the whole, uh, into the whole audience. And then I think just like the sheeple mentality <laughs> Kind of meant they're like, oh, I guess, yeah, this must be really great. And they just started clapping and everything. So hmm. I don't know. I thought that was. Mind I games. That was That's a great way to, yeah, to exactly. hack your performance. Yeah, man. Mm. That's like yeah, how well, you well, hype well. yourself up. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. It's that thing of, what is it, like staring yourself from staring at the mirror and so like pumping yourself up for a job interview or something. Hmm. But yeah, I just wanted to share that story. I don't know if you find that interesting or not, but there you go. Wow, the crowd loves it. <laughs> yeah, we love it. <laughs> Ray! Oh, now I want to clap. <laughs> Wait a minute. Oh, I missed that whole story. I was like spaced out. <laughs> Uh, he was opening uh, for Elvis uh, Costello. Oh, for real? I'll retell the story. Oh, I, uh, yeah, I, I, I ran to the bathroom, I heard, so I, I'm sorry about that. And then he accidentally pr- pressed an, an applause sound effect, and then the crowd... Oh, that's that's Started funny. The it. crowd actually, actually responded by clapping, <laughs> thinking that it that's was actually great. the crowd. It's like Fart Simpson yeah. is back. Fart is back. Back to save the show. <laughs> 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 so, wow. Allison, Fart Simpson makes these mashup. Okay. He takes two bands, and we have to figure out what the what's being mashed. What the band is, for example, um, CeeLo Green Day. Okay, okay. So it's the name of the band. Yeah, and then their words will overlap. Right, 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 right. Okay. Yeah, I saw a little bit of it. Okay. I caught it. Wait, we're going back to this for real? He, I, why is he here? <laughs> I thought you pulled him up. <laughs> Me? No. Fart, you got more? <laughs> fart just put, Fart hacked our Yeah, somehow he's he got, got through. We can front. hear him. <laughs> How did that even happen? Oh, did Fart unmute himself? I don't know. You no. got something to say, Fart? Yeah, you got more? <laughs> oh, I definitely have more. But oh. you can, uh, you can. Mute me. I'm just sprinkling drops. <laughs> how Funky. about I have an? How about um, we bring on uh, Robbie Augsburger? He's on the line. Is he here? I he was can join for in. Uh, he's he's on, on the hothead. He's on the hothead line. Oh, he's calling in. Yeah. Okay. And uh, Robbie is a uh, one of the most uh, creative and uh, you know artsy people I've ever met. He's a he's like a quadruple threat he's a i don't know is he there maybe he's, can you hear us you there robbie hey there he is yeah i'm here Roggy osberger on the phone 
and he's a he's a, po- he's a Portland boy. He's a you've definitely seen his pictures. Um, how would you explain your photography first? Like that's because it's a very distinct style, and uh, I know a number of the pictures you've taken have kind of like have a had a life of their own on online, right? Yeah, yeah. Started about ten years ago. I just they started becoming memes and uh, yeah. <laughs> That kind of thing, but uh, yeah, I guess. Uh, but yeah, I, I, I don't know. I would just describe it as uh, eye candy, probably. Yeah, yeah it's very, uh, you know, <laughs> it's your, it's your thing, a very, uh, you know, insular thing. Um, and then also, you're a musician, brilliant musician. Got the, you know, I, and I love your recordings and and uh, your albums and everything. Um, and uh, and you're just a, a talented dude. So. Happy to have you here, and you're going to be taking some pictures of us pretty soon uh, in December, I hear, right? Yeah, yeah, um, around the uh, Regent show, around that time. That it's is going to be like a nude sort of. Uh, yeah, I mean that's SNM the only thing. Kind of thing. Like, I, yeah, high concept. I just want to be the only one nude. Everyone I want to say to on. Robbie, thank you for sending me that skateboard down. Oh, yeah. Here's his shot. Oh, you're welcome. Let me pull that was up. really cool. This is a really fun yeah. one. Can you see this there? This is well, I uh, love Fraser. from uh, Office Hours alumni Stephen Malkmus. This Look at is that. one of his iconic shots. Isn't that amazing? That's beautiful. And, uh, Isn't that cool? And Rob, yeah. can, you, can, An you, eye shot. can you tell that story? Because like I know there's a lot of images that you shot of him, right? Malkmus? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Um, well, I was. Uh, he found me through a mutual friend who makes guitar amps. And uh, he saw a picture I took of my buddy, Chris Benson of Benson Amps. And uh, uh, he was like, who took that picture of you, Chris? And he said, my friend Robbie. And so Malcolmus emailed me, and then he came over to my house, and we did a photo session. And we hung out for about six hours. (laughs) And mostly he showed me stuff on YouTube. (laughs) He mostly showed me stuff on YouTube. That's amazing. (laughs) He emailed you. That's wild. (laughs) Yeah, he just emailed me. Yeah, That's uh, sick. Yeah, he didn't. He would like strip down to his boxers right in front of me. I didn't. Oh my god! We were just in my awesome. basement. Okay. Wow. Now we're yeah, getting awesome. somewhere. But, but, yeah, now we're getting somewhere. But well, there's a happen? no. But there's a but well, there's usually, a music I video, have a spot right? Where you, you don't have to. You don't have to just strip down. Oh, like, uh, oh! You have a curtain in the middle of my studio. You could just go into the changing area. <laughs> He's like, I don't care. <laughs> I like that. I guess when you're, I guess when you're a road dog, you don't care about that. Right, it doesn't matter what he's people see. A road dog. Right. No, it doesn't matter. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, it's... yeah, he would just be up in my kitchen. We we're talking. And he would just start rummaging through my cabinets, looking for a glass, for a glass of water, and that kind of thing. <laughs> so you're saying so he's so an actual kind of human being? Right. That's pretty <laughs> wild. He can have relationships with people. Well, That's I mean, cool. I wouldn't just start rummaging through anyone's cabinets if I. <laughs> He's right. kind I mean, of an asshole. I don't think yeah, he's rude so... and an asshole, right? He's listening right now, just so you know. He's a, I, yeah. he's a huge officer. Oh. Head. <laughs> God damn it. But uh, um, <laughs> I was just I was talking with Luke, the, the sound guy, a little earlier, and he could not believe, I don't know if you heard it, but I, I played that um, that Beatles super mix uh, disco kind of thing that you found. Do you remember like where that is from or who made that? Oh, that? Uh, yeah, that was... Um, so... That's called Stars on 45. That's a Dutch DJ right. um, who at one point had been in a popular Dutch rock band in the 60s. But by the early 80s, he had been uh, just a, he had become a popular DJ in Holland. And he put together, he cut together this big, long mix. <laughs> it's like 15 um, him minutes and his friend, <laughs> like Yeah, and it's just like a medley, kind of like your band name game, um, where they just kind of intersected all of these Beatles songs into one big song, kind of like what Nilsson did too, like mm-hmm. with the uh, I Want to Hold Your Hand medley thing. He right. Did. But uh, right. yeah, and that Stars and, you know, the Stars and 45, that was a huge hit. And um, people thought it was, it was so um, accurate, like mm. musically and the vocal imitation was so accurate. People thought it was, people had the multi tracks to oh, the wait. Beatles and they oh. remixed it. Oh, so it's actually this dude singing all those. Well, it's, Pop. They they were people in bands in Amsterdam at the time in like wow. 1980. Wow. Yeah, okay. So I, I, they, thought they, 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 I thought it was. I thought it was. Yeah. Like all together. That's incredible. Yeah. So um. So Robbie. Uh. Hey. Fart. Do you have a? Do you have like five minutes to stick around and then we can do the game? Uh. Yeah. Okay. Good. So we'll. Uh, I actually, I have a huge list of these that we made about 15 years ago. Oh. Uh, of the band name game. Oh, nice. Okay. So should we? Should, is Matt bored? I don't know. Yeah, just... I've got like 
I've got like 200 of those. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. So yeah, I was just going to say like, let's, let's uh, watch a performance from Robbie and then we'll do the game with, with Robbie. What, what game? What? The All farts, right. the fart Simpson game. Oh, more. Oh, okay. Well, he's online, isn't he? Or... Okay. Okay. What are we about to watch? This Vic? is Robbie. Right this now? is Robbie. This is Robbie's uh, two new songs. Uh, he goes under the name Ozarks.
Beautiful stuff there, Robbie. Thanks, Robbie. Oh, You're thanks, still man. On the horn. That was yeah, I'm that was here. Incredible uh, production there. Um, and uh, where can people find this and other songs of yours? Well, those two songs aren't released yet. Whoa! Um, but the rest of my catalog is available at castleozarks.com. Beautiful. Everybody, uh, run like out and get camp. it. So um, yeah, thanks, go get buddy. it. Yes, go get it. And, and Robbie and uh, we're gonna we're gonna get get moving here. We got a, a special guest in the in the room here. But we will see you Ooh. in uh, about two weeks or so. All right, in yeah, in the man. flesh. Cool. All right, thanks, in thanks, buddy. Have a good one. Yeah, catch you later. Take care. All right. Thanks, Robbie. Thanks for the skateboard. Uh, rest uh, in peace, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, we got right. a very got, special uh, guest here. Yeah, some new blood, Mr. Andrew Michon. Andrew Michon. Hey, how's everyone doing? I am fresh blood. I am new wow, me. Hey. What have we been talking about? Catch me up on everything that's happened so far. <laughs> you know, we Allison, got dead right? dog. Nice to we see you. Allison. Allison. Yeah. Allison was telling about uh, telling us about her diarrhea earlier. Oh, so wow. Yeah. She caught the dead. diarrhea bug. Oh, for like a minute. Wow. Yeah, it wasn't okay. like a whole thing. So it was not mostly about that. No. A good um, chunk. Well, hey, I'm glad to get caught up. I mean, what's next? <laughs> what's next for the crew? What's I got up? a fun hypothetical if you guys want to hear it. Oh, please, please bring it. Yeah. All right. It's not mine. I didn't create it, but it is a good one. Okay. Would you rather get cancer mm -hmm. or canceled? <laughs> canceled? Canceled. Yep. Cancer well, or canceled? what kind of cancer? Canceled. Can you pick the cancer? You can't pick the cancer. Let's say it's about... What stage? Wait, how, wait what's the cancellation about? It, it's not... It's No one has to suffer at your hands. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm not saying that, like, there would be victims, but basically... You are fully done. Your career is over. Your like friends someone up. found an old tweet. I'm not sure. Your friends abandon you. Like it's pretty bad. It's like very you, bad. You get fired by Subway. Or yeah, something well, like, like you're like, fully like, done. Or you get cancer and survival rates about fifty percent. I'm gonna go canceled because yeah. I could still do the Louis C.K. circuit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. So there's also there's yeah. always somewhere you can. You would just get a new fan base. Okay. I'll just go right. to like Spain or something. Okay, yeah, yeah. I hear that. Yeah, that's, I mean, life. that's the thing. Like the people that get canceled just double yeah. down. Yeah, of, course, of course, of course. What are you gonna do? They're fine. But, but let me give you a little mm -hmm. bit of an alternative. If you get that cancer, you survive it. People are gonna rally around you. You're gonna have more opportunities yeah. than you ever thought was, possible. That's what the route I was oh. thinking yeah. was like. Ooh, that go fund me. Yeah, I know. There's going to be a lot of support like, for you. Those fundraiser right. shows. Yeah yeah. yeah, yeah. But you're rolling the die. Because you're rolling the dice. It's hey, fifty fifty. It's but like I'm a head okay with tails. dying. Maybe well, I'll say. Okay maybe I'll say. I'm totally okay. With I'll dying. say thirty seventy. Thirty percent die. If it's thirty percent, I'll do it. I'll do cancer. Oh, thirty percent death. Thirty percent death. Seventy percent oh. survival. I'm a gambling man. You're no gonna more. go cancer. Yeah, I'm gonna go cancer. Yeah, you gotta go somehow. I guess. I'd probably do cancer too. Maybe. Would you rather fall to sleep? Fall asleep at the wheel of your minivan. And unfortunately, a family dies. Yes. Oh, no. My family? Or? Someone else. Some anonymous family. Okay. And you have to live with that for the rest of your life. Okay. Or the only <laughs> show you can never watch again is it's Cosby Show. Pete Holmes. <laughs> <laughs> Kill the family. Let's load, let, oh, let's load up Kill HBO Max. Family. Let's load up HBO Max. Let's get crashing on. Load it up. <laughs> And I've never seen that show. I just picked out a random. Right, show. right. I get it. I get it. Like even if you try to click on something else, like on Netflix, like <laughs> it it'll just play. Right. Right. And it starts no in the middle what. of a random episode. <laughs> <laughs> you have no idea what's going <laughs> on. Netflix you don't get any and references. Chill with someone. That's uh -huh. your choice. You have to. You know, you can pick any episode. <laughs> Actually, what about this? What if it's not even any episode? It's just one scene after another, and each oh. scene is taken from different episodes. <laughs> like a collage. You gotta watch it on shuffle. The scenes are on shuffle. You know, speaking of shuffle, I had this idea the other day. You know, we're doing Zoom, right? You guys do have zoomers and stuff oh yeah i think Big it'd be time. really interesting I, I like this is straight up a good idea that i think zoom should implement to like kind of now that we're coming out of the pandemic to kind of like revitalize its interest what if Zoom had an option where when you create a meeting you can have an option that says invite a shuffler and then when mm. you log on to zoom you can just join a random meeting shuffle style like it's like chat, chat roulette, roulette. Oh, like chat roulette. Yeah. Oh. so you can just it's a setting on your meeting you say invite strangers and then if you want to just hop on Zoom and join random people's Zooms, you can. I mean, there's going to be so many people just jerking off. I know, but you can. that's an mm -hmm. option. You just say no. Anyone can say no. Right. But if you want it for fun, you want, then yeah. why not? Because it'd be let's like, get someone in now. Let's, let's put try it right. Let's, let's shuffle in a yeah. Zoomer. Because it's like chat roulette, but with a group. You know, right, I think that would be right. cool. 
And is nudity? Or can we have nudity on the show? I don't know. Is that like loud <laughs> right now? Can we try it. That's a good idea. Andrew. It's a good idea. I yeah. think it was straight up like because people are using it less and less. I would use it more. It's it is that when it's, it's one on one. Yeah, it's, they, it's, it's a, a whole. whole I heard yeah. Yeah, Zoom this last quarter only grew by thirty <laughs> percent. Only, <laughs> only. But they were actually like really slowing down, like because uh, it, it, it like quadrupled during the the pandemic. Yeah, I met right. someone right before the pandemic who who. T- told me about Zoom like oh, a week before the pandemic the happened. They were ahead of the game. Oh, she was doing tarot card readings on Zoom, <laughs> and I had no. And she was like, Zoom. "She fucking predicted she, that." She shit. was also there wearing is. a mask, which oh, is really crazy. Holding... I'm not kidding. She was wearing a mask. <laughs> Wait, she was wearing a mask <laughs> yes. before what? the pandemic. Yes. This Who was, is this? This Dr. woman from a, a week from the future. This woman yeah. was on my podcast. She walked by and sat down, and it was like we recorded it like early March, late February. She had a full on mask, and she was talking about Zoom. It was like wow. she was like a harbinger of the future. Oh my god. god. Can we get her on here? I yeah. Know. Andrew's uh, podcast, of course, is oh, podcast, podcast but outside. Yes. We interview strangers, and and this interview is one of the strangers, strangers. on the street. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And she, so she was just a stranger on the street. Yeah, she was just a woman, wow. and she said she had a cold, so she was wearing a mask out of out of. Well, she maybe she had COVID. Maybe actually. she did. Yeah. But um, she, she, nobody owned. Where a mask was this? Right? I know. Yeah. I don't Andrew, know. How, where was this? Hollywood. Okay. Heart of Hollywood, right by that Target. Crazy. Was she? She's cool. Culturally She's, Asian. No, she that's... was she was culturally pretty white, <laughs> oh, but she yeah. was Asian. But culturally, <laughs> she was pretty white. Right. Um, no, she's she was white. She's a white woman. A, that's a thing you see more in Asian culture. I know you're right wear, about that. Wear yeah, with the, the SARS like, mask. No, no, she was like, like a, a woman in her forties who gave you know tarot card readings and palm readings. Hmm. Yeah. Anyway. Wow. Zoom. She knew too much. And she was fully vaxxed. She was fully vaxxed. She's yeah, like, yeah, yeah. I'm fully vaxxed, but I'll wear the mask anyway. Yeah, yeah. And you're like, what are you talking she, about? Like, this won't make sense now, but Pfizer. Pfizer. Right. You gotta go Pfizer. <laughs> Uh, uh, can we? Uh, oh, wait a minute! I think we got someone else coming in here. Oh, wow. Okay, wow. He'll need All a right. sec to get set up. Oh, uh, we won't the announce guys. him then. Should we get a zoomer in the mix? Zoom person. Um, sure. Let's do it up. Well, I have a request. Where do you yeah, want to sit next to me, Bray? I'll go next to you. Oh hell yeah! Go. Queasy Riders <laughs> online. Hey guys, can you hear me? Absolutely. Hey, what's up? Sweet. Beautiful, much, sh- beautiful shirt there you got. Yeah, nice shirt. Oh, thank you. I yeah. think I got the last one in large. So I'm oh, very happy about that. Sure. What's, what's, your, what's your most Skinner valuable record? Yeah. What's your oh, most what? valuable record? Well, I wanted to show you one record in particular I just got that I'm really excited about. Man, that's the dream mm-hmm. like collection right there. Like, And the, the yes, record's the like fr- up front. You just flip through them like you're at the record store. Where do you get those? Yeah. Those boxes, those are cool. Uh, those are from a record store that closed down in D.C. Oh. like 20 years ago. Okay. Uh, Yoshitoshi, I think. Okay. Electronic. Anyway, you Angelina should recognize this lady. Angeline. Okay. Is that, um, oh, that yeah. Yeah. Huh. That's a is that Kiss, Mayoral, is that Kiss Me LA? Is that Kiss Me LA? I don't know what it's That's called. Beautiful. I forget. I think it's just self-titled. Oh, um, wow. I got to do a ride with her once on the <clears throat> Corvette. And yeah. she just told oh. me to lose weight. <laughs> <laughs> you paid for this service? <laughs> no, I won it. Oh my god! But I think everybody wins it <laughs> if you <laughs> if you submit. Yeah. And then she tries to sell you merch out That's of the trunk of her oh car. Oh my god! Yeah, yeah. yeah. She's uh, like, "Want to feel bad about your body? Come icon. ride with Angeline." <laughs> <laughs> it was just the weirdest. Like I was like, uh, "Okay, <laughs> what do you say to that?" Okay, yeah. Angeline. What's She's like, work re- on What's it. on that record? "Kiss Me LA" is her oh, famous song. I'll oh, say that. Oh, yeah, I forget if that's on here, but what? one of the reasons I got it. Yeah. You can yeah. your mic in, bro. I know, I'm about to. I'm about to. Uh, give, him, give him a my, second. Uh, my list, it's called. My list. Oh, she's got a couple songs. My list. That's yeah, song, my, my buddy list. David that's actually played name. drums on some of these songs. He had just moved to LA in like 81, 82. And one of his friends was like, Do you want to play on this random? Is that an session? album or a plate? Like, yeah. <laughs> it's a picture disc. It's a picture disc. LP. Both, really. <laughs> Both. <laughs> yeah. That's cool. But, so I'm very happy with that. Thanks, Queasy Rider. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, no worries. All right. Please Be welcome well. to the show Brent yes. Weinbach from the Poundcast. Huzzah! You could, you could check. You could catch Brent and I. Oops, wrong one. Brent and me. Brent and me. Brent and me. Yeah. You could. Pre- you, uh, What's you, the difference with the you get rid of you get rid of the the, the name like yeah. so you take the name out so it's like like I'm going to the store with Brent and me so you just it's always me right isn't that right no it's, it's oftentimes it's and I. Like, it's Brent and I are going to the store if if you just just oh, no if it's, no if it's the, no in the, in the, in the, the beginning it, no it's Brent and I are going to the store because I'm, I am going to the store not yeah, me I'm going I to the store just take, oh, take out Brent okay, and yeah. then just see, if see what sense. happens if it makes yeah, sense it makes without sense. Brent then it's and that's, that's in, in life as well take yeah. out Brent and see <laughs> what happens it's a good it's a good <laughs> lesson you know uh-huh. yeah 
Well, irregardless, well, Brett and I. Well, you can stay, Brett. And Brett and me. Me, M- Mimi I, is going I, to I, the hideout in Chicago, oh. January twentieth, with Brent. That'll be fun. And the next day, Louisville, Kentucky, at Zanzibar. Zanzibar. Howdy, cowboys. It's I, like is is Billy he mic'd? I don't think I'm hearing. Oh, I don't, there oh, he is. Do you hear me now? now one, two, right. three, four, five, six. How does this sound? Four, five, six. Do I sound strong? Now we're talking. I like this though, man. I got a, we got a good little group here, huh? Yeah, it's been a fun day. It's nice yeah. to see yeah. you. I mean, I mean, we're all kind of far away, but I mean, we're far yeah, away. This is the furthest. I, this is like the farthest I've ever been from. This, this is the farthest. Host. This is far the farthest I've been from anybody. Ever. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so close to people usually. Three. Well, not now, and um, I think I told Andrew because he used to do the. Uh, what? It's funny that I'm behind you like this. I know. <laughs> kind of like it. You can pull your like chair it. up and sit next. No, yeah, you can go like right here if you want. No, but or... it's kind of funny though. It's kind of like a Joe's room situation, you know. It does look normal on. You want to put your hands on my shoulders? Come he on. almost looks like your really ventriloquist want. dummy, right. like from this angle right. that I'm sitting at. <laughs> right, 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 right. Say something, Doug. Watch this. I told Andrew to bring some pun subjects so we could do a pun contest, kind of like when we used to do it at the two at cruise shows. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah? yeah? And uh what happened at the Two Wet Crew show? Andrew would uh, well, ju- be the... the I don't uh, want to be the judge, though. I just want to bring the topics, and then we'll all just You know, you don't judge. Right. You, you kind of, just... like, run the contest. But I don't even really want to do that, to be honest. I'll, <laughs> I'll bring the topics, but let's all play, you know? I think I should be able to do puns, Absolutely. too. Absolutely. That's all. What happened to the other... Wasn't there supposed to be another game? Um, with the music? Oh, yeah, with we, Fart Simpson? Yeah. Oh, okay. what's that? Oh. And Farts Around, we got to do another fart. We did fart. enough. Oh, the songs? Is the songs? Let's, let's I, I, I was puns. listening to those earlier. Yeah, they were they're awesome. They were really lo- fun. By the way, I loved uh, Andrew's puns, by the way. He has some good puns. When? Oh. During the pun during contest? Those, yeah, during okay. those puns. I would always give oh, it up for thanks. you. thanks. I appreciate that. You too. You too, sir. And I give it up for you too. You too, young man. Are you, what are you talking about? We all got good oh. puns. Puns. When? Pun contest. Pun contest. At the live shows. Yeah, yeah. live shows. Yes, sir. Live shows. So the way the pun contest works is I just suggest a topic, and then we all just kind of free flow, come up with puns on that topic, and just have fun with it. And as Brent said, it's all about giving it up. Even if this pun is bad, you act like it's as good as can be. That's how you do it. That's how you do it. We lift each other up. That's how, as Brent's style, we lift each other up. I like that. Empowering. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So should I give so a topic? You're gonna be, you're gonna yeah, kill let's us jump in. No, no, I, I, I thought of the topics. I haven't thought of a single pun with any of them. I do promise you that. Oh, really? You thought of the topics? Already? Yeah, it's I thought. Okay. Of, I thought you know, of a I'm few topics. I'm gonna lift you up, even if you have. I'm you okay. Know, ready to lift go. you up. You know what? Actually, going off of what she was bringing up earlier, and what you guys oh, brought I up love. again, diarrhea. Yes. My, the topic will be body parts or functions. Just any body part or body function. I, we already talked to Fart Simpson. <laughs> <laughs> All right, body parts right. or functions? Yeah, any body so part. So you just or like function. say a sentence or Pretty something? much. Yeah. Pretty much. Yeah. Well, this reminds me of when yeah. I went to dinner with Brent. <laughs> I usually have to foot the bill. <laughs> okay. Yeah. 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 Did you say foot yeah. the bill? I oh, I got, got it. Got it. Got it. And, I, and Doug is getting a head start today. He's got mm. the first pun of the day. You got to hand it to okay. me. Oh, yeah. That's good. Because <laughs> you're just going to get a leg up on you guys? Yeah, I, I see. You got it. You head got start. It. I see how the game works. Yeah, you see. Yes, yes, yes. I see. Hey, I, you yeah. know what? I, Doug I, knows I, how to yes. play this game. He, actually. he <laughs> knows how to play it. He does. He does. Are you peeing this? Are you peeing this? Look. He's on. Peeing this? <laughs> it's like, are you seeing this? Uh-huh. Like, are you peeing this? Doug is so uh, good yeah. at this. I thought you were talking. He is. Wait. Oh, wait. You see that instrument? I thought you were going to say, am I a penis? Yeah. Yeah. Am I a penis? <laughs> Doug right. is so good at this. He's unbiolevable. Oh, <laughs> man. Okay. I'm having a ball here. This is fun. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Um. You're in too deep. <laughs> yeah, yeah. This is vile in urine. Yeah. That reminds me of amputation because that's a deep cut. <laughs> oh, I like. <laughs> How about this? Doug and Eyes will be going to, you know, <laughs> Chicago, you know, in a little bit. <laughs> That's good. That's Doug good. and Eyes. Keep, uh, me, keep me abreast of what's going oh, on there over there. We go. There we go. I, actually, I did say, I didn't specif- specify, but we are talking about men's bodies. Oh. Yeah, we're talking oh. about men's bodies. You know Sorry, what? Some men specify- have breasts, men, actually. Men, actually. Men, men have breasts, yeah. I was just about to back you up okay, on that. Men point. have breasts. Excuse you. <laughs> actually, more, more men have breasts than okay. women, actually. That's fair. Actually, it's more of a man thing. That's more fair. men have breasts than women? Yeah, absolutely. Look it up. That's <laughs> look a real it th- Look it up on YouTube. 
I think that's more like a nipple thing. I think they have more nipples. <laughs> they got every they, men have everything more than women. <laughs> just whatever it is, nipples, breasts, anything. Are you talking Gen- about balls? Vaginas. They, about they balls. got them all. You know? Balls. Uh, by the way, check this one out. Um, I mean, these are great puns, but <laughs> 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 this one's that one's the ultimate. <laughs> <laughs> oh, um, you, 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 oh, never mind, actually. <laughs> <laughs> what? It's not good. <laughs> go ahead, go for it. It, it barely makes sense, but I'll say, um, well, you're wearing L shirt, but what about L bow? Ty, ah, See, it doesn't. Oh, it's, that, it's oh. far. Like, that's crazy. You said that. I was just about to do an elbow <laughs> pun. Thinking, I, was, I, was, elbow. Well, I was working out of my head right <laughs> now, hard. and I couldn't figure it out. Thank you. you know, <laughs> Thank you for figuring it out for me. I went to the doctor yesterday to get a physical, and he gave me this c- kind of like a bodily quiz. Mm-hmm. And he was using like, he was touching my funny bone, mm-hmm. and it was more of like a, it it tickled. It was like a test tickle. All right, next topic. He's hitting me with that little triangle <laughs> hammer. You know what I'm talking about? Next topic. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna just rock this joke for a while. No, I like. Okay. That. Yeah, keep going, baby. Yeah. Next topic is animals. Oh shoot. Uh, now hold on a second. Just bear with me. Okay. Yes, yes. 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 <laughs> you ain't lying. You you are doing pretty good. You ain't. You did that on purpose. Good. Very yes, good. Yes. The pun contest. No. Very. No. I wasn't sure if that was accidental. That was oh, good. Oh, for sure. On purpose. For sure. On purpose. For sure. Oh, for sure. For sure. For sure. For sure. For sure. <laughs> On porpoise. on porpoise, yeah, there we go. On That's porpoise, on porpoise. Okay. I like very that. good. I like yeah. that. Very on a good. scale of one to ten, would you? How would you? On a scale, scale, <laughs> scale <lizard. laughs> Yeah, on a scale from one to ten, I would say that uh, Andrew is a very pretty bird. <laughs> you know what I mean? Eng- like English style bird. You know what I mean? Like he's a oh. he's a bird. He's a nice I like, bird. I like it. Oh, there's a know. bird right here. Actually, <laughs> where's that bird? You skip. I'm the actual female. You're right. You're right. I you just I you got blocked out for a second by the monitor here, and so I just <laughs> I think when I they do call you know what? Birds that's right. Too. Oh my gosh, there's a bird right there, here in this room. There, I could, thank I you. Just thank get a good you. Look. I need. You know what? This is a better view for me. Here. I got now. I got view of all the birds in the room. Oh, now you're off camera though. Mm, you're off camera. Oh, am I off? Yeah, you're off. Got, all right, gotta get back in. Just squeeze. Just. Yeah, squeeze, cozy up to Doug. Just you, you, even you, further you behind, ought or no. Oh, like exactly behind yeah, me. Yeah, there you go. I could go over more. <laughs> That's the shot. Oh, yeah, Man, yeah, I, I, um, I could pee so bad right now. I could pee a hundred times. And after I do that, I would call it my centipede. There it is. <laughs> there it is. Okay, <laughs> there it okay, is. Okay. I there no, is. I don't get it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll pee, I'll pee um, a million, I mean, a thousand times. Milli- millipede. 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 <laughs> got any, any, any of you Zoomers got any animal puns? Let's get some Zoomers. Get no, I'll get a good one going soon. Yeah, we'll get some real good ones. Going animals soon. Is Zoomers, so you got any? I think it should be specific. a new topic. Should it be? I, could do, I can open them up. How about this? I'll open her up. Mother Nature. Oh, I was just going to do oh. even animal. broader. Yeah. Oh you, oh, you think animals is too broad? Yeah, it should be like insects. Or oh, I thought it was I mean? too narrow, you were saying. Oh. Okay, how about this? The ocean. Well, oh, I had, hmm. okay. Oh. The I ocean. got one that's animal and ocean. Okay, what is it? Oh, I'm allowed to go? Yeah. Okay. Um, <laughs> check this out. So you know how there's, um, you know, for kids, um, you, there's, you know, these places you can go to get, you know, different games and things like that. Well, you know, adults, they're into more adult type stuff, you know, like um, when they want to build a house or something. I don't know, something like that. And then there's some, <laughs> anyway, you basically go to Wal, Wal, R- R- Us, Wal, R- Us, because <laughs> you want to build, I don't know, something uh. like that, you know, it's, I don't know. <laughs> You want to build uh, what? A house? <laughs> I like it. I like <laughs> it. He's like, I'm done. Please. Uh, I mean, get, for me, they kind of come in waves, you know. Mm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> hey, you know who's good though? I'm not even kidding. Actually, I really enjoy the music of Seal. <laughs> I'm not even joking on that one. I love those songs. What about Whale? <laughs> There's that rapper called Whale. Is there one? Yeah. Wale, technically. What about yes. Flock of Seagulls? <laughs> there we go. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, it is. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, we're just name, we should just name <laughs> bands that sound <laughs> like animals. <laughs> I don't know about that band. It's for the birds. <laughs> <laughs> mean, you mean Allison? Ocean birds. Ocean birds, ocean you mean. Birds. birds that are on the ocean. Yeah. yeah. Oh, um, Billy Thompson, you got one? All right, let's bring it Let's on hear one. it. Oh, yeah, Fish is a band, too. <laughs> yeah, yeah uh, there you go. 
ocean fish. We're just naming stuff that is involved with yeah, the ocean yeah, exactly, at this point. Yeah. So, oh, you, Billy, guys, you guys know sharks? You remember sharks? They're in the ocean. <laughs> just, that's it. Right, right, right. The snipers, uh, the sniper spotter said, "See an enemy." Ah, yeah, there we go. Nice. Oh, that's yeah. good. Oh, that's yeah, good. We're, we are anti-war here, but that was good. Yeah. That was good. <laughs> we are anti-war, but that was good. But I, we I, like I, the I, I got one brewing That's true, right but we do now. support the troops. Support <laughs> <laughs> but we do support I'm trying to brew. No, I'm brewing. I'm brewing right now. Go ahead. Keep going. <laughs> I just wanted to keep you posted that I'm brewing one right now. Yeah. Maybe we need one person to just talk while we can all be brewing. <laughs> Otherwise, there's silence. So Wait, be, is it now all the topics at once? Yeah, it's whatever you want, really. So there'll be two do you topics. Have other topics be, lined up. In I a do. Hopper? I got them. But okay. there'll be two topics. There'll be the pun topic, then there'll be the monologue topic. So the person who talks has to do the monologue topic. Oh, that's good. <laughs> right. Oh, that's, that's good. good. Okay. Okay. Let's pick a monologue okay. and we'll, we'll pick switch a monologue off. Topic. Brent, do you want to be the first monologue? Uh, okay, I'll do it. Okay. Yeah. Well, it's, you want Vic? You got a monologue topic? <laughs> no, not really. It could no, just be anything. Anything. Okay. Uh, how about? Um, that was the time. The monologue. That's the time I pooed once. <laughs> And let's, let's <laughs> that was the time that's there. good. That's good. Uh, the, uh, the most embarrassing um, shirt you've ever bought. <laughs> most embarrassing shirt ever bought. How about what shirts? Well, no a shirt. Well, that's a the shirt. No, no, no. Let's just get shirts. on that uh, embarrassing shirts. Well, it's it's more about. Okay, should I come up with a new pun topic, or are we doing yeah, ocean? I think yeah, a new topic. Us a new oh, okay, food, food and dining. So you'll okay. be brewing while okay, I we're do all my shirt stories. But then when we chime in, you just pause and we'll. Got it. Got it. Got it. Pause. That's a that's an animal pun, isn't it's it? True. Oh, there it is. Pause. It's okay. True. Oh, what's the uh, topic? Food, food, food and dining. <laughs> okay, so um, you know, it's not about the shirt I bought. It's that the shirts my mom bought for me when I was a kid, right? So, uh, no, I know you're not meant to answer because you have to brew. But um, I, ha- she got this shirt for me. This one shirt. I mean, it's not that. It's it just it said way cool on it. And I just thought that was, looking back, uh, that was kind of embarrassing. I even remember someone commenting on it at school, and they said, oh, your shirt's so way cool. <laughs> it was this kind of neon shirt that said way cool on it, you know. And then I had the, a couple of hypercolor shirts, you know. Um, one of them had a man on it who disappeared. It was an invisible man, but his hat stayed there, you know. And then I had this. I'm straight up th- listening to his story. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's hard. And I'll that's hard. another one that's yeah. too big. Too broad? Too, too broad. Mm-hmm. Really? Yeah, I think so. What if so. it's like specific, like Italian? Italian food. Pick one. All right. Yeah. I got a, I got a, food. I got a food pun. Uh, hey, you know there's that band called Fish? Mm-hmm. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Italian food hey, it is. I was trying to think of something, but I, but I was thinking spaghetti about it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you know what's It's funny because these puns are like what would be on stupid t shirts. <laughs> right. Yes, right? yes, yes. Like, these let's puns talk are about I wonder if those t shirts. Companies have like a writer's room. This is you know? it. This is yeah. what they do. Some of these puns are foo silly, you know. <laughs> They're just foo silly for me, man. Foo silly? Yeah. Is that a type of Italian pasta? Pizza? Pasta. Ah. <laughs> and I meant too silly, but you know, the foo silly. <laughs> okay. I had this other shirt that uh, said there was a big two on the front of it, you know? Uh-huh. It said two, and then on the back it said bad. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. Brent, remember you had that. Um, your 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 Filipino uncle had that friend named John, and he was a pharmacist. What did he call him? Filipino uncle. <laughs> okay, uncle. No, he his friend was named John, and oh, he was a pharmacist. John. He called him Parma John. <laughs> Parma. That's good. Parma John. I like it. I like it. Uh-huh. No, that's, uh-huh. that was really good. That's uh-huh. the best. Yeah, best that's of the good, bunch. Good man. That's good. Yeah. Parma John. That's good. That's good. <laughs> That's very good, Doug. Very good. Very good. Um, what else? Um, I had this shirt. <laughs> <laughs> had, uh, <laughs> the monologue slash brew might be a failure. Not on your, not for your, not on your fault. It's just it's too confusing hard, for yeah. everything. Yeah. Yeah. No, but it, truth be told, though, I mean, there's tons of shirts I went through, man. I had different. I had, uh, you know, I I always admired these kids who wore these. Shirts, these Looney Tunes shirts, the basketball Looney Tunes turn shirts, and I thought I want to try to do that, and I tried to do that once, and it just didn't work for me. I had some sort of Bugs Bunny basketball shirt, and it didn't work. You know, you know I feel like we're all kind of like feeling that California vibe right now. You know, mm-hmm. I feel like we're all in the cow zone. <laughs> there it is. We're all kind of like, like that. Feeling it. I like that. Yeah. I like that. Wow. I like that. Oh, man. Lift him up. <laughs> Lift him up. Lift him up. 
Um, then that was a uh, new key. Oh, very funny. Yeah. Very funny. <laughs> <laughs> like low key. Like, you know, like low key. Yeah, that's yeah. good. I feel that's like good. All, all of you are kind of just saying words that sound like things, you know? All it of sounds you? like we're being racist towards Italian. Did you say all of you? Yeah, all of you. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That was an accident. Oh, that, that was an accident. accident. Wow. That was an accident. But Beautiful. thank you for pointing lift it out. Uh-huh. Lift you See, up. See, now brother. I feel like a gobble ghoul. <laughs> hey, gobble. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's true. That's true. You, you know do. What, though? I, I'm into it. I'm in. I'm in. I'm into it. I'm into it. That's another pun. <laughs> <laughs> Not topic yet. But well, it's kind of uh, ocean related. Ocean related. Ocean gets too cold. Way. Yeah, when it gets cold. Yeah. <laughs> well, I was I was in my backyard with. There was a dirt and there was like tomatoes and stuff, you know, that area. Uh-huh. And uh, <laughs> producer Matt's like, you got to get down to the studio. And I was like, okay, I'll leave garden and go there. <laughs> I was just at Olive Garden moments ago. Uh, moments ago? A half hour ago. Yeah. Really? You went there? The heck? Really? I would never the... imagine you to be No, I place. wasn't eating. I was there for other stuff. Really? A meeting? What were you doing? For yeah. other stuff. I did my podcast. Were you in front there of for it, a yeah. meet? Oh, really? I just did my uh, podcast were, were, in front of all of them. Were you there to meet somebody? M E A T? Yes, yes, yes. To meet somebody. Yes, yes. I was doing the meet. Yeah, yeah. Gabagool, like she said. Oh, yeah. Okay. Hey, how about this one, though? I had this Bart Simpson sweatshirt, and it said, it had him reading a comic book, but it was hidden inside of a book, and it said "Genius at Work" or something like that. And man, I mean, I actually did like this sh- sweatshirt of mine, but my teacher really she ragged on me because I wasn't a great student, and uh, she just was saying, "Oh, you your shirt says Genius at Work, but I don't really see you being that way." You know, she was kind of had that attitude, so that was kind of. Oh, a, is this a real shirt again? Yeah. Oh, I forgot. I thought you were going to the puns. Yeah. No, yeah, no, 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 like no. This is a monologue. This is, I was monologue. Oh, because I saw this kid at the mall when I was looking for shirts, and um, he was just kind of standing there like this, and like I was thinking, that boy lonely. <laughs> I got it, lonely. Lonely. <laughs> <laughs> lonely. That's good. That's good. That's the, good. The last hey, time probably, I was at, uh, You know what, Doug? <laughs> I'm gonna have to give it up to you as my favorite pun of the day. Okay. That boy lonely. Yeah. Brent, are that you? Boy lonely. Brent. <laughs> that boy lonely. That boy lonely. That boy lonely. That boy lonely. Brent, you're Gen X, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm Gen OA. Like the salami. <laughs> Gen OA. <laughs> yeah. Ah, that's pretty good too. Well, the last time I was at the Olive Garden, yeah. I I walked in. I was like, oh shit, the lights are off. They they must be closed or something. And I, they were closed. And I was like, turns out I was like trespassing. A cop runs in, tackles me, and he's like, I'm going to lay down the laws on you, lasagna. <laughs> okay, okay. That's good. There we go. That's good. There That's a go. good one. It takes me a little while. These are good. <laughs> <laughs> We're cooking like here. That one was worth the wait. Yeah. yeah. I like the long walks. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, the it long walks are the good ones. Yeah. 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 Uh, talking about your I was starting to brew one, but I got to st- I got to get the shirt. I started brewing some. We, we can move on to a new monologue. Yeah. Well, here, yeah, I'll yeah. do one more. I'll do one more story about a shirt. Let me think. <laughs> Let me stop. Okay, I got it. Do you have about I got shirts? it. I used to wear my shirts out until they were so holy. You know, they were blessed by were blessed. Jesus. You know, no, uh, I had. They were so. They got so holy, and I would still wear them until they were, and they were just. You know, it's sometimes now people wear these as. Um, uh, designer shirts so they're all mm. ripped up but I used to do that for real what's more embarrassing hmm. think about it okay so what's Doug's topic gonna be um, I don't know but I was <laughs> <laughs> you brew it <laughs> I don't know I, I mean I it's marinari <laughs> <laughs> uh, alright Brett you pass me the Give me, give me a topic. Yeah. Oh, okay. I give you a caption. Yeah. Okay. Let's talk about um, your most deepest, darkest wet dreams. <laughs> deepest. Okay. Dirt. Last night, uh, <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking about the show. Thinking about you going to be on it. Oh yeah. <laughs> and I blasted. <laughs> Do we want another topic for puns? <laughs> Let's yeah. get I was in my stories. deepest waterbed. <laughs> How about this? Talk about girls you had crushes on. In in elementary school or junior high, that's your monologue. Go ahead, dude. You got shirts. I'm getting I wet. I like that. Okay, no, fine, that's fine, a good fine. one. Fine, forget that. Then how about pants? Oh, there was a girl in <laughs> most name, embarrassing Teresa pants in fourth grade. Yeah, <laughs> okay. but yeah, what about her? Yeah, I don't know. There was this one girl. I gave her a pack of gum. Oh yeah. And then I thought that was a lame gift. <laughs> she liked it, but it was all hot. You know, all right, let it was me start. like in my pocket. Kind of oh, it was like physically hot. You know, like, yeah. you know, like yeah. the Hubba Bubba. It's like a square. Uh-huh. Oh, it, you yeah, mean it was a big red? It was, warm and like it was big red. It was the, cinnamon. The edges no, of it was like the square. square. It was like bubble. No, I know the joke is that it was hot. It was hot. But, and uh, 
I gave her the pack, and it was sitting in my pocket all day, and it was kind of like a f- kind of smush. How, what did you say to her? Did you just hand it to her and walk away, or did you? No, say, I think I might have handed it? it through a friend. Oh shit! Oh god! Because like, you need to like, like, tell that flavor? your friend that I like her. Yeah, wow. I give her some gum. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Damn. <laughs> what, was she like into gum? Hot gum? Was this a thing? I don't know. It was like <laughs> the first time I liked a girl or something. <laughs> Cute. The first time you liked a girl was how old? Uh, I was like junior year, I think. <laughs> of no, college? I was college? Like, college, yeah. <laughs> it was like third or fourth grade or something. I don't know. Mm, late bloomer. I don't really remember anything before that. Hmm. What's the earliest grade to remember anything? I remember all the grades. I remember second grade, the day they came in with glasses for the first time. And she was like, you're so handsome. But they were like, <laughs> they're the worst glasses. They're gla- like so 80s. Like you know what's looking funny? Like, I got these. She was just these, being nice. I got these because these look like my first glasses I got. Oh, really? Like seventh the, grade? Like Ralphie kind of thing. They were like, they were like mm-hmm. this. It was good. Like, it's a good look, yeah. A throwback. Throwback to... What is the times. topic right now? I got. We it. don't have a pun topic. Shirts and then pants I got one, and then uh, I can give a topic. Hey, you want one? hey, hey, listen, man, don't don't eat that chicken, man. Hey, hey, bro, don't get that. Eat that chicken, bro. You might, bro, might get. Um, there might be E. coli in that, bro, 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 bro E. coli, bro, bro, E. coli in that. Are you trying to say broccoli? broccoli? Oh. Something like that. Yeah. <laughs> Famous Italian Famous dish. Italian. Yeah. No, maybe E. coli is the Italian. Oh, oh, like, you know about, <laughs> did you narrow it down to? No, it's about, you know about I this thought, uh, E. coli food. that's sweeping through the surfing world? Bro, coli? Uh, uh-huh, uh-huh. There, there it is. is. There there it is. Ocean, ocean it. there too. Hey, even it. It. All right, it. holidays. The holidays is the new pun theme. Well, wait. I, okay. By the way, I was. Oh, holidays. Any holiday, yeah. You mean holidays? Oh, Are we still nah, on food? Not on food. Any holiday. Okay, holidays. Oh, I can mm-hmm. easily do this. Hmm. Um. Yeah. I don't know. My the, my mind would be having so much uh, labor day today <laughs> <laughs> with all these puns I have to think of. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, we could move on from the pun contest. Hey, you know, you know that. Like, wait, real quick, I'll Honestly, just say this. We've kind of... I'll just say this. Do you know that? Um, because of the pandemic, everybody started doing everything online. It was yeah. everything was digital, right? Uh-huh. And so, um, you know, bartenders they actually started to mix drinks and on on the internet. And um, whenever they would mix it, they call it an Easter. And they kind of mix up the drink, an Easter. Easter, Easter, yeah. and, and, lift oh, yeah. and lift him up, and, and lift him up, and lift him up, <laughs> and lift him up. <laughs> lift him up. Right. Wait, when did they do that? <laughs> On the pandemic? I think it should be like, you know, these robots are doing the Easter. You can, like, do it online. Uh-huh. You want to stir your drink? Yeah. Yeah, that works too. Hey, lift him up. Lift, lift him, him up. up. Lift, lift him up. up. That works lift too. Up. Lift him up. Lift, lift him up. Lift this lift boy him. up. You got any zoomers that can uh, that boy. can jo- chime in here? Anybody? The boy lonely. Yeah, get some zooms in here. Let's talk to some. That boy lonely. That boy lonely. That boy lonely. The boy lonely. Oh man, there's like an hour left there. <laughs> I know. Moderner. We got, we got are you kind of? Are you guys tapped out? Making time fly. Are you guys tapped out? Oh, thank I you. Mean, We've been here since nine. I know you tapped yeah, out. Yeah. I'm asking you if you tapped out. Getting there. my brain's getting if a little. This leads to a, a pun. I'll answer. No, no, it doesn't. I'm asking: Are you tapped out? Do you feel <laughs> exhausted at this point? Um, are you I'm spent? fine. I'm know? actually, yeah, I'm, I'm doing actually all right. fine. Yeah, you don't feel fun. blasted? I felt I took a dip <laughs> after lunch, but uh-huh. you know I'm fine now. Did you guys take a lunch break? Full on lunch break? We took a dip. Yeah, we took a I got dip some plantains if you want unopened from Sage. Just out of untouched, unopened. Is Allison, Andrew, and 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 me? Are we? The last ones? Yeah, you're the... Oh, we're closing it you're out. the home stretch. Yes. Wow. But you can leave whenever you need. I mean, you know, no, I'm happy to... Does anybody want I'm me here. to go? I can go. I'm happy no, to we're, be I'm here. here. <laughs> we're, we're, I'm, if you, you know, need a drink, here. if you need a coffee, let us know. I got all I need, I right? I Panera iced coffee. You take a dip in a swimming pool? Or would you take a dip in? <laughs> in sauce. Yeah. Are you talking to me? Yeah, you said you took a dip. <laughs> it's like a sweet and sour. You mean like a dip. tired, like mm-hmm. a fatigue? Oh, you took dip. a dip. My energy level took. I a thought dip. you were saying that your energy level was going low, so you swam to kind of wake up. I initially thought that as well. Yeah, yeah, that's what yeah. It yeah. Like. So what? And by the way, why doesn't Tim have a pool? I, that's what I'm <laughs> wondering. <laughs> Someone at his serious. That's right what I'm Come trying on. to figure out. Where's the pool? Right. All right. So yeah, should we talk to some Zoom? That's the camera. That's the camera for him, huh? Yes. That's interesting. Yeah. Wait, well, with this is not the person we're talking to. Oh, that's the, just the last zoomer that just stays on the last zoomer for some reason. No, I, I understand wow. that. But can we I'm pick just someone. Can we choose yeah, someone? Yeah, the modern's on. Say something, modern. Sure, um, hey, Vic. Hey, Doug. Hey, hey. What's up? Um, so I was having fun watching the show today, and I was coming up with some OHL 
jingles, and I came up with a few if you'd like to hear one or two. Yes. Um, the David Cross segment was amazing, so here's the David Cross one. David Cross has come here to rate pets. I guess we'll find out which one he thinks is the best. How many bricks will the pet put to the test? Between one and 1,000. Between one and 1,000. Between one and 1,000. Nice, nice one. Yeah, we had David Cross on. He was rating pets. Nice. Was he in, in the studio or on no, the Zoomer? No, he Zoomer? was uh, zooming in from oh. New York. Oh. Uh, yeah. any, any, bu any busted ass pets? And he hung up on us. No. <laughs> ditched us. Were uh. there any pets that like weren't a dog or a cat? Yeah, oh, there yeah, was yeah, a couple of cold blooders. Was it a cold, oh, cold blooders. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> we had an African bullfrog and a. I have a hamster. That's a warm blooded. Yeah, I saw yeah, a yeah. rat on there. <laughs> but it's not a dog or a cat, you know? You do have another song? Another song? Another jingle here? Skip. Skip. Oh, yeah, for oh, sure. Yeah, I got one for uh, Vic the Third. Oh, here we go. <sighs> yeah, here we go. <laughs> Vic the Third gives advice for free. There's nowhere else you'd rather be. We're all needed by us, it's true. So let this man speak to you. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> and Zoomer, I have a question for you. Have you been watching all day? No, not all day, but uh, not at all. <laughs> I was just curious if your energy took a dip and if you swam or not. <laughs> Never mind. I, w I work in the circus for a long time, and I did the, the tightrope, right? Every time I stepped on the rope, I thought to myself, it's balance time. It's balance time. Valentine's. Valentine's. Oh, Valentine's. Yeah. Valentine's. Oh, yeah. Valentine's. Yeah. Yeah. Man, give him a drop. Ooh. Come on. Okay. Give him a ding. Oh, my thing died. <laughs> you thought that you thought the pun contest was over, but you thought wrong. Just getting started. <laughs> I forgot the subject altogether. <laughs> Holidays. Or I'll give you a late ding. Well, right. thank you for those jingles. Um, those are. Yeah, I think you should produce those with Steve Albini and send those in. <laughs> Make them sound real raw. Fly to Chicago. <laughs> Unless, uh, where are you located? I'm in Orange County, California. Doug. Oh, not far. I guess you could off, yeah. yeah, come up to the Maybe studio. You can work with live. Bob Rock. He's in the cow zone. Can you be up here uh, in 45 minutes? <laughs> <laughs> Lift him up. Lift him up for that callback. <laughs> Not at this hour. <laughs> callback. It's a callback. Yeah, you'll be in bumper to bumper. It's a callback. It's a callback. Cow? Cow? Yeah, animals. <laughs> 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 Thanks, Marlon. Callback. Who else we got out there? Let's see. Should we check in on I the mean, hotline? Do we have any hotlines? I'll hot get heads? on the piano if you want, maybe. Ooh, at yeah. one point. Yeah, well, yeah. you know that Tom Hanks is... Tom Hanks plays piano here? 917. Uh, 917, you're generous. live on the air. Hanks? Yeah. T. What's Hanks up? Giving. Yeah, you're on the air, 917. <laughs> there it is. Yeah, that's good. That's good. T. Hanks. T. Hanks giving. Hi. Hi. Hey. Somebody might have said that. What's up? So I'm just just giving you a call. Um, I actually have a monologue and a pun. Which one do you want to hear first? Let's start with the short thing yeah, and then pun, go to the, let's go yeah. pun first. Sure, sure, sure. So uh, I'm moving soon, but uh, we don't like to call our moving moving. We have a certain name for it. Do you know what we call it? Ooh. Boxing Day. Ah, oh, nice. Oh. nice holiday pun. <laughs> that should be what's um, Conor McGregor's actually, favorite uh, holiday. I'm actually a first-time caller, but I've been listening for a while. I'm, I'm too shy to do the Zoom. But um, uh, I actually have a small monologue. It's more of like a, like a praise. Was uh, This time last year, I had a really serious surgery I had to go through, and I was, like, really nervous, and I was bedridden for a while, and I had to recover from it. This isn't going to be uh, a pun or anything. One is thing that really... It's no, it's not a pun. No, no, okay, no. Okay, okay. And, it's uh, a monologue. Okay. One thing that really got me through recovery, because I couldn't move, I couldn't move my arms for like a few months, was uh, I found out about office hours. And so I started listening from the bed, and it really like, I don't know, it was, like, really raised my spirits. It was really fun. I just found out about it on YouTube. And then I like caught up with On Cinema and just like the whole lore. And uh, it was really cool. I'm a... Uh, subscribe to high network right now i want to subscribe to the patreon but i just started a new job so i gotta wait for uh you know money but uh oh, don't, don't i've been tuning in off it. and on all day and 
and I really, really appreciate what you guys are doing. It's a, uh, it's really great for artists like me. It's like it's cool to see you guys out there doing your stuff. And and I'm from You're California, welcome. which I really miss. I really miss <laughs> <Wait> California. <laughs> Hey, well, you just lifted us up. Yeah, this, thanks, that, bud. That, yes. And you know what? It yes. sounds like you're primed and ready to get into the pound cast next. Oh, there you know? we go. Yeah. You're ready <laughs> for that. It is. You, you've gone no, I was going to say you yeah. should I raise your uh, Patreon from five dollars to ten dollars, but to, uh, share it with the pound cast. Uh-huh. I've been listening to the Poundcast off and on. It's been hard. ever since I started my job. I've had to like. Well, turn it on, buddy. Behind on everything, <laughs> it sucks. Oh, speaking of Poundcast, actually. All right, that's enough. Poundcast. I, oh, Shut up, okay, Matt. Okay. Come on, come on. <laughs> now lift them up. I got Go it. Ahead. Thanks, guys. No, oh no, 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 no. no, 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 no. Matt's no, acting no, like wait. Tim right now. <laughs> okay, okay. I'll say, I'll say one last thing. Then. Okay. Um, no, don't just take your time. I tuned take your time. Into um, office hours, like this was year. This was actually a couple years ago. Um, I was watching Pound House uh, with a friend who actually recommended it to me, and it was like the funniest. The funniest, like, Lynchian thing I'd ever seen on YouTube in a long time. And I was actually wondering, you guys ever planning on putting those out on, like, a DVD, like a hard copy or something? Never thought about I'm thinking that. about putting them out on a BVD, the underwear. You know what I mean? <laughs> you watch the whole, se- whole series all on your underwear. Is that because it's so funny you'll shit your pants when you watch it? <laughs> that's good. That's well, good. Exactly. Uh, yeah. You know, that's a great it's idea. Fun. I don't know how many people would want a DVD of that, but... We should just make more episodes. That's what I would like to do, Brent. I would. Lo- I want to make the TV version. Let's do it. Yeah, if there's any, oh, you know. That reminds me. Can I put a word out to, to if just there's, everybody? If there's any TV executives li- listening. There's any, a few. Look, I got a couple texts We have a few shows yeah. for your network. We got Compound. If you don't like that, we got Pound House. I mean, there's even like Joel Hole, too, if you want to. If you, if you want Joel Hole, I mean, we got Joel Hole. It's pretty cool. That could be a TV show. Yeah, let's, ch- let's check and in then, where we're know, at on the Patreon, Tom. Yeah. Can you pull this up? If you like, you can even turn those shows into a DVD. You can turn it in. And yeah. Vic can burn a DVD. Right, I can burn those. Maybe Vic can burn the DVD. Bur- for everybody. I can just yeah. make multiple copies Instead of, of yeah. burning a DVD, you can also stain a BVD. <laughs> <laughs> hey, can you stain this BVD for me? So we're, oh, I got we, this, yeah. 58.74. We, got, food. we <laughs> might be here more than an hour more. I got a quick question. Huh? <clears throat> can I put something out to the everybody? If anybody knows anyone from Sony Music Entertainment, can you please contact me? <laughs> I need help with an, ish, an issue. Oh, yeah, yeah. What's oh, your issue? Boy. A video of mine got blocked on the internet <laughs> oh. because of a copyright issue, but it's not, it should be fair, you know, to use. And mm-hmm. I need help from, I need a real person at Sony Music Entertainment to help me sort this out. All so right, let's go to another call. Anybody. Let's go to let's go to the Sony Music Entertainment website and mm-hmm. see if we can apply for a job and work our way up the ranks. <laughs> and help me out. And right. help yeah. you let's go from the inside. And let's go from the inside. What's the song though? Can you tell the that, song? Is that like what? what song is oh, it? Oh Annie Lennox, why? Oh. Do you Some of the them are just strict. Wait, yeah. And they block. No, but for years they were they allowed it. Oh. But it was uh they just and they they were getting no but I think it's because I use I don't want to get it too into it, but anyway just he, it's it he should be created that video shot for shot. Yes. Oh, okay. He, he dressed as Annie Lennox. Oh, really? Kind yeah, of. It's yeah. wild. Well, it's spread like you've never seen him before. Yeah. <laughs> put it's it on <laughs> Twitch. It's wild. W H Y. You're gonna have to go to one of those like right wing video players that they have now. You know those ones? Yeah. Like what what is that? Patriots. Rum- Rumble. 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 Is that a yeah. thing? Really? Yeah. Rumble. Uh huh. What yeah, are the other free speech is allowed, Brent. What are the other ones? It's. But you're, they ban you if you say something bad about Rumble, too. That's it. <laughs> Do <laughs> they? Says not, yeah. Wow. yeah. You know, this hey, Annie Lennox? Some, uh, That's walking on broken glass. Well, don't play it now. Oh, sure. Well, there's a video. video. <laughs> well, then we'll be calling oh, just, Sony Just a couple seconds. I don't yeah. think it was even the <laughs> yeah. song that it was the use of the song. I think it was because I used the video as well mm. to put it side <laughs> by side. But I think that or, re- recontextualizes it that I think it would be Right, fair. it should be fair use. Or yeah. maybe yeah. it's because you used her energy in your dancing. I think if I actually really want her to she see has it, that copy she could see it. Yes. Hey, does anybody know Annie Lennox? Let's put that out there. <laughs> Go straight to the top. Annie, if you're if watching. You know Annie Lennox. Hey, I got some breaking news here, some office hours news. Uh, if you can pull this up, Tom. This is a big surprise. There's actually going to be a Thanksgiving Ooh, Day there show. There it is. <laughs> with Tim and Jeremy Levick and Rajat Suresh for real. That'll be streaming on Thanksgiving Day. The skipper couldn't make it today, so he's going to be back here. You're going to love this Thanksgiving Day, tune in. They call him the Skipper. Kind of a comedy summit. And wait, till you see the, wait till you Is see this Is it going to be a comedy show, Matt? Can you tell us anything about it? And it's going to be like, a, you know, it's a podcast. It's just another episode of Office Hours. Oh, okay, just another episode. Yeah. 
But, you know, with these comedians, they're good guys. All right. What do you want to do? You want to get back to the hotline yeah, or a Zoomer? Or who, Where, who, wants to, how many, who wants to talk? Is our, um, how's our Patreon looking? Did we hit our mark? Uh, we just checked in on that. 68 and was, or something like that? we got a long way to go. It's going to be a long night. I want to know if there's one more. If there's one more, let's from... act like NPR, where it's like, please call in. <laughs> right. We just need five more yeah. subscribers. Right. Let's if we see. don't we're get gonna... it, Brent right. Weinbach was going to match the offer. The Weinbach <laughs> family, <laughs> like fifty-eight seventy-four. <laughs> the Weinbach. I'll tell a, you what. I'll make a little one. offer here. Ooh, here we sweeten go. The pot. I'll sweeten the pot. I will send somebody an actual prop from the compound. Wow. An actual DVD prop from the compound. Wow. Is that a good? That's what pretty do you think? good. If, if they cool? join, if they join, yeah, if they join, if they right, join now, right now, right now, next and joiner, next, next joiner. person to yeah prove that they join. Which DVD? The one right here. This is classic rock for Tim. Yes. What about the one? I think oh, the better one, one is the one Vic made. Yeah. The better one. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. You want that post punk? Oh, I made Matt. I made both of them. I think I but that one's like the cheaper. That'll one. That'll be their yeah. choice. This you one. Up, like. Oh, the post punk for Matt. The one next to it. Yeah, that one. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, so you get a good prop. I tell you. And there's a, speaking of dogs, here we go. Oh, here comes Molly. Aww. Let the dogs in. Don't let, let Molly over here. Big in. Matt, uh, Brent hates dogs. Uh oh. Molly, hey. hey Whose dog is that? She goes straight to Brent. Molly, come here. Is that your dog? It's it's start dog. screaming, it's Brent. Dog. Scream. A mild. Dog. Luke loves dogs. It's a mild dog. Oh, it's a mild dog. Oh my god! I just, I just kicked, kicked it in the their face. I'm you sorry. kicked the dog in the face. I didn't know, I didn't know it was like at my dog. foot. I'm oh, sorry, buddy. Come here. You should have put it, uh, kicked <sighs> it, you know, in, in the, something. Like that. <laughs> I, I remember this. Watch I saw it. this uh, comedian a long time ago in Scotland, and he, I thought he was so funny. But it was it was supposed to be kind of an, I don't know, amateur night or something like that. But some professional guys came in there too. But he kept on pros? talking about <laughs> pros. There were some pros there. <laughs> yeah, there were some pros. That there. is awesome. You mean like writing pros? Like comedians. Yeah. I'm saying there were some pros. Um, there were no, there were some pro comedians there. That's but then awesome. It was mostly supposed to be an amateur night, and this guy was talking about kicking um, dogs in the balls the whole time. <laughs> and it was just, it, I know that sounds bad, right? People probably think that sounds <laughs> bad, but it was really funny though. <laughs> At first he started talking about kicking wiener dogs in the balls. And then, <laughs> then he just started moving on to just different animals. And then he was talking about kicking dinosaurs in the balls. <laughs> and he was talking about different, kicking different things so in the like balls. So it's like a fantasy he has, not like an actual thing he does? No, no yeah, he wasn't doing it. It was, he was just, yeah, fan, yeah, I guess kind mm. of a, a, a... Like a fetish? Well, I, I mean, it was obviously... It, it was, was an absurd It was an absurd premise, thing. Right? I mean, he wasn't being serious, but it was just was so I was cracking up so hard. And by the way, I was the only one cracking up. Oh no, there was <laughs> another girl. This there was this woman who was cracking up, and we were both looking at each other thinking this was hilarious, and no one was laughing except for us. I couldn't stop laughing. It was the funniest thing I saw the whole And night. that woman was Annie Lennox. <laughs> <laughs> I've that never, woman worked as I've never thought about like dinosaur testicles because you don't see them when you right, right? when you go yeah, to like the Yeah, yeah well it was funny. Then Are you start talking inside? about like, or they're something? probably inside Neat. the body like they're cold blooded, so the testicles that aren't really? they wouldn't be like hanging well, around. Do, do lizards or snakes have balls no, My, yeah the ones i've seen <laughs> how do snakes have There's no balls. sex you know where how to do look snakes they do crawl it? in each other's mouths and go all the way down to the bottom and they gotta kiss the bottom and then come it. back out <laughs> they crawl and kiss no. the bottom come out <laughs> that's a good way to do it say it again say so it again. okay snakes have sex one crawls in the other one's mouth it snakes its way all the way in kisses the bottom of the, the snake inside of the, the inside of the tail <laughs> And then zooms back out. And then, like, slithers backwards out. Yeah, and that's how they made. Hey, that's really cool, Andrew. And I, I had just had an, another alternate idea. Check okay. this out. This is how a snake shows his penis. He turns his body inside out through his mouth. <laughs> yes. And it's yes. like the penis comes out of his mouth, and it's his own body in a sense. Yes, yes, yes. Basically, well, what about when they're penises? eating their own tail? Is that like oh, a, man. that's like a sexual oh, that's thing? Right, that's that could sexual. be a thing, too. Yeah. 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 That could Joe be, Rogan like style. Self, yeah. <laughs> Joe yeah, 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 yeah. Uh-huh. He, Joe Rogan, uh-huh. Joe Rogan. You know that style. Joe Rogan can eat his own tail, right? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> Marilyn Manson, I think, could eat his own tail too. Uh, I heard. Uh, Remember that? Yeah, well, that? I, t- I think he took one of his like vertebrae, his back vertebrae, out so he could eat his own tail. Right, yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> vertebrae. Yeah, one of his back pieces out. <laughs> kind of reminds me of your joke, uh, well, Doug. Do you know how T Rex, how they fought each other? Huh. They would destroy each other's testicles. 
Really? Yeah, that's why they're that's what T is, testicle rest. <laughs> <laughs> that's why they're called testicle rest. That's oh, good. Right. Lift wow. that boy up for that one. Uh, lift that <laughs> I'm gonna have to up. lift you up for that <laughs> one. <laughs> <laughs> the T stands for testicle. But also, yeah, it's testicle also rest. Rex, <laughs> it's Rex. <laughs> Their balls are Rex. Yeah, like R- Rex. W R E C S. Rex. By the way, alpha male of the group is the one that didn't get his balls wrecked. You know how I imagine T Rexes to fight though, really? Is because they have yeah, these like little this. hands, and I just imagine them here. fighting like this, where they're just kind of scratching at each other, you know, like a little cat fight or something, you know. I don't mm-hmm. think they fought little... each other. I think they're just chilling, doing their own thing, and then they like Munch. eat something with their face whole. They just grab a whole deer, right. and they're like, mm-hmm. ah. right. But I'm just imagine them fighting with their little hands, you know. Just uh-huh. These big, they're supposed to be such the most, you know, terrifying dinosaur, right? Uh-huh. They're supposed to be the big boss, and they're just fighting each other with their little hands like this, scratching at each other. It's kind of. It's just something to think about. <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. Guys, huge news. We have a winner. I love these, oh, news, really? ca- these news alerts. From Can we that. bring them on? Miles Laird. Miles Laird, Miles. congratulations. You wow. won a DVD case. That's amazing. If you're on the Thank Zoom, you, Miles. get in touch or call the hotline. and we'll, uh, What else can we get rid of celebrate. here? What else? <laughs> yeah, what other chunk? <laughs> oh, we have a lot of stuff. To get hey, what else do you guys want out of here? There's a White Claw can on the well, floor. Yeah. Yeah. These office uh, hours yeah, toys. Matt, we should give these office hours toys away. We should have been doing this all day. I know. <laughs> we don't need These things are cool, but it's starting to pile up, to be honest. Is that soy sauce from Uncle Phil over there still? That, remember Dude, that? we got hothead Do you guys sauce? need this camera? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, we'll give yeah we have away. these cameras. Yeah. Right. We don't need uh-huh. all we have these a, cameras. You, you guys there's a lot, a lot of, of lighting There's this computer over here, and too. There, like there's that. an Andrew over yeah. there we don't need. We can just We can right auction away. off a date with Angeline uh-huh. uh, in our car. <laughs> <laughs> Hard pass. <laughs> Alice, were you saying that you did you met, did a meet with her? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I, I rode in her c- car. I sat in it too. Yeah. I mean, I didn't ride in it, but I sat in it though. You sat in it. Yeah, yeah. She didn't drive you around. No, um, no. I, I, uh, I was someone else did. Uh, my friend. Uh, yeah. Uh. She all, I also had to get, put gas in her car. Can I, oh, did you had to pay for gas? You grab no, I didn't have to pay, but she was like, Go can ahead. you do it? Ha, oh, that is like, funny. Oh, as if she? it was like an honor for me or You were whatever. like her little worker for a day. Yeah, I was like, what, is, what am I not paying for? <laughs> oh, she did, I did, she did, I did buy her a pancake. A pancake? Yeah, at Denny's. At Denny's? Yeah, Denny's, yep, yeah. Yep. You yep. went to Denny's too? Denny's? I went with her to Denny's. What? Oh my God. Yeah, that was a separate time though. We hung out a second really? time. Oh, you did two, you did a double I dosage? I did two hangs You went Angeline. back. Oh, you got, you're And you're, she you're told full. me to lose weight both times. You're fully wow. Angeline. I'm Angeline pilled, this, man. Well, I mean, Angeline. because you got the double, you know, you got two doses. Angeline, you got, got, you got full, you're fully Angeline. <laughs> yeah. Have we seen these before on the show? We have when we received them. Yeah. But uh, they're, they're very clever. Yeah, those are great. You'd be happy to get rid of What is that? These are pun pun related office hours. Yeah, so next next patron What is this one? Can get that? Is that is Next that... patron gets a toy. Yeah. Vic, have, do you know what this one is? We have four toys. That is um wait, can I see I it? don't know if the camera can really see it. Oh, that's a drop. It's not. It's like a Looks like a bullet from a, over here. Yeah, it's drops. <clears throat> oh, it's a drop. It's a yeah, it's a, but what's inside of it though? There's something just, Oh, let me see. Oh, is it uh, They're like riddles, you know. Yeah. Oh really? Oh, let me see that. Can I get that? It's a like pickle. To... It's a pickle drop. Pickle drop. Pickle, pickle drop. drop. Okay. I like doing sh- uh, riddles. This is fun. So. Oh wow, we got a lot. We got and this is Brian a... Larue, Jacob Vanderswag, Co- and this Thomas. Is, uh, Cosmic Michael Evil White. Toys. Mr. I was gonna Scrabble. say like. Do you know we'll what's... Come aboard. Let me see. Yeah. Do you know what toy this is? Scrabble. Um, <clears throat> I know what that is. <clears throat> All right, let's talk to some Zoomers. Yeah, yeah let's, let's uh, give away any some of you toys Zoomers, here, too. Let's lift them Did up. Did any of you just join? Oh, I think this is just... Oh, off- here's Miles. This is just... That's Bing... That's uh, Bing's and... Or wait. This Bing's is office bombs? hours, isn't it? Office oh, ice that's hours. Off ice off hours. Off ice hours. Yeah. Ah. See, that's really like good. Yeah. A little bo- jo- uh, bottle I love off. that. Mm-hmm. Miles, your jar anyway, is not off, working. Uh, Try and get that next, sorted uh, and we'll talk to you. Miles? Matt, oh, can we give the next subscriber one of these? So we those got are four. cool. Yeah, we just we got, got four like of these. Four. Let's give Let's, let's give read those off. Let's those see. are really cool. We got three. We got Thomas, Jacob, and Brian. Nice. One more, and you'll nice get a free job, toy. Guys. And here's Miles Laird. You want a prop. <coughs> Show him his prop options. Okay. Miles, are you there? It's not easy to see these from far. I know. It is tough. Yeah. <laughs> This one is pickle drops. Hello, Miles. The other one is, um, is uh, I office like office hours. The other, this is um, I like having fun. I like having fun with Ike in the back, and there's uh, so a fan made eyeball. these for you. 
uh, costume yeah, but toy they're like toys. Real they're official. Kind of like they make. Yeah. Wow, they're really nice. Yeah. Those are, those are nice. cool. cool. Yeah, yeah kind of giving them away. Who made, huh? who made such it's a thing? It's kind of rude to give it away. Yeah, I mean, I mean, it, it probably is. I definitely hear you on that. That's why I was trying to get to the bottom of where they came from. Let's get order more. Cosmicville toys. No, those were limited edition. We can't make them. Yeah, this is three of four. Three of four. Yeah. Don't give those. Yeah, I kind of them on Brent's Don't give those away. Those are good. I mean, this San Pellegrino is looking for a home. This empty bottle. That's what works. This is more like it. <laughs> yeah, you didn't sign it. It was a good thought. I mean, we can give away. It's Cosmic though, Evil okay? Toys, and he charges seventy five dollars for each of them. But yeah, I uh, wouldn't no. give those sure. away. Okay, we're yeah, gonna we'll keep know. those. No, in fact, I yeah, those are those are priceless items. All right. Well, sorry if anybody me. signed up well, for the toys. Too late. We gotta give them away. <laughs> I think it's better to, Wait, to give the switch. Give away a picture of it. What are we gonna yeah. do? Wait around and sell them on eBay? All right. Do you do you guys want to talk to some Zoomers? Let's chat them up. What are we gonna give away, Matt? Let's chat them up. My Miles, are you there or what? Yeah, what do you want, Miles? Hello. Well, Miles gets a DVD. You wanna, okay, you get. Oh, you get the DVD. You get DVD. Can you hold them up so he can choose which one oh, he gets? No, can you lift them up? Some... I'm not going back over there. I'm just kidding. Brent, can you fork? Can you grab the uh, hand those over the two DVD the two cases. DVD cases there? I oh, you want this? Classic yeah, rock and post Doug, punk. So he can choose which one he gets. <clears throat> <laughs> Friends, oh, he doesn't touch things. I know. Oh, I know. Okay. I, I just trying to uh, somewhat avoid. Touching We're things. in a room together. I'm, s- I'm right. somewhat trying to avoid yeah. touching. Hey, things. Miles, thanks for your support. Yeah. You just joined the Patreon, and we really appreciate it. So th- these are both. Yeah, they're I'm, both I'm props happy to here. Be here. I've been uh, piggybacking off her. Uh, her Patreon. Oh, now, oh man. One, so. oh, oh, that that's was very, too nice. Yeah, that was Double very nice. Miles, I have a question. <laughs> It, has sure. any has and this, this isn't a joke. I'm actually genuinely curious. Do you think anyone has ever been named kilometers? Uh, I don't know, but people really like to call me kilometers. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> I just think that'd be an interesting. Per- like, why not try it for a name? You well, know? Yeah. Yeah. It's a, it's like oh. Are... I'm not even. I'm not making. F- I'm just curious. I... Like, why someone should try that? You know. If anyone out Your there is nick- pregnant, nickname Kill. I should give it a yeah. go. I could be the. Are you guys having a kid? <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Lost you. Oh, there he is. Are you guys having a kid? No. Oh. No. Damn. What? I was wondering if you were having a kid and if you could name it kilometers, and then it'd be really interesting to to um you know do the math you know <laughs> adjusting between you two. Yeah, I think we're in. We're we're hundred percent in. Okay. I have a thought about this. Yes. Which is yeah. that. I feel yeah no I mean uh, I feel kilometers is maybe a little bit too much. It's not a good name. No, I no, agree. I no. I'm just what I mean is is there's this the kilo in it kind of modifies just the meters and miles doesn't have a modifier. So I think if you were gonna name somebody, maybe they should just be called meters. Mm, I like that. Yeah, I I agree with that. Sounds a little well, or a I could too. have uh, yeah, two point two kids. Yes, <laughs> and just name them combined kilometers. Yes, you, you said it sounds German. Kilometer. It sounds German. Yes, meters, meters, meters. 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 Come here, meters, meters. All right. Well, thanks, Next Miles. We'll thanks send miles. you so much, Miles. Bert, are you there, Bert? <laughs> hey guys, hey everybody. Oh, hey Bert. Whoa. Hey Bert. Wow. You want to talk to Brent? <laughs> yeah. Hey. hey. Uh, Brent? Uh-huh. Yes, sir? Yeah, I just wanted to be going around to uh, a lot of the podcasts around. Yes. Been a lot of misinformation about vaccines. Mm-hmm. And uh, Big Bird has been saying he's been getting vaccined, and uh, I am staunchly opposed you mean to sw- vaccines. You talking about Swolbird? Okay. What? <laughs> <laughs> that voice sounds nope. familiar, Matt. No vaccines. Okay. They're dangerous. Yeah. Make you sterile. Sure. Is that Matt? Hmm. That's uh, Matt. <laughs> Pre-recorded. <It's impressive. laughs> is that me? <laughs> yeah, it's you, right, Matt? How would that be me? It Bert, just is. That's Bert. Matt, Bert Matt is a secret anti-vaxxer, and he's trying to see. So, are, did, uh, does, so Bert, does that you, you? That means you're not sterile. No, no way, Matt. So you you get you have heavy loads. You got big loads. <laughs> God. Yeah. You blast. Uh, you blast heavy loads, and where do you blast? Yeah, them? It's big misconception uh, that Muppets can ejaculate. I that's mm. I always knew that. Hmm. Believe Is it just me. Just like wool or something, <laughs> yeah, look, what, or cotton. Like what comes the, out? Uh, styrofoam. 
Mm. Interesting. Who who has like the biggest loads? Is it um? Right. Is it uh, Snuffy? <laughs> or, or yeah, Oscar. you could say Snuffleupagus. He um. Speaking of him, he got the inver- Inverbectin. Mm-hmm. <laughs> what does Oscar's semen taste like? <laughs> Kind of spoiled, spoiled milk. This is a family oh, show. I don't, know, I don't know about this line of so questioning. I, I, <laughs> I know you're not a fan of the vaccines, but are you a fan of the boosters? No, no, no vaccines, no boosters. Uh, uh, kind of cool if you like the boosters, though, <laughs> but no, not the no. vaccines. But you were into He's the boosters. Into the boosters. Uh-huh. He likes the boosters only. <laughs> what about flu shot? Do you get that? No, all vaccines are bad. What about TB? No, no TB. You're not getting it, guys. This stuff is all bad here. What about HPV? What is that? <laughs> what I mean, Earth? if you're sexually human pa- active, you human should... Human pamplova virus? Yeah, you, you human... gotta get that vax too, man. Yeah. Black guys get it too? What yeah. about Ernie? What's up with him? Uh, me and Ernie are getting divorced, I'm afraid. Oh, because hmm. oh, he's getting vac- He's fully vaccinated. He's well, yeah, sterile. why? Because it's, it's a vaccine thing? He's sterile and you want to have a baby and <laughs> it's not going to work out or something. <laughs> Him and uh, you know he's on the uh, the rent freeze kick here, and uh, it's kind of a doesn't make any money, and um, I'm not I'm not a, for that either, and got into a big fight, and think he needs to be evicted, and we're getting divorced. Oh, that's a shame. Mm. Bert, yeah. are you out on the street, the Sesame Street? Yeah. Mm. He, oh, did he kick you out? No, no, he's he's uh, he's packing up. Mm. Is he gonna go live with uh, Jeff Dunham's puppets or something? <laughs> no, I, I don't know. Mm. Hmm. But uh, I'm also a uh, First Amendment auditor. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> okay, what does that mean? Uh, it means I go into post offices and I record them, <laughs> harass people. <laughs> That's cool. What, what happens if a cop pulls you over? What do you? What, what sort of tactics do you pull? I tell him I'm a sovereign citizen. <laughs> I don't need. I don't require a driver's license. <laughs> okay. <laughs> My constitutional right to travel from A to B. <laughs> okay. Cool. <laughs> You know enough about it's, this that it seems uh, Bert. genuine. <laughs> Bert, is the hand up your ass faxed? <laughs> <laughs> it looks back. Uh, I got in a big thing about with uh, Louise and Maria. <laughs> <It's> just... <laughs> Who's that? There are Sesame Street humans. Oh, oh those yeah. are Sesame Street humans? Yeah. I'm not sure if they're uh, citizens or not. Kind of a big thing with them. <laughs> Mr. Hooper is up in age, though. I mean, he's he probably should no. get the vaccine, right, Mr. Hooper? Uh, no, Mr. Hooper died. Oh, because uh, of the vaccine? He was pro-vaccine. We got into it, and, um, you know, uh, I'll tell you something. You know I collect stamps? Uh-huh. Hmm. How do you feel about Grover? I uh, have a big stamp collection. I mailed uh, Mr. Hooper some anthrax. What about oh. Grover? How do you feel about Grover? Washington Jr., that is. That'd be... The great saxophonist? Yes. <laughs> Finish this sentence. Make America... <laughs> great. <laughs> 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 All right, Bert. Hey, Matt, I think this ran its course. I kind of like that. Make America great. You know, just, <laughs> yeah, that's just... That's just... Uh-huh. That's it. it. That's, they just... Remove take it back. Then, take it back. Problem with you. Yeah, take it back. Uh-huh. Make America great. The again is what... Yeah, that's what kind of... Yeah, that, that messed it up. Oh. Well, that was uh, Reagan's... That was Reagan's... That was it, yeah. It make was. Make America great. Oh, I think right, it was actually right, Make America right. great that's why again. I'm thinking, that's why I think it's good. Was no, Reagan's again was, great? Was, uh, again was Trump's uh, innovation. Oh, anyway, oh thanks, Trump Bert. did like a Reagan yeah. throwback. Are we letting Bert go? You guys, well, ever, thanks, Bert. you guys uh, ever see the movie The Killers from 1964? He's in that. Yeah, he, he, uh, he's the, he villain, punches in, he's a, the yeah. villain in it. It's he punches a, the a woman. Film? Yeah. Mm-hmm. No. Oh, that's The Killing. Uh-huh. Uh, the uh, the Killers, I think it's directed by Don Siegel, maybe. And yeah, I, th- I think it's uh, uh, Kubrick, I think. I think it's like no, 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 no. He's thinking of The Killing, maybe. Okay. I don't oh, know. The Killing. Okay. Uh, but uh, Don Siegel, I think, directed oh. it. It has Lee Marvin in it. Um, and Angie Marv- Dickens, Angie Dickens, uh, yeah, it's not- they're from Las and- Vegas, right? Which one? The band? <laughs> oh, yeah, they we gotta them. like not talk about the <laughs> anyway. Anyway, it's a good movie, and Reagan's in- Ra- Reagan is the villain, in it, mm-hmm. and it's it's an interesting uh, angle to see uh, huh. Reagan in. Let's huh. all watch it together. <laughs> I'm interested, yeah, sure, let's do that.
Let's do that. It's weird to see Reagan as the bad guy. <laughs> right, yeah, right, right, it's right, so right. weird. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. Not weird for me. <laughs> He's usually like a messiah. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I mean, you know, you see him just, you know, he slaps somebody, slaps mm-hmm. a woman and stuff. So and you guys yeah. got a half hour left. What do you want to, I mean... Well, let's see where we're at on the big go- board. Let's, let's just do a half see. an hour let's of pull silence. This up. <laughs> yeah. Things were going off with that pun contest earlier. That was right? Should we go back to the pun contest? I thought that was kind of going off. Maybe we got to go back to that. I thought it was going off, but I try to get on this. Are there no other games you guys play? Let's get back on that. I can get on that. But you want to play piano? I can try it if you want. I don't even know what I would play, though. puns and piano? I played piano earlier. What would you want me to play? Some theme songs. Yeah. Maybe we thought we to- we toss you some some songs and you make up some ideas. You make Wait, up why don't songs. we make songs together? Yeah, let's we'll make songs, songs together. You don't want to talk to any Zoomers here? We've had people on here for like let's, six yeah. Let's hours. get let's Wait, get some right. Zoomers. Bring in. them in. Bring let's them burn in. through some. Let's burn through some Zoomers. We're gonna go in order, speed round. And it, guess what? If they're not bringing something off t- in like yeah. in the first thirty seconds, they're gone. Kay. Grant, you're on the air. No Grant. duds. Wow. Oh, so yeah, there's a lot of grants who call in on the show. It's weird. Hey, Grant. Uh, hey, hi. This is weird. Everything's all blurring on my screen. Hey, uh, thanks for all the laughs and all that stuff. I have no puns, no jokes, no nothing. I actually have a question that me and my friends have been wanting to ask Doug for a long ass time. Uh, what, what's some of your favorite jungle music? Some of my favorite jungle music? Hmm. Yeah. You occasionally drop Amen Breaks in the background. Um... To be honest, like when I listened, when I used to listen to that, I don't remember who the artists were. I would just uh, get okay, like compilations oh, and like. Well. That's a bad. I, I have no good answer for that. That's a bummer. sorry. Yeah, well, well, my right, favorite right. jungle music. Ronnie I actually Sai's, have a clip here. Is Rony Size a good one? Um, oh. Well, yeah, that's a that's a classic. I, I, I didn't like, know if you had any. This, I don't have any. Uh, I don't really have any. Anything. I blew it. Sorry. I blew no. it. Sorry. Well, what, right. What's what's something I like? All right, let's I keep blew. moving through. Let's keep moving All right. through. Let's Thank you very much, guys. Years. Happy Thanksgiving. Thanks, Thanks, Grant. Yeah, good work. Good work out there. Speed Thank round. you. Okay, we're gonna go in order. We have a half hour left. <laughs> Kim Maney. Hello. How are um, you? Good. How are you guys? We're great. Good. Excellent. I have a book of emergency questions. There we go. Mostly hypotheticals. Got one here. Would you prefer to have a hand made out of ham or an armpit that dispenses sunscreen? Sunscreen armpit. Yeah, you got to have your hands. What, a hand made out of what? Ham? ham? Yeah, because ham. Ham, ham could go bad. Is I it guess, edible? Right? Exactly. Mm-hmm. Yeah, close to, close yeah, to sunscreen. sunscreen, like, mm. that's useful. Sounds like a right. bonus. It's edible? Totally. But what it's if you're like... No, no. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, is it always coming out? Let's get let's get you a mic, Brian. Oh, I thought this this, I not, this don't work. Like when you That's for the it. piano. I don't, it squirts out. That right. You don't I get me though. I can still hear him. You can yeah, still hear him. I don't like right? to go out in the sun that much. I, I would just stick with the ham, I guess. I don't know. Ham hand? I think I would do the ham right. hand. You couldn't do your job right mm-hmm. now. Down the line, who I has don't an answer? I think it would like rot or anything though. It would be normal. What if somebody ate mm-hmm. it or something? Could it regenerate? I don't think so. I reckon it's a. Because ham doesn't regenerate. Oh, but the sunscreen is constantly pouring out? Okay, right. fine. Yeah. Interesting. No. Actually, I'd rather get it all over with it. That can get... regenerate, huh? I feel like you could plug it up somehow. Maybe you have a gland? I would rather get yeah, the, ham, the ham thing because then you just get it done with and then you don't have to deal with it anymore. You know what I mean? Once it's gone, you're done, right? No, but there's nothing hand. there then. You're stumped out. <laughs> yeah, but wouldn't you rather... Okay, the real question is, would you rather have a stump or have uh, sunscreen coming out? Would you rather have a time? stump and uh-huh. once that once had ham on it? <laughs> <laughs> give us, one, give us one more hypothetical. One more. Oh, okay. Um, and you, do you call it, would you... Wait, would you, you didn't say would you rather. You said would you reckon. What did you say? <laughs> Hi, what do you reckon? No. What? Um... Hypotheticals. No, Emergency but you, you, the, word, the way you worded it was different than we worded it here. You're clearly not from here. What, what was? What did you say? <laughs> oh, her <laughs> accent didn't yeah, give right. that away. Would what, you prefer? Would you prefer? Yeah, we don't call it that. That's, that's yeah. what I was curious I about. It. Yeah. <laughs> we don't do that. It's different. That's okay. True. What, what, what would you prefer? prefer? Not would you rather? Let her. <laughs> let her go. Oh God. Well, okay. If you could choose one thing for your armpit to dispense, what would that thing be? That's what it says in the book? Hair and odor. Next question. <laughs> oh, my God. Let's get another. All right. All Thanks, right. Kim. Let's move hair. on. Thank you, Kim. Oh, there's something there. Yes. Let's think about it. Brian what's, H. What's a useful thing that could be dispensed oh, out right. of your body? It's something that Toothpaste. kind of dries Hello. out mm-hmm. like air. Water. Toothpaste Water. You, you know what? I would, rather, mm. I would rather piss through my armpit mm. than my yeah, vagina. Yeah, you don't have to take your pants off yeah. and do that whole rigmarole. But yeah. you got to take your shirt off I, then. 
No, you could just uh, pull the sleeve. You could have a little fly right, right here. What? Deodorant. A little fly right there. How about antiperspirant <laughs> right at your pits? You know, you, you have to put sneak it on a it. leak anywhere Imagine you want. A urine. Yeah. yeah, that's interesting. Imagine if flies existed in your armpit. Flies? They can. <laughs> Not what like, we were talking no, about. Like flies. Oh, Imagine. flies. Yeah, flies. <laughs> Zippers. Like <clears throat> button fly. Okay, oh, what's up, dude? You got some records back there? Oh, look at that. I like it. Oh, yeah. I wanted to see if you guys wanted to play a quick game. Absolutely. Definitely. We love games. Uh, so a spin on the regular record game where we pick a record out, uh, we pick two records and we see if everyone in that room can, can come to a consensus as to which one's better. Love it. Love it. All right. So say when. Like it. <laughs> now. <laughs> Doug's not sold Go. yet. Wait, which, what is it? We're going to pick two records out. How about That's you, good. You pick two records out, and, and we then, choose which and one. Turn you... the other way. Turn I'm, the other. Just say when, when I, and I'll grab it. Vicky, fl- fl- flip around with your left hand, the other side of the shelf. There we go. Mm-hmm. And then down the third, the lo- right there, down there, right there. <laughs> and then, do you agree to smash the worst one? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Come Depending on. on the right. That's what this game. Is. Yeah. There we go. Uh, That's super rare. Like, yeah. 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 <laughs> You have no choice. We're just whittling down his yeah. collection uh-huh. one by one. That sounds good, Brent. Uh, yeah, let's let's get his deck collection in half. Uh-huh. <laughs> My wife would be okay with that. Uh, first one. Uh, can you guys see it? Or Lazarus. Should I read it? Oh, okay. Uh, oh, the that's musical Bowie. by David oh, okay. Bowie, Lazarus. Okay. Cool. I've heard and of it, but I don't know much about it. Number two. Parliament. Oh, dude, oh, Lazarus man. gotta go. We gotta keep. Gotta yeah, you gotta keep Parliament. keep Parliament. Yeah. Oh, which that's not an album I'm familiar with. Lazarus Bowie? soundtrack. Is David Bowie versus Parliament? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But it's but it's Lazarus. Which what is that? Nineties musical or is that earlier? Uh, no, it's the one that came out after he passed. Oh, okay. It's got some of the songs from uh, Death Star. Death Star, different yeah. Work. Oh, I see. And it's got some other songs too. Well, rest in peace to that record. Let's you know, get it smashed, brother. <laughs> I don't, I don't I break can't it say I'm really familiar with your vinyl is. hammer. Consensus? Oh, no. No, 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 no please don't do it. No, no. <laughs> okay. I gotta go okay. with Thanks, Brian. Parliament. Yeah, we yeah, gotta go with Parliament. Did you smash the Parliament? Yeah. No, I'm saying I would keep, keep the Parliament. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's keep, the one that's I mean, I'm saying yeah. that because I just don't know the Lazarus. 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 Mm. I think there's got to be a better way, a better record game in there instead of just picking one that's better. Mm. Maybe like mashing them up. We've already got a consensus, yeah. which could right. get pretty. I, I'm mm-hmm. into this game. I like it. It's fun. It's fun to see your collection. I'm going to say we're going to have to acquit uh, par- uh, Parliament. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> you know, there wasn't, it, it was in self defense uh-huh. and it was not. <laughs> uh-huh. So we pretend each record oh. murdered somebody? trial? Yeah, it was on trial. Yeah. Yeah. On trial. Yeah. Oh, what if we choose the crime that each record committed? Let's do one more. Okay, yeah, yeah. Two more records and then we'll. <clears throat> Let's pick sure. three. Why yeah. don't you pick three? That's ah, the way that'd to be do wild. it. There That's it the is. Oh, yeah. That's wet and right. wild. They went. Now. Middle row. Middle row. Now. I said middle row. Oh, I already saw that no record. Now. Whoop. Now. Second row from the top. Yeah, no you box never set, picked so one. You can't there. take a box set. Okay, now. Okay. Ooh, here we go. It's a tough one. Oh, that's can that's. You, um, so can you move Bell it back and a little bit? Right. Move it back. Yep. Oh, Bell and Sebastian. That's okay. the that's the soundtrack to the uh, Todd Salon's movie, I believe. Storytelling. Yes, it is. Yep. Oh, storytelling, really? Mm-hmm. Great movie. I just guessed it. Very. good. <laughs> I guessed it. I don't. I'm not. I can't even see anything. I'm wow. looking at he the. Said pen. It. Uh, yeah. He might have said it quietly. <laughs> he did not. I yeah. just get, got it in my. It was. It was a. It was a gift. It was a gift. Uh, number two. Is no, number two? I. That so, stays. So I'm not. I'm not familiar with that. What's oh, number two? Same. Noi. It's Any, uh, Noi. You don't know Noi? I, I, I like that. You like, I like that? No- yeah, I think um, somebody from Craftwork is in. It's there. like Kraftwork. Oh, I think okay. Kraftwork. I'd okay. say, I think somebody from Craftwork might be in there. Okay. It's N E U. Yes. And a, uh, yeah. exclamation. I, I would pick that. I would pick... Well, we, well, we got one more. Got What's one more. the game being played? We're going to see which... It's, it's not the best game, but we're stick, <laughs> We're going to lift it up. Which we're one gonna, are you okay. going to keep? Okay. Maybe you have to get rid it's, of two. We're going to do it for the full 20 minutes left right. of the show. Right. <laughs> great content. Ooh, that's, I mean, that's pretty okay. good. That's pretty good. I mean, we. For, I, I just feel like... That's Matt's favorite now. What You're if a big it's like a fuck, Mary kill or something? Oh, that's funny. Which one did you... For the albums, oh, you yeah. gotta yeah, fuck yeah. the Stooges. The Stooges, <laughs> exactly. fuck. So you would one is basically it's basically destroy. One is uh-huh. just 
listen to once. Right. You know, and one is keep. For uh-huh. That's keep. kind of basically yeah, yeah, yeah. what that is. Yeah. And come on. Uh-huh. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> right. That last one. Uh huh. Right. Well, which one would you start a family with? Right. We get a third? What's yeah, going on with, here? Yeah. There's, yeah, there's, there's, uh, three. there's three. There's three. Sebastian, Fuji, Fuji, Sebastian, and Noah. Oh, all right. Can we move on? No, we got to pick yeah. it. We got to yeah, pick it. What's, what's the third one? Everyone go around and tell you. The Fuji's the score. They're classic. Got uh-huh. it. All right. I'm Don't ready. Sebastian, uh, storytelling soundtrack, or Noi 2, their second album. Aye. Hmm. Aye. Okay, which one is... We do... Okay, Brent, we do... Pick. Me. Huh? You pick. All right, so which here's what you, you do. I would keep the Noi. I would marry, right? Mm-hmm. Marry the Noi. I'm probably going to have to go with... Oh, I don't know. I can't decide on the rest of it, though. <laughs> that's fine. All right, that's good. All right, well, thank you. This is a good game. This is a good game. Thank you for Beautiful. Night, guys. Good night, Brian. Take care. Mark, you're on the air. Hey, we lads and ladies. Where you at, lad? Uh, or ladies, sorry. Um, I had a question for for Brent. Yeah, can you hear about me? uh about mine, Jack? Uh huh. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a big fan. I've shared a lot of people. I was wondering what your connection to, uh, like, Chris Angel and David Blaine and all those kind of 2000s uh, street musicians or magicians were and, and, uh, and, you know, how that worked into the process of making Mind Jack. Well, I just saw that show Mind Freak and I thought, what if it was Mind Jack, you know? Oh. So that's the connection there. And then... Uh, but no, but actually, here's the real interesting thing: is Chris Angel saw Mind Jack and he liked it. Oh my God! Really? How did you oh. find that out? Because I know somebody who knows him, and she sent him the videos, or at least one of them, and he said it was hilarious. And <laughs> also, I met David Blaine once. I, I went to his show oh. and I met him backstage. Whoa. Did he put a needle through your arm? <laughs> no, but he put a needle through his own arm. Oh. That's not. That's very uh, rude of him not to share that kind I of. I know. Experience. I was really. I was jonesing for that needle, but he didn't give it to me. It was Brett, did, I, yeah. did I tell you there's a actual like there is a hypnotist who goes around doing that like recently. He actually does gives people orgasms like. Oh really? Yeah. Oh <laughs> yeah. yeah. I saw. They've I, seen those. I heard yeah. about that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like really? I that. Yeah. I think I heard yeah. about that. Oh yeah, my yeah. god. Yeah. Hypnotism? Yeah. Yeah. It's kind it's of a YouTuber sick. type. Thing. He goes around like Vegas and drunk people and everything, but it's like. It seems pretty real. Like, I mean, look. Is there a cease and desist? That there, should, in there should be. Well, I'll tell you this much. Mind Jack is based on a true story in a way because it's based on my own ability to mind jack in real life. Oh. And that's just a whole, you know, I don't know. Can we finish of, the show Can you this? demonstrate? Can we, yeah. I mean, I don't know if you want to get it. I think I've talked about it on the podcast before, right? Finish for the finish of the show. Would you? Have you heard about that magician that goes around and he scapegoats people? That's like his... David Blame. You know <laughs> <laughs> I'm still, I'm still doing puns. I love it. <laughs> All right, that's good. Thanks, Mark. Anyway, thank you. Thank you, uh, Dominic. You've been on all day, haven't you? Has he been waiting to be called oh, on? Oh day? man, I think so. A good portion. I know I've seen your name. Unmute your mic, Dom. Oh yeah. He's not using a calling card. Yeah, I was. Uh... <laughs> new to the whole thing but i was off work today <laughs> nice and, uh, i was able to tune in that's and, awesome uh, keep occupied but i figured i uh drafted up a nice little ad for you guys if you uh there we go. nice right, now get the music ready there we let's go, go. Yeah, cue it up. okay are you ready oh absolutely have you ever found yourself with a grumbling tummy waiting minute by minute for your next meal like you're smoking some doobies with your brothers and suddenly you get that sweet feeling. So you get up and open your fridge and you only find some old milk that would keep you running to the doctor's office. Well, instead of beating yourself up because you keep forgetting to buy groceries, how about you take it to the streets and get yourself a Michael McDonald's McDonald's Happy Meal? (laughs) Now, I know what you're thinking. Why wouldn't I just get a regular McDonald's Happy Meal? Well, that's what a fool believes. (laughs) Because <laughs> Michael McDonald's McDonald's Happy Meal stands apart from the rest. Why, each meal comes with a doobie burger and a side of Love Lies fries dipped in some sweet freedom. So wash it down with a refreshing gulp of black water, and you'll start feeling the real love. So, how do the fools survive? By eating Michael McDonald's McDonald's Happy Meal. Every day. Wow. Lift him up. Excellent, excellent. Bring 
hanging up. Thank, thank you. Thank you. There you go. Listen. Thanks, Very Dominic. Good. Thank you, Dominic. Thanks for yeah, hanging with us all day, man. Podcast, all a day's me. work, you know. Yes. Just my duty as a Patreon, you know. <laughs> Thanks for the support. Brent, did you want to play piano? Did you want to have a little moment to play? I, I, no, I, I feel it, it doesn't feel right. You, you could know? play us out at the end. Yeah, Would that be fun for feel, you? It doesn't feel right, you know. Would you play us out you at the get end? back in the mix? I'd rather sing to you. All right, Ooh. Colin Briggs. Oh, Vic can play and you could sing. Yeah. Colin Briggs. Hello, everybody. <laughs> Hello, oh, everybody. There it is. Hello, Vic. Hello. Thank you, sir. A uh, long time no talk. I uh, figured I would take this opportunity while uh, T wasn't around to uh, plug my Spotify playlist. Uh, it's called Office Hours Greatest Hits. I uh, figured uh, we might not make the uh, 6,000 patrons tonight, but um, I'm getting close to 60 followers um, and almost 800 songs, uh, 52 hours worth of music. Wow. And how, uh, what is it? How is the, it? Uh, it's like Office Hours related songs? Uh, yeah, I try to put in any specifically mentioned songs, wow. uh, that come up every week. How do we find it? What's um, your, uh, uh, it's just called Office Hours Greatest Hits. So if you search that on and Spotify, then, oh, you can subscribe to it. Oh, that's, there it that's is. Incredible. Wow. Yeah, yeah can we cool. drop that in the, in the chat? Maybe put it in the, uh, the yeah. video description or something, you know? I think whatever. I can link to it, right? Yeah, I can do yeah. it. Feel free. Yeah. Yeah, and put that I'm in the YouTube proud. description. Yeah, I, I had to stick in uh, all seven hours and 44 minutes just so I can make sure I didn't miss anything along Dude, the way. So, it's so, ha! it's unbelievable. That's amazing. That's, that's Why do you think Tim wouldn't appreciate that? He would love Every that. little drop uh, we do is He doesn't in like Spotify. Yeah, but he, you know. Yeah, but that's he's okay. He's anti-Spotify. It's okay. You know, this is a, what an undertaking. Yeah, that's, that's amazing. Yeah, thanks for uh, doing that. Um, is there thanks, any, are there yes, any songs I've, you couldn't find? Anything that like, you're like, oh, what is they're this? They're all yours, Vic. Oh, yeah. It's yeah, usually yeah. your stuff. <laughs> yeah. Sometimes it takes me a couple of weeks to catch like one of Doug's mm -hmm. uh, Doug's drops that I actually uh, one that I got on uh, recently. I was so surprised I didn't have it was I woke up in a Soho. No. Oh, yeah. yeah. Somehow I uh, <laughs> didn't have that song on my playlist. Oh, man. I guess because that, that one goes back. Right. Uh, yeah, that was in the old so days. Probably two years ago. Probably. Yeah. Prior prior to well, that was back starting the office. this. I started. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I started October seventh, twenty twenty. So look at this! Oh, this is man. wild. Let's pull this Wait, up. What's your name again? See this. Colin. Hey, Colin. Colin Briggs. Where are you calling in from? <laughs> uh, from Boston. Okay. Yeah. The old stomping grounds. Yeah. Col Colin, I wanted to say I had something I want to tell you it. actually. He wasn't kidding. Look at this. Seven sure. hours ago. That's amazing. Can I can I tell Colin something? Yeah. Sure. All right. Um. Nirvana wow. smells like Teen Spirit. You two, one. Backstreet Boys, I want it that way. Whitney Houston, I will always love you. Madonna, vote. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I just was reading top 100 songs. <laughs> <laughs> I read 100 songs. He's got to quickly add them. I just, <laughs> want, to <laughs> I just <laughs> want to see him get to work. That's funny. That's funny. Uh, I'll probably go back and do the last 15 minutes later. Okay, cool. I think most of those easy. Doobie like, Brothers songs uh, were on yeah, there. Yes. But. That's so, impressive. So is it kind of in reverse chronological, or how does this? Is there an arrangement here? I think there is a way uh, that you can do it first to last or whatever, most recent. There uh, is you such know why a Lady way. Thanks, that's on there? amazing. Uh, I, that's Which a good one? question. Which one do you say? I was just scrolling. why Lady Gaga's on there. I was just scrolling down. I saw Lady Gaga. I'm like, I see you? Judgment oh, I think, Night. Uh, that's I a think deep I have cut. A, I have from, a Lady Gaga uh, drop. You have a Lady quiz Gaga with, drop. Uh, what's his oh, face? That makes sense. Then. Brett Brett Gelman. Oh, mm -hmm. very impressive. Good stuff. All right, thanks, Colin. A lot of yeah. them were, yeah, a lot of them were drops early on, but then kind of going back, it's like, you know, they go on the playlist once, they don't go on again, you know. You're going to have to add uh, Grover Washington so. Jr. now. Actually, <laughs> since I, oh, look, Alice well, Annie, by oh, the my, Pixies is on what there. What was Grover? Oh, my God, he actually oh, added yeah. Y by Annie Lennox on But here, all so I did was, well, thanks, Colin. Did you put Allison by? Not by Elvis Costello. By Elvis Costello. That's the one that really needs to be on there. Oh, yeah. Got to get that on there now. Sean David oh, Morgan. he's doing. And look at that fireplace he's got He's doing mashups from Fart. Absolutely. Oh, really? Yeah, Sean Dude. David. Hey guys, Morgan, I, you're on I have a joke line. for you. Nick Kroll, thank, thank you, you Colin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's who I thought it was first. What's that now? Sean. I have a joke for you. Let's hear it. So, why do all QAnon believers have duck for Thanksgiving? Because they're quack. Because they're all a bunch of quacks. Whoa! Wow. It's actually, <laughs> you know. By the way, you know what I heard? I heard that QAnon is a game. Did you know that? What? No. That it's apparently it's a game that uh, 
people don't know they're playing is a, that it's a game, but it's actually it, there's clues that are dropped, and it's actually a game. It's uh, that's what I heard. I heard it's an alternate reality game. So when people show My up, it's really a lead up to a pun at Daily Plaza looking for JFK oh. Jr. That's part of their yeah. their game. Just well, a lot of people don't realize it's a game that are playing it, but I think maybe some people do th- know it's a game. I mean, oh. what what do you win? what do you mean by game? I don't know. You have to solve it. It's a mystery, and you have to solve it. Do you have? I don't think there's any solution. Do you talk to your mom about it? Yeah, I mean, she's you know she was in Dallas, so she's been there with. She's the doing that. JFK. Yeah. Oh man. Oh, she's yeah. down at Daily. Plaza. Is she disappointed? Have you talked Every, to her about it? No, she's like proud about. It. You know, it's like uh, she's like we're being a squeaky wheel. Wow. Yeah, wow. And what what do they hope like to achieve a, when they show up? The the Kennedys. I think it's for like, you know, she's older, so she doesn't have any friends anymore. Now she has friends. Wow. Like, oh, that's you know? sad. So I'm just like. You should just tell her I, to get I've into made comedy. i fun of her for a while. Yeah. Right. Tell her to go to open mics. Yeah. And now you just kind of feel bad for her. Yeah, I'm just like, hey, I'm happy. I'm just like, I'm ha- happy you have like this community that you're passionate about. But mm-hmm. Have you met her friends? <laughs> I don't I hear. Thought it was, have you like met her friends and stuff from it? No, well, no. She, I mean, she probably hasn't either, though, right? I mean, they're they're online, right? Well, now now that they, I mean, she's oh, well, going to person, the yeah. Plaza, right? She's really amped up about it. Oh, is man. she staying in a hotel down there, or she lives there? No, well, she lives there. I'm from Dallas, so she. So she was kind of like, "Damn, the biggest Q thing ever is in my town." Lord oh, help man. me. Yeah, she. But, <laughs> yeah. Oh my god! But did before she this, would, at first, but does she you know. think it's a game? Yeah. No, I mean, she's just like late to it all, you know. Like, it's like she just figured out Bush did 9-11, you know. How did she get into it? What sucked her in? <laughs> it was like, um, you know, YouTube and wow, yeah, like being afraid of pedophiles and before this, shouldn't uh, give people yeah. the internet who are over. It's crazy, you know. She's also she's afraid of um, pedophiles. I mean, she's a little old for that. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, I I grew up in the '90s, so like every parent was afraid. A yeah, pedophile. Right. Oh, that was like. You know, so it was like amplified. Why, why are the parents afraid? The kids are the ones who should be afraid. You know? They don't want their kids getting touched. Yeah. Wait, what, what else yeah. are you going to oh, say? Okay. She's also what? Oh, so they're afraid for oh. their kids. <laughs> she just. It's, I was. I forgot what I was going to say. Uh, huh. But anyways, hey guys, I made. Uh, I made that. Um, I made an animation for the Matty Glacius Octavator. Oh, oh that was, that was, that was awesome. Thanks yes. for it. Thanks for posting. Beautiful. Thanks for making it, buddy. Yeah. yeah. All right. They're fun Be to make. Well. They take forever, but I do every one. Thanks nice. so much, Sean. Thanks, buddy. Thank you. Sean. Good luck to you and your family. Take care. Yeah. Enjoy the duck tomorrow. <laughs> yeah. I hope you. And hey, I hope. Thing. I hope your mom wins. By the way, <laughs> <laughs> the game. Yeah. I'm rooting for. Her. It's um, quite sad. All right, we got a no hothead, Jason. Oh. Jason, three six one. You're on the line. Oh, on the phone. Not on the Zoom. What's up, buddies? What's up, buddies? What's up? Ooh, let's not oh, do that. Oh, shit. I like it. There we go. There, there we, we go. go. There we go. There we go. There, there we go. go. There, Ooh, there it goes. There we go. Is there it goes. Hothead? There you go. There, there you go. go. There this you go. is a hothead. Do you have a topic, Jason? Uh, yes. I actually have a pun, a Thanksgiving pun I'd love, I'd love oh, to try out. Yes. All right. Let's 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 do it. All right, here we go. Um, where do we start? Better not be a turkey. Uh, it's no, 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 no. It's, um, okay, yeah. So Americans are so fucking rude. We're such rude humans. Um, like we just indigenous people that should have more representation for Thanksgiving, but in the end, they're Native American. Okay. Thanks so much. <laughs> We're gonna drop you. Thanks, Jason. <laughs> Wait, how did it go? Go oh, stop that. In the end. In the end. In the end. They're Native American. That's that yeah, was that's funny. good. Very yeah. good. Very good. I lift think. him up. I think. Come on, yeah. Lift it up. Can we lift him up? You know up? what? Lift Don't lift up. him up. Okay. Lift it up. Okay. <laughs> Whatever that means. All right, Han. Four one two. Nope. By the way, <laughs> white men are not allowed to talk. By the way, yeah, you know good. that song, "Who that's Are You?" or whatever. Keeps going. I I thought they were saying New Orleans. What? Yeah. Han, the four one two. You're on the hot head. I know. Hotline. I thought they were saying New Orleans. New, new. Wait, Doug, have new, you ever heard that? Have you ever heard oh, that song? Oh, in New Orleans. <laughs> oh, you're in New Orleans. That song that sounds like DJ Doug Pound. You know that song? Oh yeah. Did you read yes. Drogba? 
Have we put played that? that? Yeah. Put that, on. that song's good, man. Oh, yeah, yeah. You know what song oh, is that? I got so yeah, Dridri Drogba. Here, I, I'll I, find it for you. I discovered that. Yeah, song. Brent found it. It's really funny. You ready to add that to the Spotify it's like playlist? DJ Dogbo. DJ Dogbo. Yeah. Okay, it's D I D E R. D I D E R. Um, and then Drogba. Yeah, Wait. Okay. <laughs> That's a song, though. Didri Drogba song. It sounds like song. DJ Dogbo. It's so funny. Wait. It's a, it's, it seems like it's an athlete. No, that's a soccer player. Okay, I'll find the song. No, Drogba by Afro B. That's what it is. Drogba by Afro B. Play it. It's really good. It sounds like it's saying DJ Doug Pound. DJ Doug Pound. Yeah, this is it. I don't want to get dinged. I know. You like this song? Well, it's just funny. Is it a doppelsanger? What is this? Hey, look who's on Zoom. Here it is. Here he is. <laughs> <laughs> so funny. I heard it on the radio or something like yeah. that, and I thought, this is what so is funny. He saying? <laughs> he's saying DJ Dro- He's saying the name of that athlete, but it oh, sounds okay. like DJ oh, Doug Pound. Oh, he's singing the name of the yeah, soccer player. Exactly, yes. <laughs> but it's not. <laughs> <laughs> There was a uh, hothead. Well, Let's just do five minutes. This is, we have six minutes left. Tim. Oh, wow. Right? Tim, you're back to say goodbye. You're not going to make it in. Is that what's going on? Well, I'm just I'm just leaving the lot now. Oh. And I was hoping to get back before five, and it just ain't going to happen with this traffic. I'm not pulling a gag or anything. It just didn't work out. Should we keep going for another hour? <laughs> You know, it's up to you guys. If you, <laughs> I'll be home in thirty-seven minutes. Oof. You want me to? You want to see me walk through that door? You might die. Or do you want to get the hell out of there? I mean, it's we on could, you. I'm not could, gonna. Uh, how many? What, what do we have? How, how many uh, patrons do we have to go? We're at fifty-eight eighty-seven. I don't think we're if gonna we make get our the six, goal. Th- how about if we get the six thousand? We'll wait for ten. <laughs> oh, that's <laughs> a good switcheroo. Right? We get the six thousand in the next five minutes. Yeah. yeah. If we can hit six thousand yeah. in five then minutes, then we'll, we'll wait. <laughs> we'll do another hour. I don't upset. know, oh guys. Oh my god! I know. <laughs> well, listen. Here's the thing. Here's the deal, Jack. We did. We got a lot of patrons today, and we very much appreciate yes. it. We added. I have to do the math real quick. Like 50, 50 or sixty new patrons. Is that's that what's that's going amazing. On? Guys. Sixty. Wow. Well, you know what? We didn't do. What they always do on we don't have a matching goal. We don't have a guy out there who's saying like, if we get thirty patrons in the next hour, uh, this guy's gonna donate a million dollars. Yeah. But we didn't have that incentive. Uh-huh. Wisconsin yeah, dude. So I, I said Andrew will can match. Can we send some socks to people? Is that a thing? Can we can we do, still do that? We can. We can, we can send out hundred twenty pairs of socks. socks. All right, next yeah next next hundred people get socks. <laughs> Hold on a second. Can we afford that? I don't know how much. We can stuff. afford it. I don't. Uh, <laughs> Does anybody want? Yeah, no, a lot of going to the mailbox for yeah. me. I think that's shipping and handling, not included. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it has to be the upper level or something. I don't know. I don't know how to do. What that. was the deal with handling? I always did. We knew what shipping was. That's but when they box it up. People... You got to pay someone to box it up, T. Mm-hmm. That, but that you could. Uh, that's a negotiable price right there. You could uh, <laughs> gouge. You could gouge there easily. <laughs> Brent, how much would it be to uh, ship and handle you across across the country? <laughs> oh, it depends on where I'm going. You know, I'd like depends to handle on, you. You could handle me for free. Any, you know, you can handle me for free. Do you have, a, bo- just, do you have uh, a body glove, Brent? You, know. you could put on. I mean, I know you don't like people oh, touching. Oh, like a you. body glove brand like wetsuit. Body, yeah, yeah, a, yeah, a full yeah. body condom. Uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> you can handle me all you Wait. want with a full body condom. <laughs> Vic. Yeah, I mean, Doug, I know you got a flight to catch, but I'm just proposing this to Matt and Vic and whoever. How cool would it be for me to be on the Zoom and then walk in the <laughs> right. studio? Uh huh. Okay, okay. I mean, my, that's flight's cool. mine. my flight's at eight. It's at Burbank. Oh, plenty of time. Oh, you got, well, are, you going, are you going home first? No. Well, then you got to stick around. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. In for a penny. Well, you can't leave. How far are you? I'm are you, 34 minutes are away. You on, oh. 
And I, I have to pick up my kid at six. <laughs> <laughs> I just realized I don't know, that. Tim. <laughs> this is a tough negotiation. Yeah. It looks like it's going to be the it's producer be match show for about 40 minutes. Just look for an ambulance stay. and follow it. How about this? Hey, if we get to this? 6 we'll call, in, I'll leave and we'll call in like a fake fire down the street, <laughs> and then you just find the ambulance and take and follow okay. it. Hold on. Hold on a second, Ann. I'm going to – hold on, Tim. Hold on. Tell <laughs> – Plead your case. Hey, Ann's on the phone here, and she's calling because she's nervous that uh, I'm not going to be able to pick up my kid. But tell her it's worth it, though, for – We didn't uh, hit 6,000. I'm not getting in the middle of that. <laughs> Ann, can you say something? Do you want, no. Do you want me to go get her? Oh, um, oh, he's not going to be able oh, to Oh, look at this. <laughs> wow. What do you think? Is that of okay? Of course we do. We're trying to get the 6,000 patrons here. Yeah, I'll go get her. Wow. You hear that? Oh, thanks, Annie. Let's give a round of applause for Annie. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. The show must go on. I'm making my Thank four year old walk home alone from Bye. school. So Bye. I can stay here. <laughs> How nice was that? All right. That's the all point. right. So it's on. Are you gonna stick Tom, around until Tom I and Luke, get home? Are you guys okay? Doug, you all right? Can dude? I just take a nap? Yeah, <laughs> I mean, that's the real issue. Is like I'm very. Wait, so yeah, Luke, that week, Luke and Tom, you can this is fucking sitting around for eight hours, Gavin. <laughs> like, what are you so exhausting about this? Wait, what's it? But like, poor Luke and, and Tom over here, they're not gabbing at all. They're just like staring at us the whole day. This that's nine hours stuff. of that. So you let's give them an applause. Come on, get out of come on, come on, up. Very good. Yeah, lift, them, lift, lift, those, them up. lift those boys up. Lift them up. I mean, they're not exactly like mining for coal or anything. <laughs> <laughs> no. To be honest. But Doug, if you're feeling tired, <laughs> I can try to lift you up. There's people out there that have it tough. <laughs> Luke's going to live if he stays around for another half hour. Believe me. <laughs> Uh, Give him another primary colored shirt to change into. A <laughs> wow! Oh boy, this oh, is the abuse Doug, we need right to get our energy right to stick back. Around out. a little bit. All right, we'll stick around. For Doug this still. Kid. Doug doesn't seem convinced though. Look at his face. Oh, he can. But I suck. I'll stay. Thing. Vic Doug, will stay. Yeah, I'll lift stay. You and then lift where you do you up. have to go if your flight's not till eight? You're not getting to the Burbank Airport before seven. Right. Yeah. I gotta have a couple of beers before I get on the plane. <laughs> have them here. Yeah. Listen, Doug. Have you to drive over there? <laughs> Doug, why don't you go pound a coffee? There you go. Oh, you have to get your real ID, don't you? Yeah, go get something. You have to stop at the DMV. <laughs> Do I need a real ID? No. Oh, I hope not. Do you have your vaccine you passport? You stop at the DMV before you go to the airport? That doesn't sound like a good thing. <laughs> well, I don't have a parking lot. I just, I don't know where to park and shit. You know, I don't have a parking the, lot. You don't have a parking lot? I got to figure that out. Oh, you got to get a parking lot. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what. We'll take some of that Patreon what money are... and put it towards your parking. There we That's go. What parking there lot. We go. We'll we just got to take a dump is what I got to do. Well, just go, go do it. it. Go do it. You know go what? in the main He's... house. Yeah, but I want to yeah, use style. Tim's on suite. Go for it. I don't want to use that little side bathroom. <laughs> do it. All go up in the main house. I need the main house, if you, leave, if you leave before I co come home, you're dead to me. Uh, That's all. Oh. Oh. Wow. Uh, instead of standing around and go joking about uh, uh, G2, you could have been out there going, action, okay, action. No, we got it. We got it. No, that one's good. Uh, yeah, everyone's we'll upset. We're waiting. Where are Let's they? Let's get Where? set up the next yeah. shot. <laughs> That's not how it went. <laughs> like, just look out. They're like filming uh, with your iPhone. One take. We got it. Check the gate. Check the gate. <laughs> Doug, you go upstairs and use the master bath. Like, go ahead. That curb the bed, and go ahead. Saying, uh, you, you can't drop the kids off at the pool up there, right? You can let them use yeah, the toto? Yeah, but once you get here, it's going to be you another, the you know, a day? how long, how much, once you get here, then how much longer do I got to sit here? <laughs> you just got to say hi to them. No, we'll ta I'll tap you out. Doug, I'll tap you out. It'll be like a relay race. You hear me? What about these other people? <laughs> that, you know, spot. they're putting in their precious time yeah, to be here. Right. Do you guys t are you able go, to stay? They could go fuck themselves for all like, I care. <laughs> yeah, just like, yeah, sure. Calm down. I'll sing for a minute. For a minute. <laughs> yeah. Anyone no, who wants to listen, leave can leave. Yeah, you can go record. if you want. Yeah. Just no for one's there by force. Yeah. Except Doug. <laughs> <laughs> This this uh, this quickly turned turn from a joke to a real hostage uh -huh. situation. Tim, I got kids. I forgot to tell you about. It. I, gotta, <laughs> I found out yesterday. I got these kids. I got to go pick them. But up. this does seem kind of classic to I me. Adopted I adopted mean, them today. I mean, work says nine to five. Sometimes you got to stay a little later. You know, mm -hmm. that kind oh, of checks out. Make a good impression. Yeah. Yeah. It kind of checks out. Your ass. The boss is riding you. you know, 
You go up there, take a nice, long, hot dump. <laughs> wipe your ass nice and clean. A monologue? Say hi to my wife. <laughs> a monologue. Take a nice <laughs> monologue. <laughs> take a nice monologue. It's just got to be you know, just one. You think you can do a Watch monologue? Watch the monologue on Sunday night. And uh, <laughs> by the time you come back down to gather your things, I'll be strolling in like a king coming back from a big battle on the <laughs> battlefield. Like... Like Julius Caesar himself crossing the Rubicon, <laughs> and I'll come in there like a, on my chariot. To, to the, to Vic won't be will, won't his eyes will be popping out of his head when he sees me come in. <laughs> and then you'll come in and you'll grab your bags and you get the fuck out there of here. There you go. There you go. Okay, okay I'll be like really race. I'll be like I'll be in that sprinter's position. <laughs> oh, thanks, Brian. Just you chipped know? in ten bucks for your parking oh, fund look at so that. you can get the primo lot. <laughs> Thank you, Brian. Thanks, Brian. That was very nice. <laughs> We'll all let's chip let's in. pay to upgrade Doug to first class. <laughs> oh, actually, dude, yeah. I'm on Southwest and I'm like B fifty nine. Oh my god! Uh, Even more speed. You can or you can pay for to get A. You can pay to get an A, a class. It's like thirty bucks. At least let's can check it out. Booking. I'll book. Yeah, you your, can pay at the pump. You can pay right there. Yeah, I need I've done you it. guys. To stre- I need you guys to stretch. Okay, just stretch. <laughs> Take some calls. T, we've been stretching Show for six hours down. now. Oh yeah. <laughs> Aren't you, Vic, talk about the Beach Boys yeah. for a little bit? We got this Beach Boys wanna... quiz we could do. I know that's exciting for everyone. <laughs> well, that's a good idea. Do you want to do the Beach Boys? Should we do... <laughs> Tim, do you... should we wait for you for that Beach Boys quiz? No, or... I can do it right now. Okay. Oh, all right. You want to do it? Do a couple questions. And, and maybe let's bring a Zoomer or two in or, or a caller or something, right? Is that possible? Yeah. DJ absolutely. Duckbound. We actually have a caller on the line still. At, uh, oh, oh, nice. They dropped. He gave up. Anybody want anything from the fridge? I'm going to get something. Yeah, do you have a soda water? Uh, do yeah, have plenty. Soda water? Wait, was Vic just setting up the Beach Boys I, thought, game I know, he just said he wanted to play a game and then walked out. I know, I was about to drop my new monologue, and then he's like, I'm going to go over there. Hey, if you dr- if it's more than one log, if it's two logs, is it a stereo log? Stereo yeah, log. yeah. Cool. Stereo log. But here's a new, I mean, here's a new fake ad idea. It could be... Okay. Johnny Carson's monologues. It's, of, it's all his poo. It's like a, an insert that you put in your butt that takes all your poo and makes it into one log. <laughs> so you don't have to do, you don't have to squeeze out a turd and then it's like, ah, oh, I got a couple more coming. It's just one. And it's like, appro- it's designed and approved by Carson. Yeah. What if it was called Carson's, Carson's monologue State. and it's actually Carson Daly? Or it could be Jay Leno's monologue. All right. Who wants to play the Beach Boys game versus Tim and Vic? Wait, did you say what is this? Who wants Can you play, explain it? He wants to play the the Beach Boys game, uh, Vic versus Tim. No, Vic, who Vic wants to Tim. play against Tim and Vic? Oh, again, oh, oh, they're a team. Okay, got yeah, it. Yeah. Can, oh, no, I'm no, I good. think it's I, every man for himself. No? I don't know that. I don't know those. Yeah, no, no, those is that a band? Is that a band? You don't. You don't <laughs> or is they Kent? Is that a sketch group or a band? Yes. Hello. Kent, are you on the line? All right. Uh, so, oh, can you hear me? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> All right, let me get my sound effects because if Vic's playing, he can't do the sound effects, right? Uh, probably not. If you right. got them lined up, I don't think it's fair that Vic made the game and oh no, I, the game. no, I, I honestly I didn't make the game. I found the game and I only only yeah. looked at like one or two questions just to see what it was like. And they're they're pretty tough, I must say. Is this just trivia? It's just trivia. Yeah, it's yeah. trivia, but it's like deep. Deep uh, Beach Boys trivia, from what I could tell. Sounds okay. yeah. sounds like an, a fan favorite. I know. <laughs> All right. There which Beach Boy had to apologize to Australia after a, quote, goofy concert? I mean, that's got to be Mike Love. It's got to be Brian Wilson. Oh. What are the names of the other one? There's Carl, there's uh, Al, and there's uh, Dennis. I'm going to go with Dennis. And, and John Stamos. Bru- John Stamos, Bruce Johnston, uh, Blondie Chaplin. All right. right, let's. Uh, <laughs> what, what's your answer? Well, how how do we do? Do we just shout it out? You want me to give you the multiple choice? Do yeah. You? Mike Love, Carl Wilson, Brian Wilson, or Dennis Wilson? Dennis. Oh, probably. Yeah. Phillips Wilson. Yeah, definitely go Dennis. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm swayed. I'm gonna go Dennis too because he was a mess in like the early '80s. No. What was it? Carl Wilson. Carl. What did Carl do? How do I know? It's All your right. quiz. Just... <laughs> Wish they gave the information. <laughs> what a boring game already. Let's, you have to like, right, Google it yourself. <laughs> you already want to end it? No, no, no. Go ahead. Keep going. Okay. Do we have uh, a Zoomer? Is there finish there. Yeah, there's okay. a Zoomer on. Kent. Okay. Oh, Kent, you muted yourself. What's going on? Oh, my, my fault. There we there go. go. All right. Finish the lyric. 
but she let another guy come between us and it shattered our plans, it shattered our lives, it shattered my heart, or help me, Rhonda. What, was there a question? It's going to be, it's gonna be my, it's something with shattered, because there's plans. more options for shattered. We'll Vic is correct. Shattered plans. I don't even know anything about this group, mm. and I can you probably get them right. You're going to get them all? I think I get them all. What's the angle of this Zoom going on here? <laughs> what? That's the Where he's going to eat us for dinner. That's the dominant angle. angle. Is that yeah. your... <laughs> he's going to eat us. There we go. <laughs> Much better. That's, okay. actually that's more a lot more. It was unsettling. That's actually, actually like more that. submissive yeah. in a way. Yeah. I'm sorry. I'm on my, it was like a weird I'm POV porn type <laughs> thing. <laughs> right. That's, okay, that's <laughs> like, am I his not penis? What is going on here? I, I kind of okay, go no, go no, with no. that. Go with the other. Go bring it back down. I want to see it again. But no. it would be a push it down. Yeah, push it like even lower. Around. It's even like curving lo- around. <laughs> looking back at. There it is. I kind of like that. No, I, I like just like looking up to you yeah. like this. It's kind of like I know. you seem no, like such a big uncomfortable. I know. There it is. There it is. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Like a big daddy right now. What is good? Look at some of these quiz questions are really dumb. I like that. That's a good shot. That's an excellent shot. I mean, maybe oh, in the this mirror was in the back too. Uh, wait, get it with the so we can see your like your head in the mirror in the back. Go ahead, turn the turn oh, the chair. There, there, there it is. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How low can you go? That's pretty good. <laughs> Don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> also, you're kind of gyrating your head in a weird way too. Like you're kind of going like you're doing this like chicken thing with your head in a way. It's like some kind of dominant chicken man or something like that. So a dominant chicken man was my nickname in high school. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, Are you single? I get it. <laughs> I am married. Uh, I was gonna say that could be you could do a whole dating app where all your pictures are from that angle. <laughs> <laughs> a whole profile. You get a new it, it should be like an animated gift though, so that you can do that chicken kind of move, yeah. you know, or like that head move you were doing too. You know? Yeah. I'll ask my oh, wife. Nick. I get a new Tinder profile. Actually, is your wife is your wife in the room? No, she okay. just left. Oh, I was no. just saying because she, if she holds the phone, we can get even lower. We can get like, from the foot. <laughs> that'd, be, that'd be funny. If that's the, we can go all the way down. Let's see what we can do. That'd be right. funny if the whole family just does it like that. Yeah. <laughs> How low can we get? Oh, that's... <laughs> With wow. the mirror, that's cool. <laughs> oh my god! That that just I spilt my water. Oh no! <laughs> oh, that, no. They kind of look like we just oh. kind of. Took Tilted our heads all the yeah. way back, you know. Like we decided to, li- we were like looking at it, and we kind of fainted or something from it's the shot, and we just tilted back. You know? It's like soaring across America, but it's like soaring under you. Right. Oh, I like that soaring what? under soaring, you. So, what's, your, what's his Whoa, name? That's a really good idea for Disneyland. Yes. Uh, Instead of soaring over soaring USA, under Ken. Yeah, soaring under soaring Ken. Under Ken. <laughs> soaring under Ken. <laughs> soaring under Ken. <laughs> like a weird upskirt uh, themed ride. Yes. <laughs> it's an upskirt themed. It's upskirt. <laughs> But it's men only though. Men only. It's, a, it's like up, up it's, balls. It's up shorts. Up, 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 up short. Up, up short. Up short. It's up short. Uh, or up shorts or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> up shorts. That's a good angle, man. You guys into up shorts videos? <laughs> I bet. Is there? Is I that am a, now. Is this that is a thing? Like, I wonder if on the on the I'm internet sure there is, is up shorts. It's gotta be. Maybe they don't call it that, but they call right, it. I'm gonna look it up. Up short. What's the next question? Yeah. Isn't that like teabagging, basically? <laughs> From a distance? Yeah, it's wow, a thing. It, it is a thing. It up got short dark all of a sudden. All right. Outside. Al Jardine, what is the Al short for? Alan. Alfred, Alan, or Albert? Probably Albert. Al. What? I think it's short for Al Sharpton. I think I think Vic had it. What did you say, Vic? I said <laughs> Alan. Correct. <laughs> okay. No, it's not. <laughs> According to this quiz, it is. No. <laughs> I say Alan? Right, let's make the it's fun. his full name huh? is Alan Charles Jardine. I said Alan. Hey, that's first. what I was trying to do. Just yeah, put that out there. Keep that trend going. Uh, I don't really. Do we, do we want to keep band. going with this game, Doug, or are we Janinga, ready to bail on? Janinga gave really... you five bucks to use the uh, the uh, the master bathroom, Doug. <laughs> Helping you out. <laughs> I didn't use the master bathroom. I don't want to. Just... Oh, he didn't. Oh, he was afraid to. Okay. <laughs> I thought the Would You Rather was fun. We only did like one of those. Mm. I mean, would you prefer? What or would you, would you prefer? Would you prefer? Oh, yeah. What do you yeah. prefer? What do you prefer? 
<laughs> yeah, anyone have any good oh, would you rathers? Any up? Zoomers have some good <clears throat> would you rathers? Or any would, would you, you prefers? Rather... Could, could I uh, ask Vic one question? Yeah, buddy. How about would you rather uh, not? Vic, uh, why, uh, why do you like Homeland so much? Well, I like Bosch. I don't know. Uh, you watch Bosch? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Vic, you watch Bosch? Yeah, buddy. <laughs> Dude, I, well, you're supposed to, um, you're supposed to say I, I like keeping my country safe. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, uh, is huh? this see? What's he talking? Wait, is that? I like keep. I like I've keep. never heard of anybody Wait, who like... ever seen Bosch before. All right, really? thanks. I always see the billboards, and I think who's right, ever bye, even guys. seen Thank Bosch? You. It I like keeping like, my country right. safe was that was a uh, was a What's Jeb thing, about? but I can't remember what it's what it's from. What, what he can I tell you my favorite? Can I tell you my favorite moment of the show, maybe of of all time? Has been, uh, he says, hey, Vic, wh why do you like Homeland? Vic says, well, I like Bosch. <laughs> <laughs> but I didn't, I've never, I don't it's think I've ever seen, shit. I don't think I've ever seen Homeland, though. Vic's had Bosch on the brain for like a year now. I know, I love it. You can't stop it's thinking a good show. about it. What is it even about? A cop. Some kind of man a or cop. something? It's about a cop. I thought it was about a man. An investigator. He solves crimes, murders, and stuff. Is Bosch his name? Is he a bad cop? No. Uh, in a way, he kind of like skirts the law a little bit. He like pushes things a little. He shorts the law. Takes he things a little, a little too far now and then. I think he's Does a tough he make guy. kitchen appliances? <laughs> kitchen appliances? No, not that I know of. Isn't that Bosch? Isn't that Bosch? Is Bosch uh, right. yeah. spa and spark plugs, too, they make. All right, enough Bosch talk. I had enough Bosch talk. <laughs> What's it on? Is it on Hulu or something? Uh, it's Amazon. Yeah, 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 I was gonna go. I was just, you just, I was just. Hieronymus, about to... Hieronymus, Hieronymus Bosch, Hieronymus Bosch. You know about that painter? No. <laughs> Does he do surreal? Oh, Bosch. He did the, uh, he does the surreal Garden of Earth sort of, Delights. Yeah, you're talking like uh, heaven and like hell. hellscapes. Uh -huh. And it does touch yeah. on that. Yeah, it does touch on that. Like one of the killers uses that, like those, the art somehow in the in the way they. Oh, they they do it. Yeah, they touch on it. Yeah. I just had an idea for a TV show, by the way. Not, yeah, not, not, you, not, uh, did you cry when they canceled Bosch? <laughs> What's that? We lost you there, Tim. What? <laughs> uh oh. Oh, no, it's not canceled. Uh, Bosch Jr. is coming. For real. Really? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Uh huh. Like a baby? What? His a daughter. Baby cop? His daughter, yeah. Oh, I thought it was like for kids. Bosch uh, for kids. Kind should of be, thing. but no. It's no. like Bosch with a spell with crayon. It's <laughs> like it's all crayons and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but, um,. Because that show looks so, you know, the billboards make it look so dry and for adults. You it's know? pretty mm -hmm. good. It's 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 kind of mindless stuff. I don't know, I you know, like Bosch it. sounds like a word you could use as, for slang uh, to say something's cool or something. You know, mm -hmm. oh, that's Bosch. That's, that's Bosch. Bosh. Oh, that's Bosch. That's <laughs> Bosch. It's basically like saying boss. <laughs> right. It's almost yeah. But it's like incorrectly. And, it's, and his name is actually <laughs> like a Harry Bosch. Harry Bosch. It is. His <laughs> name is Harry Bosch. <laughs> yeah, it really is. Shoot. Harry Bosch. Uh huh. Ooh, that's a nice Harry Bosch. It's a drama. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that? yeah, it's like a body part. Or what is yeah. it? Maybe Bosch is like a, a another word for some kind of body part. Well, it so kind of sounds like mm. Bosch. If you yeah. 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 Bosch. Who has a Harry nice Harry Bosch? It's like a Southern California yeah. guy saying Bush. Bosch. <laughs> Dude, it's like a Dude. nice Harry Bosch. Dude, Bosh. trim your Bosch. <laughs> Dude. dude, trim your bosh. What if dudes were into like men's boshes, you know? <laughs> what if trimming, like making, you know, kind of doing your bosh in a way was a thing, like a, like a garden, you know, like a sculpting, a, you know, leaves and stuff or whatever, bushes. You know how they do that? You know, you can sculpt it into animals, but right. it's for your pubic like hair, though. Edward Scissorhands kind of yeah, stuff. Yeah. <laughs> what if you did Edward Scissorhands on your pubic hair? <laughs> That that would be a Bosch. Be yeah, a, a big Bosch. Nice Bosch. <laughs> <laughs> I oh, saw I Trevor's. <laughs> dude, I saw Trevor's. I Bosch. saw Trevor's Bosch, dude. It looked like an elephant. <laughs> <laughs> but I think, ironically, it would actually it would make your dick look smaller. <laughs> Dude, well, that's actually, totally cool. Yeah, that's dude. good. Actually, that's what you want. Like, yeah. That's, that's what oh, you man, want, my dick's bro. looking that's too big. Yeah. I got to get a big <laughs> old hairy bosh. Yeah. What if like small dicks were cool? The, there is a thing for that. There's people who are in, that's a, a micro penis pride. They have that. What 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 do they have? Micro penis uh, pride. Pride. Yeah. Isn't it micro penis pride month? <laughs> is it November? I think that's a is thing. That it's it's I, think, I think that's a real thing. Is that there's that people are proud of their small penis, or there's a community Good of small that, penis man. people. Um, yeah. But by the way, what if uh, you trimmed your bosh to make it look like a penis? 
kind of so to overshadow a, the, mm. the the real one. You know, it's like your right. evil penis. Something like yeah, that. Yeah, penis yeah. dark. Penis, <laughs> penis dark. <laughs> penis dark. <laughs> what if you went penis dark? <laughs> <laughs> Said it after dark. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go penis dark. <laughs> I just ate a whole box of plantains. Oh, it was good. Wow. Where'd you get that from? Mixed out or something like Sage. that? Sage. Oh, okay. Sage. 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 <laughs> I brought over a dipper, like, I'm going to use it. <laughs> dude, I was at Sage, I dude. I, what I sauce was, do they give with this? I don't even plantain. know. I thought it should be more of a it white like kind salsa. of salsa. Crema. Yeah. Or I ketchup. Was, you want uh, the salsa? No, no. I was at Sage with Trevor and. Uh, he showed me his Bosch, dude. I was, I was like, dude, I don't want to see your Bosch. I'm trying to eat some plantains. I ate them all, even the crumb that fell on my seat, bro. Bosch, what did you fell call? on your Bosch? You started calling people Bosch. They're like, what's hey, up, Bosch? What's up, Bosch? <laughs> it's not like Boss, but no, it sounds like Boss. It sounds yeah. like Boss, but it's like with some kind of, you know, kind of intonation, you know. <laughs> What's up, Bosch? What if, what if you go to see Bruce Springsteen? Yeah. <laughs> and he looks like a straight-up werewolf. He's got hair all over his body. And he's like, but it's groomed. I'm the Bosch now. <laughs> <laughs> Born in the USA. Bosch in the USA. Just just Tim's using... just like, I got to get home fucking now. <laughs> he's like, listen to what they're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> They're ruining, just they're ruining my show. Red lights. They're, they're ruining my show with all this. He's stuff. like that movie uh, with Jake Gyllenhaal. Where he, or, Nightcrawler? Nightcrawler. He's oh, just yeah. nightcrawling <laughs> through the city streets right now. <laughs> what? You Uh-oh. okay, Tim? <laughs> you, did we lose him? <laughs> I'm here. I'm really fading, by the way. <laughs> the food kind of woke me up a oh, little bit. Oh, did it? Okay. Oh, really? It's the usually, monologue helped a little bit. Usually mm-hmm. the food puts you to the sleep. Monologue. It's kind of a micro-log. Okay, you want to hear my... Oh, what's that big... <coughs> micro, <coughs> oh, micro... Oh, you have a show idea. I got a TV show idea. It's not, it's not an idea for a t- TV show. It's a way to make an interesting type of TV show. You asked, like, what Bosch was on, and you said what? It's on HBO or something? Oh, uh, yeah, Amazon. Amazon. Is, yeah. What if every single streaming platform banded together... To all make the highest budget show of all time, and it's on all of them. Right. So it's on every platform. Oh, it's on HBO Max. It's on Netflix. It's on uh-huh. Amazon. It's on all of them, uh-huh. and it's that's, just the most expensive wow. show ever made. That's really interesting. Uh-huh. Kind of interesting Andrew, that's idea. innovative. I, What's I like that, that budget? I don't know. I just thought like it's a could, trillion dollars. They just Billion, band billions of dollars. Yeah, they, it'd be interesting. They make the most ultimate. Right. What's the show about? I don't know yet. I don't have that part of it. But <laughs> just like <laughs> I just have kids the in their twenties, like living in New York. Yeah, it's that. And it's like a trillion dollar production. It's like a comedian, and he's you know he's working. He's starting from the bottom. He's crashing too. He's like going through a divorce. He's dating. <laughs> and you know he does. Right. He's doing sets at open mics. <laughs> but it would just be interesting if shows started existing okay. on like multiple. Right. You know what I mean? Like yeah. they work together. I got an idea for the show. Oh, let's hear it. Bosch the third. <laughs> okay. You know. Oh, Bosch That's baby. Right yeah, oh yeah, Bosch I baby. Trying to say the Bosch talk. <laughs> <laughs> just when you thought you're off Bosch, you're back. <laughs> Bosch. Do you guys want to know where I am? Yeah. Uh, I want to say I'll, K-Town or right outside? Los Feliz. I'll say I'm, I'm, at the, I'm at one of the worst hey, tell intersections in Los Angeles. You got to Sunset. Guess. Sunset and Virgil? Nope. Oh. Mm. Oh, uh, Rodeo is Beverly Hills. Rodeo and... Well, well uh, keep in mind so he's well, on no, the He was at Paramount, so he's like... Yeah. You're probably... He's almost at, back. I want to say you're on Vermont. Is it Los Feliz Boulevard? Hey, I don't even fucking know. <laughs> <laughs> what, is, what, what intersection is it? It's got to be. I'm the, asking. I don't know. It's got to be bad. the Sunset Hill Hurt, like that where the Vaughns oh, is. Oh, that oh, one where there's like, which splits off between it's Hollywood like, and Sunset. It's, like, it's that's too a bad fucked one. up. And it yeah. takes forever. Where the, yeah. where the Vista is. Yeah, yeah at the yeah. Vista. That's that one. It's, it's close, but this is, I believe this is worse. What? Huh. A worse intersection? And it's in that it's in that neighborhood, I guess. It's in that general vicinity. Hmm. Oh, see if I can... oh, you're going up. You're going up. You're going up Silver Lake Boulevard, right, Tim? Oh, oh, oh is it by that car wash? 
Yeah. Oh, oh, that's the one. Yeah, that one Fletcher sucks. by the car wash on Fletcher. Yeah, Fletcher. yeah, yeah. yeah that's Fletcher a and oh, Glendale. Yeah, yeah Fletcher and, and no, Rowena. Rowena. Fletcher and Rowena. 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 Wow, uh, I can't want... believe we solved that game. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so used hell? to that one. I don't even consider it. I don't bad even anymore. think it's so bad. That was fun. I don't, I don't actually. think it's as bad. Actually, as to be honest, I like that intersection. <laughs> that intersection oh, fuck sucks. Off. <laughs> well, yeah. Tim, if you're coming, fuck if you're going north on Glendale, you get those arrows. You get the arrows. So oftentimes, if you're turning on the Fletcher, no, but what he's doing, trying to go left on the Fletcher, is really how many bad. It depends on the time now. of day. Yeah. It depends on the time. No, but how many yeah. people are watching? What he's doing is the worst. That's as bad as it gets. Sometimes you get a smooth transaction on that. We, this is almost like people should be tuning in like uh, they tune in for those car chases on the highway where you can be following along, <laughs> you know? You I need a know. different angle on that can on that car. Yeah, we need to see. Can we get a point of view? There we go. Oh, what what oh, lane are you in? I'm, dude, I'm never going to make my flight. <laughs> What's my cutoff? <laughs> Tim, I'm going to have to have a cutoff with all due respect. Well, once I catch this left, which is going to be in two or three minutes, then I'm smooth sailing. Which is going to be in two or three hours. Mm. Let me check. Have you checked? They're saying 30 minutes to Burbank Dude, right that now. looks fucked. What time is your flight? It's a little busy. You flying out to Chicago Well, or plus I have to figure out where to park, and then um, I got to take the shuttle, you know, from the... Tim, that, that hood's looking a little split. dirty. Maybe Duh, you could wash it on the way. Maybe stop at the car wash right now. <laughs> don't fuck up your flight. Yeah, actually, do you mind if I hit the car wash? <laughs> <laughs> it's right there. You're right there. <laughs> And it's kind of backed up, but <laughs> I'm not going to do the wax. <laughs> You'll skip the vacuum. <clears throat> How about when they, they, they all, all the uh, lists of options for car washes, like uh, premium, Excelsior, diamond. <laughs> there's no like bad. There's it's, it's, it's all premiums. Uh, deluxe. Mm. Right. And the, that's the, the lowest level you could do with a car wash is deluxe. Right. You know, can I bring something up real quick? Yeah. I don't understand why there aren't more drive through car washes. In They're coming our, back, baby. They, that, that's like my business idea is I want to open up a drive through car wash in like the east side of L.A. There, the one, no, there's one right by where, that, where he's at right now. Is a but good it's one. not drive through. Yes, it is. It, it is. does the, the it does time, its own. Big time. No. Yes. I thought it still somebody 100%. goes and cleans it for no, you. No, 100%. You drive through, they do it. It does it all. It sounded like you really? said Honda person. Yeah. Huh. yeah, Tim and I, I. I saw Doug there once. Remember, Doug? I saw you there like two weeks ago. That's right. <laughs> and we I both did there. something? I get my car washed every day. <laughs> 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 just a habit. It's like brushing my teeth. You know? yeah, yeah, yeah. Twice a day, too, Twice right? Twice a day. <laughs> Morning and night before bed. <laughs> on my way to work, on my way home. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, I've got a good personalized license plate I just caught right here in front of me. No joke. It's X Tacos X. So it's just tacos. <laughs> That's a straight edge taco um, <laughs> situation. No hormones, no GMOs. Run those plates, guys. Run those plates. <laughs> I can't, I wish it was just not, the, there wasn't the first X and it was just Tacos X. Because that sounds kind of, you know, interesting. It sounds mysterious. And... All right, I'm going to take this. Here we go. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to turn the camera here. We're taking the left. We're getting the left uh, arrow. And once I'm... Oh, it's so jammed, Doug. Uh, <laughs> so oh, my God. Are you getting on the five oh, right I'm here, I hope? Going to pick out. Oh, you're at that intersection. The there it is. Wait, you're you're yeah. just getting there. Oh. Uh, what is he? What That's street is he on? Wash. I didn't hear. That's a drive through car wash? Is he on Glendale? It looks like you could use a car wash. Yeah, Look that, at that actually... Window. <laughs> are you All like right, by I'm Zebulon? Through. Is that where you're at? Yeah, like that area. Yeah, there's a car wash. Yeah. Right there. Huh. Well, I'm in good shape now. That's the, that's the that's the that's uh, the Rubicon right there. We crossed the Rubicon. Hmm. Now it's just a jump on the two, and I'll be I'll be home in ten minutes. There you go, Doug. You're not gonna take the five to the one thirty four. <laughs> it's right there. Now we gotta wait for you to get in the two. <laughs> you pop in the two. It's... You know what, Doug? Get out of my house. <laughs> get out. Okay. Why don't you take a call? Yeah, Taco Someone Prez. Talk Taco Prez, what's up? 
waiting patiently. <clears throat> Taco Pre- wow, finally, it's been it's been years. Pre- I've never expected this. Are you Prez driving Lowe? in front Prez, of Tim right now? Prez, yeah, Prez, Prez Taco Prez. <laughs> Actually, I am. Uh, I'm right here. <laughs> <laughs> There's this car that keeps flashing its lights behind me, and I don't know why. Hey, that's a pretty good prop right there. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> Nicely done. Wow. <laughs> Oh, man, I had a monologue planned out and everything. I just wasn't ready. All right. So on today's show, how about the compound? Yes, we saw that earlier. And, man, if I could say that's anything I've ever seen a Soprano ripoff, I've ever seen one. <laughs> rip off? Extra... But it was a good, it was a good, it was a good, it was influenced by. It's a good, it's a good one. It's a rip on more. Mm. <laughs> I liked it. I liked the Gabagool. And then after that, we had the Avatar lady. What? That was a musical treat. I'm sure everybody loved that. Yes. I especially did. I think we loved Apex Sisters more. That leaves us with the mystery of what really happened in the menage a trois this morning. So after that, we're left with puns and Thanksgiving, and what more can we say than bok bok? I know a turkey doesn't make that noise, but it's rough. It's, I like this monologue. I know. Just it's good. It's good. Let him go. Just, it's like a set. You, know? you just crossed over Riverside. Like just, <laughs> Doug just crossed over Riverside. <laughs> That's a tough one, too. All right. I like Be careful, Tim. Don't Thank dox you, yourself. Here. Which way are you going? You, have you been watching you all day, dude? Riverside? He's doing the two. You've been watching the whole show? Oh, okay. I have been watching the whole show all morning. Oh, wait. I had my you guys pull in people, watch it. People can be nice. following me? No, no, no. We're not following you, Tim. This is just a live report. You're following him. <laughs> You know what? Yes. People are, You're behind people him. Are, people are honking. I think maybe I've been found. <laughs> <laughs> that would be awesome. That would be amazing. I'm trying to get hey. into the compound. <laughs> hey, um, I don't have time to go see the new Ghostbusters movie, do I? Or do you guys want me back <laughs> now? You could catch a quick Ghostbusters. <laughs> There's a new one? There's always a new oh, one, Doug. Please. You could probably it make is. it to the first bust. <laughs> one bust. <laughs> <laughs> I heard it's a real drag, the whole Ghostbusters movie. Oh, no. It's a real bummer. Like a it's new sad? One? Like it's a drama? <laughs> eh, dark, dark stuff. Just like very craven, you know, fan service. Mm. <laughs> I'm on like- the two, folks. This Dude, sounds gotta... like an intro to an adult film and service. You were, you were going to be here and you said 35 minutes. It's now we're at the 30 minute mark. And there's no way you're five minutes. Doug, okay. if you have to split, don't don't mess up your flight for real. No, you need to stay, Doug. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta wait. I love being. This is probably like a just rush. racing to the airport and stressing about. Yeah, yeah don't I love don't that do stuff. that. Do you think there's gonna be a lot of people like going through security and stuff? Do you have uh, do you have Easy Pass or what's the yeah uh, you got the you have Fast Pass Fast Track TSA. That's a no. Pre-check? Yeah, no, of course I have, he does. I have TSA. Of course he does. He has to. <clears throat> well, Doug. Why don't you take an Uber from my house to the airport and leave your car at my house? I'll call the Uber and then I gotta wait for that. Or for better yet, minutes. Tim's I'll close. Take your car. T- Tim's such a good driver; he could take you. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> he could get a car wash on the way. <laughs> no, I, I'm I'm coming home to do the show. You get into the next nine hour block. <laughs> <laughs> hey, should we bring on this guy taking a shower? Yeah, Hell of course. Yeah. Hey, Nick. Thanks, Taco. Thanks, Taco. Hey, Nick, how's that shower going? <laughs> One second. Oh, you got to make some noise to have your camera come up. Can you hear me? Oh, there he is. There, there we, we go. go. We hey. go. That's a classic right here. Yeah, we've seen him before. Yeah. He's oh, a classic yeah. shower guy. Get your YouTube channel band. The mail. <laughs> How you guys doing? Keeping it clean, buddy. How are you? Damn, can't hear oh, I think there's some suds. Again. I think you got some suds in the, in the, <laughs> yeah. stand, in the microphone. You're shampooing the beard. You're, don't turn that camera oh, down boy. at all, please. Oh, <laughs> we don't, Easy now. We don't want to start talking about Bosch again. All right, sorry, I, Nick. I thought, I thought we let's were about to check out your Bosch. <laughs> Damn, I thought, yeah, yeah I thought we were about it. to go uh, yeah. penis dark. <laughs> well, we got, we got a face Bosch. Yeah. All, right, all right, Skyler. Skyler, still smoking. Gotta hey, quit that, uh, Skyler. Great, good hangs. I know, good hangs today, guys. Um, I'm just a, a big fan of your raps, Doug, and I uh, wrote these a little earlier. Okay, here we go. If you find love, provided so, 
Trust it. Don't wait, Joe. And get some kind of Idaho russet potatoes. <laughs> next one. <laughs> <laughs> I like when rappers <laughs> between... <laughs> say, next one. That was that. Next, that's actually next really one. good. Uh, next one. Next I like that. That's a new... <laughs> that's an, it's just <laughs> building up. Okay. New twist. If you're grief-stricken, yo, stop huffing Vicks. Just get a weef of that stove top chicken stovetop stuffing mix. Whoa. That's good. Okay. That's good. Next one. Next one. Uh, Next one. Well, uh, yeah, I'll move to the last one. Last one? <laughs> last one? <laughs> and last, talk, last, last one? Last one. Last one. Last one. Last one. My mom... Right, here we go. My mom sent plenty more socks and praise, but my religious dad sent a challenger... A 24 chocolate days till Christmas advent calendar. Wow. Oh, yeah. I'm in there. All right. Well, I just wanted to say hi there. That was great. Yes. That was good. That was Thank great. Lift, I need lift up. Lift, I need lift, up. Lift, lift up. up. Lift up time. Lift what did you up. ask for Christmas? Uh, what are you going to get for Christmas this year? I didn't need a, no Christmas presents. I, I saw your show at the Zebulon this year, and it was all I needed. That was like the first comedy show I've been to since the uh, pandemic. It was great. Mm. Well, it was Tim's, Tim's and Greg's. Okay, that was not mine. <laughs> <laughs> I was wondering who you were talking to. I mean, to. it was Greg's. <laughs> it was Greg's. Nice <laughs> but, you yeah, know, was, I will be, I'll, I'll be at Greg's show this Sunday. Oh, really? That's another plug. Oh, yeah. There you go. Yeah, I'm doing Greg's show. Oh, you're coming back Oh, that's soon? a quick uh, jaunt to uh, the Midwest. Well, it's thanks. I'm not going to the Midwest, once again. <laughs> oh, I didn't hear <laughs> And um, Where no, you going? You're going to the mountain. You're going to Appalachian. Colorado. Place, right? Mountain time. My, uh, my parents moved to Barcelona. My parents moved to Ibiza. I'm going, we're, going, we're doing a phone party for Thanksgiving. And... Ibiza, actually. Yeah. Ibiza. Ibiza. Um, anyway, yeah. Doug. Thanks, Skyler. Well, that's four days. That's long enough for a family trip. Four days. <laughs> yeah, it's mm-hmm. plenty. More than enough, some would say. Um, yeah. yeah. Chris Anderson, what's up? Oh, yeah, just hanging out with my, my dog, Bosh. I thought the dog was talking. I thought the dog was going to talk. You shouldn't like the have dog told was us talking. That. Pretend you're your dog. <laughs> That's funny. It's like yeah. the, the Hey, Chris, how you doing today? It's been pretty rough. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> uh, oh, oh look at that slobber. I, I've been oh. watching this for eight hours, and I, I don't understand. Uh, I only understand, like, five words. So. <laughs> 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 just waiting for my food. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, just wanted to say hey. Oh. I got to get back to my uh, my Kramer puzzle. Nice. Wow. <laughs> wow. Smart dog. All right. Oh, you're drooling, right, thanks, buddy. Chris. You're drooling Can a bit. Can we see you put a couple pieces in there? Do you got anything lined up there? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> wow. that, that looks so much drool. Crazy. The drool looks How like... How does it not in, fall? It's like floss it or looks something. Like fake. Chris, Chris you have like... something on your chin, Chris. <laughs> It's it a little cold. Like. How do they just stay <laughs> there? They look like icicles. Icicles, yeah. He said it's oh. cold. He said it's cold. It's pretty cold here in Providence. It's getting pretty cold now. <laughs> oh, yeah, but you're wearing a like fur coat. You should be fine. They look like whiskers or something like that. Yeah. Yeah. Can you? They're so perfectly e- even too. Yeah. How, are they, how is that? It's too perfectly. Oh no, it, it goes way down. It goes way down. Are that pierced? Is that like two piercings <laughs> on that, that little black lip? <laughs> right, right, right. right. Earrings. It's like Your a backward yeah, septum. Yeah, my, my, my friend can, he can like actually make it go a little lower. Oh, oh God. No! Oh, no! What? Oh, my God. Oh, They're strong. Oh, Holy oh, shit. Oh, that's so strong. Oh, oh, that is strong. That's like glue or something. Is that, oh, what is like the reason for well, that? I've Why is it so glue strong? For like eight hours. Is that permanent? Oh, is it always like that? <laughs> it's been eating glue all day, he just said. No, no, no. You gotta... oh, oh, no. Oh, I think that's how he uh, kind of... You're going to go wipe it on your pillow now. the puzzle together. Oh, yeah. That's how you shellac the yeah, puzzle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 These are weird puzzle pieces. It's very difficult. Oh. Very difficult It's truly jigsaw-like. Was that Kramer? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was not expecting it to be a difficult puzzle, but well, tr- Kramer's a difficult man. Yeah. Mm-hmm. He's a difficult man. He's a canceled man. You ever seen it his is. set it's at hard. the Comedy Factory? Oh yeah. There's no, <laughs> What's that there's no way Laugh around factory. it. Laugh factory. I can't. I, I mean, I'm done. That's as far as I'm going. Some Honestly, that looks pretty good. Yeah. You could just frame that. Yeah. Yeah. You know, they sell know, well, it as it a poster. It has already. You know, it's you already know, got this. It's actually kind of poignant if it there's pieces missing yeah. from his portrait. You know mm-hmm. what I mean? There's right. something right. kind of symbolic about there's that. There's something beautiful know? about it, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Tells a better story. Tim, what exit are you passing now? <laughs> Don't dox yourself. <laughs> Nothing specific, I'm not, please. 
Roscoe Boulevard? I am not going to reveal my location. But you know, but you, could, you could tell us getting close. figure it out. Here's what uh, I would like you guys to start singing. <laughs> uh, happy birthday. Oh, wow. Whoa. Okay. That's a pretty short song. Yeah. Why don't you just burn out in the, so, in the driveway so we can hear you arrive? <laughs> I want you to sing happy birthday to uh, whose birthday is it today? What? Thanks, today. thanks, Somebody. Chris the dog. Joe. <laughs> the Pilgrims. Happy birthday, little one. Remember that big? <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> little one. No, it's Harpo March's birthday. birthday. Congratulations, Harpo Harpo March's birthday, really? We'll sing Wait, for Harpo. Start singing it's Harpo's? Happy birthday to Harpo March, all right? It should be, okay. it should be Har- Harpo birthday. <laughs> sing Harpo birthday. Harpo birthday, 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 birthday to you. To you. Let's do it. Harpo, Harpo birthday, birthday to you. Harpo, Harpo birthday, birthday, dear Harpo. Harpo birthday to you. For he's a jolly good friend. Oh! How do we like that? Get out of here! Safe travels. Safe, 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 safe travels. Wow. wow. How about that? Hey, is your is phone I think I'm hearing an echo from Tim's phone. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. Happy, 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 safe happy safe travels. travels. Yeah. travels. Yeah. Bye, bye, Doug. You got plenty of time. <laughs> Don't you think he likes to relax. He wants to. He needs to relax. Oh. He wants to kick back. No you know, disrespect. Check emails and stuff. Oh, uh, you'll get there. It's not too bad out there. Peace. See you, Doug. Yeah, see ya. <laughs> wow. Wow. What a turn of events. Well, I don't want to keep you. <laughs> <laughs> so we should probably take a couple of calls. Right? Well, we, you know what? Let's yeah. try. Yeah. Can we try to get to? We're at fifty-eight ninety-three. Let's let's get to what? I don't know. Can we try to get to fifty-nine hundred? Is that so crazy? That, ten, ten seven? More? We need seven, seven more? more? Seven more, yeah. I mean, it's a failure either way. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, nice to meet you. Hi. Hey. But you want it to be an even failure, yeah. you know? A nice, mm-hmm. even exactly. failure. All right, we got some hotheads still. Uh, Bob, 760. Bob, you're on the line, I think. Oh, good, you wouldn't belong getting frozen. Bob, are you there? Hey, how's it going, guys? Hey, Bob. Hey, hey, guys. Hey, Tim, I had a direct question for you. I was wondering if you thought Heaven's Gate was a fucking accident or not. Heaven's Gate? Was an accident? Heaven's Gate, the biggest mass suicide in the United States history. Oh, this is the guy who calls off the Sours East all the time talking about Heaven's Gate. I think I watched uh, that documentary. It's the it's the, it's the, guy with the Nike ha- shoes and Haley Bop. Ha- Haley Bop. That was very. How the fuck do I know? <laughs> <laughs> but did you say it was a prank or a joke? They castrated themselves. Seven of them castrating themselves. Do you think that happened by fucking accident? Yeah, this guy's gonna take us into a. <laughs> yeah, I like, yeah. I, like, I like the accent though. I got nothing to like say. He's, to that. Though. Yeah. And All you right. think Thanks, it's Bob. accident? Wait, what is Yo, he? You think that's an accident? <laughs> yeah, right. I mean, we Allison can go in a, if you want. Heaven's but I'm real, you think real it's an accident? Good. Allison this? has a good point. What, what did you say? I'm what, telling what, you, it's what not going to be good. What is the caller thing? Yo, a good question. I slipped on a banana peel <laughs> and broke my neck. You think that's an accident? <laughs> <laughs> All right, Bob. Yo, Allison wants to know. I'm trying to take the left yeah, turn and dude comes out in the intersection and rear ends me, t-bones me. You think that's an accident? <laughs> tell, tell us. You, it, them so, check, you call it a shower? See, what's I it? told you it's not Wait, dude, go in anywhere. one in in uh, <laughs> thirty seconds. Sum it up. What's going on with the Haley Bop comment? Yeah, good luck. Well, have you ever been in a fucking shit? See, this is. I try to tell you, you ever been guys. You been in a bar? Listen, you get punched up by a guy, be a dud, and then you punch I him back, but it turns He's out he punched you hard. You right, get thanks, knocked Bob. out. Was that an Bob. accident? <laughs> Stay healthy, Bob. Yeah. You ever go for your glass of milk 
and it <laughs> knocks over, and the milk spills everywhere. You call that an accident? <laughs> oh, God. You ever, you know, eat some Mexican food, and you're driving home, and you can't help yourself, and you just shoot diarrhea all over your car? Is that an accident? And the car crashes as well. And the car, and the car and it causes too. your car to crash <laughs> into someone else. Is that an accident? Is that two accidents? Uh. You might, it's like a, uh, you might be a redneck. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, that's so funny. It's the new redneck routine. It's just, is that an accident? It might just be <laughs> an accident. <laughs> that's hilarious. Oh my God, that is so funny. Uh, oh, is this, uh, is this who I think yeah. it is? Is this Angelo's mom, 703? You ever move into a new house? If you ever move into a new house and you're trying to transport a mirror from one place to the next, you accidentally let the mirror fall or breaks into a hundred pieces, it just might be an accident. <laughs> 703, is this Angelo's mom? Yes, it is. Oh, this is another you're rabbit live. hole. What? This is another oh rabbit my... hole. Who is this? Angelo's what? mom. Oh, Angelo's mom? Hey, Angelo's mom. Yes. What are you and cooking I for have, Thanksgiving this uh, year? Guys, I have a question for Vic, okay? Oh, that's a curve. Okay. okay. Um, I have Jimmy Baker's bucket food. Oh, yes. And I wonder, on the world is ending, and it's thunder and lightning, and the water is rising, and earthquakes, how we eat that food? How we gonna have time to eat that food, and what we do with that that, yeah. that doo Did Angelo write that afterwards? question? God has a plan, and and it, and it will happen. He will bring water to you because you need water for these bucket foods, right? But, wait, you're you're not yeah. some kind of uh, you don't have to explain those <laughs> those buckets. They're not. It's not your deal. <laughs> the dra- yeah, the directions are on the side How of the buckets. Do that? Well, I mean, you gotta you gotta have a, a bunker, probably it's like a fireproof bunker and a waterproof bunker, and just go down. And I don't know, I don't know. Do you what, have to uh, get his bucket water? No, I don't. Th- I think you just have to provide your own water. That's the thing. <laughs> but do you? How much? Yeah. How many buckets yeah. you got now? What are you? What are you up to these days? I, oh, I don't know. I'm sort of bought like uh, I have two buckets of uh, food of that stuff, and I don't know what to do with it. Well, you gotta wait. Just wait, wait until it's time. You know. What? What is this? Wait, is who? Doomsday prepper food wait, stuff. Doug, I think Doug's not here. How, where's that? that we got a new drop. Matt does that. Thank now? you, Angela's mom. Happy it's, Thanksgiving. You the joy. Best. Tell oh, Angela hello. hello. I was just get, get your turkey you bucket. You gotta get a turkey bucket. I was just waiting for her to say, "Was that? Is that an accident?" Or is that, <laughs> is that you know, is that... <laughs> the sweetest woman right there. Good old Angela's mom. Uh, Mr. Social, I know you desperately want to give us your fake ad. Come on down. Hello. Wow. Don't ask us how we're doing. We've been here for eight hours. Oh, I certainly won't. (laughs) Is that a two-dimensional Christmas tree? (laughs) (laughs) I think it's in all three three dimensions. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Okay, we'll make this quick. (laughs) <laughs> You're tired of slaving away over a hot stove on Thanksgiving? American actor and former professional wrestler David Batista is doing something a little different this holiday season. We are proud to introduce the Dave Batista's Thanksgiving Fiesta. If you're craving squash, this guardian of the galaxy will be a gourd cooking pal, you see? <laughs> okay. <laughs> 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 The Batista Fiesta is easy to order. Ah. Simply fax Drax, sit back, and relax while Drax packs satisfying savory snacks into a sack. Batista uses the nicest spices from Dune to season his delightful delicacies so decadently for you that you'll have your knives out too. (laughs) Anyway, order Dave Batista's Thanksgiving Fiesta now Mm -hmm. and you'll receive a free Dave Batista gravy boat pizza. Thank you. Very good, very good. Gravy boat. Thank you, Mr. Gravy boat. Yeah. Pizza? Lift him up. Yeah, like lift him up. Thanks, lift guys. Him up. Yeah. Lift him up. Lift, lift him up. up. Lift that boy lift up. up. Lift that Thank boy you. up. You guys are sweet. Good rhymes. Love there. you guys. Love you, Bye too, buddy. Mr. Take care. Social. Well, listen, guys, we have 
<clears throat> We're at 58.97. Can you pull this up, Tom? 58.97. 58.97. Let me talk so to close. the audience. Let's not try bad. and get not to 50. Where did you start not today? Bad. Let me ask you, wh- how many people are watching right now, Matt? Uh, oh, whoops. Sorry, Tom. We got, uh, let's see. Here. About 700 people or so? 600, 700? 705, yeah. 705. We're about right to now. enter the prime time time period. It's true. <laughs> Are we going for another eight hours? We're at nine o'clock Eastern. This is when we're watching the big shows. Hunter. Cheers. Frasier. Yeah, Frasier. (laughs) Night Court. Night Court. Bosch. And Bosch. Bosch Bosch is on whenever you want it. (laughs) Bosch is not. Vic, I was going to ask you if you... Bosch is anytime. I always... I know we goof on Jeff Bozos, but are you secretly <laughs> rooting for him because he's the provider of Bosch? <laughs> <laughs> he provides you with Bosch. Of course. He's of the course. Bosch master. And, and uh, <laughs> there was I'm a big surprise, because like, I thought it was like ending, but then the last episode's like to, to be continued, basically, and mm. there's the, the, the girl, so. Oh, there it is. Nice. Pretty cool. Wait, so Bosch died? No, no, she's there. I mean, he's there with his, his, his dog. No, he's still alive. Why do they need Bosch the girl? Okay, enough of Bosch. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, we have to get been put sucked into the him. Bosch hole. We're trying to get the Bosch visor? Where'd that come from? I, I ordered, special ordered it. <laughs> did you, you ma- did special you, ordered it. Did you make that? By no, the no, order? no, oh, yeah. I special ordered it. Oh, they actually sell this? Yeah, yeah. This I is mean, official. It's, it's, it's official. spark plug. Well, spark plug. Yeah, it's a spark plug. It's a spark plug. To me, it's Bosch. Though. Sure, sure. Uh-huh. On the West Coast, it is now 549. It is 10 minutes to 10 minutes? 6 yeah. o'clock. And I'm asking, and I'm a guy that doesn't need a lot. And I have a lot. But we are building something here. And some people get they get a little uh, uncomfortable with these hmm. new platforms like Patreon. Hmm. Rumble. Rumble. I have, actually, I have something to, uh, serious to say about this. I've been thinking about this. You know how people always say, oh, it was free. Why isn't it free? Guess what, assholes? It was never free. All this content you think is free. You were just paying fucking Time Warner and whoever else. And you probably watched like what six or seven channels on it. So guess what? You were paying way more than five dollars a What's month. What's he on about? He's getting mad. <laughs> He's getting swim. really mad. Huh? <laughs> you were always paying mad, mad. for the content that you're quote unquote well, yeah, getting but free. Yep. Yeah. No free lunch. No not... free content. Yeah. Well, so you're, yeah. Like, yeah. like you're, like you're paying for Fox News, even if you're not watching it. Exactly. If you're buying cable, that's a but good. That's a good problem. way to put it. What the problem is is these new companies, these tech disruptors, have come in like Netflix and everything. And they have devalued things mm. to such a tremendous degree. Mm. The amount of stuff they provide for what they charge, you can't compete with it. Mm. It's like Thank what Walmart Jesus. did to the mom and pop uh-huh. hardware store uh-huh. and the Home Depot. Yep. Right. You're running mom and pop uh-huh. YouTube guys out of the game <laughs> with your Bosches <laughs> and, and your you. This is a mom and pop operation. The you. Right? It is. is. Yeah. I'm running the damn yeah, thing out right. of my garage. Right. That's right. Okay? Yeah. And all we're trying to do is pay our boys, mm-hmm. make a little money on the side. Not a lot. <laughs> a little bit. Cover expenses down here. You think the fucking government gives away these <laughs> AKG <laughs> microphones? <laughs> and we don't ask for much. We ask you support the show. $5 a month is nothing for many people. Mm-hmm. That's a cup of coffee in a lot of cities. In San Francisco, that's half a cup of coffee. <laughs> a lot of places. Well, Tim, we're one away from fifty nine hundred now. We're at fifty eight ninety nine. I want to get six thousand by six o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> six new, six additional thousand. So <laughs> and you have these dirt bags over at Chapo Trap House uh-huh. with That's the fifty. True. How many do they have? Fifty thousand. I mean, how many does, how many does Tim Dillon have? And what do they do? Oh, All they do Tim is they Dillon. sit around and whine about how hard dead, things dead, are. Dead. And read. They read art. Is that what we should start doing on the show? Reading articles. Here we go. <laughs> Let's see. Let me go to. Uh, let me go to. Uh, what's that? Uh, what's a website with the liberals go to? With, uh, <laughs> Mother Jones. Yeah, Mother Jones. Look at this. Here, here's how we'll get thousands of uh, subscribers. I'll sit here and read articles to you. Mother Jones. Look, did you see this mm-hmm. the other day? <laughs> look at this. You have to look right at the camera uh, too. Okay. Terrible toll of tar sands mining on ca- uh, Canada's native people. Terrible stuff here. Anyways, I am not Fort, uh, watch the, the world's watch smartest our, man. Watch our numbers jump. Here we go. <laughs> and uh, and also, I could I could stoke fear, mm-hmm. stoke fear like Tim Dillon does. <laughs> right, folks, we are heading towards another American civil war. 
<laughs> and if you don't act now and start planting C4 bombs around <laughs> where the Starbucks are, <laughs> and you're gonna have to do, you're gonna have to start cutting people's heads off. <laughs> So we could do that. We could start going down that road and play to the cheap seats. Or I'm we could like do what we love to do is make you smile. And talk about Make Bosch. you laugh. Uh-huh. And take a bath, talk a, take a bath <laughs> with Bosch. <laughs> That's what I'm getting you for Christmas, right. a bath a with bath Bosch. Bosch. <laughs> a, ba- a Bosch bath bomb. A Bosch bath bomb. <laughs> and I'm going to hire that actor. What's the actor's name? Uh, what is his name? Oh, you don't even know the actor's D- name. Uh, Titus, Titus. Andronicus. Take Andron- a bath. Titus Andronicus. <laughs> take a bath with Bosch. <laughs> For one night only, Vic will have a long, that beautiful bath with Bosch. Be Tim, your rant question. worked. We surpassed 5,900. Wow. We're at 5,902. Wow. With no help from Phil Braun, let me right. tell you. He, he tried. Well, he, he did his he best. Did, he did. He what did. did he do? He was burnt. He was burnt, yeah. Oh, he was burnt. He was the puppet, yeah. yeah. Nobody yeah. wants that. Bath with, <laughs> bath with Bosch. That sounds so funny. Well, we did it, <laughs> and we have a couple minutes just to... Yes. Wrap things I mean, up. Mm-hmm. Just imagine him. At, you know, it's like this present he gets. Bosch is in the tub, you know? and there's suds and stuff, and you get to actually bathe. You get on the bathe. other side. You get to it. soak with him for a little bit, you know, soaking with Bosch. He's like, like uh, rubbing your feet. It's like Hi, a, I'm uh, Titus Adronicus from uh, the TV show Bosch. Are you interested in getting clean with me? He has to specify it's a yeah. TV show. I am. Uh, I. I'm, ru- I'm running this contest for Omez, right? Omez. And we're raising money to, to fight homelessness. And uh, so, or, uh, what would you say? Uh, sign up now to see if you can win a bath with Bosch. We have a beautiful Bosch bath. Bosch bath from Home Depot. Yes, there you go. And we've got uh, Dr. Bronner's suds ready to go. And we'll clean each other. There'll be no ins- there'll be no sexual activity. It'll just right. be a bath. He's like, I'm sonic. in here. Hurry up and enter. The water's just right. getting colder. <laughs> just just come on in. Bring your loofah. <laughs> I will be fully nude if you'd prefer to be in the speedo. It's up to you. There will be a photo the shoot. Clothing is optional. <laughs> there a will mandatory be a, photo shoot. A mandatory photo shoot. Take a bath with Bosch. <laughs> Anything else, Matt? <laughs> Look at how congested I am, huh? Yeah, you never heard me so congested. No. You want to take some more Zoomers? <laughs> Bad case of COVID. <laughs> Jesse. <laughs> Jesse from Minneapolis. Hey. A uh, long-time listener, long-time patron. I love you guys. Hey, look at Tim, that I've camera. Your support. You looks good. You like the camera? Yeah. It's like the Lemmy yeah. camera. You're looking yeah, good. It, it, You're looking all a, right. It's wow. a, oh, it's my it's face a fucking you one day. DSLR. Whoa. No one caught me oh, saying yeah. that. What did you say? Oh, it's my face fucking you one day. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> I'm a little, I'm not a guy. Right, I think thanks for the call. A nice looking face. So a, a I'll give you a choice. Do you, want a, <laughs> do you want a short joke, a long joke, or a, or a deep thought that I had today? Do you want me to do the penis thing? <laughs> I'll take a bit of both. Okay, Maybe short joke. Short joke and a long. This is not a good joke. one, but uh, why do why do sharks only swim in salt water? Don't know. Pepper water makes them sneeze. No. Ah. Mm. Pretty, pretty Pepper good. Pepper water makes mm. them sneeze. That's right. <laughs> uh, was, was having breakfast with my wife this morning. We we're talking, looking out at the woods, and I thought. Why do we spend so much effort reading? You know, I spent I, I spent 99% of my time is spent reading. About 1% of my time is spent doing something about what I'm learning. I, I feel like uh, it was a kick in the butt this morning. I feel like I need to change, you know, maybe start producing something rather than just I, I don't think I'm not you, reading. You yeah, I don't think anyone else reading. reads 99% of the time. So <laughs> yeah. it's all on you know, deaf I'm, ears. <laughs> Let, let's put it this way in, the, in terms of like input versus fan. output, you know. No mm. confidence. So, are you reading like self-help stuff or something? What are you reading? Uh, just like I read, I read good books. I read lots of news. I read this, this, and that. But I rarely produce anything of value. So you want to write a book? I, life's no, tough, I don't man. even want to. I just figure like, should well, I, you know, you could spend your whole life consuming stuff and never do anything about it. Well, you know what I had this thought was uh, this might not apply to you. I don't know how old you guys are, but when I was a kid, 
did you, Matt, maybe this would be, maybe, did you imagine you'd be doing so much typing in your life? Mm. Oh, all, no, yeah, it's all true. All we do is type. Mm. Well, on you the know phone or on the keyboard. Yeah. Well, when I was a kid, yeah. I never thought I'd be, I'd be, all, I'd be. That's how I'd, my main communication. Did you have typing be. class in school. Well, I was the, I was I just did. gonna say it's probably yeah, the I most did, yeah. useful class I took in yeah. high school. Was yeah, typing. Right. but at the and time, it seemed like a waste. Uh, something about typing is, this is a true story. Like originally, they it was like A B C D E F G. But then because the the typewriter uh, repair shops couldn't keep up with the demand. They changed it to make people uh, type slower, so you'd have what? to like, yeah, no. yeah, yeah. Oh QWERTY? yeah, I've heard uh-huh. actually. Uh-huh. But QWERTY. now is it faster to use the QWERTY Qu- thing? QWERTY. That's I mean, QWERTY. I guess so. Yeah, QWERTY. Now it's QWERTY, but yeah. I thought but it was just based on I that. It was like, based on words. Likelihood are of to touching them. That way. It's my understanding. Yeah, yeah. I, I think, <laughs> you you my got understanding. Some I, I think that yeah. QWERTY is designed in a way that most words are easier yeah. to type in, in the way that their letters mm-hmm. are arranged. Right? I wish there's some way to find out. Or it might be an accident. Do you that think sounds like something your, your dad might have told you. <laughs> told you know? <laughs> he also, my dad also told me his grandfather invented uh, iced coffee. Too. <laughs> <laughs> He's probably listening. He can, he can confirm that. He, oh, yeah. <laughs> what's the most, th- the is the most common word, right? And that's mm. so easy to type with the QWERTY setup. I guess you know, that you just, would be, yeah. You just T-H-E right there, boom. You just, does you can does do anybody know what uh, the McDonald's character Grimace is, uh, represents or is based off of? Does a, anybody a, know? A, li- a liver? No, close. A liberal? A uh, heart, a heart. <laughs> Freaking <A> liberal. <laughs> heart? He represents a liberal. Fat, <laughs> <laughs> fat, lazy liberal. All that government <laughs> cheese he's no, eating. Yeah. Stealing everything. This, this is... Uh, this is all. This is true. Unlike Vic's typewriter, tall tail, <laughs> kidney stone. Uh, uh, the the um, uh, lung taste bud. It's a, ta- oh. it's a taste bud. Really? Are they purple? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> What's the name? Can I can ask you what? a favor. Yeah. Will you just say hi to my daughter Esme and my son Benjamin? They would freak Go out. Go ahead, if they Matt. Matt, ever. <laughs> <laughs> hi, Esme. Hi, Benjamin. Well, Really appreciate you. They're, being in, they're going to bed right now. It's I'm in Minnesota. Let me tuck it's kind of late. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Read a little story. Let me tuck them in. You know. <laughs> you know. All right. Rock no, and roll, Gary. Uh, you're what's not their name? Benjamin and Esme. Esme. Benjamin and Esme. Good night. <laughs> <laughs> Esme. Thank you. What is that? Yeah. Pig Latin. I've heard. <laughs> I've heard that name before. No, you haven't. I, in, yeah, yeah. <laughs> heard it many times. Pig Latin for Mez. Yeah, pig Latin for M. Say. Well, it's six o'clock. Shall we uh, let our boys go? Uh, let's wrap it'll it up. Me- it'll be Mez. Fifty nine oh six. Thank you, everybody. Wow, everybody. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. Happy Thanksgiving. And Matt, do yes. we want to say anything about Thursday or not? I announced <clears> it, <throat> but well, you, you should give a quick. Uh, you know. I hope you didn't say it too much. No, no, I just said you're doing a show without Doug and Vic on There's Thursday. Something big coming on Thursday. I think it'll be. I announced the guests, Jeremy and Rajat. It'll be much, uh, much to discuss after that uh, is broadcast. So tune in Thursday all day. Thank you uh, guys for coming by. Uh, Thank I hope you. you had fun. Did you have fun? Yeah, I did. It's been quite yeah. fun. Yeah, lots it's been laughs. quite fun. Lots of laughs. A lot of laughs. Lots of laughs. I mean, been here a while. Vic, what was wow. a highlight? I mean, I got a highlight. I don't know. I was there's so much. That guy's angle was real. That, that guy's angle. I mean, was that great. part yeah. killed me. Yeah. That was really that funny. Was, I, 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 that that was, was, I was on the call, but I couldn't really see what that was. That was. You're gonna have to rewind. That was, that was, that was really funny. funny. Yeah. That's the best. That no, no, no. To me, the the the, the accident good. thing was really funny to me. Yeah, like the new redneck thing. Right. The accident thing. I know, that's I'm hilarious. talking all day long. <clears throat> well, I wasn't that, here. I mean, I just saw that. Yeah. I mean, we, we had, watching it at we had all? so much. Too I mean, many to even remember. I mean, we started Matt, with Johnny Pemberton. Uh, like, that Weird was... Al did a great call. Yeah, Weird Al Weird was great. Uh, Pacino, Pacino. Pacino. I mean, uh, Weird Al Pacino. Mm-hmm. Oh, right. Weird Al Pacino was uh-huh. great. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and Cross, you know. And the uh, um, musician, like my brain. Oh, Maylee Todd. Maylee Todd was amazing. No. That was amazing. What about Jamie Loftus? Was she here? She, she was, was great. incredible. So much she fun. People seem to love her. We got to have her back. She yeah. took over for like a half hour. <laughs> mm-hmm. Really? Hosted. Yeah, uh, Doug and, and I. And we used the out. green screen for. And the uh, green screen worked nicely. Really? Until you yeah, see you got to see that. You got to see that. Cool. Yeah, it's really good. Hey, Brent, would you play us out at the end here? Play a little piano? Oh, uh, no, no. Uh, we, let's, how about everybody sings Happy Birthday? <laughs> <laughs> Har- no, Harpo Birthday. Yeah, we would love to. And you won't be on camera. We'll just. Put the card up and you play us out. Ah, uh, you don't want that. You of course we do. Yeah, you're good. No, we, we don't do. want. We that. want a great a piano. You don't. We're not, we always we're end not music, leaving so until you either. play the damn piano. Yeah. What do you want to hear? Uh, something Christmassy. Yeah. Christmassy. Huh? Well, all or right. Jazz, aren't you all a right. jazz pianist? Yeah, I do that. Can you do anything from the um, the peanuts? Yeah. 
Yeah, I do the penis. Oh my god. Oh, there we perfect. go. Penis. Do the penis thing. Um, all right, Silver thanks. Bells. Thanks, everybody. Thank you, everybody. Thanks, thanks everybody. for sticking around. I'm so happy I got to be here yeah. for a few minutes. I'm sorry I wasn't here all day. You know I would love to be here. Thanks for your support on uh, Patreon, and we'll see you Thursday. Yeah. See you later, everybody. Uh, so, so something like... Um... <clears throat> actually. Darker, it's a darker ending, you know. It's like a dark, you know, end on a dark note. You know? That's that's it.